My marijuana patch. Uh, I mean, or my carrot patch. Yeah. I better do what any sensible middle American would do in this situation. Get my gun. Hello, and welcome to Earth. With open bar. Holy crap, it's Sonic the Hedgehog. Uh, no, it's an alien. Holy shit, it's an alien. Finally, on this dead plan. Wait, what the crap? Did Kakarot screw this up? Oh god damn it, I knew we should have sent Turles. Better think of something cool to say to make him stop. Hey you! <laughs> Genius, farmer. Genius! Aw, oh, look at him. He thinks he's people. What's your power level, little human? Five, huh? Protect me, gun! Hey! No! Bad human! Yeah, but I voted for Bush! Bad. Now get back up and tell me you're sorry. Human. Human. <sighs> so this is why Dad said I couldn't keep a pool. Good old wasteland. Yep, sure is some kick-ass training. Damn it, I'm lonely. Might as well check MySpace. No new comments. No friend requests. Damn it. Well, at least I have you, Tom. You're always there for me. Hey! You! What the hell? Are you Kakarot? Seriously, if you are, stay still! I need to talk to you about killing and selling this planet! It's really important! Oh, wait a second. You're not Kakarot. My bad. I've got green skin, pointy ears, and a turban. Oh yeah, I must look like so many other people. Oh, a smartass, huh? I don't appreciate smartasses. Prepare yourself for my signature attack! Double son! No! Uh -huh. Give me the mic! What? No, no, come on, man! Give me the mic! No, this is it. a real attack now! No, it isn't! Fine! Here, take it. I'll just go practice my Vegeta. Ass. Then prepare yourself for my signature attack. Keep your eye on the bird! Ooh, a higher power level. Hey, what the hell? Weren't you going to kill me? Ah, uh, there we go. Considering the average set by this one green guy I met Farmer, the chances of this being Kakarot are... Ah, screw it, I was going to check. Fine, go ahead. I didn't want your company anyway. Right, Tom? Hey, I'm here! Boobs, I mean, Bulma. Hi. Okay... How's it going? I'm drinking OJ. Now it's apple juice. No, it's beer. Yay, beer! So where's Yamcha? I think the bastard's cheating on me. Why do you say that? Bulma, it's not what it looks like. Oh, okay, it's totally what it looks like. Can I still live here? Please? Before this, I was living in the desert. Oh, and have you changed Par's litter box yet? I need boom boom! Oh, are you serious, Yamcha? Oh, that is so out of care. So you're single then? Hey guys! Goku! Fail! Wait, what? <laughs> uh, Goku, I can't help but notice that five-year-old you're carrying. Goku, just because we picked you up in the middle of the woods when you were a kid doesn't mean you can go around stealing children. Uh, okay. This is actually my son. What a twist! Oh, wow! I guess this means you finally, you know... Know what? You know! Bow chicka wow wow! What are those noises you're making? Oh, oh my god, god he's, he's a, a parent. parent! So when's the little guy gonna start training? Well, actually, Chi Chi is making him study. She wants him to grow up and be... what's it called? A productive and responsible member of society? Yeah, lame, that's it. 
Hey, son, come here. Stop playing with a turtle. We don't need people saying things. Hey, is that a Dragon Ball on his head? Doesn't that sort of make him a target for villains who might want them? Oh, come on. I beat Piccolo. I'm strong enough to beat anyone who- HOLY BLACK ON A POPO! WHAT IS THAT?! What's wrong? I just felt a power level bigger than... than... Krillin's losing streak! You know, you guys are the reason I go to therapy. He's... getting closer. Shouldn't we grab Gohan and put him inside? Oh, son of a- It took me a while to get here, but I oh. finally found you, Kakarot. What? That's right, that's your name. What? The name you were given before we sent you to this planet. What? You hit your head as a child, didn't you? What? Oh, for God's sakes, listen. You were sent here as a child to take over the planet. You're part of a dead race of intergalactic super warriors called the Saiyans. And to top off this expositional onslaught, I am your brother! <laughs> So you're his brother, huh? Wow, that must mean you'll be involved in a lot of future events, right? Right? <laughs> what did I say? Hey, stop hitting Krillin! Why? Because you're breaking Kame House! Yeah, stop breaking Kame House. So, what are you here for? The Dragon Balls? The... the Dragon's what? The Dragon Balls, you know? There are seven of them, they grant you any wish you want, like immortality? Or Bulba's panties. Vegeta, did you hear that? Oh yeah, we're totally going to Earth to get our wish. Yeah, we're gonna get panties. I mean immortality. Immortality is what I meant, right Vegeta? Just get in the damn pod. No, I'm here for you, Kakarot. So, what are we gonna do? See a ball game? Catch a movie? We're going to kill everyone on the planet and then sell it for profit to an alien overlord who may or may not have destroyed our own planet. Oh, well, uh, I sort of like people here, so with all due respect... Daddy! I'll be taking this, yoink! Quick, somebody stop him! Damn it, Krillin! Hey, I was bitch slapped through a house! What's your excuse? I was kneed in the stomach! You guys are pathetic! <laughs> what? Aw, oh, jeez. Hey, look, I know you totally want to kill me and all, but... Today's kind of a bad day. My brother just showed up, turns out I'm an alien, he stole my kid... Oh yeah, I was watching that, that was priceless! <laughs> Sorry for your loss. Yeah, anyway... Wanna help me get him back? Why? I'll friend you on MySpace. Tom, you've been replaced. Hey Piccolo, mind if I ask you something? What is it? You're not human either, right? Yeah. And your dad spit you out as an egg, right? What about it? Are... Are you a Yoshi? Yes, Goku. I'm a green fucking dinosaur. Can... Can I ride you? <laughs> shut up. I said shut up! <laughs> shut up! <laughs> Damn it, why is it screaming angrily making you cry less? Oh, the hell with this, you won't have a timeout, Bob. Thanks, sweet merciful god, that's over. Now I can just sit back and... Beat the crap out of whoever's coming. Great. Raditz, give me back my son! Whee! So, you're here already. And I see you brought the Namekian as well. Uh, actually, that hasn't been explained yet. Oh. Well, it's not like anyone cares about him anyway. Well, screw you too! Piccolo, you use weighted training clothes as well? No, Goku. I just love to get naked when I'm around you. Their power level is rising. So, nudity makes you stronger on this planet. Uh, no. We're wearing weighted clothing. Oh, of course! Because that would be ridiculous! <laughs> so that hair does compensate for something. Ha <laughs> ha! Dangly parts. 
Shut up! Okay, what the hell was that? I don't know, but let's try it again, from behind! We really shouldn't be announcing our attack strategy! Rush him! Damn it, Goku! Can we at least try to dodge this one? Dodge what? Loki! Ah! Ha, you missed me! My bad. Ah! <laughs> Note to self. Less talky, more fighty. Ah. Hey, Piccolo! We may be taking a beating, but at least we managed to dodge that one. High five! Uh, handshake! Thumbs up! G good job! Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, excuse me, has anyone seen my arm? You can't miss it, it's green! <laughs> yeah, anyway, listen. I've got one more attack that should do it. Upside is, I can use it with one arm. And what's the downside? You'll have to distract him while I charge it. That's not too bad. For five minutes. And considering he beat us to a pulp in under one it Ah, oh, never mind, I'm sure you can handle it. Wow, you really have that much faith in me? Yeah, sure. Why not? Well then, I won't disappoint you. Here goes nothing! <laughs> Ready or not, here I go! I'm charging my attack. Ha! Got your tail! Please let me go. Well, since you asked nicely. Perhaps on second thought, a whole five minute startup time for an attack is pretty abysmal in terms of usability in battle. Ha! Got your tail! Again! Please let go? I'm not falling for that again. Pretty please let me go? Well... Oh, ow, spine! Ow, ribs! Definitely ribs! Aha! Uh -huh. Attacking an opponent roughly four times your strength in a one-on-one -on -one battle. A cunning strategy. No, 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 not cunning. What's the opposite of that? Retarded! That's it, thank you! Now, disregarding the Namekian, I... Uh-uh. A Yoshi? I'm not a goddamn Yoshi! But you said you were! It's called sarcasm! What's that taste like? Damn it, Goku! Stop ignoring me! Ah, my ribs! I think you broke my... Mmm, ribs. <sighs> Stop <laughs> ignoring <laughs> me Ow. and die! Huh? Stop beating at my daddy! No, my space bar! <laughs> ah, my space Space armor! We get it, you're from space! Ah! Uh, Go Gohan? Huh? What was that? Daddy! No, no, seriously, what the hell was that? We were getting slaughtered out there and you could huh? do that- Oh, crap. Uncle Raditz is pissed! We here at Team Four Star do not condone child violence. We do, however, find it hilarious. <laughs> Wait, hold on! Oh, what? Mr. Shattered Ribs is going to stop me? Listen, you don't understand! Nothing you could do could ever compare to what Chi-Chi would do to me if she found out he died! Well, sucks to be you. I don't have any choice! I have to use my last technique! Now die! Full Nelson! A full Nelson? That won't work on me! I'm Raditz! <laughs> okay, let go! Seriously, this is starting to piss me off! Piccolo! Ready! Good! Just make sure you give me a signal before you fire that thing! I'm right behind him! Oh, sure. I'll give you a signal. It'll be the last signal you'll ever get! <laughs> well, okay, as long as we're clear on that. Makonsup! Makonkasabab! Make a supper! Oh, to hell with it! Special Beam Cannon! Is that what you're gonna yell out when you- OH GOD! Damn it! And there was no way I could've gotten out of there! You know, you could've flown. Damn you, hindsight! Blit. I don't think that's gonna work. Why not? 
I sort of have a hole in my esophagus. Wait, then how are you breathing? Uh, Goku? Uh, Goku? Holy crap. I'm not the first person to die in this series! Krillin! What? Too soon! I can't believe he's gone. Yeah, pity that. <laughs> Wait, what the hell? You can regenerate? Yeah, and you know what else? What? I didn't go on by. Quick! Somebody stop him! Damn it, Roshi! Shut up, Krillin! Oh. Well, Goku was passed, but his sacrifice has stopped a great evil. Thanks to him, our lives can return to peace once more. Raditz! Raditz! What the hell is that? Guy who's as strong as a Cyberman says what? That usually gets to him. I think he's dead, Vegeta. Big shocker, nobody cares. We're ten times stronger than him anyway. We'll go to Earth, find the Dragon Balls, and kill everyone! And we'll be there within a year or so. Depending on filler, of course. Anything else we need to go over, Vegeta? Nope. That's about it. Well... Alright, you little human... Saiyan... thing. I saw what you did to that Saiyan back there. That kind of power can be useful. What? what do you mean? I'm going to make you my pupil. And then, I'll use you for my conquest to take over the world. But... but where's my daddy? Hate to tell you, kid, but your dad's dead! Actually, I kind of like saying that. Ha <laughs> ha, your dad's dead! Damn it. This is why I hang out in wastelands. Hello, and welcome to the Heavenly Check-In Station. Please, no cutting in line. If you are caught cutting in line, you will be sent straight to hell. And so, we need Goku here to get to King Kai's for his masterful training, Lord Yama. Give me one good reason I should allow this. Because if you don't, that line's going to increase by six billion! Six billion? I'm supposed to be intimidated by six billion? Please, I can judge six billion souls faster than you take a piss, old man. You know, I am the guardian of Earth. Could I please get a little bit more respect here? Big deal, I'm the closest thing to a god in this show. Until you get to the guys. Then I'll be horribly insignificant. I do have a desk, though. It's made of mahogany, and not just any mahogany, but mahogany from the planet of Malkior 7, where the trees are 300 feet tall and breathe fire! From these trees, this desk was forged 2,000 years ago, using ancient blood rituals of the Malkior people. <laughs> not only does this make my desk nigh indestructible, but it can bend the fabric of the universe itself! Also, it's a very fine material. Very expensive. Okay... Mahogany. Mahogany. Uh, anyway, can we please- SILENCE! Mahogany. Um... Sir? What? what? Oh, uh, sure, whatever. He can go to King Kai's. But he'll have to run on Snake Way! Sounds fun! Prepare to be surprised! Alright, I'm off! Oh, wait! By the way, did you see a guy named Raditz come through here? He has spiky hair and a tail? Oh yeah, I remember that guy! I put him in my patented Yamalock! And it worked? No, he kicked me in the balls and ran away! Now I don't know where he is! He didn't keep his eye on the birdie. Huh. Okay. Well, bye. See you next time you die. Mahogany. So, Krillin, how did Chi Chi take the news? Um. Well, Krillin, what did you need to talk about? So, Chi Chi, hypothetically, what would you do if you were told that your husband was dead? and your son were kidnapped by his worst enemy. I'd castrate the messenger in his sleep with a rusty carving knife. Oh, then it's a good thing I'm not telling you that. <laughs> <laughs> Would you like to spend the night? Uh, against my better judgment.
Well, so are you going to gather the other Z warriors and go train with Kami? The who warriors? The Z warriors. You, Goku, Tien, Yamcha, Chiaotzu. That's what we always call you guys. That's the stupidest thing I've ever. Krillin! Where the hell are you? Well, I'm up to gather the Z warriors. Bye. <laughs> Listen up, runt. Today we're going to commence your intense training under me. But wait. Wouldn't that cause horrible muscle degeneration for somebody my age? Crippling me for years to come? You're a wordy little bastard, aren't you? My mom wants me to become an ortho- NERD! What? Anyway, I figured to unleash your hidden potential, I'd have to put you in immense physical danger. So I'm gonna throw you at that mountain. Actually, that looks more like a plat- <laughs> Any second now. Here it comes. And... <laughs> this is gonna be a long training session. Alright, Mr. Muscle Man, here you are at Snake Way. Now, you might want to pack a lunch, because it's gonna be a long run. Now, I'm just joking, you're not gonna be eating none. Wow, that looks like it's gonna take me a while. Now, be careful running, you don't want to fall off and die. That's just a little bit of dead humor. But seriously, do not fall off or you will go to hell. Has anyone ever run the whole thing before? Well, there was one man. Well, who was he? I believe his name was... Mr. Popo! Yes, Tommy? I just received word that we have a new batch of trainees coming. Make sure you take good care of them. <laughs> <laughs> Last time on Dragon Ball Z Abridged, Goku began his journey down Snake Way. Wait, is that some kind of innuendo? This is going to be the longest, toughest journey I've ever made! I have to receive King Kai's training and battle the biggest threat to the planet we've ever faced! I have to run as fast as I can! I have to keep running! For the sake of the Earth! Humanity and my fam. <laughs> oh God! Ow! Oh. Ah, oh, who do we have here? A little girly man, yeah. I'm Goku. Who are you? I am Gaz. And I am Mez. And, and we, we are, are here, here to, to pump, pump you up. up. Okay. But I'm sort of- First we are going to do a hundred squats! And then lots of push-ups on the hard ground. And then a bunch of jumping jacks! Ooh! That sounds like fun. But I'm sort of in a hurry. How do I get out of here? Ah, there's no way out of here. Unless you manage to beat us in a test of strength and speed. Yeah, lots of running and wrestling and sweat. And grappling each other on the cold ground, yeah. Okay, now let's say we went through all of that. Then where would you say the exit is? Oh, it's right over there. Yeah, but you have to beat us first. And ah, he's running away! Oh, before I go, have you seen my brother Raditz around here? Spiky hair? Tail? Ah, yes, he made a horrible mess of the blood fountain. Looks fine to me. It used to be water! Wow. Well, I'm going now. By the way, thanks for the fruit. Ah, he has a piece of the fruit! Ah, nein, no, don't eat the fruit, don't eat the fruit! Bye. No, oh, now we can make the fruit salad for King Yama's barbecue! Yeah, and Tubura is going to bring something totally kick-ass and we will have nothing but we will look like fools! Ugh, I am so mad! Yeah, let us go work off our stress by doing squat thrusts and stretches. Yeah, then we'll do grappling in our speedos. I'll grab the oil! Meanwhile, back on Earth. Now that's got to be some kind of innuendo. I can't believe Piccolo left me out here all alone! How am I supposed to get down from here? I'm down! I can't even get any food or water! What should I do? I said climb down! If only I had some sticks or reeds lying around. I could make a makeshift ladder or a rope.
You have all come to train on my lookout, but since I am quite old, I shall leave you in the capable hands of Mr. Popo. Mr. Popo, you know what to do. Yes, call me. All right, maggots, listen up. Popo's about to teach you the pecking order. It goes you, the dirt, the worms inside of the dirt, Popo's stool, call me, then Popo. Any questions? Um, yeah, I got- <laughs> Enjoy the climb back up, bitch! Now any more questions? Good. Then we can begin. Okay, no more diversions. This is really important. No more psych- Ooh, a house! Is that a snake? Princess Snake, you have a visitor. Ah, oh, perfect. Now let me assess the situation from here. Wow, he's quite the hunk of man-made. But what's with the hair? Ah, I just love this fur coat. Especially since I killed all the animals for it myself. Huh? You don't look like you big King Kai. What? Did my magnificent breasts tip you off? What? what Nothing. Are you hungry? Yeah, I could eat anything right now. Ah, uh, me too. What? Nothing. Take a seat. I killed everything here with my bare hands, including the bare hands. It's a pun! I can't believe you took all this down yourself! I want to take you down. What? Nothing. Get in the hot tub. Wow, this water's really nice. <laughs> as your ass. Huh? Well, thanks for the food and stuff, but I've got to get to King Kai's. No. First you must pass a test of... endurance. What's that mean? It means I want you inside me. What do you mean? You'll see. Ah! Ha! Total simplification! Ha! Ah! It's creepy! Waka 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 Oh for God's sake, now he's just standing there looking at the moon like a retarded puppy. I was trying to teach him to fend for himself, but no! He has to be a weak, defenseless little wind is he getting bigger? Okay, that's new! Wait a second. That tail is saying blood! Does this mean every one of Gohan's race can become a giant gorilla? Damn it, if he destroys everything, what'll be left for me? Stop mocking me! Ha! Take that, Moon. Perfect orbit, my ass! Uh, uh, huh? Where'd the monkey go? Uh, well, he's back to normal. Oh god, what the hell is that thing? Well, whatever it is, I don't like looking at it. This either. Now, CLOTHES BEAM! That is easily my most metro attack. Meanwhile, back on Snake Way. Man, that was close. Sure I'm glad I got away from that giant snake lady. <laughs> Once again, wanton destruction has solved all of my problems. With absolutely no negative repercussions. We've got breaking news that the Earth's moon has been completely destroyed. While the long-term environmental effects can only be guessed at, preliminary speculation puts the short-term death toll from tidal effects alone at the hundreds of millions. We now go to our resident expert on lunar science, Sailor Moon. Sailor? <laughs> Thanks, Sailor! We now return you to Nick at Night's 24-hour Full House Marathon, already in progress. Hey, Vegeta! What? Are we there yet? No. 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 After 
endless running and detours, Goku has finally reached the end of Snake Way. How very convenient. Ooh! Oh, wow! That must be King Kai's place! <laughs> Meanwhile, back in the deep reaches of space. Over there yet? No! 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 Hey, Vegeta. What? Can we stop with that bug planet? Not if it'll shut you up for five minutes, then fine! See? Look how fun this is. Hey, Vegeta! The locals. Seems they brought a welcome service. You know, Vegeta, on some planets they really appreciate foreign commune, where he brings in the revenue. They'll probably treat us like royalty, considering the- Well... Yeah. Ah, I see! You two have been imprisoned by our horrible fascist king! Hey, Vegeta. What is it? We're in prison, Vegeta. I see that, Nappa. Hey. What? Don't drop the soap. I swear to God, Nappa, I will shiv you. Meanwhile, on the Kai planet. So, you're King Kai. That's right, I am the most superior martial artist in all of the galaxy. Ooh, a monkey! Yes, this is my monkey, Bubbles. Say hello, Bubbles. <laughs> Alright, that's enough, Bubbles. Anyway, welcome to my planet. Man, I'm so heavy here. Well, because of the small size of my planet, the gravity here is much more intense than that on Earth. That doesn't make any sense! Shut up, Gregory! Alright, fine, how's this for a reason? I have an unbelievably powerful space pirate locked within the depths of my planet. That's why the gravity is so heavy here. Here, get me out of here! Shut up, Bojack! Anyway, what are you here for? Oh, well, King Kai, I need you to train me. There's a terrible threat coming to our planet, and I'm its only hope. I'll do whatever it takes for you to train me. I'll withstand any test. I will try as hard as I have to, and I- Sir. What? I'll train you. S seriously I thought I'd have to do some kind of test. Are you kidding me? The only company I've had for the last 500 years have been a disembodied pirate, Yarr. a monkey, uh -uh. and a grasshopper. Actually, I'm a cricket. Nobody cares. Uh -uh. You tell him, Bubbles! Wow, you're right. I can't imagine anything more boring than that. Meanwhile, on Namek... Nell... Nell... What is it, Lord Guru? I saw a fish. That is all. You can go back outside now. Oh god, this is so horribly dull. I hope something exciting happens around here soon. I don't care what it is. No! What? I saw a bird. It was pretty. Kick its ass. <sighs> Meanwhile, back on Alia. As you can see, many questionable people have been locked away in here. Welcome to Oz, bitch! That's right, you with the spiky hair! You're going to be my bitch! I'm going to sell you for a cigarette, but not before I violate you, because you're my bitch! I love ruling this planet with an iron fist! Right, my queen? What in the great Aryan moon was that? Hi. Who the f*** are you two? Hi, I'm Nappa, and that's Vegeta. He was a prison bitch. Shut the hell up, Nappa. Okay. Anyway, we're here because my partner is an idiot. Now that we got introductions out of the way, I think I'll just kill you and- Hey, Vegeta. Oh, God, what now? I think that's our queen. I'm curious how they breed. Oh, God damn it, Nappa. That's disgusting. I say we just- Hey, you guys, breed for us. Why should we listen to you? You're surrounded by my 13 elite dead guards. Well, you heard them, honey. They're not doing anything. They're just standing on top of each other. And... Oh, there we go. Oh, God damn it. 
Kappa. Meanwhile, back on Earth, Piccolo has finally begun his training with Gohan. So, Mr. Piccolo, what are you going to teach me today? A brand new technique? How to sense energy? What about how to fly? Dodge! Ah! Oh, man. This training with Mr. Piccolo is really difficult. <sighs> but I think I'm finally getting the hang of it. Dodge! Ah! Meanwhile, at the Hall of Justice. All right, everyone. We have to do something about these Saiyans. They're approaching Earth quickly, and I don't think we have the strength to take them on alone. Batman, what are your thoughts? Well, I think... I have an idea! Oh, God, it's Aquaman. Come on, guys! We could use whales! Whales! Someone, get him out of here. Meanwhile, back on Alia. There, I begged my wife. Will you leave us in peace? Actually, no. I'm still going to kill you. Summon the Ranger! Vegeta, it's... It's... It's so cute! Can I keep it? Can I keep it? Fine, just catch it or something. Yay! Here, boy, shake! Ah, I got your finger. Okay, now, boy, catch them all. Catch them all! Ah! Ah! I broke it at Vegeta! It must have been made of something weak, like paper mache or raditz. Please, we'll do anything you want! We'll give you riches! Women! Wait, what are you doing? I'm about to rock you. Like a hurricane. I love that song! <laughs> ha! Did you see that now? But that was totally bad at- What are you doing? I'm cuddling it, Vegeta. It's dead, Nappa. No! <laughs> oh, I remember when we first got him, Vegeta. <laughs> ah, good times. You have freed our race! You two are the greatest heroes known to our planet. We shall erect statues of you. Well, isn't that nice of them, Vegeta? Out of our dung! Well, isn't that nice of them, Vegeta? We're leaving, Nappa. Okay. Look at us, Vegeta. We've saved an entire race from tyranny. We're heroes, Vegeta. We are a couple of really great gods. Ha ha! Ah ha! Ah ha! Ah! Tragic. Um, Mr. Popo? Are you sure this will make us strong? Checking order. Sorry. Damn right you are. Now, stand in this circle here. You mean like this? Yeah. Bye. Wait, what? Alright, today we will commence your training. Yahoo! Alright! Now, what's my first lesson? First, you must- Catch the monkey! <laughs> Actually, I was going to- Okay, have fun with that. Meanwhile, in... somewhere... Wow, this place is a wreck. I know. The desolation. The ruin. The horror. Where are we, New Orleans? Krillin! What? Too soon. <sighs> you must construct additional pylons. <laughs> Chao Tzu, get away from there. Why? You have no idea where that's been, it could give you an infection. You're not my dad, don't tell me what you- Chao ah! Tzu! My partner! Gay. Hey, at least I don't spend all my free time living alone with a cat. Hey, at least I get some puss- Wow, that did not come out right. Hey, Russ, look what we got here. Yes, we've got some tourists, Sprout. Oh, then we should give them the tour. Yes, the tour straight to hell, because we'll be killing them with our own two diabolical hands, which are comprised of many sinister fingers, which we shall use to fiendishly destroy them one by one until- oh, for Christ's sake, yes, they get it, we're evil, shut up! Oh God, why?! <laughs> Oh, God! This can't possibly get any worse! 
Hi. It's up to us. We have to attack together. Right. Back to back. Let's do it for Chiaotzu. And Krillin. Okay, just Chiaotzu. All right. Let's see how they're doing inside. <laughs> so, how was it? <laughs> it was horrible. <laughs> Good. You survived the first test. Oh, thank God. But I have some bad news. What? You're going back. Wh what? Bye. No! Mr. Popo, where did you send them? I'll tell you where they're not. Safe. Woohoo! All right! I caught the mon- Ooh, a cricket! <coughs> yeah, I'm Gregory! I'm a smash him! What? Oh my god! <laughs> Shut up, Gregory! Oh. Shut up, Bojack! It seems that your training here is complete. But, wait, Mr. Popo, do you have any last comments for them? You're all going to die. Thank you, Mr. Popo. Now I believe it is time for you to leave. But, but all we did was... Pecking order. Ah! <laughs> I completed the first two lessons, King Kai. Yes, congratulations, you managed to catch my pet monkey bubbles and get Gregory a concussion. You psychotic bastard! Now we can start on your real training and I can teach you that. Oh, before you do, could you tell me about the Saiyans? I must I tell you other than they all died 20 years ago. Uh, even my dad? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Really? What killed them? Let me check. Let's see here. Stupid monkeys hit by falling rocks. <laughs> P.S. Frieza rules you. Well, that doesn't seem right. Bored now. Let's get back to training, King Kai. <sighs> and so, one year has passed. The characters who actually did anything in the last series, but not in this one, have finally found themselves of use, and have summoned the Eternal Dragon to wish back their fallen comrade, Goku. I don't get it. Why are we doing this again? Because my sister Baba told us to. You have summoned the Eternal Dragon. Make your wish and I am. God, it's you guys again. Can't anyone else find these damn things? Ugh, screw it, whatever. What do you want? There are two horrible Saiyans coming to our planet, and we need Goku to be brought back to life in order to defeat them. Really? You know you could, um, just wish me, the magical dragon, to send them into an asteroid field. One crossed wire and BOOM right in the sun. No, you see, as long as we have Goku, we'll be fine. Right. Yeah, okay, fine, whatever. I'll grant your wish. Just don't come trying to me when half your stupid asses get killed. Ah, uh, who am I kidding you, Will? Hey, King Kai, I'm alive again. Yes, and you conveniently learned the Kaioken and Spirit Bomb off screen. Now get the f off my planet! Alright, and thank you, King Kai, for all the training. It'll be a hard fight when I return to Earth. But now, I'm truly confident- GO HOME! Okay, bye! Uh, oh god, what have I done? I'm all alone again! <laughs> Shut up, Bubbles! Well, I'm still here for you, sir. Shut up, Gregory! Yeah, you still have- Shut up, Bojack! Alright, Runt, your training is complete! Now you and I will take over the world! Oh! Who? Oh? <sighs> what is it, old man? I just wanted to check in and make sure you are ready for the Saiyans. R ready for the what now? Didn't Mr. Popo tell you? There were two Saiyans headed towards the Earth as we speak, both several times more powerful than the last one you faced. 
They should be landing pretty soon. Within a few days, in fact. New plan, Gohan. We're going to kick some Saiyan ass! Um, okay. You're still there, aren't you? I'm just so lonely. Get out of my head! Over there yet? No. Over there yet? No. Over there yet? No. Over there yet? No. Over there yet? Yes. Yay! Hey, look, Vegeta. More locals. <laughs> So are you guys aliens? Ah, I hate awkward silences. Damn it, Nappa, think before you act! What if you had blown up one of the Dragon Balls? The what now, Vegeta? The Dragon Balls, Nappa. Don't you remember our wish? The Dragon Balls, you know? There are seven of them, they grant you any wish you want, like immortality? Or Bulba's panties. Yeah. And us. You know what, Nappa? One of these days you're going to die, and then you'll be out of my hair forever. Now let's just go. Go on! On your guard! They're coming right towards us! But why would they be headed our way? They're probably seeking to eliminate the strongest power level. But my dad's dead. I was referring to me. Oh, well, by that logic, I suppose you would have the strongest power level on Earth. <laughs> hey, guys! Krillin's here! Oh, I thought I sensed someone else coming. Good. It seems you've increased your power since we last met. I know! Isn't it great? I- You're almost as strong as Gohan now. I- Wait. But he's only five! It's because I'm a Saiyan! Well, at least there's only two of you. So, uh... How bad was the training with Piccolo? Well, the training wasn't that bad. Mr. Piccolo is actually really nice after you get to know him. Gohan! I've brought you a sparring partner for today. Really? Who? <laughs> so how was your training, Krillin? <laughs> First rule of Popo's training! Do not talk about Popo's training! Krillin? Why are you crying? Second rule of Popo's training! Oh man, he's already crying and the Saiyans aren't even here yet! Yeah, we are! Hi! So, you guys are the Saiyans? No! Don't be rude, Nappa! And you're here for the Dragon Balls! No! We are... And I am the Prince of all Saiyans! You're a prince? No. F*** you, Nappa. So what do we call you? I am Nappa. And this is Vegeta. He was a prison. Shut up, Nappa! Bitch. Damn it, Nappa. Oh, look, Vegeta. It's a Namekian. Hey, I take offense to that! He's referring to me, you idiot. And it's not an insult. The Namekians are a fine, proud race of- That means he doesn't have a penis, right, Vegeta? <laughs> Unix. So what exactly does that make you, Mr. Piccolo? You survive mostly on water. Does that make you a slug or a plant? Gohan, not now. And you also conduct photosynthesis, or do you- NERD! Wait, what? These are them, folks. The terrible monsters who destroyed West City. Jimmy, hurry up and get a shot of the ball. Um, which one, Mr. Ken? Look, Vegeta, the paparazzi. I have to protect my image! Oh my god, he blew up the cargo robot! And the cargo was people! Good. Now I'm gonna read their power levels, Vegeta. Nappa, don't you understand? They can hide their power levels. Those readings are useless. You mean like you two friends? Yes. And I have a better way of testing their power levels. Plant the Cybermen. Yay! <laughs> Ta-da!
Ta-da! What? What are those? They're cultivated life forms, all with the same power level as Raditz. That's right. He was so weak, we could actually grow Raditzes! But, Vegeta, then you have to worry about the Fraggles. Oh, God damn it, Nappa, nobody's going to get that. As a matter of fact, I did. Oh, goody, more of them. Who the hell are you? Vegeta, look! More bald people. The small one, the two tall ones, and... Uh, uh, Vegeta! Look! A Pokemon! I'm not a Pokemon! I'm Chiaotzu! Chiaotzu! You hear that, Vegeta? It's a Chiaotzu! I'm gonna what? catch it! I told you I'm not a Poke- Ow! Oh, it didn't work, Vegeta. That's because you have to damage it first. Alright! Let's see if I can get a critical. Hey guys, I'm here now. It's Yamcha! That's right. Don't worry guys. We worked ourselves half to death with our training. So I know that as long as we stick together, we'll take on these Saiyans. And we will win! <laughs> Snugger, and that one's Foo Foo, and that one's Cabbage Head, and that one's Other Cabbage Head, and that one's Vegeta Jr. Vegeta Jr., no! And there you have it, folks. That man is dead. Very, very dead. Mr. Kent, if you had to come up with a word for how dead he is, what would it be? Cadaverific. Yamcha was our friend. And you bastards killed him! Don't worry, Yamcha! I'll avenge you! Alright, you're going to avenge him. The five-year-old over here is stronger than you are. But I- Face it, you're pretty much here as a meat shield. Ha! Look at him, Vegeta! He's like the Raditz of their group. That's it! I can't take it anymore! I can only be pushed so far! Drill it! Live it! Congratulations, you've just destroyed the equivalent of three Raditz. That's right, what now, you son of a bitch? Nappa here is worth five Raditz. I owe him... What? And I am worth fifteen Raditz. I... Oh. Ah, come on, don't get so down on yourself. At least you've proven that your Raditz is still stronger than our Raditz. I hate all of you. So in short, good for you. Oh, by the way, you missed one. <laughs> yeah, no. That was incredible, Mr. Piccolo. Yeah, way to go. But what about- Well, you can all learn a thing or two. But I just killed three of them! Nobody cares, Krillin! Oh. Well, Nappa, looks like it's your turn to teach them a lesson. Yeah, right out of Saiyan University. Hold on, you went to college? Yep. What the hell could someone like you possibly major in? Child psychology. Wow, that sounds really interesting. With a minor in pain! <laughs> <laughs> Looks like he's been... disarmed! I get it! Shut it, Nappa. Oh, I love this game! No tag backs. Ugh, damn, this guy is strong. Maybe it would be best if I just took Chiaotzu and... Wait, where is he? Vegeta! The Pokemon's on my back! Chiaotzu! No! I can't get it off, Vegeta! Here, I'll use Rock Smash! Chiaotzu, you get down from there this instant! But Chiaotzu! Don't worry! You can just wish me back with the Dragon Balls! Now you follow my friend! 
That won't work, Chao Tzu! We already wished you back once with the Dragon Balls! We can't do it twice! Him. As a memorial to Yamcha? Gay. At least your sacrifice wasn't in vain, my friend. Ah, oh, dang it, Vegeta. You self-destruct. I hate it when they do that. Damn it! Ah, oh, I think I made him mad, Vegeta. Should I talk to him about it? The first step to working out your problems is healthy communication. Ah! Hey, that was very rude. I was talking to Vegeta! Ah! 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 Should... shouldn't we help him? Can't you see he has to fight this battle on his own? He's fighting for the honor of his fallen comrade. Help me for the love of God, help me! Like a hero. Mr. Piccolo, help him! Oh, fine! Krillin, go! For Pony! Oh, he hit me! Oh, he hit me too! Go on! Hurry up and blast him with all your strength before he has time to die! Damn you, Pavlov! For those of you who don't know who Pavlov is, allow us to take a brief moment to explain. Back in 1904... Get back to the fight! And back to the fight! Hey, not gonna lie. Dick move, guys. Dick move. Piccolo, do you have a plan? That depends. Can you get him in a full Nelson? Any plans that don't involve killing me? Well, there is the multi-form technique. But doesn't that cut our power levels by- Plan A or Plan B, Krillin? Plan B! Plan B! Kage Bushin no Jutsu! Vegeta! I can't... believe it. He's dodging every hit! We can't lay a finger on him! What kind of incredible mental discipline has this guy gone through? Patty cake, patty cake, baker's bad! Make me a cake as fast as you can! <laughs> Good effort, but I'm the patty cake champion. What? But at least you didn't uselessly self-destruct like that Pokemon. You stupid, ugly, son of a bitch. His name was Chiaotzu! Pico! Yeah, that Chiaotzu! Oh my god! Right here. Right behind you, Chiaotzu. God! Aha! Pointless. We're gonna die, aren't we? Yep! <laughs> Vegeta! What? I can fly. Uh, 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 yes, Nappa, yes you can. You know, you're gonna be in a lot of trouble once Goku gets here! Who? Goku! He's stronger than all of us combined! Well then, I guess we better kill you before he gets here. Wait, I mean... But Vegeta, I want to meet the strong guy! Nappa, just kill them first and- But I want him to see us kill them! Oh god, there's no arguing with you! Fine! I'll give you three hours tops! After that, I'm killing all of you! Yay! And now we wait. Is he here yet? No! 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 no! Is he here yet? No! God damn it, Nappa! Just go do something! Go have fun! I don't care how. Oh boy! This is gonna be my best day ever. Well, time.
time's up. Time to die. So, where's your friend? I'm back! <laughs> Napa, where did your armor go? I had a hell of a day, Vegeta. I sank their battleship! And their whales. Mr. Piccolo, wake up! You have to stop him! <laughs> Don't worry, Gohan! Goku's never let us down! I'm sure he'll be here any second! <laughs> That's no food again, Princess Snake! Well, it's the least I can do for trying to eat you like that. But I thought there was something else you had to do. Something about Saiyans and the Earth. <laughs> Crap, 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 crap! Mr. Piccolo, get up! Please get up! Seriously, he's gonna kill us! Well, the green guy's out. Too bad. Guess I'll have to find someone else to play with. Please not me, please not me, please not me, please not me, please not me! Eeny, meeny, miny, you. What? Ah! <laughs> Woo! Not me! Go on. <sighs> Whoa! Thought that would've lasted longer. Midget's next! Ah! My turn! My turn! My turn! Uh. What? Nappa, what are you doing? It's his turn, Vegeta. I have to wait for him. Uh, uh, uh. You okay, Vegeta? Yes, just... just an aneurysm out of sheer stupidity. Wow! I didn't think you were that stupid, Vegeta. Ah! Nine minutes, 18 seconds. Nine minutes, 18 seconds. What's that, Vegeta? Happiest moment of my life. Hey, stop treating me like a joke, damn it! I've got a new technique, which I probably could have used earlier and maybe saved all of our friends' lives. But that's beside the point. Get ready for my destructo disc! Lame. Now, take this! Ooh, a frisbee, Vegeta. Papa, no, it's a trick! But Vegeta, tricks are for kids. You know what, Nappa? On second thought, catch it. Catch it with your teeth. Yay, like a dog. Ow, ow, ow! Three, four, oh, God damn it! Ah, oh, no, my face! My precious modeling career! You know, I was trying to be a team player. Trying to be a nice guy. You killed half our friends. I said trying. Well, you're failing. Oh, God. And so are you. I'm back. Ah, I see what you did there. Now, it's you and me, big guy. And I'm going to kick your ass. Yeah. Whoa. Take that, you insufferable f***ing simpleton! Whoa, Gohan! What the hell? Well, well, I'm sorry, Mr. Piccolo. I didn't mean to snap like that. No, stay snapped! Stay snapped! Ah, oh, God damn it. Uh, you are making me so mad! <laughs> Vegeta, look! I'm a fire in my <laughs> Myself. Through one final act of redemption, I'll save Gohan and- Wait a second. Why didn't I just grab him? I could probably still do that now, actually. Yeah, that's it. I'll grab him and throw him out of the way- <laughs> Yeah, that's right. I can take anything you can dish out. Oh god, there go my organs. Mr. Piccolo! Go on. Come closer. There's something I have to tell you. Is it that you always pictured me as a son? Because you can never make your own, considering you lack the reproductive organs to produce your own legitimate offspring? Nerd! What? Just... Shut up and listen. What is it, Mr. Piccolo? Why didn't you die? No! <laughs> well, Mr.
Mr. Bobo, it seems my time has come. But don't worry, my friend. You can go to Namek and wish myself and the others back with their Dragon Balls. It will be a long and arduous journey, but I'm sure you can- Bitch, I ain't going nowhere. But Mr. Bobo, the fate of the entire universe is- Pecking order. But I- Well then, goodbye, my friend. Bye. Vegeta, did you see me kill the green guy? Yes, yeah, Snapper, that was a very good kick. Ah, oh, Vegeta, you weren't watching. Can you at least watch me kill the toddler? Ugh, fine. Yeah! I'm going to eviscerate you and use your gastrointestinal tract as a condom while I fornicate with your skull! What? I'm going to skull f you! Masenko! Mr. Piccolo, I... I failed you. You sure did! I, uh... I mean... Sorry for your loss. Well, it's been fun, kid. I mean, for me, not for you. As for you, everyone important to you is dead. Hey, I'm still alive! Everyone important. Damn it. Now, Nappa smash! <laughs> ah! What? Hey, where'd he go? Did he disappear? Or was he never there to begin with? Oh, wait, there he is. Huh? Hey, guys, what'd I miss? I... oh. Are they all... Tenshinhan? Piccolo? Yamcha? Oh, wow, especially Yamcha. Wait, where's Chaozu? Oh, he's here. And there. And there. Drillin! What? Too soon! I'm sorry I'm late, you guys. But I brought some sensu beans for you. Woohoo! Thank you, Max Machina! Hey, which one of you did all this? That was me totally calling it. I killed every single one of them, except the Chaozu. He blew himself up. <laughs> Jada, what does the scouter say about his power level? It's 1006. What, really? Yeah, kick his ass, Nappa. Yay! Hmm, that doesn't seem right. Wait, 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 Nappa! What? I had the scouter upside down. It's over 9,000. Why do you sound so bored? Because it's still not a threat. But... To me. Besides, once we get the Dragon Balls, we'll just wish for immortality. Then no one will be able to stop us. Wait, what? But you killed Piccolo. And your point is... Well, if he's dead, the Dragon Balls don't work. What? Oh, and I totally killed that guy. Oh, well, at least we still had fun getting here, right, Vegeta? Vegeta? Remember the bug planet? Vegeta? 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 He's finally gone! I'm so happy right now! I might not even slaughter you all! R really? <laughs> oh, oh, oh no, you're all thoroughly screwed. Oh. Gohan, Krillin, I'll handle Vegeta on my own. I need the both of you to get as far away as... Where'd Krillin go? <laughs> Gohan, follow Krillin. Get home to your mother. Right, Daddy. Is there anything you want me to tell her? Yes, Gohan. 
Tell her to put dinner on because I'm hungry. All right, are you ready for this? You bet I am. But first, why don't we take this battle somewhere else? What's wrong with here? I don't know. Something about it doesn't feel right. Well, it is a little corpsey. Meanwhile, on King Kai's planet. So, the fight is about to begin. The showdown between the Saiyan Elite and the low class warrior trained by me. Taking all bets, guys! Taking all bets! <laughs> Here, I am at 50 gold doubloons on the short run! Aw, uh, sir, is this really appropriate? If Goku loses, the entire Earth could be destroyed! You were saying? Dial 1000 Zenny on Goku. Hey, can I get in on this? Wait a second, don't you already know the outcome of the fight? N no This is it! Ah, oh, yes! A perfect place to mark your grave! Listen, we don't have to do this, you know. If you leave now and promise to never come back, I'll let you go. And we can stop this meaningless bloodshed! Such tripe! Where's your Saiyan pride, Kakarot? We are proud warriors, bred to fight and conquer! This planet has made you soft! Are you sure about this? Because even if you're a little sorry... No! I'm not sorry! Are you absolutely sure you- Yes! I'm entirely sure! I'm going to obliterate you and the rest of this planet myself with my own two- I'll catch! Do you want Okay, not bad. But still nothing compared to me. Now witness the power of a Saiyan Elite! Elite? What's that mean? It means I'm of the upper class, a finer breed, the highest grade of warrior! <sighs> okay, consider yourself beef jerky while I'm filet mignon. Ooh, I like both those things! I'm going to start beating you now. I don't know when I'll stop. Hopefully before dinner, because I told Gohan to tell Chi Chi to- ah! <laughs> ah! What's wrong, Kakarot? Can't keep up! I told you, Kakarot, there's no way you can measure up to an elite like me! You're fighting a losing battle here. You may as well just surrender this pathetic planet now and- I can times three! Times one! <laughs> This proves nothing. Are you okay in there? Yeah, I'm fan fantastic. Nothing but gumdrops and ice cream in here. Oh, really? Can I come in too? I'm surrounded by idiots. I thought you were surrounded by gumdrops and ice cream. <laughs> Humiliated by a low class wretch! Aw, sounds like somebody's got an ice cream headache! That's it! Everyone dies! <laughs> Say goodbye to your planet, Kakarot! Well, that's not very nice. Of course not! I'm fing evil! Garlic gun! Ooh, did he say garlic? <laughs> oh, man!
Meanwhile, back at the ranch... Remember when we used to do stuff? You know, be out there with them and help? Yeah, oh, yeah I remember that. I remember that. And remember the Red Ribbon Army? Oh, oh, right, so yeah. Yeah. And what about King Piccolo? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Good times, good times. Whatever happened to launch? Who? <sighs> Meanwhile, back at the plot... Son of a bitch! This can't be happening! I'm the prince! I'm supposed to be the best by default! I'll show that little bastard! I'll become the mighty Ozaru and crush him into the... Where's the moon? Where's the damn moon? Huh? Very clever, Kakarot! I'd taken you for a fool, but it seems you're far more cunning than you let on. But destroying the moon won't stop me. We've learned to create artificial moons that supply the necessary blood. Question! What? Are they made of cheese? I'm going to enjoy this far more than I should. Ah! Now watch, Kakarot, as your life becomes inconsequential as I reveal my giant monkey! <laughs> Form! Oh. oh my god, I thought he meant penis! He's getting huge! That means he'll only be stronger! That means he won't be as fat- Oh god, he's so fast! He's too powerful! I have to come up with a plan! Wait, I know! I just have to think like a monkey! Hmm... Hmm... Hey, it's working! No, that's just Bubbles! Get off my back, Bubbles! <laughs> Goku, listen! The only way that you can beat him is if you use the spirit bomb! On it! And whatever you do, make sure you're very well hidden! It's going to take a lot of time to gather up all that energy! We're sorry, the number you are trying to reach has been disconnected. Please hang up and try again later. Hmm. <laughs> what did I tell you, Kakarot? I'm ten times stronger in this form, while you are beaten and weary. Man, this is worse than that time I was in high school. And all the guys called me Giko, and I was Piccolo's slave. I couldn't get Chi Chi to like me, and. Oh, wow, I hit that rock harder than I thought. Now, Kakarot, to finish this! Oh, man, what would Yamcha do? Um, um, what would Jen do? Wait, I know! Prepare to die, Kakarot! Solar Flare! <laughs> In the shower! Wait a minute, Freeze is always naked. Ah! Alright! That should buy me some time. Now, I let's see. Sort of Planet! Give me your energy! Everything you can spare! Ocean! Forests! People of the planet! And all the animals that live alongside them! There! I think I have enough energy. But maybe a little more one hurt. Daddy? Daddy? Alright, that should do it. All finished. <sighs> Finally I can see again. Kakarot, I am going to kill you! Now, take this! Energy from the entire world! <laughs> well, if that don't beat her. Kakarot, what's the opposite of Christopher Walken? Huh? Christopher Reeves! Ow! That was in terrible taste! Don't care, evil! Now time to crush you like an alien! Uh, what? Exactly! Now die! <laughs> ah! Again with the fucking eye! God. Ha! Now to make my cunning escape! Thank <laughs> you.
Ah, that would be awesome. I've had enough of this. I'm going to crush the life out of you, you insolent little... Krillin, are you sure my dad's going to be okay all on his own? Oh, come on, Gohan. You saw how much stronger your dad's become. I'm sure he can take care of... Ah, Jesus Christ, Vampire Hunter. All right, Kakarot, let's hear those bones shatter! What the? Oh my god, that's hilarious! <laughs> Get your filthy hands off him, you damn dirty ape! Oh, very creative. And what exactly will you do if I don't? I'll make you regret it! Law of mass dictates that the mass of an object dramatically increases the force of impact when said object collides with the ground. And with your size, you'll make an extensively large impact upon your inevitable defeat. What? what? The bigger they are, the harder they fall! What? <laughs> ah, stop that! Listen, kid, you're real brave and all, but your dad's beaten and broken, and neither of you have the skill or energy to take me on. <laughs> you're finished! All of your planet's greatest fighters, all of them worthless in the presence of us Saiyan elites! None of you can stop me! None of you! <laughs> Reading, 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 reading! God! God damn it! He's back to normal! Go on! We can do this! We can beat him! We have a chance! <laughs> You know, I thought I'd be angrier. What with the utter humiliation and loss of my tail. Or maybe I'm just so unbelievably enraged that I've come full circle. Oh well, either way it's time to put an end to this. Go on. Is that you? Hey, Daddy. I'm really sorry. It's okay, Gohan. You tried your best. At least you... You got home to your mother, and told her to- Um, actually, I never went home. I came back to save you. Oh. The daddy Everyone makes mistakes, Gohan. But we have to be strong now, okay? Daddy. Son. Now, Kakarot, you've damaged me! You've cut off my tail! You've insulted me beyond belief! But you still haven't taken my pride! Oh, my pride! I'll teach you to hurt my daddy! What are you going to do, huh? You barely have any energy left! Yeah. Ah, my eye! Why is it always the goddamn eye? K Krillin, come here. I have something to give you. Your last will and testament? No. It's energy from the entire world. It's our last hope. And you're giving it to me. I'm kind of out of options. Holy crap! So this is what being important feels like! <laughs> Alright, Kakarot. Say goodbye to your son! Wow. Such power. From every living being on the planet. You can feel it all surging inside of me. Every man, woman, and child! This is planet Earth's very essence! Booyah, motherfucker! What what the hell is Enjoy your stay in hell! Gohan? Huh? Listen! You have to bounce it back at Vegeta! But are you sure? I don't think energy works like that. Don't worry, Gohan. You can do it. You're a good guy. Oh, okay. If you believe in me, then I'll... Or it'll kill you. What? 
There's nothing left now. Your last hope and you missed. You're all defeated and there isn't a damn thing you can... What smells like deer? Go, you guys! <laughs> All right, Goku! Let's get you and Gohan home! It's been tough, but now... We'll never have to see that rotten Saiyan ever again! Alive again! Never have to see him alive again, that's what I meant. <sighs> but at least it's finally over! You gonna eat that Saiyan? What? Dibs! Right. Anyway, it seems the spirit bomb's done the trick! And with that, we can all go home and live in peace and- What's going on, guys? We won, right? You know, at a time like this, I really only have one thing to say to you. Bitch laugh! Oh, snap! And as for the rest of you, I'm going to end this with a big bang kind of attack. Oh, this isn't gonna end well. to be kidding me! They're still alive? Oh, the hell with it! I may not have enough energy to kill you all at once, but I can still kill all of you without any trouble! Yeah! You! You cut through my armor! This was a gift from my father! I'm sorry, I'm sure your father was a great man! I hated my father! Oh, well then I'm sure your father was a total prick. How dare you talk about my father like that! <laughs> Finally, I can just sit back and enjoy myself. No cares in the world. I can just beat these worthless cretins all day long and I... I think I'm forgetting something. Oh, damn it! The kid! That's right! Oh, wait. I'll just become the mighty Ozeruid. Wait. I don't have my tail. This fat bastard cut it off! Uh, no, no, stop it! Stop it, damn you! Why? Why won't you people just die? Yay! Gohan's transformed! He's gonna save us all! Oh no! Gohan's transformed! He's gonna kill us all! Gohan? This is Daddy. I know you're angry right now. But you have to focus your anger! Re remember Icarus? <laughs> he did it! Oh, that's bullshit! I haven't killed a damn thing since I got to this godforsaken planet! Not for lack of trying, mind you! <laughs> hey, fat ass! You wanna take out this one's tail too? Uh, uh, <laughs> Fine! I'll do it myself then! <laughs> I did it! I'm the best around! No one's ever going to keep me down! Broken beneath an unconscious naked child. Yep, I think I'm done here. So, Mr. Spark, what do you make of this ship? Well, sir, I would find it highly illogical to refer to this as a ship. The spherical design incorporates no propulsion system. It looks more like an orbiting vessel or a satellite. Ah! Suck it, Spark. Alright, I'm just gonna get in my ship. 
gonna fly back to Frieza Station. And I'm gonna sweep this off like a bad hangover. Uh, You're not going anywhere! You think you can kill all of our friends and threaten our lives and just leave? Would you be surprised if I said yes? I'm going to end this! And you! Right now! Now die! Dylan! Wait! Vegeta, are you sorry? What? If you say you're sorry, Vegeta, then you can leave. You can't be serious. What are you talking about, Goku? He killed all our friends! But Krillin, if he's sorry, truly sorry, then there's nothing we can do. I'm sorry. Yep, totally sorry. I just feel terrible. Let him go, Krillin. But, but Goku! Yes, I'm very, very, very sorry. But you're all still alive, suckers! <laughs> And so our heroes look towards the sky, their battle finally over, and victory on their side. Many lives were lost, many lessons were learned, and I made out with a cool 100 thou. You cheating son of a- Can't hear you, don't care. Now, where was I? How will our heroes bring back their fallen compatriots? What new dangers will present themselves? Has anyone really not seen this show already? Find out in the next season of Dragon Ball Z Abridged! They've broken my body. I failed in my mission to find the Dragon Balls. I even lost my tail. But at least it can't get any worse from here. Vegeta! What? I'm haunting you. Goku, how goes the recovery? Well, the doctors say I should be in here for a couple of months. What with the crushed legs, shattered ribs, and the brain damage, and the brain damage, and the brain damage. Oh, hey, Master Roshi, when did you get here? Mr. Sangaku, you have another visitor to see you. What? But all of my friends are already here. Not all of them. Uh, uh... I made it to the top! Now I can train with Kami, the strongest, most powerful being on the... Who's that? Well, we've finally been able to sedate him. Took us a while. We had to go through some alternative treatment. Oh, really? What did you use? Something I found under the sink. I think it was Clorox or something. <laughs> well, page me if you need me. Bye. Oh, you're still here. Who are you anyway? That's Mr. Popo. He lives up on the lookout with Kami. Did that cat just talk? All right. Everyone listen up if you want to get those other useless maggots back. You mean you can get our friends back? Shut up, maggot. Yes, sir. As I was saying, the only hope to get your friends back is to use the Dragon Balls on Kami's home planet, Namek. Namek? That's not a planet I've ever heard of. Oh, look at that. A woman who doesn't know any better. What are the odds? To be fair, Mr. Popo, until recently I've never heard of that planet either. Oh, look at that. A woman who doesn't know any better. Ah, 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 damn it, I walked right into that one. Anyway, I'm the only one who knows where Kami's old ship is, and the only one with the transportation to get you there. And this is a carpet made for two. Well, I think the only way to fairly decide on this is to have a democratic vote. Bulma! 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 <laughs> you, Bulma! <laughs> okay, um... Uh... Oh, ha! We don't need your help! 
I've got right here a remote control to one of the Crash Saiyan ships. All I have to do is put in these coordinates and... Critical failure. Well, well, well. Look who just ran out of options. Damn it, Bulma! Stop being such a scaredy cat and get on the carpet with a scary genie! <sighs> I swear to God, if anything happens to me while I'm gone, I'm kicking Krillin's ass! Oh, you and I are gonna get along just fine. <laughs> Alright, here we are. Yawns a bit heights. Wait a sec. How did we make it here so fast? This is the other side of the planet! Yep, this carpet gets about 10,000 miles to the soul. What? The gallon. But if you can make it to the other side of the planet so fast, why didn't you help Goku get to the Saiyans when he arrived on Earth? I was preoccupied. Mr. Popo, I need your carpet to get to my friends as quickly as possible. Making toast! Ah, oh, fine. Nimbus! Butter and toast! Here it is, Kami's ship. It's old and covered in moss. I know. Fits, doesn't it? Now get in. But how do we... Popo! Oh, wow! Your name opens the ship? Popo! And it closes it, too. Popo! <laughs> no, it just knows better. Welcome to Jupiter. My god! We're so far into space! It's such a short amount of time! This is wonderful, Mr. Popo! We can finally save our friends! This is terrific! This is... Po -po! <laughs> and we went to Jupiter in just a couple of seconds! We'll be at Namek in no time! And even better, Popo can be our pilot! Oh dear God! No. Oh thank God! But why aren't you? If I was going to do it myself, why would I need you? See you when you get back. Except, this season, you. <laughs> what do you think he means by that? <laughs> well, all I know is that my little boy isn't going anywhere. Actually, Mom, I'm going to Nemec. As I said, my little boy isn't going anywhere! But Mom, Piccolo died for me! It's my responsibility! Gohan, I am your mother! And as your mother, you will listen to me and you will do as I say! But that's not- Did you carry around a baby in you for nine months with a man who literally thought you had Cinnabons hidden in your shirt? But I- Now you are going to lay in this hospital bed, recover like a normal boy, and then you're going right back to your advanced trade classes, and that is the last we will- Shut your fucking face! I'll be going to Nemec now. You best. Well, uh, better get started on that ship! Please hurry. With that, Bulma got to work on the ship to prepare it for their travel. Hey, Dad, how are things coming along? Well, I'm working on your translator, but all I can get it to do is translate the Namekian into another language I don't understand. Oide arimas! Damn, Moonspeak! And in ten days, the remaining warriors were recovered and ready to set out to Namek. So, you sure this thing's ready to fly? Yep, I've gotten everything worked out. Well, except for one thing. We couldn't fix the translator for the toilet. Ich bin gefühlt mit Peacewasser! Hey, I think I see their car! Hey, Gohan, how are you? Oh my god! What happened to your head? You look like a young Mo Howard! Well, look who's talking, Curly. Why, I oughta... Clam it, Chowder Heads. We've gotta get going! Bye, everybody! Now, Gohan, don't make any friends with any questionable strangers! That includes you, Krillin! So, Boma, where do I put my stuff? Sit down, strap in, and shut up! Oh, uh, alright. So, Gohan... How much stuff did you bring? Well, Mom packed my bag, so there's a lot in there. Well, you know what they say. Always be prepared. Popo. So, Frieza sent you to follow us, huh? Looks like he wasn't satisfied with just our planet. Who the hell is Frieza? Shut up! 
There's no way we can let you people live. Not after what you did to our planet. Our families! Yes! And now, for your crimes against our people... Okay, seriously, we have no idea what... We sentence you to death! Uh, isn't that a little... Men, ready your blasters! Go on, this may be it! Close your eyes! Aim! Fire! Oh. Huh. Oh my god. Frieza's men are stronger than we thought. Everyone, take your cyanide tablets! But we told you we don't know any Frieza! I... uh... uh... Krillin, can I open my eyes now? Just get back to the ship, Gohan. But I can't see... Just get back to the ship! Krillin's log, start date, uh, November 28th. We've been flying for two weeks now. Starting to feel very pent up. Not just from being trapped on the ship, of course, but from Bulma walking around in nothing but her underwear! I would relieve this tension, but I've had no alone time as the toilet keeps screaming at me! Scheiße and say auf meinem Geschicht! I'm not sure how much longer I can last. Krillin, are you saying something? Nothing! Goddamn cocktees. Huh? You guys! You wouldn't believe it, but I see Planet Namek! Wait, how the hell do you know it's Planet Nam? Huh. Well, what do you know? Bring us in for a landing, Bulma! Yeah, um, about that. About what? Did I mention I don't really know how to land this thing? Uh? See, go <laughs> Gohan! Saying, what does that make me? Fine! Uh, are you sure they're okay? They've been out for a long time. Of course I'm sure they're okay, now just follow the plan! We had a plan? Of course they have the plan, stupid! To take their ship! And get off this stupid rock! Oh crap, they're waking up! Act natural, act natural! Hi. Hi! Welcome to Namek. Yeah, Namek. Totally. The totally Namekers. You mean Namekians? Yeah, those guys. That's us. So, uh, what brings you to, like, our planet? Bitch is Namek. Well, we're here to search for the Dragon Balls. Yo, that's disgusting. Why would you- I think they mean the ones that grant wishes. Oh yeah, we totally have those. The wish granting balls. Oh, well, if you wouldn't mind helping us look for them. Oh yeah, we'll help you find the ball, dragons. Dragon Balls. Yeah, that one. Hey, Zachro. What? We should totally help them find them, and then we'll take them, and then we'll make our wish for ourselves! Uh, ours don't actually grant any wishes. I think we made that up. Did we make that up? What? No! Why did we make that up? Well, cause, like you told me when we read their minds that we wanted their ship so we could get off this planet. That's... that's... no, that's just no! We would never do that, dude! Come on, not cool! Krillin? Do these two seem off to you? I like them! Time to find the Dragon Balls! Yeah, he landed here a few days ago. He was pretty messed up, I'll tell you what. But what happened to his partner? Well, that's the screwed up part. They say he killed his partner, and that his ghost still haunts him to this very day. What? Really? No, what are you, stupid? We're doctors! Scientists! Now inject this man with some science! Delicious, magical science! Gotta get out of here! Gotta get to Namek! Gotta get the Dragon Balls! God damn it, Nappa! You were saying, saying, saying. My god! We have to get him out of there! His heart rocket is sky rating! Uh, don't you mean his heart rate? Damn it, man, I'm a doctor, not an English teacher! Good to see you're awake, Vegeta. We have to apologize, though. We couldn't save your tail. It's all right, I can live without it. If you call that living, you'd walk around a shell of your former self. Everyone calling you a tailless freak! You know, I could probably kill all of you and Frieza wouldn't care. 
Yeah, but that still wouldn't get your tail back. Tell me something, which is your favorite internal organ? What an odd question. But if I had to choose, I guess I would have to say my liver. You know, it's the simple things in life. Hey there, Vegeta. Speaking of simple, what is it, Quee? Where are you off to in such a hurry? Off to plow your mother! Ha! Shows what you know, Vegeta. We reproduce asexually. Gross, out of my way. Off to Namek, are we? Come again? We heard about the Dragon Balls. We know the Namekians made them, and Frieza is way ahead of you. But how? The Scouter was on the entire time. That's impossible! My transmitter was off the entire time! Whose Scouter was- God damn it, Nappa! Wow, you guys! We've already found two Dragon Balls! Wow, this usually takes us, like, months! That's because you're on the planet Namek. Everything's better up here. You should totally stay here. Forever. But we take your ship. What? Oh look, it's another dragon ball into the egg. You should go get it! Is that a giant skeleton? Oh come on, dude. What are you, chicken? Don't you want to have the awesome adventures? On the planet Namek with the dragon balls? And the awesome musical montage! It wasn't that fun. Yeah, it was woo. Hey, um, I've been meaning to ask you guys. Where are all the other Namekians? Oh, they're around. Don't even pretend you didn't see them. Yeah, we passed them like three times. Didn't you see Steve? He waved. Don't this Steve? Yeah, don't do that. He has social phobias. Come on, you guys. We only have one more Dragon Ball left. Then we can wish back our friends. What? No! We can't let you do that! Yeah, we... what? See, we can't let you have the Dragon Balls! They're our Dragon Balls! We will take them and we will make our wish for ourselves! And then you can suck our three foot long Schwanstuckers! Your what? Our... our wangs. It's funny because Wang means penis. Wait a minute! Namekians don't have penises! What? What are you talking about? Of course we do! Uh, actually, I, uh, read their minds. And I don't think we do. You guys aren't Namekians at all! Oh, look what you've done, Zachro! Why do you have to go and mess this up, blow our cover? Okay, I did not do that. Did I do that? Well, you must have, because I would never do anything that stupid. Well, there was that one time when you got mad at those two guys who just wanted to play a children's card game. And you made us chase after them. Then we ended up crashing here on this planet. Why do you have to bring that up? Open those wounds. You know what? Screw it. Just summon the tentacle monsters. Oh, alright. Um, tentacle monsters. Here. Okay, I think that did it. Ha! Now soon, you will deal with the many protruding tentacles of the violated tentacle monster. Don't worry, Bulma! I'll protect you! I was talking to you, Baldi. Wait, what? Oh! No! 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 I'll say. No! <gasps> oh man. I have got to stop editing so late. I'll say. <laughs> Lord Guru. Oh. Uh. I have terrible news. Someone has attacked the planet. This is very serious. I must put on my war face. <sighs> there. Now show me yours. Needs work. So, after 731 grueling galactic weeks of travel, or one month if you never watch Men in Black, our <laughs> heroes have finally arrived on planet Namek, where the sky is green, the grass is blue, and it's boring as Hey, go on! Check it out! Blue grass! 
What do you think their favorite kind of music is? Huh? Huh? R&B? Huh. You're really sheltered, aren't you? I had to read an entire book about peach farming on the way here. You tell me. Well, hey, we're on Namek now! Bulma, got the dragon radar? Right here. We're already picking up four Dragon Balls. See? Now we just have to find them, wish our friends back, and head on home! Hey, Krillin, is that a Saiyan ship? Huh? I think I sense Vegeta. Uh -huh. Oh, and now those four Dragon Balls are on the move. <laughs> Ah, good to be back at 100% again. Oh, I just got here and this planet's already annoying me. Wait a minute, is that Queeze pod? Well, I better go take care of this. You done, Krillin? Yeah, I'm good. Hey, what's that over there? In the name of Frieza, we demand that you stop! Wait, haven't I heard that name before? All right, stay where you are and we'll shoot you. Don't you mean, or we'll shoot you? We know what we said. Huh. Well, there goes our ship. What the fucking hell? Damn, man, you couldn't hit the broadside of a space barn. Yeah, well, that's only because I'm too busy hitting the broadside of your mom. Ah, yeah. my face! Yeah. Ha! Looks like they're all... Washed up! Yeah! Da, 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 da. Oh. I can't believe this! We're stranded on an alien planet! It's like pitch black! Only Irvin Diesel is a total bitch! It might be best if we get ourselves out of the open! Hey, look, a cave! See, Bulma? Isn't this nice? A nice, dark, dank cave? Who knows? Maybe here I'll finally meet a real man. What about Yamcha? A real man. Hey, uh, Krillin? You feel that? What, the need to pee? Well, they destroyed the toilet, so I guess I'll just use a bush or- OH MY GOD, GET THE CAVE! Krillin, they have the Dragon Balls! Yes, Gohan! I noticed. Did you feel their power levels? They were as strong as Vegeta. Yes, Gohan! I noticed! But that one guy at the front, he was like a hundred Vegetas. Yes, Gohan! I noticed! On the bright side, I no longer have to pee anymore! I'm gonna go change in the cave. Jeez, took you long enough. We're going after those Dragon Balls. Well, what? We may be outmatched. But we didn't come this far just to give up! What the heck happened in that cave? Something I should have taken care of a month ago! I don't get it. Come on, go on! Bulma, stay here and call Roshi back on Earth! We may need backup! Stay close, Gohan! Well, I guess I better set up camp then. Now my house, where the beaches are fine and the bitches are finer. Could you speak up? I'm not wearing pants. And not only is Vegeta on the planet, but apparently someone else is there. Even stronger than him. So in short, shit be whack, yo! But shizzle, Master Rizzle. I can't do anything until I'm fully healed, though. If only there were a way. Hey there, I thought I'd just drop in with these magical sensu beans that heal all wounds and restore your stamina. If only there were a way- TAKE THE DAMN MAGICAL BEANS, GOKU! Ooh, sweet sciencey magic! <laughs> Naked time! Alright! Okay guys, I'm going to Bulma's place. By the way, taking the beans. Krillin? Krillin. But why Bulma's? Well, I need a ship, and Bulma's dad's a scientist. I'm not even gonna begin to go into what is wrong with that, and just wish you good luck. Nimbus! Later, guys! Nimbus? Nimb- Oh god, oh crap, oh Jesus! I'm okay! Oh, there he is. 
<sighs> Hello there, Vegeta. Fancy meeting you here. So you followed me. Sure took your sweet time. Well, I could have gotten here sooner, but I stopped on my way to plow your mother. My mother's dead. I know. You know, I'm having trouble remembering, Kui. What's your power level? Ha! <laughs> you would forget! 18,000. Same as yours, Vegeta. Funny that. See, I just read my official Saiyan handbook. And it says right here, when a Saiyan is beaten to near death, their power level increases immensely. Well, I don't see what that has to do with anything. And while I was down on Earth, oh man, I got destroyed. <laughs> you... What? Yep. All by a low-level warrior, his half-breed son, a midget, and an obese man with a sword. I lost outright. Why are you telling me this? You never tell anyone this! Easy. Because I know you'll never tell anybody, Kui. But... but I hate you! Why would I- God, I love therapy. Oh, oh my, I seem to have gone off prematurely. Well, hell. Looks like Vegeta just took out Kui. Poor fish-faced bastard. Wait, which one was Kui? You remember. Purple guy. He's Vegeta. Gonna have to be a little more specific. Reproduced asexually. Oh, him. Ew. You know, I wouldn't have minded so much if he wasn't all up in my face about it. I can only swallow so much. Will you two pay attention? These innocent bumpkins won't slaughter themselves. Well, you might be able to find a way to make them. Ooh, that'd be fun. <laughs> a new evil has revealed its face. Who are these mysterious enemies? And do Gohan and Krillin stand a chance? The answer to these questions will be revealed... Right now. Zabon, Dodoria, Frieza, and oh my no. Wait, what? Alright, now that you have arrived on my planet, we will begin your training. Tenshin Han, Chao Tzu, 20 laps around the planet. Piccolo? Go to hell, I'm meditating. Keep doing that. Yamcha? What is a King Kai? I'm ready for anything. Watch my car. Ooh, like in that movie. Wax on or wax off? Yeah, go wax off. All right, Gohan. Keep your power level down. Well, I'm trying, but I can't seem to get it as low as yours, Krillin. But I haven't even... I mean, yeah. Like me. Hey, Krillin, look. The Dragon Balls. Whoa, those things are huge. ACDC be damned! Jeez, these aliens are scary. Especially that one in the front. Looks like a total fag. Krillin! What? A freaky alien genotype. What'd you think I meant? Oh, I thought you were calling him the derogatory term for homosexual. That thing's a guy! Hmm? What was that? Uh, quack! Oh, it's just a space duck. Who are you? Hello, allow us to introduce ourselves. My name is Frieza, and we're a traveling improv group. Here, let me give you a demonstration. My men shall play a group of drunken sailors, and you're a bunch of baby seals. And go. <laughs> and scene. <sighs> what do you want from us? Why are you slaughtering our people? Well, you see, I was just in the area, and I thought this would be a delightful place for a summer home. What the f*** do you think I'm here for? Our trees. Zarbon, two or three more. Two or three more. Two or three more. <laughs> Very good, Zarbon. See, why can't you be more like him, Dodoria? Sorry, just listening to the space duck. Quack! Quack! What a majestic creature. Now then, all kidding aside, Where's the Dragon Ball? We don't have it. You know, I'd be inclined to believe you if the last village elder didn't say the exact same thing. Until we killed everyone and tortured the information out of him, of course. It's the darndest thing, too. You're beginning to remind me a lot of him. Please, do not be upset. Oh, I don't get upset. I have people to do that for me. Dodoria? With gusto. Stop right there! Oh look, more baby seals. We're here to stop this senseless slaughter of our people.
92. This has gone on for too long. And now, you're going to pay. 355. We are... we... What are you... No, go on, continue, don't mind me. And... we are the ones who will stop you! Ooh, wow, 419. That's... what the hell are you doing? Oh, sorry, it's a little hobby of mine. I hear these heroic speeches so wearily often, so I started making a mental list of how many times I've heard certain lines. You... you insane bastard! 190. Yeah? Well, uh, we're going to... F*** your face! <laughs> oh my! 12. <sighs> Zarbon, give the command! Dodoria, give the command. Get him. <laughs> to stick to the plan! Quack! What plan? You just keep quacking over and over. And we're still alive! <laughs> Sir, they seem to be stronger than we thought. Oh, how cute they can hide their little power levels. Kinda killing our guys. Oh, we have more of those things back at the ship. It's not like we're losing anything valuable. <laughs> <sighs> Now you can no longer find our villages. Dodoria, kill them. Okay. Come on, bring it. There's three of us and one of you. Man, you must suck at math even worse than me. What do you mean? There's only two of you. That's not right. <laughs> Hi there, Mrs. Briefs. Oh, Goku, you can call me what everyone else calls me. What's that? Milf. I have no idea what it means, but it's just the cutest little name. Well, you are quite the milf, honey. Now, what are you doing out of the kitchen? Oh, my mistake. Remember what I told you, sweetie. Wives are for kissing, kissing, not, not talking. talking. <laughs> <laughs> have fun, you two. Wow, is this the ship? Well, Bulma told me to start on it while you were in the hospital, in case anything went wrong. Grillin? Grillin. The good thing is, it's almost all done. Wow! This is just the best day ever! <laughs> Oops. Looks like I miscounted. I must be having an off day. Bravo, Dodoria! Now, seeing as we have no one left to threaten you with... Oh wait, what are those adorable little things over there? You wouldn't. They're just so cute, though. I could just pinch their little heads off. Are you going to make me do that? Because at this point, I could go both ways. As could I, Lord Frieza. Fine. Here, take the ball and leave us be. Say, Gohan, he's handing over the Dragon Ball. Now no one else has to die. Oh, just one more question. Could you point us in the direction of the next village? You seem to have destroyed our scouters. That wasn't part of our deal. And 500. Dodoria, show them what they've won. Uh. 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 Krillin, he's killing them. Happy thoughts, Gohan. Happy thoughts. You, you killed my son. Yeah, sorry about that. How about I do you a favor? <laughs> There. Now you won't miss him. Oh, and while you're at it, could you deal with the rest? I really do love kids. They don't leave much of a mess. Breathe, go on! You're a leaf! A leaf in a calm stream! The stream! No one's Did I just get hit by a bowl cut? <laughs> Zabon, what the hell was that? I believe that was the space duck, sir. This ship is awesome! Now, where's that button that makes blueberry muffins? There is no button like that. I never even considered that. Are you sure? It'd be really nice to wake up in the morning, push a button, and have muffins. That'd be great. Wink, wink. Damn it, there is no muffin button! Darn. So... Is it ready to take off then, Dr. Briefs? Goodness, no! I still have to install the cappuccino machine! But... but 
I don't even drink coffee. It's not coffee, Goku. It's cappuccino. Now stay here. I need to grab the pots from my shop. Make sure not to touch anything, like the gravity controls, or the start button. The start button. Don't touch the start button. Now I'll be right back. Okie dokie. I wonder if this is the button. No! Goku! He's blasted himself off into space! What has science done? Sweetie, I do not see a sandwich with that beer. Mmm, those muffins smell like they're almost done. Goku! Hi, Dr. Briefs. Goku, what have you done? You've blasted off into space! You're incredibly lucky I already set the coordinates for Namek, but you... You... Where did you get that muffin? Muffin button? I never installed a muffin button! Then where did I get this muffin? Listen very close, Goku. Whatever you do, don't fool with the gravity controls. It goes up to 100 times Earth's normal gravity. So what you're saying is, if I turn up the gravity, then I can get stronger! No! What I'm saying is it will crush your bones! The detrimental effects could be catastrophic! You may never walk again! Bored now. Gonna train. Bye-bye! Goku, wait! <laughs> I like his mustache. Are you alright over there? Yeah. Little bastards just hit me out of nowhere. Oh, trust me, I know what it's like to take a hard one to the face. Good to see you're still conscious, Dodoria. Oh, and just so you know, it's not a big deal or anything. You might want to get right onto this one, but they're getting away, you fat bastard! <laughs> Gohan, not your brightest move! Oh, come on, Kuhn. We have a two-mile lead on him. Factoring in our speed and velocity and his mass, there's no way he should be able to catch up. Well, look who's wrong! It's always for prayer! No, you don't! How do you think Dodoria is doing up there? We're talking about one of my finest soldiers. There's no way that they'll escape Dodoria's grasp. God damn it! But what if they have any tricks up their sleeves? Come now, Zarbon. We both know Dodoria would never let them out of sight. Forward flare! God damn it! Still, sir, we have to remember that Vegeta is on the planet. Oh, please. Like Vegeta could even lay a hand on Dodoria. What's up, Bubblegum? Vegeta! You got some serious balls to get the drop on me! Funny you should mention that. I just happened to be looking for a set. Well, look at you, Veggie. All grown up and out on your own, trying to move up in the world. And look at you, packing away more bacon than Hormel. Very funny. But you won't be laughing when Frieza finds your scrawny ass. So how about I make you a deal? You hand over that pretty red scouter, and maybe I won't point Frieza in the right direction. Oh, you mean this scouter? That's right. Well, I'd be inclined to give it to you, but you see, there's a problem with it. And what would that be? It's broken. Blah! You fool! Now you're as blind as the rest of us! Not quite. See, while I was on Earth, I learned a new trick. I can sense energy. How the hell did you do that? Huh? Wait a minute. I get it now. Those little bastards I was chasing were Earthlings. You sent them to lure me away from Frieza. I'm sorry, but at this point, all I hear is, Hit me, Vegeta! Please kill me! God, this armor makes me look fat! That's it! Not the little prick! I am in Dugong. I'm a daisy. Any last words before I take you apart like a pink potato head? Wait! I can tell you what really happened to your planet! You mean that Frieza blew it up? No, that Frieza blew it up! What? Really should have told Frieza to keep off the Twitter. <laughs> Please! Don't kill me! I beg you! Don't kill me! <laughs> Look at you, Tutoria. You're always so damn proud! And now here you are, crying like a woman! I am a woman! 
What? I said I am a woman! What? Well, good thing I was there to get us out of that one! Well, yeah, but why didn't you use your key, Enzo? Hey, look! I even saved this thing! Can you fly, little guy? My name is Dende. And yes, we all learn when we are children. You know, you should probably stick with us. Considering it is either that, or going back to meet the same fate as my brother and father, I am weighing my options. I like you! I'm gonna call you Little Green! My name is Dende. Come on, Little Green! Let's go introduce you to Bulma! And that's why I was considered the most beautiful and fertile woman on my home planet. Before Frieza blew it up. He tends to do that also. <sighs> so now you know the truth, Vegeta. Yes, I do. And now I'm going to start repressing the truth. And the first step is killing you. Wait, you and I, we could team up against Frieza, rule the universe as husband and wife. Repressing in five, <laughs> four, three, <laughs> two, <laughs> one. <laughs> And repressed. Krillin, that's the cave! Hey, Boma! You clean up in there? We have guests! I do not think I want to go in there. Oh, don't worry. That's just Bulma. I do not know what this Bulma is, but it sounds needy. Hey, Bulma! Open up! Hmm? Well, if it isn't Mr. Super Soaker himself! What happened? Got tired of abandoning me and found something else to abandon? Boma! You're scaring little Green! I am still weighing my options. Oh, by the way, my dad called earlier. He says Goku's on his way here. <laughs> and he'll be here in six days. <laughs> well, good thing I took out that life insurance policy. Mr. Gohan, those things on that person's chest, what are they? Oh, um, Boma? Those are breasts. They look lovely. I wish to nestle between them. You are just adorable! Oh, no, no, Ginyu, we won't need any assistance. We have this all under control. Lord Frieza, I wish to enter. Oh, pardon me, I have to take this. Ta-ta! What is it, Zarbon? Well, sir, the scout has reported back. Good, so Dodoria has eliminated those pests, then? Well, that's just it. It turns out... She's dead. The f Now, before I start training, I need the right music to train to. Let's see here. Oh boy, we love visitors! Now, now, don't crowd the young man. Why, hello, good fellow. Welcome to our fine village. You look like you're not from around here. You have to be careful. Word through the grapevine has it that some unruly characters have been going around and attacking our villages. By the way, would you like to see our Dragon Ball? It's our prized possession. Sacred on this planet. So, what brings you to our village? Life sure has a way of working itself out. I find Kui, I kill Kui. I find Dodoria, I kill Dodoria. I find this Dragon Ball, I take this Dragon Ball. Let's see what else I can find. Sweet crap, did you feel that, Gohan? Uh, yeah, but maybe we shouldn't- Man, Vegeta just ended that village! Krillin, seriously, you- I don't even think he needed to kill him either. They didn't even put up a fight. Krillin! What? I- Oh, cripes, um... Hey, listen! They may be dead now, but they've all gone to a better place. Heaven! Where everyone has their own little house, and everything is wonderful, and we all get along, and there's puppies and kitties and- This sounds totally asinine. It totally is. Hey, guys, I think I might have an idea. Frieza and Vegeta need all seven Dragon Balls, right? So, what if we just found one and hid it away? Then neither of them could make their wish. Hey, good idea! 
but we also need someone who can help us out. Little Green. Dende. Do you know anyone on this planet who might be able to do that? I know of one person. He is called the leader of our people, the Eldest Namek. It is said long ago, when our planet faced a great drought, he led our people through the peril. It is said that it was terrifying. The drought? No. Well, Gohan, looks like this is our only choice. Stay here and protect Bulma. Oh, now you care. I'm gonna follow Little Green to meet this eldest Namek guy. He sounds like he's our last hope. Please do not make jokes. Frieza seems increasingly frustrated. I'd best find Vegeta quickly. You know, Zarbon, I'm starting to think my people don't understand what I pay them for. You don't, Bales. Uh, allow them to live for. I mean, first we lose... What was his name? Kiwi? Uh, Kiwi. Then we lose all of our scouters, and now Dodori is dead. I'm sorry, but if this shit goes any further south, we're going to hit Space Mexico. What would you want me to do, Lord Fraser? Well, what I want you to do is pull up your frilly stockings, tighten your thong, and stop being such a pansy! Oh. Vegeta, how dare you ram into me while I'm thinking about Lord Fraser in my thong? Yeah, just going to ignore that one entirely. But it is a good thing I found you, Vegeta. Now are you going to come quietly? Or do I have to make you scream? Oh, you mean like Dodoria? Oh please, never send a woman to do a man's job. Where is he? Face down with another man beating your ass! Is it Wednesday already, Zarbon? Very cute, Vegeta. But you have no idea what you're getting into. Ha! You have got to be kidding me! I may have lost to those fools on Earth, but since I got here, I've done nothing but slaughter you Cretans! First Kui, then Dodoria. I'm two for three, and I'm back on top. Well, Vegeta, I hope you've enjoyed being on top, because I'm about to put you back on the bottom, where you belong. You see, I've been hiding another side of myself. Where in the closet? Now prepare yourself for the beast within. I should warn you though, this form is entirely different from me in every way. I'm a rape, ya bitch! To be perfectly honest, you're not that different. You're just a lot less subtle about- Oh my god! Do you believe in karma? What is that? Well, you see, karma is where if you do something good, <laughs> something good happens to you. And if you do something bad, <laughs> something bad happens to you. So, if I am good enough, then I can have my family back. Are you still on about that? No, 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 no! no! And that's the end of that! I'd best hurry back to Lord Frieza. If I take too long, he'll really lay into me. <sighs> Why did I explode? That is it up ahead. So that's where yours lives, huh? On Earth, our old Namek lives in a floating castle. You have one as well? Well, he died, but yeah. This does not bode well. Dende, nukai so kempukurus tuk. Lato, cha jato cha o nader daka. Vit, jihar ma o bond. You have such a beautiful language. To, vajmal jatol te bitmal ho. English. Aw, so you made a friend, little green? Oh, I know! I'm gonna call you Big Green! Call me that again and I'll snap your neck. But with that attitude, I don't think you should be friends with him, Lil Green. Listen, I don't care where you come from or who you are, I will not put up with such disrespect! Big Green! Get in here. Oh, good god damn it. What is it, Lord Guru? I have a bitch of an itch on my left ass cheek. Now, there is an albino Namekian standing behind you. Kill it like the rest. Oh, actually, sir, I'm from Earth. Kill it like the rest. Uh, actually, sir, I think he has business here about those people attacking our planet. Yeah, we came here looking for help. 
And I see you have a Dragon Ball up there. Well, we're gonna make sure that they don't steal it! And how is that? I'm gonna take it! Learn your place, Earthling! You have some nerve demanding the Dragon Ball from- Here, take it. I- What? Just don't steal the TV. Sir, we... <sighs> we don't have a television. Nail, gather the rest of the Dragon Balls and wish for a plasma TV. Lord Guru, that would be a grievous misuse of their powers. I'm about to misuse my hand upside your head. So I can just take this and go? Wait, there is something I must first do. You don't mean- Yes, I see something within this young man. Strength yet untapped, power yet unleashed. Now hold still, as I unleash the Valley of Strength hidden deep within! There, I have unlocked your potential. I don't feel that different. It wasn't that much. Huh. So this is my full potential? Yes. So, then it's- All downhill from here. Like Yamcha. I do not know what this Yamcha is. But it sounds disappointing. Well, I'd better get this Dragon Ball back to Gohan. Once we find them all, we can wish back our old Namekian. Wait, you said that you were from Earth, correct? Yeah? So, the son of Katat has passed. Unfortunate. We just called him Kami. Oh, so he calls himself God. Pretentious prick. Nail. What? I shall henceforth be known as Super Kami. Yes, Super Kami. No, wait. Super Kami Guru. Can I just call you Guru for short? Super Kami Guru allows this. Well, I'd better hurry up. See you later, Little Green, and thanks for the Dragon Ball! Nail, prepare to retrieve the Dragon Ball and the body. Lord Frieza, the dirty deed has been done. Ah, very good. It's nice to see there's still somebody I can rely on. Oh, he barely put up a fight after I transformed. Now that he's dead, we have very little left to worry about. Zarbon, about an hour ago, a scout informed me that an entire village was completely destroyed. Do you possibly know who could have done that? The... Vegeta? And, unlike all the villages we've visited so far, there was no Dragon Ball there. Do you know who could have possibly taken it? Vegeta. Very good. Now, use your brain for this one, Zarbon. If somebody were to know where that Dragon Ball was, who would it be? Vegeta. Vegeta, yes. And you said you killed him. Wait, sir. It is possible I just left him unconscious. Oh, good. And where did you leave him? At the bottom of a lake. Minion 43, would you come in here for a second? I need an example. Private Namol reporting. An example of what, Lord Frieza? <laughs> you see that, Zarbon? That's you if Vegeta is not in front of me in the next ten minutes. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Last time on Dragon Ball Z Abridged. Finally, I've gathered all seven Dragon Balls! State your wish. Dragon, grant me immortality! Your wish is granted. Yes, I've done it! I'm finally the strongest in all the universe! <laughs> I am unstoppable. Oh, how cute. He's having a little dream. Hein, 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 hein. Now let's get you back to Lord Frieza. I need to probe you for information. My power is maximum. Take that, you bastard! This one's for each pay! Report! Uh, I just... I'm just checking... His vitals. Is he going to make it? Well, it's a good thing you got him to me when you did. Even a little later, and we might not have been able to save him. Why isn't he naked? Luckily, we... What? In the healing tank. I always thought you needed to be nude. What? Why would you think that? You know, to absorb all the healing juices. 
Well, looks like you have everything under control here. Freaks me the f out. Is this thing on? Is it on? Okay, there we go. <laughs> you are now thinking about what Saruman did to you while you were unconscious. Have fun with that. You know, Vegeta, I gotta admit, it was pretty impressive how you went all manhunter on us. But now, you're all ours, and I can't wait to watch Zarbon break you like a glow steel. Here I come, HP! And I want you here in 24 hours, understood? And make sure to bring the up-to-date scouters. Understood, Lord Frieza. Lord Frieza, I really need to use the space Skype. Zarbon, what could possibly be so important that you need to interrupt me during my call? Well, I need to call my girlfriend. Well, I... Ginyu, I'll call you back. <sighs> Come again? You see, our one-year anniversary is coming up, and I want to see where she wants to go so I can make reservations early. Oh. And all this time I could have sworn you were... Never mind. What? You thought I was single? Well, no, I just... I thought you were into... Uh, you know, it really doesn't matter. Well, it matters to me, because frankly, it sounds like you thought I was- Lord Fraser! Vegeta's broken out of the healing- <laughs> Oh no, that minion died. Could you go fix that? We'll continue this conversation never. Did he say something about Vegeta? What? Oh! Zarbon, who did you leave guarding him? A pool? You left a pool here? Well, I thought he could handle it. A pool couldn't handle a shot of raspberry schnapps, much less Vegeta. Oh, where's the damn phone? I need to make another call. Yes, sir. I'll go look for Vegeta. He won't get far. <laughs> yes, that's right. Search all over for me, Zarbon. Of course, you'd never think to check inside your own ship. You know what they say. Keep your friends close. And your enemies closer. <laughs> Lord Frieza, I found him! Ah, oh, fuck it. Can you hurry up double time? Zarbon really screwed the pooch on this one. Lord Frieza, Vegeta's really giving us a pounding. I'm coming, Zarbon. Quick, grab my balls. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely bunch of dragon balls, do 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 do. Here they are, all sitting in a bunch, do do do. One star, two star, all as big as my head. Give them a toss, I've landed across the tower, Vegeta wins, bye bye. Damn it all to hell, he's gone! And he took off with my dragon balls! Lord Frieza, I found a note. Let me see that. It just says, Dear Frieza, and it's a picture of a butt. Can I see it, Lord Frieza? Vegeta! Dragon Balls, now! Yes, sir! Damn it, he's up here somewhere. I just need to spot the bastard. Later, bitches. Whew! It's taking me five whole days, but I'm finally up to a hundred times gravity. It's a good thing that I brought along all these sensu. Oh, man, it looks like we only have four left. Oh, well, we won't need that many on Namek. Nom, nom, nom. Mmm, tastes like healing. Hello, Goku. Do you hear me? I swear to God, if this is George Takei again, I'm gonna shove a brick up the Verizon guy's ass. Takei? Ah, there you are, Goku. I see you're on your way to Namek. I'm gonna beat someone up. Of course you are. But listen, there's someone on Namek that you must absolutely stay away from. You hear me? He's even stronger than Vegeta, and he. I know. What? I'm gonna beat him up. Goku, no! This is nothing like Vegeta! It is much, much worse! Uh-huh? He is known throughout the galaxy as the most terrifying and evil person there is! Really? He's conquered hundreds of planets and slaughtered billions of people! <coughs> Stop it! Stop getting excited! Now promise me you will not fight him! Ooh, I can see Planet Nimic! No, wait, no, it's fake. Goku, seriously! Promise me that under no circumstance will you go anywhere near Frieza. But King Kai, I... Promise me! Oh, all right. 
I promise I will absolutely not click burn. What the? <gasps> he, he hung up on me. How the hell did he even do that? Damn it, I'll call him back. Goku, I swear to God, I will ride your ass on this one. Oh my. Damn it, Takei! <sighs> All right. They should be here somewhere. Aha! They're here! They're all here! Perfect. Now I have six, counting the one I have hidden near the village. All I have to do now is stay under the radar and not fly around like a jackass saying, I've got a Dragon Ball! I was gonna say come and get me Freezer, but that works too! This is useless! I'm never going to find him like this! I might as well hide under a rock. Maybe Lord Frieza won't find me if I just lay low and don't fly around like a jackass saying, Come to Papa, you bald bastard! I was going to say, come and get me Frieza, but that works too. <laughs> Son of a bitch! Huh, I thought you'd be back in the cave. Well, I would if I didn't keep finding puddles of- Yeah, yeah, I know, in the cave. Get over it! Besides, I brought us a Dragon Ball! Oh wow! They're much bigger than the ones on Earth. Yeah, Gohan and I were pretty surprised too when we... Wait, where is Gohan? Oh, he took the Dragon Radar. We found a Dragon Ball that was all on its own. Wait, what? I got a Dragon Ball! You let Gohan go out on his own? Yeah, what's the big deal? Do you have any idea what Chi-Chi will do to me if he gets hurt? I like my penis where it is, thank you. I still don't see how this is my problem. Uh, well, we'll just have to wait for him here then. At least we have a Dragon Ball! Hi there, I'm taking your Dragon Ball. Uh, care to trade for one of yours? How about no? You drive a hard bargain. Who drives it hard now? <laughs> oh, I thought I smelled body glitter. You, the short one over there. Give me the Dragon Ball. Um, not so fast! He's handing the ball over to me! Right, Baldy? Uh, Bulma, little help here? Oh my god, he's so hot! I just want to grab him and- 69... 70... 70... One time you've defeated me, Zarbon. And that's one time too many. Nothing's changed, Vegeta. The last time we fought, you were barely alive when I retrieved your body. That reminds me. Did you do anything to me while I was unconscious? Did... did I what? Did you do anything to me while I was unconscious? What? No! God, no! Oh, thank God! I j Wait, what do you mean by that? Am I not good enough for you? Alright, Vegeta, I'm gonna be totally honest with you. This is sounding really gay. What? I- What are you- Not that there's anything wrong with that. Just- Just transform, damn you. We're going to have a penthouse suite, and he'll drive a Corvette, and he'll make love every single- Kill him with- You've made a huge mistake, Vegeta. Now prepare to die! What was that? I couldn't hear you over that hole I made in your stomach! V Vegeta, please! Just give me a chance! We could work together! Yeah, yeah, I've heard that bit already. Now let me put this in a way you'll understand. I'm about to blow my load all over your insides. What the- No homo. <laughs> Freaky alien genotype. Guru, sir. I have a question. Ask away. You've been around for so long. Just how old are you? I am this many. You didn't raise your hand. That's how old I am! Wow, you really took care of that guy. Yeah, didn't even know I could pull it off. But you know our sayings, we get stronger every time we almost die. Well, that seems incredibly unfair. So, um, you seem like a busy man, so... Oh yeah, killing people. And I'm about to become immortal. Well, we don't want to keep you, so I guess we'll be seeing you. Yep, I still got a lot to take care of, and I... Oh, <laughs> oh wait a minute, nice try. Give me the Dragon Ball. Oh. You know, I could kill both of you right now, but after killing Zarbon and getting this last Dragon Ball, 
I'm in a good mood. I mean a really good mood. But just remember this. Next time you see me, I will be immortal. Not that you stood a chance to begin with. I'm just... saying. <laughs> waka waka! Well, congratulations! You've single-handedly doomed us all! I didn't see you do anything! What exactly did you expect me to do? Well, I don't know, maybe you could have bitched at him! How about that? That's all you appear to be good for these days! Huh? Used your bitch-foo on him? Bulma, the mistress of bitching! That's what they should call you! Don't stop me now! I'm having such a good time! I'm holding this ball! Don't stop me now! What the? That's Vegeta! If I just hide here and lower my power level, he shouldn't find me. Okay, what the hell is going on? I know I just sent something down there. Good. Now just go on and... Hey! Show yourself before I turn this place into a barren wasteland! So basically the same, only on fire. Come on, baskets! Three... Two... One... Hi! Um... Hello... Mr. Vegeta... Sir? Oh, well, if it isn't Mo Howard. How do you even... Space Hulu. Figures. So what are you doing here? Oh, you know, just flying around. Flying around? Flying around. Thwarting my plans? Thwarting your plans? Are you? No. Good, because that'd be bad. How bad? I'd have to kill you. That's bad. Indeed. Stupid looking watch you got there. Yes, it tells time. And nothing else. Oh yeah, that's what a watch does. Dumbass. So, uh, can I help you? No. But maybe I can help you. Well, uh, I need an adult. I am an adult. <laughs> By the way, I only hit you because I have pent up aggression against your father. Take that. Don't stop me now. I don't wanna stop there. Oh. <laughs> Seriously! Five ancient sages of bitchdom all gathered together one day on the peaks of Mount Bitch to proclaim your birth! And a hundred years later, when all the bitch stars had aligned, you were born and made everybody's life around you a living hell because you are such a bitch! <sighs> you done? Yeah. Yeah, I guess. Good. No! Guys! Go on! You guys? I think we should find a new location. Why? What's wrong with this place? Because we have ten minutes before Vegeta finds out that I just stole this. God, I love it when a plan comes together. Took some time, effort, and lots of bodies, but now it's mine. Immortality is my bitch! Now, it should be right here. Right here. Where the hell is it? Couldn't have gone anywhere. All right, I'm going to close my eyes, and when I open them up, it's going to be right here. It's not here. Why isn't it here? I don't get it. Who could have... Kid! What? How could he have found it? He would have... Wait. That watch! That watch wasn't a watch at all! It was some kind of Dragon Ball locator. Which means... Which means... He took the Dragon Ball. Uh, really? Do you hear that? I feel that. What the devil is that noise? Ah, time for a delicious sports drink, huh? The heck is that? Purgatory. Hell. Denise? Denise, do you hear that? Oh god, is that my wife? Leave me alone! You already took the kids! What more do you want? Alright, Mom. Once that time machine is done, I can go back into the past to save Goku and my father. Daddy? Alright. I don't think Vegeta will find us here. Gohan, I need to get you to Guru's. What? Why? So the old man can touch you and pull things out of you that you never knew you had. 
I need an adult? I am an adult. Oh no, 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 no! I am not letting you abandon me here again! Those bitches on Lifetime might put up with it, but not me! Bulma, you're right. You have been very helpful and very patient with us. So in return, we're letting you watch the Dragon Ball. Bye! I will kill you both in your sleep! As soon as the Ginyu Force arrives, all of my problems will officially be over. Soon, immortality will be mine, and the entire universe will be under my foot. I wonder what I should do first. I guess I should start with what I won't do when I become immortal. Die. Lord Frieza, the Ginyu Force is scheduled to arrive in five minutes. Thank you, Asai. Also, after rising concerns with our personnel exploding, we've decided to form a union. Adorable. Ah! First thing I'm going to do is go up to Cooler and slap him right in his smug prick face. Hey, Krillin! That's it! We're going to make it! We're finally gonna- ah! Die! We are going to die! Krillin, what is that? Pure rage, Gohan. Pure rage. What do we do? Run, Gohan! Run as fast as you can! But I- Do as I say, bribe the Heavenly Buddha! What? Just go! <laughs> Guru, sir, we have another traveler from Earth. Oh, tell me you didn't let him inside. Hello, Mr. Guru. Oh, god damn it. Mr. Guru, sir, my friend Krillin told me that you could help us by touching me. Do I look Catholic to you? Sir, I think he means he wants you to release his hidden potential. Yeah, that. Fine. Stand still. It's your first time, so I'll be gentle. Now relax as I reach deep inside you and grab hold of your essence. I need an adult. I am an adult! Huh, that's odd. I don't feel anything anymore. I wonder if we lost it. I am here for it. For what? Dragon Ball. I need that Dragon Ball. Give it to me. One you took. I need my wish. Our you okay? I think you're right, broke Vegeta. Shut up, Ghost of Nappa! What was that? I'm not crazy! You're crazy! Especially you, Nappa! Hey, Who are you talking to? Dragon Ball! Hands now, please! Um, I don't... really... have it. No. What? No. Oh. Uh, no. Uh. Oh, wait, what? Where am I? Why are you here? Where's Nappa? Didn't you kill him? Yes, of course I did! He's dead. Forever. So, uh... Where's that immense power coming from? Oh, that's probably Gohan over in the hut with the creator of the Dragon Balls is. You know, the guy who can unlock your potential by putting his hand on top of your head? Oh, God, I cannot shut up when I am scared. Interesting. I'm gonna go pay him a... What do you call it? A visit? Beating, that's it. I'm gonna go pay him a beating. Ah, crap, bastards. Hello? Can I help you with something? Yeah, the first thing you can do is go die. Save me the trouble. Ooh, ooh, is this really happening? Cause I really hope it is. Oh, trust me, you don't want any of what I am right now. Then come on, bring all four feet of you. Or should I count your stupid hair? Pretty big talk coming from a bipedal slug. Big talk coming from a bipedal bitch. Oh, 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 oh I gotta admit, you are the best challenge I've gotten out of your people yet. Then again, all I have to compare you to are those villages I slaughtered. Oh, you are dead! No! Stop making out with your boyfriend! I can hear it from here. It sounds like... <laughs> Thank you, Lord Guru! I'm not here for any of you idiots anyway. I'm here for the old man. Oh, no you don't. With this power-up, I'm now as strong as you were when we fought on Earth. Congratulations! You're still weaker than the last three guys I killed. Wow. I now know what it's like to feel like Krillin. Sucks, doesn't it? Look, it doesn't matter how strong you get, kid. Besides, Frieza, I'm the strongest thing on this planet! Bar none. Hey! Just thought I would inform you all. I detect several high power levels coming towards the planet. What? Several high power levels? There are five of them in total. Five of them? And they're all incredibly flamboyant! Oh god, it's them! What are you talking about? I don't. Don't you understand? We're all going to die here! Who? Who is it? It's... The Ginyu Force. We're here! Men! Enter 
Productions, Genyu, Joy, Slater, Galdo, Rikum, and together we are... Eddie the Fish, in the Talk Center! Talk to Sentai, Talk to Sentai, Talk to Sentai! Sure is Zarbon in here. Lord Freezer, thank you for this chance to serve you. And but some hate! Quite. But before we get down to business, Jace? Yes, sir, Captain. Here you go, Lord Freezer. The new up-to-date Scatters. Good. And they have the ringtone I wanted? Yes, sir. The free, the free, the free. Glorious. Now, as you have been informed, Vegeta and a few other pests have taken my Dragon Balls. Whoa, 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 Vegeta? Little Veggie? What's a Dragon Ball? Raccoon can't believe he had it in him. I know, right? What's a Dragon Ball? Yes, it turns out Zarbon and Dodoria weren't enough. I've called you five here to get them back. Easy enough. Would you rather them dead or alive? Either or. Dead it is. Can you force? Assemble! Speed of light and strength of all! The Ginyu Force shall make them fall! Lord King Cold's army's strongest force! We'll beat them all! Secure the course! If trouble meets us as we pass, we'll, we'll shove our fists right up their ass! Ginyu Force, move out! We're dead! We are dead! All dead! All gonna die! Dead men be we! A cornucopia of pain and despair is coming our way to ensure our demise! We are so going to die! <laughs> now, slap him. Ow! Thank you. Every fiber of my being wants to puke at once when I say this. But I need your hair. I need your hair. You need our help? That, yes. All right, but if we're going to be a team, we need a name. No, we don't. Oh, I know. How about Team Three Star? What? Well, we're a team, and there's three of us, and the Dragon Balls have stars on them. Team Three Star. That just makes me want to kill you even more. And you're still only the second most annoying bald person I've ever had the displeasure to work with. Team Three Star, move out! I swear to God! <laughs> Hello, Earth Woman. Uh, 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 you know what I want. Uh, now give it to me. The, the Dragon Ball's right there. Oh, I'm not here for the Dragon Ball. Wh what? Spread them. Uh, ah! Taking the Dragon Ball, bitch, at me later. Yeah, it looks stupid. Sorry, Bama. All of my hate! Vegeta, if you don't mind me asking, what are we in for? You ever watch Power Rangers? No. Ninja Turtles? No. Sailor Moon? No. Beetle Bogs? No. VR Troopers? No. Samurai Cyber Squad? No. Tattooed teenage alien fighters from Beverly Hills? Oh yeah! God damn it! Yes! We made it here before the Ginyus! Come on, let's get this over with and- What the hell are you two doing? We don't think we can trust you! You still haven't pledged your allegiance to Team Three Star! What are you, dense? The Ginyu Force could be here any second, and then we're- Hi, Vegeta. Hi, Ginyu. And then we're- <laughs> Son of a f***ing <laughs> f beast! Why the f*** does all this f***ing sh** happen to me? As far Jace, as I can, please. Sorry, Captain. My scat is acting a bit chunky. With a goddamn pig! Are you done? <sighs> Yeah. Very good. Now, to cut straight to the point, I want those two Dragon Balls you have there. Oh, so that's a Dragon Ball. Supposedly there are seven in total if my report is correct. And the other five are... Right behind you! My god, man, you just cannot... Shut up when I'm scared, I know. I once had a crush on a little Indian boy that I thought was a girl. Please kill him. Seriously, he won't be missed. Well, I do believe that accounts for everything. Before I take these Dragon Balls and leave my associates here to clean up, is there anything you'd like to say to me, Vegeta? As a matter of fact, there is. Look at your men. Now back to me. Now look back at your men. Back to me. I am not your men. I'm flipping you off. Now look at the ground. Back to me. Where's the Dragon Ball? It's gone. I threw it, and there is not a damn thing you can- Here you go, boss. Thank you, Berta. It's what I do. But I chucked that son of a bitch as hard as I could! Oh, you can't beat my speed. I'm the fastest in the universe. That's what she said! 
We're all going to die anyway, so... Baldy, break the ball! What the- I punched the damn thing! <laughs> ah, my hand! Hit it harder! But I- Harder! Yeah! <laughs> Oh, Goldo, don't you think you should? Uh... Oh, oh, right, that thing I do. Stopping time, yeah. One sec. What? I. What? Where did it go? See this, Vegeta? This is for all the time you used to embarrass me! Hey, Vegeta, how's it going? Oh, look, it's Goldo! You want a biscuit, boy? You want a biscuit? Do you think I'm a dog? Have a biscuit! <laughs> And now, it'll be you who rolls over and plays dead! <laughs> Alright, everyone settle down. Before I take these Dragon Balls to Lord Frieza, it's time for everyone's favorite game! Wheel of Death! Now, for the folks viewing at home, the rules are simple. One of my men will spin the wheel, and whoever it lands on, he kills! What the? When did you have time to set this up? And is that a camera? What kind of sadistic retard watches this crap? Love this show. All right, first contestant. Come on, Vegeta. Come on, Vegeta. Ah, race spin, race spin, race spin. Lucky little bastard got two of them. All right, let's give this sucker a spin. Congratulations! You've just won a free, all-expense-paid trip to Space Australia! Oh, you've got to be freaking kidding me. Oh, hi, Spice Oz! That's me own planet! Wait, hold on! You're from Australia? Spice Australia. Or more specifically, Spice Brisbane. Go Spice Broncos! So, it's like... Australia... In Spice. Gotta be careful though, Berta. Spice Dingo will eat your Spice baby. Like me sister. Poor Sheila. Can we please get on with this? Oh, right. Let's have a go then. Oh, piss off, you great bloomin' pinwheel. Oh, great. That means Vegeta goes to... Yes! In your face, Vegeta. Your time is coming. Soon, you will face the end all. The be all. The police all. Re-Koomba! I swear, I don't even know what's going on anymore. All right, gang. It's time for me to head off. Try not to mess up your uniforms and be back by 0500. Yes, Captain! Ciao! So, uh, I guess we're fighting the little green guy over there? Yeah, that's Goldo. Have fun with him. Any strategies? Throw dog treats at him. Oh, that help. I'll find it hilarious. Well, come on, Gohan. We're strong enough to take this guy. Just keep your guard up. That's right. Keep on your guard. Don't drop it. Not even for an instant. Zah! What a dog! What are you going on about? You see that? That was just a taste of my power! Huh? Oh, what the hell was that? That was supposed to crush you. Go on! Did you see it? His power! He can Stop time? Summon steamrollers! Y you sure about that? Positive! Go for it! You fools! <laughs> My psychic powers are unrivaled in all the galaxy! You stood there and mocked me! The whole world stood there and mocked me! But now, you find yourself slaves to my whim! Feel the earth fall out from under you! Your world shatter! As I am your... Why can't I feel my everything? Oh. This is the end of the road. The end for me. <laughs> I... I wonder... Will I dream? I f***ing hate you. I know. You really saved us, Vegeta. Yeah, you totally pulled our butts out of the fire there. Really showed that Team Three Star Spirit. They'll never find your body. I feel a little sorry for those guys. They just lost their teammate. They must be devastated. So, when was the last time you had to... You know... Three weeks. Bloody hell! Three weeks?! I did it on the trip here. Raccoon didn't even have enough room in his pod. Oi! Oi, is that Galdo over there? Is he dead? How tragic. Not telling the captain, one, two, three, not it! Not it! Not it! Ah, oh, wankers. 
So are we gonna do this or what? Hit Recombs music! Vegeta! You think that just because you're the prince of all saying you're the best there is at what you do. But let Raccoon tell you something, brother. You ain't no Wolverine. And you ain't got what it takes to step up to a five-time champion. Champion of what? This fight right here is gonna be a bloomin' slobber knocker, it is. You can just feel the intensity. Who are you talking to? The audience. We're doing commentary, mate. You see, Vegeta. You sit there and brag about how the Saiyans are the mightiest warriors in all the universe. How they're the most ruthless. Well, look at where they are now. Dead. You talk about your legends and your warrior race and your pride, but that doesn't mean a damn thing to this man because the name's Riku and it rhymes with doom. And you're gonna be hurting all too soon! Wrestling's fake. Oh, go to hell, all of you! And if it means getting this damn thing over with, then I'm just going to have to kill your ass! Now hit my music! Into the oh, the f with this. <laughs> Suck it, jump, Brody. <laughs> well, everything went better than expected. You talking more, Smack Vegeta? What? How could you possibly get up after a hit like that? Silly Vegeta, the only thing Raccoon sells is merchandise. I better. Bet your Raccoon don't even leave a body. Please, you already owe me a space soda for my last bet. Well, you still owe me a spice burger from the one before that. And where can you find all this spectacular space food? At Spacey's. Now with our new Raditz menu. Spacey's. It's good food. In space. And one more makes seven. Ah, Ginyu, I should have called you from the beginning. Thank you, sir. Now in celebration, I shall commence the Dance of Joy. Oh, no, no, that won't be necessary. It is entirely necessary. Uh, no, really, you, you don't have to- Actually, I do. I'm contractually obligated under your father to dance the Dance of Joy post every successful mission. Uh, proceed. <laughs> And we're back, mates! While you were gone, Raccoon cut Vegeta off guard with his patented Raccoon knee. It was absolutely devastating, Carter, and now he's back on the offensive. But he can't seem to land a single hit. Raccoon elbow! Oh, and Raccoon follows up with a vicious Raccoon elbow. It looks like Raccoon is just too fast for Vegeta, and that's coming from the fastest guy in the universe. Not really relevant, Butter. <laughs> and that ends the Dance of Joy. Uh, thank God. Now let's wish me some immortality. Not quite yet, Lord Freezer. Lastly, I must complete the Daddy's Little Princess Dance. My father would command no such thing. You are correct, Lord Freezer. Very well. It was your brother. Ah. And we're back with the fight. Here's what you missed. Boy, did we time that commercial right or what? Oh, sneak attack for Vegeta! But it looks like it didn't do jack Wait, he's setting up the Royal Driver! Royal Driver! <laughs> hey, hey, go on, look! He picked Vegeta like a- Like a vegetable, yes. <laughs> you see, Vegeta. You don't seem to comprehend where you stand right here. Because the names! Oh, look at that! He might have just taken Raccoon's bleeding head off! This would be a huge loss for sport edutainment! As Raccoon was saying, the names! Raccoon! It rhymes! With doom! And you're gonna be hurting all too soon! He's 
standing up for the Rakuma Racer Gun. This is vintage Rakum right here. Rakum Eraser! This could be the end! Oh! Oh! Tina! Oh, last second interference from Team Three Star! You idiot! I'm already one foot in the grave! You should have attacked Raccoon! Come on, Vegeta! We couldn't lose one of our most valuable Team Three Star members! You carry this stable! If there is any solace to all of this, it's that you will die along with me. Could Raccoon get a mirror? He feels like he might have chipped a tooth. Dear God, what happened to your face? According to the rules in Reg, he's allowed to take on both of these new challenges. Sounds good to Raccoon! Raccoon! Does every move you have start with. <laughs> Oh, and a devastating raccoon kick there! Let's see that again in slow motion! Brought to you by Spice Forex! Spice Forex! Because Spice BB is his! Cool. Does every move you have start with. <laughs> what a ripper! Cohen! Hello, Gohan! Have you done your homework? Because if you don't, Chi Chi will kick my ass! Uh, are you okay? Yeah! Seems he threw my nervous system out of whack there! Can't quite feel the pain! There it is! Ah. Now, our visitors from Earth require your assistance. You must go help them. Lord Guru, that would leave you totally unguarded. No. I would have Dende. Please don't leave me alone with him. He is the third strongest of our kind. Lord Guru, there are only three of us left. Dende, how does it feel to be the bronze medal? Like everyone I know and love is dead. Every party needs a pooper, that's why they invited you. Party pooper, party pooper. Lord Guru! Why are you still here? And welcome back to the fight, ladies and gents! Last we left, we had two new contenders! We now have one! I'm not going to back down! I might be younger than you, smaller than you, weaker than you, and much less experienced, but I learned more about peach farming than you! I think this was a horrible decision. Rikum agrees. <laughs> This fight's turning into a regular piss kicker. Oh, shit, doesn't stand a chance. How old is he? Like five? Six, five and a half. But the real question is, what do the fans think? You... You talk about who you are all the time. Raccoon this, raccoon that. But you're <laughs> nothing compared to my dad. I am the son of... Son Goku, the man who will come and kick your... My god. That was incredible. This seems like the end, folks. Goku looks like he's got this one in the bag. It doesn't look like there's anyone left who can stop Riku. What? Who's that? <laughs> all done. All right, so you're done with all your dances? Yes, sir. We can wish for my immortality now? Of course. Fantastic. Now, Dragon Balls, grant my wish. Make me Lord Frieza immortal! Um... I don't think it worked. But... but why not? Those village elders explicitly told me there were only seven balls and that I need merely to bring them together to grant my wish. So what the hell? Perhaps there's a password. A password? 
but I killed them all. There's no one left to tell me. I've lost my wish. Might I suggest the dance of cheering you up? Uh, proceed. Finally, I'm on planet Nemec. Help us! So serene. Oh god, he's killing us! Help! I think I hear a duck, but this far out in space? That doesn't make any sense. Wah! Oh no, that sounds like Krillin! I'm a coming! I can't believe we came all the way out here and spent a week in the space boonies for nothing. Seriously, I'm surprised we didn't hear banjos on the way in because everybody's inbred and looks the f***ing same. Not to mention I lost to Doria and Zarbon, the latter of whom spent 400 credits making long distance calls to his girlfriend, who I am convinced is named Chuck. Lord Freezer? What? There may still be a few hold up somewhere. Perhaps you should check your scouter. Well, would you look at that? Three in that direction. Good work in you. All in a day's work, sir. And now, the Dance of Solitude! Strike the so, are we just waiting for this thing, or what? Holy dooly! Jesus, that was fast! I, I mean, not as... not as fast as me, considering I'm the fastest in the... in the universe. Uh, but compared to the average person... We get it, Mike. It's cool. Gohan! Hey, Gohan! Gohan! Gohan? Maybe he'll wake up if I shake him some more. Goku, just give him a sensu! Oh, right. Eat up, Gohan. Hey! Rikum was in the middle of a match here! So how about you- Sir? I am talking to my son. Oh, Rikum apologizes. Wait, what am I apologizing for? Rikum's gonna kill you! Dad? Dad! Oh my god, you're here! I love you, Dad! That's right, Gohan. I am here. Hey, Krillin! You hanging in there? Oh, I've had worse. You know, when I died. This is definitely a close second, though. Rikum will not be ignored! Sir, I am trying to talk to my friends. Hey, Vegeta, we're friends now, right? Fuck off. The best. Now have a magic bean. But make sure you chew it, or else you grow a beanstalk in your belly. Goku, it was terrible. We landed here, and then there were these really strong guys, and then there was even more strong guys, and then our ship blew up, and then there was even more strong- Lord, now, reading your mind. Wait, what? Haha, <laughs> <laughs> that thing was a guy. Goku, did you just read my mind? Yeah, huh? But how could you- Muffin button. What? Huh? That's it! Rikum has had enough! Feel the strength of the Rikum! Ultra Fighting Miracle! Sir! I will fight you in a minute. This... this is impossible! Kakarot was nowhere near that same level when we fought on Earth! The only way he could have attained this strength is... No, it can't be! The legend says it only happens every 1,000 years! Has he become a Super Saiyan? So anyway, Vegeta, what happened to you? Did you get beat up by this guy? Uh, n no. I, um, uh... You fell down some stairs. I fell down some stairs. No, you didn't, you... Shut up before I throw you down a flight. So, Dende... Sucks about your family. We've gone over this. But do you know who also lost his family? Batman. I don't know who that is. See? This is why we need TV! Why? Na 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 dende! Na 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 dende! Dende! Guru! Dende! Neil's here. Neil. Why are you back? I never left, sir. I was outside hitting my head against the wall for 20 minutes. So that's what that was. Why have you ignored my order? Because, Lord Guru, I can't leave you unguarded no matter what. <laughs> Clean that up. What the bleeding hell? We were having a right rip snort here, and then this piker shows up, and just like that, it's good night, Irene! We get it, you're from Space Australia! He's making fools out of us, Jace! You're blooming right he is. We'd better bust out our special technique. 
Seizure procedure! Cohen, whatever you do, don't look directly at it. Cohen? No why? No one resists the seizure procedure! Plan B! All right, you bastard. Prepare to feel the wrath of the Ginyu- oh, oh, You goddamn wanker! You punched me in the- Oh, oh you did it again! Oh, stupid! Stupid! The piss! Oh, what did the kitten tell us to do in this situation? Jace, if you ever find yourself being punched repeatedly in the face, always remember to- Oh, oh, he got off the kitten! So, are you gonna dodge any of these? Oh, that's what the kitten... <gasps> Better! Support! Well, you've got very nice hair, you're a beautiful shade of red, and honestly, you're the only guy I can rely on on this team. Oh, man, punch him, you daft bastard! Oh, oh but thanks, you know, that it really cheered me. Oh, God, I think he broke something that time! Yes! Yeah. Goku time! Oh! All right, this is just bloody stupid. Calm down. We gotta come up with a plan. Listen, if you use your crusher ball on him, I can rush him the moment he tries to dodge. He may be fast, but he's not faster than the fastest guy in the universe. Okay, might. We need to talk about this whole fastest in the universe thing. First off, the kitten's got a higher power level than you. Yeah, so? Well, and correct me if I'm wrong, but a higher power level means he's faster, yeah? Well, okay, maybe. And Lord Freezer's got a higher power level than all of us. Okay, that's just not fair. And if you think about it, Goldo uh. can stop time, so that technically makes him faster than- No! 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 Okay, I am not slower than f***ing Goldo! Better calm down. No, shut up! You shut your stupid red face! Oh, don't worry, mate. You're just there with a go, though. I wonder I if there's a Denny's on this planet. I could really go for a Grand Slam. It's like everyone has something special. I don't. What am I? The big blue snake guy. That's all I've got. That's all I've got. Jeez, mate. I'm, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hurt your feelings. I just, I just want to be special. Something to call my own, you know? Might, might, you do got something special. You mean might. Ah, oh, dude. No, no, really. Remember when I had to move me piano into me flat and Raccoon was too busy with his match and Galdo, well, he was Galdo, but you, you got those ivory keys up those five flights in no time at all. You mean best might. Thanks, Chase. You're my best friend, too. You know, after all this is over, what do you say we head off to space season? Just have a good old time. Sounds good, Mutt. But remember, you still owe me that space soda. <laughs> You're right, I do. Now, let's go show that bloke what for. <laughs> say, do you know where there's a Denny's around here? Butter! No! Butter! That'll go great on my Grand Slam. You just killed me, best Mutt. I, I'm gonna get the kitten, and he's gonna beat you up! Kitten! Well, that was fun. Now, where are the fighters? I really want to deck that freezer guy. You've got to be kidding. This is a Super Saiyan! A Super what? Nothing, just lamenting my crushed dreams. Goku! I can't believe you're so strong! Well, I did train at a hundred times normal gravity. Man, no wonder you killed them so easily! Ugh. Krillin, I'm not gonna kill them. They're hardly even a threat. <laughs> Vegeta! That was not very Paragon! <laughs> Renegade for life. You think that's bad? Seriously, if you hit him hard enough, you can play a song. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what that's from. I think that was Tetris. Isn't that what you get when you cut yourself with something rusty? Nope, that's rabies. Actually, Dad, you can track rabies when you're bitten by an animal with a disease. Silly, Gohan. Animals don't eat people. People eat animals. Silly, Gohan. And so I tell him, I don't care who you are. Now clean my jowls. And that was Nail's first day on the job. Yes, sir, I remember I was there.
That also doesn't have anything to do with what we were talking about. What were we talking about? That ungodly power headed our way! Oh yeah, that. You know, perhaps you should give someone else that power up? You remember the one you gave the Earthlings? You are correct. It is time for me to unlock your hidden powers. Dende. Oh, what the hell? And now, your power has been awakened. I noticed. Sir, I was referring to me. Now listen to me, Dende. With these powers, you garner a huge responsibility. I need you to run as fast as you can to the Earthling. Sir, he left you the moment after you gave him the power up. <laughs> That slut! No way, this stupid guy in this stupid outfit starts beating us up and I lost me best mind and- Jace! <sighs> You'll speak to me professionally and dutifully. Oh, um, sorry, kitten. Now, Jace, back from the field. Full report. Well, see, at first it was going fine, but next thing we know, Galdo, well... Oh, Lord, he's dead, isn't he? Dead he is, sir. Well, in our line of work, our lives can be compromised at any moment. This is something we must live with. On the plus side, Bird owes me 50 rabbits. About that, kitten. He's probably not gonna pie up. Really? He's usually such a good sport about that. Thing is, he's come down with a sudden case of death, sir. Oh. That's... wow. That's a rather hefty loss. Yes, sir. He was a valued teammate. Strong, fast, and... And blue! Pardon, kitten? Blue! And tall! And you're so red! And short! It was the perfect little yin-yang thing we had going. Not that short, kitten. Oh, don't go all Vegeta on me. Now, where are we going to find another blue recruit? Perhaps Raccoon knows someone. <sighs> He's dead too, isn't he? Yeah. Well, did he at least die with dignity? Define dignity, sir. Uh, well, Jace, I believe the next step is obvious. We, as professionals, cannot allow this act to go unabated. We have a job to finish, and we shall see it through. Yes, sir! Can you force? Away! Sure is nice to see you guys again, but I sure can't help but feel that someone's missing. Oh yeah, Bulma! What do you think she's up to? Probably something girly. <laughs> Her hair. Your idiotic banter is charming, but if you haven't noticed, we're pretty much screwed here. What? Why? Frieza has the Dragon Balls, you dolt, which basically means we're already dead. Actually, not really. Oh? Something you know that I don't? A lot of things, actually. You have five seconds to rephrase that. Four. Three. Actually, what I meant to say was, when you make a wish on the Dragon Balls, the sky turns darker than the blackest void! Hmm? And out of the balls? Rises a giant dragon! So yeah, none of that. Two, one... Hi, Vegeta. Hi, Ginyu. Uh... That's him, Kaden! That's the one who beat us up! What? Just look at his hair. He looks like he just got out of bed. For goodness sakes, Jace, he's even wearing pajamas! I swear it, sir. He picked us apart one by one. We never stood a chance- <laughs> oh! So oh, that's just your fair! Jace, what have I told you? You know, I'm surprised you're here, Ginyu. I thought you'd be busy polishing Frieza's boots. First off, Lord Frieza doesn't wear boots. Second, if he did, I'd have already polished them. Third, he's off chasing some leftover Namekians. Wait, so Frieza's not at the ship? Correct. And you're here? That's right. And the average power level of Frieza's soldiers is... 2,000. Interesting. Krillin! Gohan, get out of here and find Bulma. Vegeta and I can handle this on our own. Oh no, I mean I'd really hate to leave you on your own, you know, but if you say so, let's go, Gohan! Be careful, Dad! Alright, Vegeta, we have to put our differences aside for now, and take these guys as a team. Yeah, that's fantastic and entertaining and all that, but first, if you don't mind me, I need to use the restroom. Oh, okay. About a hundred miles away. <laughs> He has a very nervous bladder. So, for the first century, I'll go easy on them, lure them into a false sense of security, and then when they think I'm not so bad, BAM! I'll go full tyrant on them in the second century. 
After that, I'll disappear for a millennia and make them wonder if I ever existed to begin with, just to come back and kill them all. Good afternoon. It's morning. Attack. Cute kid. Seems familiar. What do you want? Ah, good sir. I suppose you could say I'm looking for technical support. No. Do we have a visitor? Yes, sir. No. Take his coat. I don't have a coat. He doesn't have a coat, sir. And I believe this is the man who basically killed our entire race. No. Don't take his coat. You see, I recently acquired what you people refer to as Dragon Balls, but I'm having trouble getting them to do what I want. Did you try working the shaft? Classy. Now, what does he want? He's asking how to use the Dragon Balls. Did you tell him to work the shaft? Yes, Lord Guru. Good work, Nail. I have the distinct impression you're going to be difficult. Well, sir, if you're having a problem with our customer support, you can call 1-800-EAT-A-DICK. We don't even have those! Okay, this is getting ridiculous. What is that? Oh, God! Natural light! Good Lord, I was led to believe your species survived entirely on water. How is he so fat? Oh, hello. I'm Super Kami Guru, and I'm the guy who's not judging you on your appearance. Well, my name is Frieza, ruler of most of the known galaxy. I'm here to offer you a deal. You give me the information I require, and I'll let the sporting young man live. Please. Nail isn't afraid of you. He is the strongest of our race. Oh, really? Ah, uh, sir? Yeah, Nail's gonna destroy your sorry ass. They wouldn't be able to air it on the news because it'll be so brutal. Sir, seriously? Hush, Nail. I'm speaking for you. Well then, if this is the only course of action available to me, I accept. I'll dispatch of this worm, and then I'll be back for you, slug. Leave my brother out of this. Sir, his power is overwhelming. I can also sense it's only a fraction of what he's capable of. Nail, listen to me. You are Namek's number one son, a prodigy child. You have been trained in the ancient ways. I believe in you. You mean that, Lord Guru? Yes, Nail. Now show him the staggering spirit of Namek and waste his smug ass. Yes, sir! Follow me! Fool. If I had trained him in the new way, he might have stood a chance. You have an interesting form and a surprisingly well honed technique. And you're purple! I'm sufficiently impressed. You've held your own very well. But your form and grace will never compare to that of the illustrious Captain Gundyu! You mean like this? Oh god! Is that what I look like? Jace, that isn't what I look like, is it? No, Captain, you look amazing! No offense, but this is boring. Like, really boring. Like, listening to Gohan's piano recital boring. I realize these poses in an effort to invigorate my men and raise morale. How dare you mock them! Well, I mean, it's just... I'm not even using half my power right now. Ha! <laughs> Quite a substantial bluff. But a bluff and nothing more. I've witnessed your abilities firsthand, and I assure you that you're... <laughs> A hundred and eighty thousand! Huh. Oi, Keaton! Isn't your max power level only one hundred and- <laughs> Yeah, one hundred and twenty thousand. That's what I thought. Is he gonna be okay? Hey, the Keaton? Yeah, he just does that sometimes. <laughs> Alright, I'm back. How you going, Keaton? How do you think? Well, Keaton, if you're getting stressed, you could always, you know. Oh, jeez! This is hardly the time or the place. Besides, I did it in the pod on the way here. Uh... I meant switch bodies, sir. Ah, yes, of course. Hold my scouter. Hey, what are you doing with your head? <laughs> um, sir, you're supposed to do that to me. Oh, but you see, I did do it to you. I don't understand. No! <laughs> oh. 
Wow, what happened? Everything seems weird. Oh, hey, there's another me over there. I wonder if... Ah! Oh, my chest! What in the... Oh! 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 oh. What happened? I'm all purple and horny. Chi Chi's gonna hate this. What's mine is yours, and yours is mine, as they say. G give me back my body! I'm sorry, you can't have your body anymore. It's mine now. Jace, shall we? Right, kitten. Goodbye! Enjoy bleeding to death. I won't! Man, I'm a jerk now. The radar says we're getting close. Yeah, who'd have thought Bulma would have been so compliant? Why? Why would you leave me alone here? I know this place. Did you know there are giant crabs down there? I do. I killed one. Okay, Bulma, let's just calm down. Why are you upset? Why? Because I am always alone. Okay, Bulma, if we were to stay here, what would that accomplish? Just take the fucking radar. Thank you, Bulma. Say thank you, Gohan. Thank you, Bulma. No problem, Gohan. And no problem. Shove it. I'll take it. Let's go. <laughs> Well, if you ask me, all she needs is a little bit of wink wink, nudge nudge. Still fine. Right. It's called the Wilhelm scream, man. It's like the one in Star Wars where the stormtrooper falls. Oh, yeah, I love that scream. Uh, doesn't it sound like... <laughs> nah, dude, it's more like... Ah! Nah, that wasn't it either. Ah! That was totally it! Ah! Ooh. Ah! As the body, sir? Fantastic. A little too pink and hairy in odd places, but I'll grow into it. So, what's the plan, kitten? Well, first off, we have to touch on Freeze's balls. Uh, sir... Yes, yes, realized the moment I said it. Alright, get your act together. Hundred times gravity? That's for pussies. The only reason he took those jokers out was because I loosened them up for him. Like a jar of space pickles. Ugly, stupid space pickles. I just gotta get those Dragon Balls. And if it's anything like that jockstrap incident, then you probably buried them somewhere around here. Hey, Gohan! I think they're buried somewhere around here! Well, at least I'll have something to put back in the hole. Think like there's no tomorrow! Okay, the second they summon the dragon, I'll swoop in and break the bald one's neck. Totally gonna yell Team Three Star when I do it, too. Oh, I can see it now. Team Three Star! Ow! Amazing. We found them. Krillin, we really did it! Finally! Now let's hurry up and wish back Piccolo, Tianjin Han, and Chiaotzu. What about Yamcha? What about Yamcha? I don't know what this Yamcha is, but it sounds just like Raditz. Eternal Dragon! Rise up and grant our wish! It's not working. Is that what you're supposed to say? Honestly, that's always been pretty vague. Usually just gather them together and then out pops the magic dragon. Maybe there's something special about Namekian Dragon Balls. Huh. Maybe if I sing to it. I know a song that gets on everybody's nerves! Actually, Krillin, I was thinking something else. Maybe the only way to summon it is to call it in its native language. I don't speak German! And the only person I know who does was the toilet. And it's dead. God rest his seat. Ugh. What? Oh, you can't be serious. Huh? Hey, Krillin, I feel two power levels coming this way. You don't think my dad failed, do you? No way, Gohan, your dad's the best! But on the off chance, hide yourself! Oi, Keaton, someone's dug up the balls. Well then, someone's in for the beating of their life. Hey, Goku, check it out, we dug up the Dragon Balls. How you doing? Did you win that fight against that Ginyu guy? Why's that Space New Zealand guy here? Ah, uh, what the fuck? What's up with the scouter? And do you happen to know anybody who speaks German? <laughs> ah! Ah! And what was that about? Cullen, that's not my dad! Gohan, of course it's your dad! Goku, what's your favorite food? Waldorf salad. See, double baconator! Oh, shit! You see, I've acquired the body of your former associate. Goku, was it? And with that, I've gained his power level of 180,000. That's... that's horrible! Quite. I'm sure you understand now the situation you're in. That is identity theft! We're gonna sue the crap out of you! You can't sue me if I kill you. No, then you'll get put on trial for murder. Ha! Ah! 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 
Huh? Uh, Captain? You're here! The devil are you? Oh. Well, look what the space cat regurgitated. Hey, Gohan. Hey, Krillin. Hey, Goku. D dad I'm surprised you're still kicking. How's that wound treating you? This is easily the second worst hole I've ever had in my chest. It's gonna take, like, a million mommy kisses to make it better. Gohan, we may have a chance now, but you'll have to give it your all. Remember, he may look like your dad, but you can absolutely not hold back! Ah! Abandon me for a year with Piccolo! Send me off into space, and the next time I get to see you, you lost your damn body? You're not even you anymore! I don't know where he gets that from. <clears throat> this is absurd! His power level was a league above my own when we fought! What the blazes is going on? Haha, <laughs> you don't know any of my techniques. What techniques? Tell me. I'm not gonna tell you how to use the Kaioken. Kaio what? <laughs> oh, oh. Jay, since huh? you're not too busy standing there like a slack-jawed idiot, I could use your help. Wait, if I'm Ginyu now, does that mean you have to listen to me? No. Oh, well then, what about him? Good day, <laughs> mate. <laughs> So, we've been flying for about 20 minutes now. Got any family? Because if so, I probably killed them. Really? Nothing to that? You're no fun. Hey, Jace, I've killed every single one of Freezer's flunkies I've got up against so far. Six in total. How would you like to be number seven? Piss off, you bloody monkey! Thank you, sir. May I have another? What the hell happened to you? You were not this strong when you fought Raccoon! Looks like you have some required reading to do. Alright, let's see here. Our Kai, full moon, lose your tiles, stronger every time you... Oh. Well, I'm right f***ed, aren't I? Right in the down under. <laughs> Clever girl. <laughs> No! Jace! All of my men. I'm the only one left. Please, all of you, just... Just allow me a customary moment of silence. The best part about this? I get to kill both Ginyu and Kakarot at the same time! Wait, who's Kakarot? Your Kakarot! I thought his name was Goku. His name is Goku! No, it's Kakarot! But he just said Goku! Yeah, I did! I know what he said, but he- So what is it? Kakarot or Goku? It's, it's Kakarot. Kakarot! No, no, no! Just- Look, his Saiyan name is Kakarot, but he changed it when he landed on Earth as a baby! So they kept calling him by his Earth name, and I am calling him by his real name! So does that make me Ginyu? Yes. Yes! Perfect! Change? No! 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 I'll save you, Goku! What just happened? I don't know. Yay, I'm me again. Wait, Goku. What is your favorite food? Favorite? He's him again! This is ridiculous! But at least I'm not trapped in some useless body. <laughs> Give me a minute. <laughs> so I'm confused. Ginyu took my dad's body, but then he tried to take Vegeta's body. But now he's back in his own body, my dad's back in his own body, and Vegeta's... Still a prick, yeah. Now, to switch your body to a cross! Ah, crap, kinda walked into this one. Ribbit. Ribbit. Croak. The hell just happened? A frog got on my hand. It was gross, so I threw it. So then, is it over? Are they all gone now? They will be in a second. Vegeta, no! He can't hurt anyone anymore. Stop! Oh, all right, fine. See? You really can be a nice guy. Psychate for eight. Oh, I know. How about a good old-fashioned joke? 
How many Namekians does it take to screw in a light bulb? The whole race! One to screw in the light bulb, and the rest to die. And then the other one dies too. Stop ignoring me. This is my people's sacred battleground. We flew over an hour for this? It looks exactly the same as everywhere else in this godforsaken rock. Hmm. <laughs> racist. Well, maybe so, but I can't quite be a racist against a race that doesn't exist. Like the Clawfors. Dirty money-grabbing Clawfors. Tried to claw me right out of my money. Blew those little bastards up is what I did. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know we were starting. Here, allow me. <laughs> Looks like someone's going to be missing this. No, not really. Hmm? Oh, that looks like it hurts a lot. Are you okay? I'm fine! Good to know. Going so, what exactly is this? It's a healing tank. This will bring the idiot back to full strength. <laughs> the bubbles tickle. <laughs> Ow, it hurts to laugh. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Ow. It'll take a while, though. This is the only other model a ship has. And it's kind of an old one. What happened to the newer model? Blew it the f up. What? Did it have an opinion? Eat me. Now both of you. Strip. Um. I've got body armor for you. Less awkward. <coughs> you know, Gohan, it just occurred to me. Yeah, Krillin? We're still on Namek. What do you mean? Well, I mean, it feels like we've been here for like a year. But we've only been here for six days. I know, right? Hey, by the way. Don't I look like that one guy that Vegeta landed with back on Earth? What was his name again? Hey, Vegeta! What was that one guy's name? Vegeta! 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 God damn it, Nappa. All right! Good old God damn it, Nappa. Krillin, we should probably focus on finding a way to use the Dragon Balls. Well, there's always little green, but... But what? That's a really long flight. Krillin. Plus, I think I sense some hostility. Krillin! Fine, fine, I'll go get him. Enjoy your company. Try not to get yourself killed. God forbid you make me happy. You know, you seem like you're in a bad mood. Maybe you should take a nap. Maybe you should... Uh, actually, that sounds good. You keep guard out here. Make sure not to go too far. I like my meat shields within bullet blocking distance. I didn't think bullets could hurt you. Shut up, I'm sleepy. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Goku! Goku, are you there? Oh, hey, King Kai. I'm in a healing pod. I noticed. I wasn't paying attention. What the hell? Well, when I got down here, I ran into some really weird guys. One was really big and muscly, but he went down real easy. Then these two guys double-teamed me. One of them took it really hard in the back, but the other didn't seem that interested. So he went and brought this really horny guy. Oh my. Who's that, King Kai? It's Torch the K. Somehow we made this into a three-way. Oh my. Call! Three-way call! How many arms do you think we're up to? I think we're up to 24. <laughs> Tell me, huh? have you ever heard of the planet Vegeta? Uh, no. Funny, because I expect to hear the same from the next person when I ask them about Namek. <laughs> oh, was that your nose? That was your nose. I've had a worse time, you know. It's not often I dirty my own hands with this sort of grunt work. There's always a certain amount of satisfaction I get out of doing it myself. <laughs> ah, it is kind of funny, isn't it? I'm, I'm laughing at something else, actually. <laughs> <laughs> what? The Earthlings have the password. What? Remember the little Namekian you passed on the way to Gurus? On his way to the humans with the password. By now he's probably already there and they're about to summon the dragon. <laughs> Yeah, if I had to guess your biggest mistake, it would be not stopping him. That or the purple lipstick. I will f***ing murder you! Whatever. Why aren't the Ginyus showing up? Oh, they're dead. Why are they dead? Stop right there, Namekian scum! Ah! <laughs> you should see the look on your face! Oh, I'm just kidding, it's me, Krillin! Ah! <laughs> You're killing me, little green. 
come on, we gotta go summon the dragon! You know, it's not so bad. I mean, sure, I've seen more people die than most people my age. Or really, most people in general. Then again, I don't really know anyone my own age. My best friends are a 26-year-old dwarf and a giant green alien who constantly hits me. Still, better than my dad. At least they're around. Huh, where did that come from? Hey, go on! Huh? That sounds like Krillin! Wow, you made it in no time at all! Yeah, little Green here was on his way back from Gurus! He said he can help us summon the dragon! Great! I'll go get Vegeta and- No, 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 see? That's the best part! We're not gonna tell Vegeta! That sounds like a very dangerous idea that could very easily backfire. Well, we can either take the wishes for ourselves or give them to Vegeta. And I'm not gonna lie, I don't think he's dedicated to Team 3 Star at all. You know, I've been meaning to tell you, that name? Really doesn't sound very good. Well, why didn't you tell me sooner? I thought it was stupid from the beginning, but nobody said anything! Let's just go summon the dragon and go home. Yeah, fine, whatever. Uh, first immortality, then the bitches. Now we just gotta have Little Green summon the dragon, and we'll finally have our wish! Hey, is that Frieza? No! I think that's Frieza. No, it's not! Yeah, that's definitely Frieza. Summon it, summon it, summon it, summon it, summon it, summon it! Damn it, stop speaking gibberish and summon the- Holy crap, your dragon's on steroids! Alright! We can finally get our wish! The dragon says he'll give you three. Wait a minute, we get three wishes? That's awesome! I want a three point- Stop in screwing around and wish these idiots off my planet! Holy crap, I can hear a voice in my head! Is it telling you my name is Dende? Hush, little green! The voice speaks to me. This is King Kai. Wish these guys back to life before I kill myself. Wait, can gods kill themselves? I'm about to try! Alright, little green. Use our first wish to bring our friends back to life! Paranga can only bring back one person at a time. Oh. King Kai, he says it can only bring one person back at a- I heard him! Which means one of us gets left behind. Just wish me back. I guess we should ask Yamcha what he thinks. <gasps> no one cares what Yamcha thinks. Listen, if you wish me back, then that wish is Kami back. Then you can use those Dragon Balls to wish these morons back. Which leaves us with two more wishes! Let's wish them to Namek! Wait, what? Wait, what? Little Green, wish our friend Piccolo back to life, and then with our next wish, bring him to Namek! Hold on a minute, don't do that, that is a terrible idea! He is on Namek. Wait, where is he? On Namek. You why didn't it bring him here? You must be specific. Oh, so it's a sort of monkey's paw. You have to be careful with the hubris in your wishes. I have to pee! Jesus, I overslept. It's already night. For the first time since I got here. On a planet with three suns. You motherfucker! Oh my ear! So, what do we do with the third wish? Well, if nobody else has any ideas, I want my three foot. Hi! What's up, guys? I'm never gonna get my hoagie. So, what are you doing? What am I doing? What are you doing? Nothing much. What my plans? What are your plans? Are you? Yes. I'm gonna fucking kill you! But first, yeah. you are going to give me my wish for immortality, or I will snap his neck! Wait, he's the only one who can ask the dragon to grant wishes! And I've got nothing to lose! Whatever. Good answer! Yeah. Now get to wishing. I feel that they have finally summoned the dragon. Would be a real dick move to die right now. Huh? Dump 
Colombia, Novka Kun, Jorra. Is... is that normal? No, it's dead. And that means Guru is too. I'm so sorry for your loss. Someone has to be. That doesn't matter! Don't you understand? If it didn't grant me my wish, then I'm not immortal! And Frieza's <laughs> going to... <g> going to... <laughs> oh no, don't mind me. By all means, give me some ideas. <laughs> Fan friggin' tastic, we're back here again. Oh, you're back. Hi, Kami. Mr. Popo, what are you watering? Pot. Pots of what? Pot. I'm not getting rid of it. Are you kidding? That shit's great for my glaucoma. <sighs> what was that idiot doing bringing me here? It's... Wait a minute. I can feel it. This is my home. I can finally see its beauty. The lush blue fields. The crystal clear waters. The wind brushing past my... God, this is boring! <sighs> no wonder I feel at home. Well, Vegeta, you've finally pulled it off. You've managed to dash my hopes entirely. With some help, I see. Quark! No, I'm seriously not helping. I can try. I'm very curious. Where exactly are you from? We're from Earth! Oh, no! All right. Thanks for stopping me, Gohan, because I can't shut- They're from Earth. Little Grain! Why? Because my name is Dende. Oh, good. I'll stop by there on the way home, pick up some space eggs, some space milk, and blow it the f up! Oh, I'm sorry. I'm usually far more composed. I'm just a little bit absolutely livid. Oh, Frieza, quit being such a woman. I lost my chance at immortality too, and you don't see me crying about it. Yes, Vegeta, but you see, the difference between us is I'll live long enough to regret it. <sighs> Everything looks the goddamn same on this goddamn planet! Wait a minute. A body! Social activity! Please tell me you're not dead. Khrit is out. Ptak! Ah, crap. I find the only living thing for Miles, and he's so broken he can't even talk right. I was speaking to Meki and you idiot. Don't you know anything about your own people? Well, we're demons, right? Eh, more like slug people. Ah, oh, damn it! I liked it better when I was a demon. And I liked it better when I had proper bladder control. Nobody's perfect. Yeah, I've been meaning to ask about that. What happened? Let's just say our world elder's kind of a giant green asshole. Preaching to the choir on that one. Well, it's been fun, but I have to go die again. Wait, I might be able to help you. Look, buddy, if you want to add me on MySpace, I switched to Spacebook a while ago. No, 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 listen. I think I know something that might work out for both of us. I don't want to die, and you seem pretty lonely. Just pro- I mean, go on. There's a special ability our people share. Forbidden, even amongst our most sacred clans. And we're just going to abuse it? Oh, maliciously. Bitchin' how we do. Well, first you put your hand upon me. Okay. Yes, like that. Now lower. Uh-huh. Lower. Mm. A little lower. Mm. Ah, if we had junk, you'd be gay right now. <sighs> Fusing! <laughs> Wow, unreal. My gosh. This is amazing. I feel incredible. Yes, 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 yes. I can win. I can drink. I can do this. Ah! What are you doing? I, uh, nothing. Really? Because it looked like you were chanting to yourself. Are you in my head? Yep. Don't worry. Supposedly I should fade away into your subconscious. Sooner or later. Okay, so what now? By my estimate, this fusion should have given you just enough power to wipe out the bastard who killed our people. And? Well, let me put this in terms you'll understand. You can win! You feel great! You can do this! Oh, ha ha! Impudent little... I'm impressed, Vegeta. When did you graduate from pull-ups? About the same time you got off the rag. Cute. But bear no false hope, Vegeta. You're a mere paper tiger in front of a storm. You have no idea what true power I possess. Just that you can transform, right? I can transform... Okay, when and how? Goldo told me. So, did you know that Frieza can transform? Huh, all right. Yeah, and Birdo's gay. Really? And then I threw a dog treat at him. True story. Right. 
But if you are so aware, why do you persist in goading me? Because, Frieza, you're not dealing with the average Saiyan warrior anymore. I am a Super Saiyan! Oh, here we go. That's right, Frieza. I've risen beyond the limits of a normal Saiyan and into the realm of legend. The legend that you fear. The legend known throughout the entire universe as the most powerful warrior to ever exist. I, Prince Vegeta, have become a Super, Super Saiyan. Saiyan. Blah, 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 I get it. Then you slayed the Jabberwocky and went on to save Narnia. Go ahead and mock me, Frieza, but I'm not afraid of you. So why don't you doll yourself up and get ready for a night on the town? Because I'm about to take you to a ballroom blitz. Fine, I'll indulge you, Mr. Super Saiyan. But before I do, I have a funny little story I'd like to tell you. Funny how? I like to call it, I killed your dad. So, haha, -ha funny. You see, thanks to a rogue lower-class warrior, your father caught wind of my plans. King Vegeta, I have urgent news! Speak, Butorega! Bardock has gone absolutely mad, sire! Frieza! What's all the commotion about? He's been telling everyone that Frieza plans to destroy Vegeta! Wait, my son, the planet or me? Yes. <laughs> Freaking smartass. Counselor Nappa, what do you think? Let me tell you what you need to do. You need to sit him down, uh -huh. you look him dead in the eye, yes. and you say, Don't blow up my planet. And you think that'll work? He'd have to be awfully evil if it didn't. And I'm not gonna lie, I like the cut of his jib. Alright, but I want you to take my son, the prince, off planet just in case things go south. Don't worry, sir, you'll do just fine. Prince, can I sit down and have a word with Sorry, you? Can. <laughs> Yatta. And then I blew the planet up. The end. How did you know about the parts you weren't there for? Cullen, do you feel that? I taste that! All done. And judging by the expression on your face, so are you. What? How? Let's be practical and put a number to that feeling, shall we? Last time I clocked this form, it was at... One million. You're lying! Am I? Am I really? Not impressed! I can do that too! Krillin, are you okay? Yeah, and I've got a little green right here. Peaceful young races with fires on their houses Millions of voices all silenced like mouses Watching the cowards bow toward their new king These are a few of my favorite things Is it just me or is he singing to himself? <laughs> well, he's dead. This is the worst! Really? Sure it isn't this? Or this? Or this? Or this? Or this? Krillin, stop! You're making him stronger! One down. Uh, I think impalement is my favorite way to kill a person. You condescending, sadistic, callous mother... Pardon me. Go on, smash a feminine alien! Go on, strong as there is! Yeah, how's that feel, Frieza? Now, if you can, why don't you pick your sorry ass up and take on a real say? Huh. That happened. Vegeta, mind sitting right there for just a moment? I need to go play babysitter. Uh, think. What would Dad do in this situation? Bye, son! I'm beginning to think I have issues. <laughs> so, Vegeta, does this get you angry? Not really. Kind of a smartass. Well then, why am I even bothering? Because you get off on it? Oh, unbelievable. Oh! All right, who has the balls? Get my ass, bitch! I'm a mortal! Mm -hmm. 
Suck my dick! How the hell did he get up? Oh my god, I swear if he used that wish of immortality on himself, I am going to murder! That bastard. Come on, you can't leave me alone here. You're the only one I can talk to. I... you... healed me. You are the only one I respect. Then why did you heal Krillin? The better question is, why did I tell him he was immortal? Holy crap! Thank God I'm immortal! Actually, I healed you, you idiot. Wait, so I could have died back there? Yeah, and unlike the runt and I, you don't get a power boost from it. Hacks! I call Hacks! How did you escape? Oh, it was awesome! See, he was gaining on me there for a minute, but then I managed to lose him in some crevices. But he kept cutting me off at every pass. He didn't just blow it up? I thought the same thing, but no! So I thought fast and I used a solar flare on him. And then you used your key enzyme to cut him in half? Um... I will mount your head where my tail used to be! To answer your question, Gohan, no, I did not do that. Dust this bitch! Did we get him? Curling, we can feel his energy. Why do you bother asking? I'm an optimist. You're an idiot. You're both wrong. You're dead. You know what? I'm sick of this. If I'm gonna die, then I'm gonna go out the same way Piccolo would. Oh, oh no! Oh, God damn it! No! Uh, Mr. Piccolo! Well, well, well. I'm legitimately surprised I missed one of you. But that's just fine, because I've been working on some jokes. Now tell me if you've heard this one. How many Namekians does it take to... <laughs> just one. To think your race had the ability to produce such capable fighters. I'm surprised I hadn't destroyed you sooner. And to think your race has the ability to produce such whiny bitches. I'm surprised anyone can take you seriously. <laughs> Wait a damn minute, something's wrong here. Huh? Back on your planet, the Namek couldn't even stand up to Nappa. Yet here he is now, taking on Frieza, in his second form! What do you think happened? Well, either Frieza hit me so hard I'm in a delusional coma, or... Or? Power levels are bullsh**! Wow, you're really kicking his ass. Oh, you're still here. Yeah, I've just been watching you knock this guy around. Kind of bored, wishing I had something to do. You got any ideas? Now is not the time! Piccolo's actually standing up to him, Krillin! I don't believe it! We may actually win! Yeah, that's just, uh... Great. If you'll excuse me, though, I've, uh, gotta... Bye. Oh, for the love of... Ah! I'm out! Ah! Huh? Would you hold on for a moment, please? I'll be right back. All right, I just gotta find one of the Ginyu ships and get the hell out of here. I'll just go to Freezer Planet 419. No one ever goes to Freezer Planet 419. Not since its species miraculously repopulated. Mom and Vegeta have a kid. Our cell reaches its perfect form. Gohan is the strongest in the universe, but still doesn't do crap. So, Vegeta, where are you going? Oh, you know. Places? Places, hmm? Like that mountain over there? Actually, that looks more like a plateau. Ah! Sorry about that. Where were we? Last time I checked, I was planting my foot firmly somewhere between your lungs and colon. An admirable feat for a lowlife such as yourself. I have a question for you, though. What's that? Die. That's not a question. Ah! Ah! That's because I don't do requests. Well, that didn't last real f***ing long. Oh, come on now, that was just a love tap. Don't think you have the upper hand yet. I'm still wearing weighted armor. Oh man, that sounded good. Now I have to do my neck. Ow, my neck! Weighted armor? How quaint. And how much does it weigh? Same as it always does. One hundred kilo! Oh. That's just cute. That concept just sort of lost meaning after a while, didn't it? True. But I have one that's nice, fresh, and ripe for abuse. Transformation. And spoiler warning, 
It's not getting old anytime soon. You can't be serious. Oh, but I am. See, I mean. Hey, man. Can I talk to you about something really quick? I'm seriously in the middle of something right now. Yeah, I know, but I've been looking around and you've got, like, no apps up here. I have already played the crap out of Minesweeper. Could you just- Wait, I have apps? I have Minesweeper? I just thought I could connect to the internet with my antennae. I didn't even know he could do that. We learn something new every day. Now, could you let me focus- hey. Want to play me in Minesweeper? You can't play someone in Minesweeper. That's a single-player game. Ah, see, first I go, then you go and try to beat my tide. And hey, is he transforming? Oh, damn it! So, Namekian, what do you think of my third form? I think Ridley Scott's gonna sue somebody. What are you talking about? <laughs> Let me touch your skin. Ah! Oh no, this is horrible. How could this happen? He's going to kill us all! Help me! Ah! Poor little Namekian. Can't touch me anymore. How about this? Let's play a game. Ever heard of paintball? Yeah. Just remove the T. I don't get it. Oh, I get it! Now for your other glue bark. You're not really familiar with our anatomy, are you? It doesn't matter. I'll hit your glue box somewhere. Oh, oh no! Oh, not this crap again! Hold on! I have an idea, and I don't want to hear any of your stupid crap. I only promised to try. I need you to and follow me on this one. Almost kill me. Almost kill me? kill you. Yeah. And there's no repercussion for this. I will not punch you. Oddly specific. I'm going to need a moment to prepare myself, otherwise I might go into <laughs> shock. You are so punched! <laughs> Why is this still happening? Get on around, Mr. Piccolo! Hey, Frieza! The human body is composed of 75% water! I am 100% death! Half time! What? God! The invincible Lord Freeza defeated by a mere child. What dramatic irony. <laughs> no, just kidding. Fred baskets. Mr. Piccolo, you saved me again. Saved is sort of subjective here. So we're all well aware that that all basically equated to a game of hot space potato, right? Well then, I say we get a move on. Who here is tired of my third form? Me. 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 Alrighty then, final form it is. Personally, I was a bigger fan of the first form. I'd settle on second, really. Yeah. Come on, Mr. Piccolo. Ugh. Don't worry, we have Dende. He can heal you. Krillin, where's Dende? Oh, but Little Green's over there with Vegeta. Why? I blew a hole in his chest. Why? Because he asked for it. <coughs> You... green thing... heal me. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm having a hard time hearing you over the smell of my people's blood on your hands. Oh, no. Do not be that guy right now. Oh, I'm going to be that guy right now. I am literally going to die. Well, how about this? I'll heal you on one condition. And that is? Say my name. Oh. Ah. Uh... You don't even know my name. Oh, I do. It's, uh... Um, uh, little green? <laughs> no. No, it's Dende. Say Dende. Dende. Now say, please heal me, Dende. Please heal me, Dende. Well, since you asked so nicely... Come back, magic man. <sighs> and you, my friend, are a subject of nepotism. <sighs> Thank you, Magic Man. It's good to have you back, Nail. I'm not Nail. Technically, you kinda are. Shut up, Nail. Why are you talking to yourself? No reason. Now go heal Vegeta. Why would I do that? Because that. Oh yeah. That's happening right now. Yeah. Dylan, why aren't you using your Tianzong? Yeah, you know, I keep forgetting to do that. And? Well, I kind of used all my energy to mortally wound Vegeta. Seriously, what did I miss? <sighs> Twist my arm a little bit more, why don't you? You healed me. Of course I did. I'm a nice guy. And now what's to stop me from kicking your face in? Because you touch me, and you're not getting back up again. That's right, I'm your white mage. And nobody f***s with the white mage. Oh, 
I feel real good about my life right now. Little Green! No! Actually, Krillin, his name was Dende. Oh, that's funny. Never spoke up about it. You put the lime in the coconut and drink them both up. You put the lime in the coconut and drink them both up. Goku, come in! Oh, hey, King Kai. Your friends are in trouble, Goku. Are you healed yet? Uh, no, I don't think so. Well, how long do you think it's gonna take? Well, I think the machine will tell me when I'm done. Okay, you think or you know? You put the lime in the coconut Goku! And... Oh, come on, King Kai. They don't need my help. I bet they're doing just fine on their own. Heal us down! Heal us! Out of mana! <laughs> it's been so long since I've had to use this form. It feels like an old suit I never have an occasion to wear. <laughs> Unfortunately, whenever I put it on, someone dies. Dende, no! Oh, don't cry for the poor thing. I've saved him the fate of seeing what I'm about to do to you. Joke's on you. He hated the bald one. Hey, that's not fair. He just met Piccolo. I couldn't even follow that attack. It was almost instantaneous. Yep. Just gonna stand here and keep being awesome. There's nothing we can do against that kind of power. Ah, uh, hello. Awesome. Right here. We're all gonna die! You know what? All of you better duck. Because I'm about to turn left, and I don't want to smack you with my dick! Oh, look at you, Vegeta. You're really going to fight me. Well, not, not really fight. More like uh, flailing angrily. Make your jokes while you can, Frieza. Because I can now see the peak of your power, while I'm only beginning to tap into mine. I feel like we've been here before. Have we been here before? You see, I have finally realized the legend. Oh my god, this is happening again. That's right. You're not dealing with the average Saiyan warrior anymore, Frieza. I, Vegeta, have finally become the legendary Super Saiyan! Okay, seriously, first off, Super Saiyan. What is that? What even is that? I'll tell you what it is. It's just some stupid legend passed by your filthy monkey ancestors around a campfire like it was their own dung. Let me tell you, Vegeta, I don't deal in legends. I deal in facts. And here's a fact. By the end of this, you are going to be crying. Like a little bitch. Bitch, you just jealous of my Super Saiyan swagger. Oh, for f sake. Yes, I have him on the ropes. All he can do is dodge me. God, Zarbon's dead, Dodoria's dead, the Ginyus are dead. This has been one giant mess. It's just like that jockstrap incident, only now I don't have Ginyu around to dig the holes. What? This may be a little off topic, <sighs> but how good are you at digging holes? What? Are... I mean, besides the one you've already dug yourself into. Uh, don't you mock me! Oh. I don't get it! Why can't Vegeta hit him? Because he keeps aiming where he is instead of where he's going to be! Oh, crap. So does this mean we should... Oh! So, are we done playing children's games, Vegeta? Or do I have to tickle you? Eh? Eh? I'm gonna blow you up! We'll see how you stand up to everything I've got! Take my super Saiyan Oh, and I should probably send the Ginyu's family something. Perhaps some wine, a gift basket? <laughs> or maybe gift baskets with wine. What? I was... I was... Uh... Oh, God. See? It's like I told you, Vegeta. Like a bitch. Shut up! Oh, my God, you actually are <laughs> crying. I'm not crying! Not! Honestly, now I just feel bad. Usually I just blow up whatever's in my way, but with you, I've gotten kind of attached. 
It's sort of like putting down old Space Yeller. How is that a thing? It's sad, really. But before we part ways, Vegeta, let me tell you a tale. <laughs> the end. See that, Vegeta? Now for my next trick, I'm going to make an asshole disappear. Bagwan, brethren, Vegeta. Me be a spirit animal. And me here to tell you how to mash up that bomber clad freezer. All you got to do is... <laughs> hey, Vegeta. Uh, why? Stop hitting yourself. Stop hitting yourself. Stop hitting yourself. <laughs> You're the one hitting me! Oh, contraire, Vegeta. You brought this upon yourself. <laughs> Should we help him? Oh, go ahead. Pool's open. Water's fine. Hmm? No? Just going to stand there like a bunch of pissants? Thought so. Now, where were we? Oh, right. I believe it was... Kidney punch. Kidney punch. Kidney, kidney punch. And pause. Kidney punch. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Row, row, row your boat gently row, down row, the stream. Row, row, row your boat gently merrily, down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Row, row, your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Row, row, row your boat. Hot stuff! It seems our game is over, Vegeta. Now that we're done here, it's time to send you crying home to Mummy. My mother's dead. I know. Yeah! <laughs> Who? Hey guys, how's it going? Piccolo, when did you come back? Uh, Dragon Balls. Oh, neat. Hey, Krillin, that armor looks funny on ya. Hey, Dad! Hey, so are you that Freezer guy? I am Lord Freezer, yes. Awesome! I'ma deck you in the schnoz! Ow. I'm sorry, that's a new one. Uh, who are you exactly? I'm Goku! I'm insane! From Earth! He means Saiyan. Uh, between you and the Namekian, I think I've lost my touch at genocide. What's wrong, Vegeta? Did Freezer do this to you? Oh, look, he's all concerned. I'm impressed, Vegeta. You managed to make a friend. Hate you. Hate you both. Unfortunately, Vegeta and I were having a disagreement. He wanted himself to live, and, well, I didn't. Why do you want to die? Well, no, I, 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 I meant I want him to Is die. Is it because you look weird? What? Oh, you know, you got that big head, those weird lips, and that tail. And you don't have ears. Okay, no. And to top it all off, you're really kind of a jerk. And apparently, this is now happening. Vegeta, explain! <laughs> what are you... You see, Frieza? You aren't dealing with the average Saiyan warrior anymore. Oh my god! He has risen above and become a legend. The legend that you fear. He has become a Super Saiyan! <gasps> Vegeta! No, seriously, you have no idea how old that got. Vegeta, no! Vegeta, no! Don't worry, little Gradle! Oh. Vegeta, no! Meh. Are you alright? I have a f***ing hole in my chest. Why didn't you block that one? I thought you had it. No! It's funny how he's still talking. I could have sworn I hit a lung. <laughs> oh, there it is. Kakarot, if you're ever going to listen to anything I have to say, do it now. What is it, Vegeta? I've lived my entire life under Frieza's rule. My entire kingdom. My race was enslaved to do his bidding. 
I understand now. If it weren't for Freezer, you wouldn't be... Dying? No. I was gonna say evil. Oh, no. I'd definitely still be evil. If this situation were reversed, this conversation would never have happened. You'd be dead, and I'd be laughing. <laughs> oh, it hurts to laugh. So, why are you telling me this? Because, Kakarot, you are our race's last hope. You are the last remaining Saiyan. Oh god, you're the last remaining Saiyan. Vegeta. You... Come on. You deserve a proper burial. Oh yes, a proper burial. An unmarked grave on an empty planet in the middle of nowhere space. Honestly, I'd say it's too good for him. I'll make sure to give Freezer one for you, best buddy. Goodbye. Come now, I'm sure he's in a better place. Oh, who am I kidding? He's probably in hell. I don't know, I went to hell once. The only real bad parts were these two oiled up German guys trying to wrestle me. Are you real? But now, I know what I have to do. I have to stop you! You're a heartless monster who kills everyone in his way. Even children. Oh, please. Everyone's always on about the children. I already tried leaving them alive, but all they do is grow up under my rule or dedicate their pathetic lives to revenge. Usually both. Really, killing them is a kindness. I can retract that kindness if you wish. But then who's the villain? You... you. N no that was a rhetorical question. And I gave you a rhetorical answer. Good lord, I traded Vegeta for this. Gohan, Krillin, Piccolo! Get on out of here! I'll take Freezer and myself! But Dad! No buts! Piccolo, you take care of Gohan. So, keep doing what I've been doing then? Yeah, huh? Yeah, I figured. Let's go! Oh, thank God! Dad, beat him within an inch of his life and hang him up by his entrails! Wow, he sounds like he's had a hard time. Piccolo should really have a talk with him. I see. Sending your friends off to fight me all on your own. How gutless. What? How is that gutless? Because suicide is the coward's way out. Can we fight now? Son of a- Yes! Wait a minute, they're all missing. He can't sense my energy. Ha uh ha, -huh. you can't sense my energy. No, but I can hear you, moron. You can't that vision. Ha, huh, you missed. Or did I? Yeah, you did. Well, no, I really did. You see, not a hole on me. I wasn't trying to. You should really work on your aim. You know what? I'm not going to say anything. I'm just going to let this next part be a surprise. What part? Ha! Ah, now what do you have to say? My body's flaming! I miss Zarbon. Wow, that was close. I was almost out of the frying pan and into the... lava. How do you function? Hey, I'm just like any other guy. I pay my taxes one leg at a time. I'm going to drown you. I'm going to drown you like a sack of dumb puppies. What? Why would you drown puppies? Because they're cute and cuddly. Are you coming on to me? <laughs> oh man, this guy's strong. I've got to catch him by surprise. Wait, he can't sense my energy. I know. Kame! Kame! This is the best idea I've ever had. Second only to the double bacon witch. A sandwich with bacon instead of bread. Come now, I've waited long enough. I know it's something new to you, monkey, but it's called a bath. Go, my children. What? That's just distracting. And that's just annoyingly distracting. About time someone kicked you to the curb. Nice work, Brain. You're welcome.
You're a cheeky little monkey, what with your silly martial arts. But you know what the difference between you and I is? You can punch a board and it will break in half. I can punch a board and wipe out its entire race. But can you block? I'd like you to meet my friend. A friend? Is he nice? Rock solid. Filthy monkey, meet General Mountain. Hi, General Mountain. My name's Bill... Sorry, Mr. Mountain. <sighs> Want to play a game? Yes. So how did you like that game, monkey? Eh, uh, it was okay. What? You- It was not Donkey Kong, though. That is a pie level. Oh god, that was so refreshing. Too bad it was all salt water, though. All right then, how about this for another game? I'll fight without using either of my hands. Okay, then I'll fight without using my shirt. I think you're missing the point. Wait time now. Aha, uh -huh, got your tail. What are you, do you think this is a game? Well, you, you said it was a game. I was being coy, you imbecile. I'm trying to kill. Ah! What are you doing? Stop it, stop it now or I'm going to. What's that? Ah, he's gone. I'll have to keep on guard. All my vital areas. Oh no, my neck, my most vital area. Oh, what's wrong? Don't have anything cute to say this time. Adorable. He's gonna choke me to death. Quick, go computer instincts. Ah, son of a. Mother... Ah! You punched me in the face! You bit my tail! You punched me in the face! You bit my f***ing tail! Yeah, well I still haven't used my shirt! Does that mean I win? Yes! Yes! You win! <gasps> what do I win? Another bath! But I'm not dirt... <laughs> Just tell me when you need to come up for air! Crap! Lungs filling with water! Muscles hurting! Brain! Status report! Yeah, yeah, frozen peas. Well, that's not good. That's not good at all. Kakarot. 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 Oh, you know what? Screw this. Wake up, dumbass! Ah! The Vegeta? You're failing your race, Kakarot. Frieza's unlike any opponent you've ever faced. You need to embrace your heritage. Become the Saiyan that you were meant to be. Why are you naked? What? You're naked. Why? Idiot, you don't take your clothes with you when you die. Well, I did. What? Yeah. I even had my weighted clothes on, too. And I didn't even die in those. Huh. That lying red motherfucker! Anyway, listen, Kakarot. Inside you is the primal burning fury of the Saiyan race. Like a wild, raging Ozaru. You must unleash it, Kakarot! So, do I gotta throw my poo at him? Oh, for God! Just use your stupid Kai or whatever! Oh, okay. Thanks, Vegeta. F*** off. I'm gonna go get my clothes back. So, any last words, monkey? You know, besides gurgle gurgle. <laughs> uh, 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 yeah! Kai okay! Oh, what?
No, seriously. Kyle, what? Kyle, crap. I thought so. That last attack drained all of his energy. We gotta help him. All right, Gohan. It's time to get in there and throw down. Really, Krillin? Ha <laughs> <Fuck> no. <laughs> Now, what do you have to say for yourself, monkey? You know what? This is totally bogus. I'm going to do my best to ignore that you just used the word bogus. King Kai hasn't taught us crap since we got here. And what's worse, Piccolo didn't even have to train with us. He just sat and meditated all the time. You're just jealous. No, I'm not. Okay, a little. Hey, do you guys hear that? Hello? Yeah. I've got his left leg. I've got his right. I've got his middle. Hey, what's up? So, are you guys... Why's your attack? Whoa, little quick to the trigger there, Ace. Sorry, I kind of lost my head there after I... lost my head. Hey, I was just inside taking a crap. I'm old, takes me a while. Come out, there's a tree in my living room. What's up? We were just standing around and talking about your awesome training, and then these guys showed up. Look like a bunch of queers. Chiaotzu, we don't even know them. You shouldn't make such rash judgments about them. Well, we shouldn't think less of them for it. Good day, mates. How you going? We're to take control of your planet in the name of Lord Freezer. Sorry about that. <laughs> ah, yeah. Good luck with that. All right, guys. Zomu's boss. That'd be you. Yep, all you, man. You're the boss. What? What? Raccoon has to fight this? He doesn't even come up to Raccoon's kneecaps. Frawley can't even handle a gut full of piss. I bet you can't even run a mile. You're blue! Yeah, all of you can just go straight to hell. Oh, yeah? And who's gonna make Raccoon? Hapun Zika Ha, Das Deutsche Band. Mitsu Bang, Mitsu Boom, Mitsu Bing Bang, Bing Bang. Maz, we have visitors! Prepare the camps. Well, that takes care of that. Hmm, that reminds me. Wonder how Goku's doing. <laughs> That's about right. No, I can't lose. I have to beat you. You're evil, and you have to be stopped. Oh, come now. If I'm really as evil as you say I am, then let God strike me down where I stand. Nice try, jackass! Next time, give it your A-game! Anyway, back to... What are you doing? Have to use a spirit bomb! It's my only chance! Uh, seriously, what... what is this all about? Uh, are you trying to tell me you once caught a fish that big? I'm just... stretching. In the middle of a fight. Yes! I have only one chance. But this planet barely has enough energy left as it is. Wait! I'll just draw from the surrounding planets! What's going on? He's just standing there with his hands up. Wait a second! He's using the spirit bomb! The spirit what's it now? Oh no. Would you stop screaming? The spirit bomb is the only thing that can kill Frieza! Shut up! Too scared, damn it! What is that fool yammering on about? He's talking about... ghosts. Ghosts? Yeah, you know. Spirits. Ghosts. What do ghosts have to do with this? Everything. That's stupid! You're stupid! Stop being stupid! Or... maybe I'm just being rhetorical. No! No, you're not! God, it's like you just use words you hear randomly to try and sound smarter! Huh. Well, now you're just acting transcendent. Ah! Ah! Oh no! If Goku can't focus on the spirit bomb, he doesn't stand a chance! I think the issue is less about him focusing and more about staying alive. I don't get it, though. Where's the ball? Holy balls! Wow. Is that... the spirit bomb? It's massive. Oh my god, that thing's gigantic! It's gonna kill Frieza for Shut sure! Up. <laughs> there you are again, throwing your hands up in the air like you just don't care. Care, damn it! Damn it, this is bad. Dad. I believe I'm done. 
As entertaining a punching bag you make, I find there is no more enjoyment to be found here. Wait! We could always play a game of 20 questions! Alright then, first question. Are you about to die? No. Ah ah ah. No lying. Damn! Say goodbye, monkey. Uh, what? What is that glare? That's not a sun. It's not a moon, and it's certainly not a space station. What is that? What is that? What is that? Are we still playing 20 questions? You were planning on using that on me, weren't you? Yeah... I don't know where you got that much power from, but it doesn't really matter now, does it? <laughs> oh, I'm nuts. Looks like that whole Super Saiyan thing didn't pan out after all. <laughs> when you see Vegeta, tell him I said, like a bitch. <laughs> Piccolo, what are you doing here? No talk time, plan now! Well, I still got the spirit bomb, but I need both arms to charge it. You'll have to distract him while I gather energy. Well, that's not so bad. For five minutes. And considering how bad he was kicking my butt, eh, I'm sure you can handle it. Did you just hold a grudge? And I just keep getting reminded of my failures. You mean your failure at killing me, or just in general? <laughs> You know, I think I have an edge to fix for this situation. I'm going to blow you and this whole miserable planet to nothing. Isn't that fun? <laughs> Go -go just throw the damn thing. Can't. Not done yet. What? How? It's only been four minutes and fifty-eight. Done. <laughs> what? Oh, somehow I completely forgot about that. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> if I had any single regret for the countless horrific events that have transpired in my wake, it's that I'm dying. about my dad. Who do you think I was talking about? <sighs> Krillin, what? <sighs> All right, come on, you heavy bastard. No, no one actually helped me. That would be a little too much. <sighs> They're both alive. Neat. Grandpa, I don't want any more baths today. I'm clean now. Dad! Hey, Gohan. <laughs> you know, I gotta admit, after what happened with Vegeta, I was pretty sure the spirit bomb was gonna be a dud. But we showed him what for. Yeah, you could say he suffered a bad case of freezer burn. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, not dead. K thanks, die. You. No. Oh! Yeah! Whoa! For a moment there, I thought that was gonna be me. <laughs> You're next. Wait, what did I do to you? Remember my tail? Can't you take a joke? Called it. Last time on Dragon Ball Z Abridged. <coughs> oh, out of all the people I've blown to bits, that one will hold a special place in my heart. <coughs> What's wrong, monkey? 
Come on now, give me something funny. You killed my best friend. <laughs> <laughs> that is pretty funny. Hilarious, actually. I don't believe it! Goku has truly done it! He has become the one and only Super Saiyan! Right? E yeah You hesitated there for a second. Why? What the hell is all this about? What's up with your hair? What's up with your eyes? Answer me! Gohan, take Piccolo. Find Bulma, get back to the ship. But what about you? If Piccolo dies, then all this was pointless. Take him, get to the ship, and get out of here! This is surprisingly well thought out for you. Johan, where should you be right now? The ship. The ship! Okay. <laughs> Real cute. But at the very least, I do love a moving target. <laughs> what are you... Let go of me! I'm going to break you! What? Like a Kit Kat bar. What? What? You, you're different. What happened? What the hell are you? Can't you tell, Freezer? It's just like Vegeta said. No, you fing don't. I am the hope of the Omniverse! I am the light bulb in the darkness! I am the bacon in the fridge for all living things that cry out in hunger! I am the Alpha and the Amiga! I am the terror that flaps in the night! I am Son Goku! And I am a super! <laughs> Saiyan. <laughs> Uh, 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 uh. King Kai, what's going on on Namek right now? You know, you could always just grab my shoulder and watch. Yeah, but you kind of... smell... That's just my natural musk. 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 Stop saying musk. Stop eating my food. King Kai, do you hear me? Oh, hey, Kami. How's everything coming along? Well, I've sent off Mr. Popo to collect the Dragon Balls like you asked. Good. The whole plan is coming together. Hey, I don't think you ever told us your plan. I don't have to tell you everything. I don't have to tell you anything. And that just about sums up our time spent here. Ha <laughs> ha. Huh? It's the ship! See, Mr. Piccolo? We're halfway home. I mean, not literally, but... Just don't bleed out, okay? God, so many buttons! I forgot, I don't know how to fly the ship! I could have sworn somebody did that for- Oh my god, Bulma! Help! Somebody! I have to admit, this is new, monkey. This is definitely new. But a monkey is still a monkey. And I've killed plenty in my day. Millions. Literally millions. What's the matter, run out of quips? Cat got your tongue? No more words to fail? You think now that you're this so-called Super Saiyan that you're better than me, Lord Freezer? Well, you're not! I own you! I own your planet! I own this planet! In fact, this planet! Wait, I zone out there for a second, what? No, 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 son of a bitch! Arr! What's wrong, King Kai? You dumb assholes are gonna be here forever! <laughs> yeah, real funny, King Kai. Oh god, you're serious. I had this whole plan ready to go, but as it turns out, Fraser's a sore loser, and just- Slew himself up along with his opponent? What, it's what I do? Yeah, only this time it worked. 
And now, Goku, go on, Piccolo, everyone's dead. And I'm stuck with you idiots for the rest of my life. Should I call you back when you're done screaming? Or is that just not happening? And then there's this cut. I mean? Yes, I wanted to inform you that Mr. Popo has acquired the sixth Dragon Ball and- You're alive? So this is what counts for omnipotence these days, hmm? But if you're not dead, then that means Piccolo's not dead. And Namek is still there. Did, did you miss? How could I miss? I don't know, how did you? I know I hit the core. God, this always happens when I try and perform under stress. Seems to me like you just couldn't go through with blowing us both up. That's not the problem, you idiot. I can breathe in space. Uh, but space is a vacuum. Honestly, I say you only have, I don't know, five minutes, is it five? Yeah, yes, five. Five minutes before this planet explodes and you perish along with it. Oh. Well, then I'll just have to kill you in four. Wait, hold on. I I'm only at half my full power. I don't see how that's my problem. No, listen. If you let me power up, I'll give you a pizza. You killed my best friend, Freezer. That's not gonna work anymore. Two pizzas. I said I'm done! Ah! With stuffed crust. Go, cow. Now, hear me out, King Kai. If I let him power up to 100% and beat him then, he'll demoralize him. And he'll never threaten anyone again. Goku, that is retarded! Stop, Crust King Kai! You can eat it in reverse. I, I can't even believe we're having this conversation. Me either. Thanks for waiting, by the way. Hold on a second, King Kai. What was that? Oh, smash, monkey! Smash, monkey! <laughs> Get me! Only let me strand it all on my own to fend for myself! Planet's going to hell, I always die, and I'm freaking the f out! Bulma, how high would you have to fall from to hit terminal velocity? I thought so. I just love how easy it is to get away with this sh with you people. I want to transform, you just sit there and let me. I want to blow the planet up, you just sit there and let me. I want to reach 100% power, and you just sit right there and let me. So, can I get a meat lovers? And that is my star pupil. I don't even know why I bother. King Kai, are you there? Oh, Kami, do you have an update for me? Apparently, it's all I'm good for anymore. I wanted to tell you that Mr. Popo has acquired the final Dragon Ball and is ready to summon the dragon. Awesome, now let me talk to him. <laughs> if you insist. All right, now, Mr. Popo. Ah! How the hell do you work with this guy? It's easier than you think. I'm so f***ing high right now! I am the Eternal Dragon. Speak your wish and I shall... Oh, it is you, my master. Is it time to lay waste to this world? Eh, not yet. Give them a couple hundred years. See if they can clean this up. Then how might I be of service, Lord Popo? Good question. Call me. What the f*** am I doing? Good question. King Kai, the f*** is he doing? Ah, oh, my head. Okay, listen. I want you to bring back everyone Frieza and his men have killed. Why? Are you questioning God? Are you? Not in the mood, Kami! Fine, not my problem anyway. Mr. Popo? I heard. Dragon, bring back all the worthless maggots that were killed by Frieza and his men, or whatever. As you command, so it shall be. Oh, oh, right. I stopped my heart for a couple minutes there. Oh, God. Global warming? No! Oh, why is my neck so stiff? When there's no more room in hell, Vegeta shall walk thee! What the hell? What the hell? Well, I have my clothes back, so at least that's a start. Am I alive? Oh, yay! I'm alive! I'm alive? I'm alive! And... 
And I have an idea. <laughs> Well, now you're Super Saiyan Soup. I invite him in, dumbass. <laughs> huh? Oh god, what's up with the sky? This planet really is about to blow. I give it like two minutes tops. I'd better get to my ship and... Ah! Stop that! Stop not dying! You think you're better than me? You're nothing but an overgrown monkey! And you're nothing but an overgrown that thing Chi Chi keeps in her drawer! Man, Freezer's stronger than ever at 100%. I'll have to strategize. I know. A distraction. Hey, look, Freezer. A giant dragon. What? Well, I'll be damned. Immortality is mine. No, I am become error. Whip, you just piss off already. I don't have to use the bathroom. All right, I know one of the Ginyu ships must be around here somewhat. Yeah, I think I must stay away from that one. That, however, mine, 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 mine. Ah, my golden filthy wish dragon, grant me immortality, as so I may rid myself these vile creatures and secure myself as ruler of all creation. Is it those Tartapu? What? This isn't what I wished for! What's going on? Down here! You! No! No, you didn't! So what if I did? What are you gonna do about it, huh? Come at me, bro! Yeah. Hey, huh? Frieza! Hope you're ready to party, because it's Vegeta Club! <laughs> What just happened? Where did they all go? Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I'm actually just as lost as you. Huh? Are we? Huh? Toma! Gohan! What do you think happened? I don't know. We just disappeared all of a sudden. Ah, it's good to be the king. Hello? Who am I speaking to right now? My name is Dende. Dende? Are you the one who made the wish on the dragon? I am. How the hell did you know my plan? What plan? I just wanted to screw over Frieza. You know, if it makes you feel any better, I'm not immortal either. And I'm okay with that. <laughs> Are you just mad because I'm out with you now? <laughs> bigger! 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 Perfect. Nice try, but you won't be destroying any more planets. Um, except, you know, that one. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, bad touch. Kidney shot. <laughs> kidney shot. Kidney shot. Kidney shot. <laughs> and pause. Uh, uh, stomach punch. Oh. Oh. Gonna whiz red. What? What? Welcome back, Nail. Where? Am I? May I hug you? No! Oh. Johan! Ah! Uh, Mr. Piccolo! And Dende? But I thought that... Turns out we're all alive! <laughs> Except the Krillin. How unfortunate. No! 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 I think he's looking for you. Do not tell him I'm here. No! I can sense you! Do not make eye contact! You know? Looking around, it seems like the only people who were bought back were those killed by Frieza and his men. Huh. Well, that's convenient. Sir, we cannot find the Tagrock tribe. Wait, you mean that one guy who really liked showing off his Dragon Ball? Yeah, that dumbass. Oh, huh? I wonder what sort of handsome, dashing rogue could have been responsible for their deaths. Oh, wait, it was me. Ha! Huh. Nice. He massacred an entire village! Yeah, I'm going to be honest with you. I don't really like any of you. Except him. Ha! 
Oh, God. Actually dying this time. Lord Guru, you can't leave us. I'm sorry, my children, but I must leave you now. My time is at an end. But before I leave, I must confess my sins. What do you mean? Do you remember the great drought that befell our planet? The one that nearly wiped out our race? Yeah. The one caused by those filthy albinos? Yeah. The ones we purged as per your instruction? Yeah, see. I might have shifted the blame on that one. You what? Remember when I said they were the ones responsible for the disappearance of our precious water? We slaughtered thousands! It was me. How? I drank it. What? How do you think I got so fat? And now I can die with a clear conscience. Uh. Uh oh. Kill him! No! Ah! Oh, no! Choke oh! on now! Choke on now! Dirty monkey! Duh? Well, oh my god, you could grind meat on us. Ah! I'm done. What? I'm done finding you. I'm bored. You're boring me. What? Oh, I get it. You're scared, aren't you? Afraid knowing that this planet only has one minute left before it explodes. Question. Huh? Do you have a watch? No, why? Do you know what a minute is? What? Of course I do. I don't think you do. Uh, but, uh... Anyway, I'm gonna leave now. <sighs> Try not to blow uh, up any more planets. Uh, else I might have to kill you. You can't just... Why not? You little... <laughs> hey, monkey! You forgot your pizza! Oh yeah, thanks for reminding me. That's not a pizza. That's not a pizza at all! Now to end this! I... Uh, huh? Oh, come on now, I... Uh, this blasted thing! What are you doing down there? You trying to swat a bee? Because I don't like bees. No, don't worry, I'm just... Uh, what is going on? What are these, inverted controls? Who even uses... Ah, got it! Damn it! So are you just stealing Krillin's attacks now? Or should I watch out for the tri-beam? Or the garlic gun? Or the macacopotamus? Gotcha, bitch! Huh? Don't feel bad. Phil never hits anyone with it either. Anyway, you done? Oh, far from it. I just remembered I promised you two pizzas! Really? You seriously think that that pathetic million year old trick is going to. Clever dick! Where'd that flying monkey go? Now say you're sorry! Are you sorry yet? I think I peed a little. I am done. Freezer, look out behind you! I already told you that trick won't work! No, serious! Get down! Oh, ha ha! Keep going, you stupid! Inbred monkey! Daddy, I don't want to be on Namek anymore. Oh. My. God. You know, you keep reacting, trying to prompt us to ask what's going on. You could just tell us. Alright, fine. Frieza got cut in half. <laughs> Whoa! Wow. I didn't think Goku had it in him. He doesn't. Frieza did it to himself. Ah! My organs! Stay in there. Stay in your home. Daddy needs you. Wow, Freezer. You really were a cut above the rest. Oh. But too bad you didn't make the cut. Oh. Guess you could call this a slice of life. Please stop. All right, then. I'll cut you a break. I'm going to split. Wait, wait, wait. I, I know I've done a lot of terrible things. Killed quite a number of people, some of which you liked. Uh, but may I ask you, as one neighbor to another, can you spare a cup of energy? 
Well... No! 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 I'm not even no, asking anymore. No! no. Ah! Now be responsible with this energy. Don't use it to hurt any more people. Or on the drugs. What? But... Why? I'm gonna go now. Got a long trip home. I'd ask if I could take one of your legs with me, but you're probably hungry too. Bye! Uh-huh. He's... really just leaving me here. He gave me his energy and left me. Maybe this is a sign. Maybe I should change. Maybe this is my second and last chance. Maybe I was wrong. Nah! Oh, dang it, Freezer, now I have to give you more! see him anymore. I guess he took the energy and left. Speaking of which, where am I going? Ah! 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 I... Don't you dare. Ah! Okay, you win! Goku blew Frieza up! See, was that so hard? Well, not as hard as it's gonna be to get off Namek. Where am I? Where's my ship? Everything looked the same before, and now looks all the same, but I'm fire! Uh, a ship! Oh, I gotta find it! Goku, hurry! The controls! Where is it? Where is it? It's about to blow! Come on, come on! There! <laughs> Oh my god. Yay! It's... It's over. What? Goku could not escape the explosion. Namek is gone. And so is he. No. Goku, no! No! Why do you care? Uh, what? Why do any of you care? Are you forgetting the whole reason that they went to Namek in the first place? Now we have two sets of Dragon Balls. Well, yeah, but you make it sound like death is no consequence. It really doesn't. We're literally waiting to go back. Hell, this is Chaozu's second time. Next time I get a free Sunday. Huh. Ha. Huh. Yeah. So, who wants to tell Bulma? Let me do it. Bulma's my girl. <laughs> yeah, okay. Go ahead, stud. And now that I have devoured Guru, I have become the new Grand Elder. Huh. Seems legit. Hey, Bulma! It's me, Yamcha! Oh, hey, hold on a moment. My ex is calling me. Hey, girl, let's get to... Wait, ex? What's that about? Yeah, I'm breaking up with you. What? Why? You haven't called me in months. I have been dead! Oh, well, that's not stopping you now, is it? Do not do this right now! Hey, you want to know how this is ending? Hey, Vegeta, want to come live with me? Only if it's got a pool. He's the reason I'm dead! Well, then, I guess he's just more of a man than you, isn't he? Oh, you dirty bitch! Yeah, okay, I'm gonna take over. This isn't going anywhere. Now you listen here! Attention on... Oh, my God, Wag! Okay, listen. Gohan's fatherless, and the Namekians are homeless. So, that's a thing. Have fun delivering the message. I've got to go cast up Yamcha's leg. Why? Huh. Well, uh, Gohan, Goku's dead. Damn it! Namekians, your planet blew up. Damn it! So, until we can use the Dragon Balls, who wants a big old sleepover? You think you can accommodate the entirety of my people? My dad's a billionaire genius playboy philanthropist. Speak of the devil! Wait, I feel a dark presence on that ship. Where's my baby? And so the Namekians were relocated to the Briefs compound. 
So, honey, you say all of these are your friends from high school? Yes, Dad. Tell them to keep out of my scotch. The Namekian adults learned golf. Tricky bit of putting here. Very difficult to read from this angle, and the greens have been running rather fast today. Maury looks like he's aiming slightly to the right of the hole, and good for par. The Namekian children learned strip poker. All right, Sprouts, lay them on the table. Gohan caught up on his studies. You read it, you learn it, you love it. But Mom, I've already read Huck Finn. Yes, but this one has the N-word taken out. Piccolo did his usual thing, only with company. So, uh, you want to go hang out with our race? No. Because, you know, this may be the last chance we'll ever get. No. Well, you're boring. And you're ruining my meditation. You're not meditating, you're napping. I know the difference. Vegeta did what he does best. Bitches! Son of a bitch took my scotch! Call me! And soon four months or one Namekian year passed, and the Namekian Dragon Balls became ready for use. During our time squatting here on Earth, we taught the dragon how to speak English. Oh, well that's convenient. Rise, Paranga! Wait a second, I just thought of something. Maybe we shouldn't do this out in the middle of the... Godzilla. You have summoned the great Paranga. Make your wish and I. Okay, listen, I'm sure you get this a lot, but can we just get like six wishes? Because we're just going to bring you back in four months and do this crap again. Plus, we're just bringing some schmucks back to life. Well, that is unconventional. But considering the ease of these wishes, I will accommodate. And a planet. Well, that's just a dick move. All right, let's get the hard one out of the way. Dragon, build the Namekians a new Namek. Donzo. Sweet. All right, you guys do whatever you want. First, Tien and Chiaotzu. Oh, hey, we're back. Kind of want that Sunday, though. Chiaotzu. I'll wait. Next. Yamcha. And I guess you want to wish back your dad now, huh? Actually, we want to save him for last. Yeah, like I said, you want to wish your dad back, right? Dende, we have to wish Krillin back. Ah, uh, fine. We wish back Krillin. <laughs> Krillin, you're alive. <laughs> eh, just give him a minute. And now, last but not least, bring back my dad! Bring back his dad! I cannot do this. <laughs> what? The one called Goku is still alive. What? He is? That's great. Then just wish him here. Dragon, will my father hear? Oh, uh, sorry. Can't do that either. Okay, what? The one called Goku wishes not to return. Pardon? He said your father wishes not to return. I heard what he said. I want an explanation. Well, I'm sorry. Wishing all your other friends back to life and building a planet has left me a little worn out. He doesn't want to come back. End of story. Now if you have another wish for me, I can try that. Otherwise, bite me. Gohan, I... I know it must be hard. But maybe your dad is off somewhere else, doing something really important. I just want you to know that, that I'm here for you and, and that I, I love you. What? What? What, what did I, did, did I say it too soon? Oh God, I said it too soon. Oh God, I f***ed it up. Dragon, take everyone from old Namek and put them on new Namek. <laughs> This ship will take me where I need to go. Now I can train without anyone bothering me. What the hell is that? A phone? Hey, it's me. Don't ask me how I got this number. I've got people. 
What the hell is going on? Okay, listen, I figured out that they used the Dragon Balls to wish back everyone who was killed by Frieza's men. Technically, you worked for Frieza when you killed me, so BAM! Nappa's back, baby! Woo woo! What about all the ones you killed? Well, technically I worked for you, but that has changed. I'm in Hollywood now! What, are they doing a live adaptation of Mr. Clean? Ha! That's hilarious! Find me the guy who writes your material and give me his number, because I'm a producer now. Of course you are. What do you even do? Actually, I'm in charge of this new project. Wrote it myself. It's about this one guy who's killed tragically by his best friend, but then comes back as a ghost and haunts him. I call it Citizen Nappa. Merchandising rights alone are gonna make a f mint. We just signed on this great new actor too. Name's Mark Satan. Need to work on the first name, thinking Hercule. What do you think? I... What do I care? You're not on my board. But I- Listen, I'll see you around. And when you're back on Earth, give me a call. We'll do lunch. Ciao. God damn it, Nappa. <laughs> Yes, though this rain may wash these pools away, the blood that soon shall flow, no storm shall meet the task. I will cover this world in a darkness so thick and chilly, the only rival shall be the hell in which I spent all those years. Brace your brittle selves, you worms. Garlic Jr. shall soon rule you all. In the Great Lakes near Mount Palzu, there is a breed of Palzu tuna clinging at life in its saltwater habitat. Fist near to extinction by the inhabitants, they are slowly making headway back to a sustainable population. A sweet salty Christ now. Hey, go on! Going fishing? Yep, the dad's on. I'm the breadwinner now. Well, what's with the weird clothes, Krillin? Uh, 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 my name is no longer Krillin. My new name is Juan Sanchez. I'm compelled to ask why. Well, before we left for Namek, I took out a huge life insurance policy on myself and left it all to my twin brother. But you don't have a tw- Wait, your last name's Sanchez? And it paid off in triple because I died off planet. They said, don't worry, there's no way you're gonna die out in space. Show them! Well, I'm still gonna call you Krillin. So, what do you think of my new ride? Eh, it's a nice car, I guess. Not what I was referring to. Juan, I broke a nail. Can I have a thousand dollars? You can have two! Gohan, I am an excellent boyfriend. Krillin, how did you meet this woman? We met at the bank. I was there picking up my life insurance money, and she was there depositing her money from her night job. I think she's a waitress or something because she was depositing a lot of fives and ones. And me and my dear, sweetie little chestnut fell deeply, truly in love. She says I have a very rich personality. And a wealth of knowledge. And her boobs are as big as my head. I have made the comparison. So, you going to the party tonight? Well, I don't know. Mom wasn't a huge fan of that Walking Dead theme party. Previously on TFS's The Walking Dead. <laughs> I think I can make it. See you there, Gohan! Goodbye, Gonad! See you at Master Hoshi's! <laughs> eh, say what you want. They're a good couple. You ever think about buying a house? Oh yeah, let me get right on that with all that money I don't have. Well, you ever thought about getting a job? I'm a green slug man. No amount of affirmative action is going to get me a job. If you say so. By the way, that old guy's been standing there for like 15 minutes. Maybe you should say something. Ah, <sighs> fine. What do you want, Kami? Mr. Popo has kicked me off the lookout for the night. Apparently, he has a booty call. Jinx! 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 Shut up, bitch! You love it! Last time he did this, I found five corpses. He laughed when I said five. Well, what do you want from me? I was hoping I could stay at your house. I don't have a house. See, what I tell you? Shut up, Nail. Is someone in there? Hello, Kami. He can't hear you. Actually, I can. Hello there. 
Who are you? I'm Nail. I'm a Namekian Piccolo fused with Onnamek. You do know that technique is forbidden, Piccolo. Your face is forbidden? Sadly, that was the best one up here. Shut it, Nail! So, nice of you to bring your new girlfriend here, Juan. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. At first, we kind of thought you brought home a hooker. Yamcha! Oh, we did? I can assure you that my darling, beautiful Marin is no hooker. Well, that depends. Sometimes I take extra cash in the back room, but those are always under the table, so I don't think they count. How much extra? How much you got? Well, I am a professional baseball player. Okay, first off, no one screws Yamcha but life. Second of all, blue hair, real original. Third, Juan, don't you have any other friends you can take Marin to meet? Well, we saw Gohan earlier, but he was busy pounding the tuna. What? With Goku gone, Chi Chi needs someone to do it. <laughs> we also stopped by Corin and Yajirobe's. But. This brunch is delicious, Yajirobe. Thank you, I cooked everything myself. So, if you two had babies, would they be little fat men or kitties? And we are leaving! Probably fat kitties. I don't think I'll be taking her back there again. Happy birthday! Thank you. Thank you all so much for remembering my 1,000th birthday and for this marvelous cake. Isn't that thing kind of a fire hazard? Of course, Turtle. You're our very best friend. My birthday was last week and I didn't get a party. You've been there for us from the very beginning. Anyone remember when I saved the world from Pilaf? Like a member of the family, I say. Seriously, I live upstairs. Oh my gosh, someone got whoever's birthday it is a turtle. Can I have a turtle? Sure. Oh, can it be this turtle? Of course. Wait, what? Turtle, be my wingman on this one. If I get some, I swear to God, I will send you pictures. Deal. Seriously, maybe we want to blow this out before something catches on. Ah, my beard! My glorious beard! No! Hey, Krillin. What are you doing out here? Why aren't you upstairs sleeping with your girlfriend like everyone else? Oh, hey, Turtle. I'm just up thinking to myself. What you thinking about? It's just... I'm not sure if Marin loves me for who I really am. It's all presents and traveling and caviar and... Beluga? No, Pauzu tuna. Well, that's rare. And it's just... I just don't know if she loves Juan or Juan's money. How much money do you have? Uh, about 5.7 million. Didn't you get me a gift card from the Gap? Not what we're talking about. Okay, look. If she really does love you for who you are, then you have to tell her the truth. Open up to her. It's the only way. Are you sure that'll work? Well, if it doesn't, you could always get her a giant pearl. What? Bitch is a gold digger. Okay, first we're going to go by Lush because all of their soaps look like cakes and I want to eat them. Oh, and I hope you remember to make those reservations for Le Nucere at 7.30. I hear they're very uptight. And can I really go through with this? She seems so happy. No, no, Krillin! Stop focusing on that perfect heart-shaped pillow of an ass! Tonight, you will tell her! And then you will tap that! Please tap that! Oh my god, I just love nice walks on the beaches. Oh, do you think if I swam out far enough, I'd reach Australia? Oh my god, can we go on a sandals vacation? Listen, Marin, I need to talk to you. Oh, don't worry, Wonton. I made the reservations for you, so you don't have to worry about it. Actually, I need to come clean. See, my name isn't actually Juan Sanchez. It's Krillin. That is a silly name. <gasps> I'll call you Krilly Billy. That's not everything. You see, all this money I own is actually from my own life insurance policy. From when I died on another planet, blown up by an evil space emperor, but was then brought back to life by a magical dragon. Uh, huh. But what I really want to ask Marin is, do you love me for me, or do you just love me for my money? Oh, Krilly Billy. Of course I don't just love you for your money. You, you really mean that? I never loved you at all. Oh. 
Well, can we at least still try the sex stuff? No, Krillin, you don't understand. I was never really your girlfriend. See, I'm with the state's fraud bureau, and you just confessed to a lot of insurance fraud, which I recorded. Wait, you have a recorder on you? Where? In my boobs. Curses! The one place I couldn't reach! I'm going to prison, aren't I? Well, normally you would, but do you have any idea what they do to guys like you? No, you'll just have to pay back everything you owe. Wait, what about all the money I spent on you? You'll just have to pay that out of pocket. But I dropped over 500 grand on you! Honey, I work for the government. I never claim to be a good person. And that's why I need a place to stay. Hell, go blow up the air mattress. I do have to admit, though, it's nice being a free man again. No women nipping at my heels. Know what I mean? <laughs> All right, I demand to know who has been spreading rumors that I've been forcing Gohan to, and I quote, pound my tuna! Look, Chi-Chi, if it really upsets you, we'll all take turns pounding your tuna, okay? But only if we get to eat it together. Hmm. <laughs> 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 the view hasn't changed a bit. Clean that up. I beg your pardon? Have you any inkling in that simple little head of yours who you're speaking to? Oh, please, do go on. I am the usurper of this once proud throne your worthless guardian holds so dear. I am Garlic Jr., returned from the wretched abyss known as the Dead Zone. And I have come for what's rightfully mine! What's going on? I don't remember releasing the black or a mist just yet. Oh god! Mr. Popo, I'm back, and I, oh my me, what happened to the lookout? Oh, don't mind this, Kami. I just had a bit of Italian for dinner. What does that have to do with- Cause it was nothing but garlic! Sweetie, roll out the cot. I think we have a visitor. Where's she coming? I'm not sure. I never opened my eyes. Hey, you've got a lot of nerve coming back here. Oh, a valet. Neat. I'm not tipping. Don't you remember who I am? We fought when you landed on Earth! No, I fought Kakarot. Nappa fought everyone else. Well, except for that one scrub who got killed by a cyber- <laughs> Oh yeah? I dare you to come over here and laugh at me! Ha. 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 Yeah, see, now we can laugh together. Okay, seriously? We have enough to clean up without a pool of Yamcha's urine. You, come with me. What? Why? Because you need a shower. I could smell you from East City. How's it specific to smell you from East City? Yeah, you better run. Hey, I'm setting out some new clothes for you, and I'm gonna wash your armor. Fine, but be careful. There's a dry clean only. Whatever. No, seriously, they lose their elasticity. Hello? So, Vegeta's living here now? That's neat. The man single-handedly responsible for murdering most of the entire gang is taking a shower in the other room. Neat is not the first word that comes to mind. Okay, so I just got a look at Vegeta's ass, and besides being surprisingly nice, he's got this weird hole. Uh, yeah, even boys have those, Bulma. No, you idiot! I mean a hole above that one! You mean he's a chick? Earthwoman, where's the cleansing powder? We don't have that here, we have soap. The hell is soap? It's that yellow block there made of animal fat. That sounds awesome! Ow. Ah, this tastes nothing like what you just said! Okay, I changed my mind. This is pretty neat. Is that the beta male? No, Krillin just got here. Oh god, they're breeding. I swear, the only thing I hate more than weaklings is the color pink. There it is. The home of the brute who dared laid hands on my darling little angel. Yes, Daddy. What a pretty little blue pearl it is. 
What was it called? Earth? Actually, it's pronounced Earth, Daddy, 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 Daddy. Really? But there's an A in it. I'm just going to keep calling it Earth. It doesn't really matter anyway. Soon it'll have a brand new name. Vacant Lot. Son of a bitch! What, still ticked off about the shirt? No, I'm... Well, yes, actually, I'm absolutely livid. But that's not the point! That idiot Kakarov failed! Frieza's still alive! Chiaotzu, do you feel that? There are two enormous power levels approaching the planet. Yeah, see? Last time this happened, I blew myself up. Yeah, I was gonna ask you to hold off on that this time. <laughs> See, now we just have to carve out an area, and then we'll start building the hi hey Do you feel that? Frieza? No! Okay, I'm right here. Please stop yelling! Oh god, go on! It's him, 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 it's him! Krillin, calm down! Now are you sure it's him? Go on! Once you've had a man inside of you, you know when he's coming. Mom, where's my Saiyan suit? Woman! Where is my Saiyan suit? It's under your bed. Thank you. It's in the wash. You bitch! All right. Judging by how quickly his power level is closing in, he should be here in about- Hey, so I need to talk to you about Bulma. You cannot be serious! Look, we're not dating anymore, but still, she's a really close friend and- You are actually doing this right now. Hey, guys! Oh, great, and she's here too. Why don't all you idiots just start showing up? Hey, Vegeta! I was f***ing kidding! Shinhan, Chiaotzu! Huh, looks like we got here in time. Oh, hey. Vegeta. What? Nice shirt. And there it is! Now all we need is the Namekian and we'll have the whole potpourri of pathetic. Uh, been here the whole time, actually. Oh, what do you want, a medal? Nice shirt. Kiss my ass, green man. Yeah, it's the kind of shirt that really screams, Huh! He's coming! <laughs> Wait, now he's pulling back! No, now he's... going back that way! What's he doing? Daddy, we can park anywhere we want! Now, son, if this is anything like that jockstrap incident, we don't want to get boxed in. So has anyone else noticed that there are two power levels around the same strength on that ship? Yeah, it's probably his dad. He has a father? Makes sense. Everyone has a dad. Except me. Ha! Your dad's dad! So's yours! Ha! So essentially, we have two opponents of equal strength that my father could only beat after fulfilling an ancient alien prophecy. Does anyone in particular know exactly what we're doing here besides trying not to lose it? Guys, we are so screwed, I don't know what we're gonna do! I mean, this is completely crazy! Why did I come here again? We're going to die! I'm gonna die again! You know, if he weren't again. doing it, it I would! Oh, we don't need Kakarot or anyone else. You have enough badass saying on your team as it is. Now, if you'll excuse me, you can all just sit on your hands while I go up there and take care of business. Or, maybe we could hide our power levels, sneak closer to them, survey the situation from up close, and perhaps catch them by surprise? Y'all are bitches. Well, son, is this what you were expecting? My god, this is droll. We're so far out in the space, dick 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 dicks. There's not even a space radio shack. Much less a space best buy. Buy, buy, buy. Circuit City. Are you alright? Yes, Daddy, just processing. And wouldn't you know it, no place to buy more RAM. But I won't lie, Daddy. I'm absolutely ecstatic. When that filthy monkey arrives back on the planet, he'll return not to the smiling faces of his dear friends and family, but a total, unadulterated genocide. Speaking of which, soldiers, the scavenger hunt will proceed as such. Normal human heads are worth one point. Namekian heads are worth 20. Filthy half saiyan brats, 50. And if you find any miserable, odious, insubordinate, full-blooded monkey garbage, you win. Well, off you go. Yes, sir!
So, how many points are those? All right, Frieza's just over this next formation. Now, before we move in, we need a plan. So here it is. All of you will attack from the front. And while you're being slaughtered, I'll flank him, taking him from behind and securing the kill. Ready? Break! No. Yeah, no. Personally, I don't think Bulma should be here. A battlefield is no place for a lady. And yet you're sticking around. I'm serious. I worry about her safety. And as my close personal friend, possibly even bestie, I think we need to consider- <laughs> And you don't want to explain to Yamcha here what 10 pounds of torque does to a human ear? Rips it off? Very good, Gohan. <laughs> gonna f***ing die. So is this him, sweetie? Is this the man who hurt you so? No, Daddy. This is a new one. So, you must be Frieza. Actually, it's Lord Frieza. Really? Then why is there an eye in it? There isn't. Huh, gonna have to fix that one when I get back then. Anyway, I'm here to kill you. Oh, my, my. Not five minutes on this wayward rock, and we already have a volunteer. Tear, tear. Dead man. Soldiers, do your jobs. Lord Frieza, with all due respect. This sounds like insubordination. He just turned an entire squad into a pile of limbs. And that sounds like it's not my problem. Man, move your bitch and bitch ass over, bitch. What, power level of five? Shit, ain't nobody got time for that. Well, that ain't right. Consider that a warning. Either leave now or die. Ooh, is that an ultimatum? I love ultimatums. Here's mine. Either die to him or die to me. What? What just happened? Give it a second. No, really, they're just... No, no, hold on. Yeah, it took me a whole three months to get that one down. They make it look a lot easier than it really is. Real hard part was that guy's armor. I ended up going through a dozen mannequins before I cinched that one. You missed a spot. Lord Frieza. The f***. You know that was our last minion, right? Who cares? We have more at home. No, I mean now we have no one to fly the ship. I can fly it. Son, we do not fly ourselves. Flying is for the help. So, uh, curious. What's with all the spare parts sticking out of you? Impudent little. These are not spare parts. What you are looking at is the ultimate culmination of science and nature. Oh, wow. I've never seen that before. You know, the only reason you continue to breathe is because I need something to entertain me until the Super Saiyan arrives. Oh, really? Because if it's a Super Saiyan you're looking for, I can fill the part. What? <laughs> oh, you hear that, Daddy? I can fill the part. It's like a five-year-old trying to play police officer. Or like how you play Pretty Pink Princess. Daddy, not in front of the malcontent. But it's so cute when you do it. I haven't done that since I was eight. Eight, eight, eight. My quinceanera. Ah! What? Jones! That's... that's my dad. Are you sure, Gohan? Either that or he just fell Frieza's mom. Who here just thought of Frieza with boobs? Really? I'm the only one? Yes! He must never know. Those... those eyes... they're the same as... Pizza! No! 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 Build! Murder! Destroy! Exterminate! Exterminate! <laughs> All right, get down here. I'm going to call Space AAA and have them tow us. Thank you very much. What? What? Frieza, what did you do? Daddy, not now. <laughs> huh? 
Well, Frieza, looks like you dropped the ball. Dropped the ball. Drop to the ah! You almost destroyed the whole planet there. Sorry, I got a little bit carried away. Doesn't matter now, though. Our little Super Saiyan is dead, dead, dead. Cadaverific. Hey, Frieza! What? You should if you're trying to be clever, you're sorely yeah! lacking, huh? Ah! is a Super Saiyan! Like hell he is! Spiky gold hair? Incredible power? You don't know that he's a Super Saiyan! Maybe he's superhuman, huh? Maybe you slackers just haven't been trying hard enough! Says the non-Super Saiyan. F*** off! You murdered my princess! Oh well, you win some, you lose some. Children? Yeah. Oh. Okay, sorta of thought you'd be a little more pissed. Oh, blindingly so. Mind if I see your sword? What? Why? I just wish to hold it. No! Oh, come on, be neighborly. I'm not your neighbor. I also think I hate you. Look, after what you did, I can fit what's left of my son into a meat pie. Let me see your stupid sword! <sighs> Fine. See? Nothing nefarious. I just wanted to inspect the craftsmanship. <laughs> Admire the temper. Test its edge on you, you insubordinate hit! Oh, still not sure if you hate me? Actually, that pretty much sealed it. Uh, no, no way, please. I, uh, we can make a deal. If you spare my life, I'll give you a planet. Three planets. Two and a half. You just went down. I'm a haggler? Good work, team! Hey there, guys! F*** this guy! I'm about to go meet Goku, just follow me! Wait, did he just say my dad? Wait, go on! We don't know if we can trust this guy. I also brought snacks. But the Bible does say love thy neighbor. You're a Buddhist. A hungry Buddhist. Fly 300 meters northwest, then land near Idiot Rock. So that's what they called it before Idiot Crater. Now, I'm sure you're all wondering why I brought you here. Snacks! To kill us! To kill Snacks! Goku is going to land near here in approximately three hours. Until then... Let's all have a drink. I've got soda, beer, and heat tap. Isn't it a little early to start drinking? Hey, five o'clock was 20 hours ago. So, stranger, what's your name? Can't say. Well, Mr. Can't Say, I'm Krillin. That's not funny. What isn't? So... You know my dad, right? Well, sort of. Really, I've just heard a lot about him. It's kind of- So hey, like, just gonna throw this out there? You're really cute. Uh, well, you know, my mom always said I was a cute kid. <laughs> oh, a mama's boy, huh? I'll be your mommy. Can I have another heat tap? Yes, yes you can! By the way, that jacket is awfully familiar. Um... Yeah, I even made it myself. Capsule Corp logo? Even cut it short to show off my midriff. 
If he's never met him before, how the hell does this kid know where Kakarot is going to land? And he can't actually be a damn Saiyan. Either he's a liar or... Maybe. Wait a second! Did someone drink the last heat tap? I'll kill you! Xiao Tzu, we only have to wait a little while longer. We'll say hello to Goku, and then we'll go home. Can we get McDonald's? Only if you're good. Aww. What? What are you looking at? What, do you like what you see? Yeah, that's right. Eyes to yourself. I don't swing that way. I'm a real man! Hey, Mr. Pickle? Yeah? I was wondering, why didn't you go with the rest of the Namekians to your home planet? Oh, I don't know. Why don't you just go to Vegeta with the rest of the Saiyans? Hey, I've already got one hitting on me over here. I don't need another. Oh, thank God. All right, everybody. Goku should be landing any moment now. <gasps> well, I don't see him, so you're wrong. I think you've been lying to us the whole time. There's no way you could... That could be anyone. I mean, I swore Freezer was gonna Yamcha at least one or two of you. Speaking of which, hi Yamcha. Hey. So, which one of you guys ex nade the old Freezer frame? Well, Kakarot, while you were off bumming around in space, I took charge of the situation, gathering up your planet's measly excuse for fighters and spearheaded an assault on- Right over here. I was getting to that. Oh, if it ain't you, you old so-and-so. It's been so long since I, uh... I... I mean, you? We've never met before. Oh, thank God. Or Kami, or King Kai. I don't know, the whole thing is screwy. Actually, if it's okay with you, I'd like to talk to you in private. Oh, okay. One minute, guys. But, Dad, it's been almost two years! I know, but I gotta go talk to this purple stranger. But, I uh, yeah, cool. Okay, Trunks, don't be nervous. He's just a normal guy. Just introduce yourself. So, you're Sun Wukong, right? Damn it! I'm Son Goku, yes? Roll with it. I'm Trunks. Nice to meet you. Trunks, huh? So you're the one who whomped Freezer. Yes. I was actually wondering, how did he survive Namek? Well, I kinda maybe sorta kept letting him go. Yeah, probably a bad call. If I hadn't shown up, all your friends would be dead. Oh boy, the dragon wouldn't be happy about that one. Also, I'm curious. When you fought Frieza, you were a Super Saiyan, correct? A super duper Super Saiyan. Well, can you show me? I barely know you, but I guess. <laughs> Still kind of tickles. Yep, that's a Super Saiyan, all right. So, now that you've shown me yours, I'll show you mine. into your hair it's yellow so is yours it is blonde spiky hair incredible aura well vegeta now that goku's here to compare we can finally say for sure that that kid's a super utter one more word and no dragon alive will be able to fix what i do to you so tien uh, have you been lifting because you are jacked yeah who knows? Maybe I'll be the next Super Saiyan. So, a Super Saiyan too, huh? That's cool. Took Krillin dying for me to become one. Wait, did something happen to Krillin while I was gone? No, but seriously, how's Krillin? It's just like my mom said. You're absolutely amazing, Goku. Now I know that I can reveal to you my secret. A secret? 
I love secrets. I'm awful at keeping them, though. Like, the worst. Um... Oh, but don't worry. I'll totally keep this one, though. I promise on Krillin's life. Um... Okay, you're right. I promise on Bulma's life. You promise on my mother's life? Bulma's your mom? Damn it! I can't believe it. I was only gone for a year and a half, and already a Super Saiyan. Kids grow up so fast these days. Uh, no, wait, you don't understand. And what? Next thing you're gonna tell me is that Vegeta's your daddy? Mm. Oh my gummy, Kai. <laughs> What's so funny? Your shirt! Man, good for them. I'm gonna go over there right now and congratulate them. I'm from the future. For realsies? For realsies. Whoa. Listen. Three years from now, on the 12th of May at approximately 10 a.m., on an island nine miles off of South City, two creatures will appear. A pair of man-made monstrosities, half human, half machine, crafted by a mad scientist from the now defunct Red Ribbon Army. <gasps> Androids? Actually, the technical term is cyborgs. Androids! Look, my point is, they're dangerous. Each of them on their own dwarf even Frieza with their power. And? And they kill everyone. As in Vegeta, Kiran, Piccolo, Tenshinhan, Chaozu. The only ones that survive are myself, my mother, and Gohan. Oh, wow. Wait, you didn't mention Yamcha. Oh, um, I mean, he dies, but... See, after he found out that my mother was pregnant with Vegeta's child, he sort of... Dark. Wait, what about me? I don't know how to tell you this, but you don't make it to the battle either. You die of heart failure the year before. What? Why? How? High cholesterol. From what? According to the coroner, too much bacon. You take that back. But listen, in the future, my mother has developed medication that will help level your cholesterol. Is it grape flavored? I don't know, yes. Because I don't like grape. Then it's bacon flavored. Yay! Well, now that we have all that settled, I better get back to the future. It was interesting to meet my mom and dad. As I said before, I really needed to keep that a secret. One little slip up, and I suddenly may not exist. Wait, but if you don't exist, then you don't come back in time. But then you could never tell me, which means I'd never know you'd still be born, and why does everything smell like copper? I tentatively leave this in your hands, Goku. Train well, until we meet again! Oh, okay. Goodbye, Tron! What a nice young lady. Now, get my story straight. Goku! What was that all about? You guys! Androids! Yeah? And? Um... On Mars... May. May... 20... 12th. May 12th at 10 p.m. A.m. A.m. Nine miles? Nine miles. Nine miles off of... North? South? South City. Two androids will appear on May 12th at 10 a.m., nine miles off the South City. In three years, I heard everything. Please don't tell everybody. Oh, I won't. I will. Shut up, Nail. Okay. According to the kid, we all die to these androids in the future. We have three years to train before they arrive. Well, maybe they'll kill all of you, but I'm not afraid of any over-touted washing machines. By the time they show up, I'll crush them without a thought, and then we'll see! Oh, hey, Vegeta. Nice shirt. I... you? Pink is a good color on you. Just take the compliment. Ah! Hey, there he is! Well, it's time for me to leave. I'll see you all again in three years your time, but hopefully you won't need me. Father, I hope to get to know you a little better next time. Mother, I hope to get to know you a little less. Get the hell out of here! By the way, I can teleport. What? Yep. Check it. But aren't those... Goku just done stole my glasses! Master Roshi's on the whole other side of the world! Yep, yep. I just gotta imagine him and poof! There I go. I learned it out in space. 
Oh yeah, sort of forgot the obvious question there, but how did you survive? Mm, muffin button. Don't say muffin button, but it was. There's science and stuff. See, while I was on Freezer's ship. There! Yes! But when the planet exploded, the muffins actually formed a seal around me, both protecting me and feeding me all the way to Yardrat. And that is... The place where I crashed. The Yardies were awfully nice. They nursed me back to health and even made a ship for me to come home in. They also kept feeding me their sick. So now I can teleport. So if you could teleport and you knew Frieza was coming, why didn't you teleport to freeze a ship and stop him? I kind of wanted to give you guys a chance. Please don't make a habit of that. No promises. Looks like we'll have to put ourselves through the training of our lives if we hope to stand a chance against these androids. Wait! We don't have to do any of that! Hear me out! We just have to gather the Dragon Balls, have the dragon tell us where to find the guy who's making the androids, find him, then murder that son of a bitch in cold blood! As much as I love the phrasing of that, I'm gonna have to say no. And by no, I mean hell no. Are you kidding me? You heard Piccolo, none of you survive. And I, as a Super Saiyan, relish the challenge. <gasps> You're a Super Saiyan, Vegeta? Show me. I, well, yeah, I just, I- Don't tell me. You're not in the mood. What, does that third eye make you psychic? No, but it does help me see bullshit. Hey, you know what? Fuck you. <laughs> You know, to be fair, I'm with Vegeta on this one. I want to fight me some androids. I haven't had a good fight since Freezer. Wait, so the first thing we do after you get back, after being gone for a year and a half, is train. I know, I'm excited too. Yeah, okay. Well, guess that settles that. I'm off to go fire Kamehameha's at the ocean over and over. See you all in three years. Good to have you back, Goku. We're gonna go get McDonald's. Suppose we'll get moving on too. Come on, boy. Wait. Yamcha? Yeah? You're my friend. Oh, uh, <laughs> thank you, man. So, wanna go drive cars? Bitchin'. I'm on the highway to Hippo. I'm on the highway to Hippo. And thus, they went their separate ways to prepare for the upcoming threat. However, a few of them would find roadblocks. Like hell you will! Oh, come on, Chi-Chi. Don't you come on, Chi-Chi, me! You're gone off in God knows where space, refuse to let the dragon take you home, and the first thing you ask for when you get back? Oh, hey, Chi-Chi, mind if I take our baby boy to go train to fight some monster robots? Androids. And the first thing I asked about was dinner. The answer is no! No to dinner or no to Gohan? Ah! Aw, oh, but Chi Chi, don't be like that. Be a pal. Yeah! Oh my gosh! Ugh. Dad, run! What? The worst you can do is ground me, now run! Meanwhile, Vegeta found ways to innovate his training. 500 times Earth's gravity? That's insane! You'd be crapping out your own spine! I know, the challenge excites me. Look at my nipples. Look at them! Fine, I'll build you your ship. What's the worst that could happen anyway? Ah, my nipples! Wow, he really needs to learn how to dodge. Yeah, I know, still working on that. By the way, how'd you convince your wife to let him train with you? We're on a field trip to the Ozarks. Please never tell her we were here. What are you talking about? We're just studying. Uh... uh... Let's go drive cars again. Yay! Are you f***ing insane? No, but you're upside down. Now you're not. You know, it would be easier to count the amount of your ribs that aren't broken. Work through the pain. And exactly how are you going to work when your body collapses? Please, the Prince of All Saiyans does not collapse. 
Whoa, look at that. The prince of all two Saiyans on the ground. Three and a half, shut up! Oh no, the prince is getting all huffy. What are you gonna do, try to blow up Earth again? Because I have Goku on speed dial. You must be as stupid as he is if you think he knows how to work a phone. Don't you call me stupid. Okay, then how about bitch? Arrogant dick. Spoiled sow. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. My room, 10 minutes. Oh, yeah, that's it. Keep going. Right there, right there. Yes, Gallic yes, gun. yes, yes! Oh, wow. Yep. <sighs> Gotta admit, even with the broken ribs, you really... Wait. What? Where's your condom? The fuck's a condom? All right, I packed you all some lunches for your field trip. We're going to Uruguay. Uruguay. Make sure you're safe now, okay? Well, I don't know how safe we can be. We're gonna be finding androids. Uh, what? But make sure you don't tell Chi-Chi. Three years, Dad. Three years. You almost had it. I'm taking a long bye. <laughs> So what do you think? How ready are we to take on these androids? On a scale of 1 to 10? My chest hurts. Huh? At uh, 7 or 8. Hey look, it's Krillin! Hey Krillin! Oh, hey Gohan! You've barely grown since the last time I saw you, huh? It's funny, I think that every time I see you. <laughs> hey, that must be the island! Holy crap! The city is huge! And this island's so tiny! What do these people do here? Apparently, prostitution is legal! Oh. oh! So the prostitutes... Hey, guys! Down here! Hey, Yamcha! Get shit on! Bulba! Bulba's baby! Baby! Bulba has a baby! You're damn right! Yeah, and you won't believe who the father is! Vegeta! 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 Vegeta. Well, it could have been mine! It's Vegeta. I'm just gonna walk over here. He's my baby boy. His name is Trunks. <laughs> That's a girl's name. So then, where's Daddy? Unfortunately, our last conversation was... You are such an unbelievable asshole! You know, you're being bitchier than usual today. And not in a hot way. You got me pregnant, you idiot! How is that my fault? You said you were wearing protection! I was wearing my armor! You're a moron. Well, what do you expect me to do about it? What you're going to do is go out, get a job, and help me raise our child! That was a year and a half ago. So, you know, you tell me. Well, on the plus side, your boobs look amazing! I... you... <sighs> Just take the compliment. If you guys are done acting out your favorite chick flick, we've got it coming. <laughs> Oh god, not my son. Oh wow! Yeah, Jirobi, I can't believe it! You came all this way to help us fight the- Yeah, no! Kern sent me. Take your beans. Bean Daddy out. Bean Daddy? It's what I call my burrito shop. Or at least I would, if Kern would let me have one! So that song... I was desperate and needed the money. And no, it wasn't worth it. Cat loves food, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, hey, we never wished him back before. Look, in the sky! Is it a bird? It's the androids! My second guess was plain. Damn, they flew into the city. I can't sense their energy. Neither can I, and that's my specialty. It must be because they're androids. We only know how to sense life energy. Then we'll have to hunt them down the old-fashioned way. Search the city. What? Oh, oh come no, on! No, really? Do we have, have to? I mean, I just want to go home. All right, gang, split up and search for clues. Gohan, go grab Yajirobe. Bulma, hold the sensu beans. They'll only weigh us down. Hold on. What? Break. Right now, if I were an android, where would I be? Well, I guess I'd be right here, because being an android wouldn't really change where I am, just what I am. 
If you think about it. Uh, all right, time to find me some androids. Hey, you, have you seen any androids? I don't know. Are you an android? No. Then no. But I did see a flying dude. Landed right in front of me, man. Looked a lot like you. You holding? Hey, Jerry! You see that guy explode? Yeah. I bet you it was a terrorist attack. Jerry, you always think it's terrorism. You think your house getting TP'd is terrorism. You're what's wrong with this country. What do you think, inconspicuous old man in mime? Whoa, 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 Marcel Marceau. If that's what you're looking for, it's gonna be $30 an hour. 50 if you want it weird. <laughs> Hey, you old jackass, get out of the road! You wanna beat up prostitutes? Do it on your own damn time! Please put that back. I kinda need that to flee from you. Huh? Oh, man, that was close. Surely someone else heard it, right? I mean, I don't have to. Oh, this isn't fair! Huh? Oh god, oh man, oh jeez, oh crap! Nineteen, identify! Orange jumpsuit, black spiky hair, higher than average power level. Son Goku, 94%. I don't remember him having a scar. 87%. Close enough! I am totally in over my head here. Maybe, maybe I should call for help. No, 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 that's exactly what they'd expect. Isn't that right, inconspicuous old man? And... I mean, really? An android is just a human with wires instead of veins, and oil instead of blood. I wonder if they dream of electric sheep. Hmm, techno lamb. Huh? Whoa. Woohoo! Not me! Now, Senbuku, I shall extract my long awaited revenge forthwith. I'm not Goku! I'm not! Forthwith! No! Oh, come on! Really, man? You couldn't last like 30 seconds? Ah, we have company. Correction. New target identified as Son Goku. 100% match. Well then, looks like I don't need this anymore. <gasps> oh no! Yamcha's been yamcha Quick, Krillin, give him a sensu! Goku. Alright, quick, Krillin, taking the Bulma! Ha! <laughs> looks like there's two kinds of fisting in this city now. Pretty sure he's bleeding out. Alright, fine! Bulma will get it. Man, seeing that hole in his chest kinda makes my chest hurt. Like a lot. Anybody else? So then, you two must be the androids. What? Impossible! How did you know we were androids? Scanning probabilities. Scanning. Scanning. Analyzing. Could not tell you off the top of my head. Processing complete. They are psychic. 92.4%. They can't see the future! Psychic, eh? Well then, bet you won't expect this! Oh! Ah, I see you have discovered that the off switch to my ocular vapor beams is in my cheek. But you are too late! The entire population of the city has been reduced to ash. Now no one shall interfere with my revenge. Actually, I'm pretty sure you only- Yes! The entire population! All right, you are most unkind! We really should move this, though. Hey, Piccolo, know any good wastelands around here? Why are you asking me? You know why. <sighs> Northwest, about a hundred miles. It's actually kind of nice. Then it's a date! I can think of worse places. Nice rock formations, neat cacti... Oh, fuck! Hey, look! Goku and the others are leaving with the androids! Oh, no! We have to warn them! When the old man was holding me, I could feel my life force draining! You were losing a lot of blood! No, it was coming out of my mouth! Gross. I'm telling you, they can absorb energy! Then we have to go now! 
You know, I uh, might just sit this one out. Oh yeah, I get ya. I never have any energy after I get a hand job either. But up, up, but up, bye. Well, fine. If you're not going anywhere, I need help with the baby. How are you with diapers? Hold on, Krillin. I'm coming. <laughs> so how you feeling? My car got blown up. Well, to be more specific, it was Corrin's car. Pussy wagon ain't no more. Well then, are you gonna fly after them? No. Is it because you're fat? Yeah. All right. Now that we're away from the city, we can- <sighs> Does it feel hot out here to you guys? <sighs> Cause it's hot. As I was saying, we can finally get this underway. But first, who are you? And what do you want? You don't need to know why. Just know that I despise every one of you. Especially him. Hey, does anyone have any bacon? I sort of ate all of my pocket bacon on the way here. But allow me to shed a little light for you. For the last 14 years, ever since the 22nd World Martial Arts Tournament. Ooh, I remember that one. I got hit by a car. Indeed. Since then, my Insectoid Nanoborg has been surveying and processing every battle you have fought, rating them on a scale of 1 to 10. Out of curiosity, how was ours? Average, 6.5 out of 10. That's fair, I guess. How about mine? 8 out of 10. Ha <laughs> ha! I have utilized this information to calibrate ourselves appropriately. We are now powerful enough to kill Son Goku and take revenge for what he did to myself and the Red Ribbon Army. Wow, so you even followed him all the way to Namek, huh? Of course I did! Nineteen, what is Namek? Data not found. What do you mean, data not found? Insectoid mana board destroyed during Saiyan attack. Bugger all! So, I guess you've never seen a Super Saiyan then. Nineteen? Data not found. Then no. Goku? Oh yeah, okay. <gasps> Power output exceeds projected parameters. I don't care if you're Super Saiyan or a Super Solid. 19! Kill him! Kill him proper! Executed murder.exe. Loading. 10%. 20%. 40%. 60%. 70%. 80%. 90%. 100%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 1000%. 
Team, what are you in safe mode? Start responding this instant before I shove my boot up your ass! Breathe it, breathe it. Murder.exe fully online. Oh, bully. Ah, uh, didn't seem to work. Don't worry, guys. I'll try again. Double strength. Ah, uh, me! Goku, don't! They can absorb your energy! Hold on a sec. Did you know? Well, yeah, I felt it when the old man was holding me earlier. And you couldn't have said anything before because... Hey, give me a break. I've already been through enough crap today, and if I wanted to be bitched at, I would have stayed with Bulma and the baby. Yeah, guys, lay off him! He needs this like he needs a hole in the chest. Huh? Huh? I get it! And he's got you! Oh, hey! Can I have the energy back? <laughs> Guys, I don't want to make a scene, but I'm pretty sure I'm dying. What's going on? He hasn't used that much energy. Come on, the sensu bean. Sensu bean! Thanks, bunny. Oh, God, it made it worse. Goku, what's wrong? It just hurts. Hard to breathe. How's your arm? Dunno. Can't feel it. Is that normal? So, Goku's having a heart attack. Dad! You took the medicine, right? Yeah. Well, I mean, I started to. Started to? What? You mean you stopped? Why did you stop? Because it was great play bird. Did he just knock the Super Saiyan out of him? Piccolo, tag in. <laughs> Go on, tag in. Well, boys, I can't say it hasn't been fun. In fact, if I still had a penis, it would be quite auspicious that we are wearing baggy pants. But enough about hypothetical erections. Nineteen! Suck him dry! No! Dad! Does anyone else hear that? Yeah, and it's getting closer. And it sounds an awful lot like... Mine. And the prodigal asshole returns. Mr. Piccolo! I wanted to wait for an opening on the android, so I faked my injury. But now he's here. Wait, so you weren't actually wounded? No, but I got a better question. Where was my sensu bean? Sensu bean! Hey, Vegeta. Kakarot, you idiot. What are you doing? Dying. Mostly. A little help. <laughs> Best buddy. Ugh. Come on, Dad. We'll get you home and give you the medicine. No, let me do it. Let's be honest. If I stay, I'll probably just get in the way. Yep, probably. No offense. Why are you even here? Sensubine! You know what? Have fun. Primary threat he's keeping. Two kilometers. Three kilometers. Excuse me, but your primary threat is right here. Six kilometers. Seven kilometers. Am I being ignored? Don't mind him, he's programmed to only respond to my command. Nineteen! Forget about Son Goku, we can finish him at our leisure. For now, focus on... Who are you again? Scanning. Vegeta, Prince of all Saiyans. Oh, of course, how could I forget? Nineteen, take care of him. Understood. <laughs> this is precious! You expect to beat me with this automaton of fun? Registering insult. Retort, you are short and your hairline is receding. Ooh, scathing. Your confidence is noted, Vegeta. But Son Goku is able to achieve a form far beyond anything we'd ever seen before. And we still beat him! And Nineteen has extensive knowledge of all your techniques. Oh, is that right? Quite the cutting-edge piece of tech you got there. But I'm curious. Can it feel fear? Scanning. Processing. Results inconclusive. Let's fix that, shall we? Seriously? What the f*** is Namek? I 
thought you had to have a pure heart to become a Super Saiyan, like my dad. Oh, trust me. There's more than one way to realize the legend. I wanna! I wanna be a Super Saiyan! I wanna! I wanna! I wanna! I wanna! I wanna! I wanna! Push-ups, sit-ups, and plenty of juice. And besides, my heart is pure. Pure, unadulterated, badass. Yeah, more like pure, unadulterated ego. I heard that, Triclops! Is that okay? As a matter of fact, go f*** yourself. Now where was I? Hmm, what a shame. Looks like you just initiated your self-destruct sequence. Let me give you a countdown. Five! Did I just see his foot? Well, well, well. Looks like I'm a size 19. Four! So have you rusted your pants yet? Three! Damn it! No, don't panic. Everything will turn out dandy as long as Android 19 can grab Vegeta and steal his energy. You know, I'm sure there was an advantage to building a fat robot, but for the life of me, I just don't see it. Boxing be breached. Trapped up EXE activated. Yes! That's it, 19! Do not let go of him, no matter what! Drain him until he's a shriveled up prune of a corpse! Parameters recognized. Grip locked. Locked, huh? Well, guess I'm not going anywhere for a while. How's about I get a workout in? That's right. I'm gonna do squats all over your face! Initiating. Energy. Drain. Aw, oh, how adorable! So you want my energy then? Tell you what! Take as much as you want! In exchange, I'll take your hands! Two! Error. 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 So then, before I put down the clown, let's put it to bed, shall we? Do you feel fear, Android? No, please. Get away. Leave me alone. All I needed to hear. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. One. Big bang attack! No, 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 no. Your 30-day trial has expired. Would you like to purchase when raw? <laughs> ah, now that we have Chuckles the ass clown out of the picture, how about we tend to the elderly? The f did he go? <sighs> Whatever. Baldy, pass me a sensu bean. What do you think? I'm just giving these away? Cause I'm not. How? <clears throat> when a goddamn Super Saiyan asks you for a sensu bean, bald man, you say how many? <laughs> ah, that's better. Count yourselves lucky to be in the presence of a shining golden god such as myself. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm off to go kill the other android. You peons may stay here and erect a statue in my honor. Vegeta's a Super Saiyan! Yeah, whatever. Did you catch the name of his attack, though? I know, right? Big Bang Attack? Uh, I don't know. This coming from Mr. Special Beam Cannon? Hey, why don't you try coming up with a better name for an attack? How about... Devil Drill Beam? What about Spiral Death Beam? Doom Laser? Rail Beam? Nail Gun? Shit, that's good. So just because he's a machine, I can't feel his energy? That doesn't make any sense! Energy sensing's bullshit. Hey, why are you hiding? You scared because I blew up your friend? I'd call it your sex bot, but as you're currently demonstrating, you don't have any balls! Yes, he's desperate to find me. I just have to wait him out. Oh man! Sure do feel winded after blowing up your robosexual life, partner. 
Sure would suck if you jumped me and took my energy. Oh no! Some dust in my eyes! This is the worst! Get the f*** out here! Hey, Vegeta! We finally caught up and oh god, no! And now your energy is mine! But that's exactly what I was planning on. I knew you couldn't resist jumping out to suckle on my Super Saiyan teat. And now you're mine. All mine, you old lady! Hey, get back here! I wasn't done! This tactical shit's getting really old! Now you get out here and fight me blindly like a man! You're a mandroid. Yes, you may be a Super Saiyan Vegeta, but you're still just an arrogant little brat, aren't you? Ollie Ollie Oxen, bitch! Well, while you continue to prattle on, I shall make my escape and... Oh, they followed me. No matter, I'll just head the other way and... Okay, fine. I'll just maneuver back where I came from. Why the hell is he even here? Then again, at my age, I could use more greens in my diet. Alright, what about Regicide Blaster? Doomsday Crush! Anarchy Barrage! Taco Tuesday! Hellzone Grenade! Eh, yeah. screw you, I'm keeping that one. <laughs> Hello there! I'm gonna leave you two alone for now. Oh, don't struggle. Just lie back and think of... Namek. Damn it. I have to contact Gohan. Gohan, do you hear me? Oh god, this feels amazing. First thing I'm gonna do when I get home is step in front of a full-length mirror, strip down, turn Super Saiyan, and... Uh, go on, go on, go on! Cat loves food, yeah, 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 yeah. Cat loves... Uh... You heard... nothing. Damn it! Johan, this old man's got me from behind! You have to- Oh, my... Seriously! How do people keep getting on this line? <laughs> no! My head cylinder! Johan, how did you- You two are hanging in the middle of the air! How could I not see you? Don't you... sass me. Well, look who oh. finally installed a pair! Well, uh, this is a little awkward. Maybe we could have a little dialogue and work this out No. Out. Okay. Then how about I fight the bald one first? Anytime, old man. No, that one! Yeah, I'm opt out! How about this one? Oh, please. As if you're in any condition to fight me. Krillin? Sensor Bean. Sensor Bean? Sensor Bean. Sensor Bean! Ow. Call me the can opener, because I'm about to bust open your metal ass. Yeah, how about you just leave the one-liners to me? Besides, the old man is mine, Namekian. I just figured you wouldn't want to sully your Super Saiyan hands on such a weak opponent. You know the funny thing is, I know you're playing me, but you're right. He's all yours. Ah yes, pick me against your little green man. I've already consumed enough energy from him to match him twice. <laughs> ah. Oh my god, Chaozu's dead! And he really let himself go. And he's an android. That's not Chaozu. Oh, crap baskets. There's a long list of bad ideas, and this one is at the top. You know that, right? I absolutely refuse to sit around and not be part of the action anymore. Do you know I never even saw Frieza? Not once? I'm pretty sure no one ever complained about not meeting Hitler. I mean, some people do, but they're weird. This isn't up for debate. You do know your kid is in the plane, right? Oh, he doesn't know what's going on. Yeah, I don't think that's the point. Also, he keeps trying to feed off me. Don't worry, he'll give it up when he realizes it's a dry well. Yeah, about that. Have you ever seen what an old sensu bean diet does to a man? What? Corn likes it. Okay, first, 
What? Second? The f You know, I did spend three years training with Goku. Oh, so what? Are you a Super Saiyan now, too? Well, more of a Super Namekian, I guess. Wait, I thought you were a demon. Nope, slug man. Wow, that's significantly more mundane. Uh, I know. By the way, what's that brain case made out of? Oh, well, it's a polycarbonate thermoplastic laminated- <laughs> Anyone else feel like we overtrained for this? Tell me about it! No, shut up! You know, I never understood why you would even bother installing pain receptors. Kinda comes off as an intentional design flaw, if you ask me. Don't you criticize my methods like you understand the neural system. Pain is imperative to recognize when you are in peril. To give the human mind context! So contextually speaking, how f***ed are you? You lime colored son of a bitch! It's going to take me at least two hours to program a new hand! No, wait. I'm right-handed. Three hours! You miserable reprobates! What have I ever done to you? Pretty sure you vaporized half a city. I meant recently! That was an hour ago. Semantics! I'm sorry I'm late. The time machine's a little imprecise in terms of hours, and what the hell is that thing? Trunks? What are you doing here? Ha! That's a girl's name. Wait, isn't that the name of your kid? What, are you trying to imply that this wannabe Super Saiyan from the future is my son? Well, guess that cat's out of the bag. But seriously, what is that? That's the android. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Yes, I am. You stay out of this. Wait, so you're saying that that's not the android that kills us? No, I don't even... But you said two androids, right? And we've been fighting, too. Yes, I said two, but that's not one of them. Why didn't you tell us what they looked like, then? I only ever met the two. Well, look at that. So did we. Hey, guys. And now the woman's here. Mama, no! Did she bring me? And there's my door. <laughs> oh, wow. Pretty sure I was about to be a wish there. Oh, God, the baby! Oh, there you are. Aw, don't worry, Trunky. It was just an explosion. You'll get used to those. Those happen a lot around Mommy. I could have sworn I saw somebody else in the car with you. Hmm? Hey, Anjirobi. What is it, Corin? Why don't you go help out the gang? Oh, sure, Corin. Why not? What's the worst that could happen? I gotta rock up my butt. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! He got away again, and not a nut or bolt to be found! Not that you had any nuts to begin with! Uh -huh. Look, I don't mean to tell you how to be a father, but why didn't you try and save your wife and son? My what and my son? Wait, you mean you two never got married? What is that, some kind of food? No, just listen. When two people love each other... Oh wow, I'm just f***ing with you. My god, who doesn't know what marriage is? Also, love each other? Making a lot of assumptions here. <sighs> So, I thought you guys were fighting androids. Why was Dr. Giro here? Who that? Scientist. Worked for the Red Ribbon Army. Adequate with robotics. Oh! Hey, Mr. Kansai! You may want to hear this! You f***ing failure! Hold on a second, I- You told us! Two androids, May 12th! 10 a.m. South City! Well, nine miles off of- And what happens? We waste our time on the wrong f***ing androids! Look, I was- uh, How old is that baby? About 10 months. 10 months old at the time! How about next time you come back to give someone a heads up, you give them a goddamn photo! Just listen. I think traveling back in time may have caused a butterfly effect. The androids that kill you in the future could still appear. I don't give a shit about butterflies. With all this time we've wasted, Dr. Giro has probably made it back to his lab already. And God only knows where that is. I know where that is. You do? You do? Why didn't you tell me? Because this never came up before. No, I meant in the future. Never mind. How do you know? All scientists know where other scientists' labs are. 
Dr. Frapp, Dr. Wheelow. Who? Long story. Last time I checked, Jiro had a secret lab right outside North City. Well, then it's time for round goddamn two! Wait! You can't just take off on your own! Are you giving me orders? No, I'm trying to help you! Oh, well, I'm sorry, but... I don't listen to bastards. Gohan? Yeah? You're a good kid. Oh. Thanks? No, we have to stop him! Dad, wait! Wait, Dad? Oh yeah, by the way, that kid's your son. No harm telling you now. Damage already done. Oh wow, he grows up to be a cutie! And... Oh my god, I solicited my son for sex. <laughs> Why didn't you tell me? Because it's hilarious! You just learned about it. And it is hilarious! Anyway, Gohan, I think Bulma and the baby need to go home. We do? You do. Well, it would be nice to check in on my dad. Actually, I kinda need a ride too. But I... Actually, I'd like you to take me home first. But you... Stop worrying, Gohan. I'm sure Goku's fine. <laughs> All right, made a miscalculation. A couple miscalculations. Lost an android and a hand, and I think my brain case is loose. But there's no way they can follow me, and none of them know where to find my lab. Huh? That's funny. They're all flying right toward my. Oh, find me in the Alps! No, there's no way they could have secured the location of my secret lab. Unless they know a scientist, like Wheelow or Frapp, or any of the brief. Shit! Oh, your father, huh? Yeah, you never talk about Dad. What was he like? He was... a loner? Had a lot of trouble making friends, very abrasive. Am I a lot like him? You have his gender. You know, if you really wanted to help out, you could stop following me around and start searching these mountains. I'm trying to save your life! If you just stop and listen to me... The hell do you care? Oh, come on! We both know I'm your son! And are you as disappointed as I am? Alright, we've got a lot of ground to cover. Please don't say what I think you're gonna say. We should probably... Here it comes! ...stick together for safety. Oh! Thank our green god and the lookout! I don't know. Probably cover more ground if we split up. You shut your mouth! Nah, he's got a good point. Ah, great god damn it! Why am I so scared anyway? There's like a sextillion mountains around here. Chance of me running into him are. <laughs> 540,000 to one! Lucky you! Ta ta! Ah, there's no place like home, and the only person who even got close is currently incapacitated. Hey guys! I found Dr. Jero! In his lab! I found Dr. Jero's lab! Inconceivable! How are you? Sensor Bean? I don't know what I was expecting. Please, if you wouldn't mind waiting for a moment, uh, Tien, I have something I'd like to show you. Okay! <laughs> Ah, <laughs> oh, crap, it's the androids. I literally can't believe that worked. I also can't believe I may have to resort to 17 and 18. I should measure my choices. I can't be too careful with it. Piccolo, over here! I found your own lab! Ah, oh, my wrist! Caution to the wind, then! Hello, Dr. Zero. How are you today? Well, that's... new. I... I'm just messing with you, man. What's up, Doc? Oh, there it is. Good morning, Android 17. Man, according to my database, it's been a while since you last turned us off. You mean since you tried to destroy me? Yeah, Doc. And I'm real broken up about that. It's just every time you talked, all I heard was, Kill me, kill me, kill me! Something with my auditory. 
think it's gone now, though. Well, suppose you just needed to be turned off and on again. Hmm. How about that? You gonna wake my sister up, too? Indeed. I require both of your assistance. Wow. Must have gotten yourself in some shit. Here, let me get in on this. Ah, now my rip! Hello, Dr. Jero. How are- I already did it. Ah, uh, you dick! We were supposed to do that together! I know, but I couldn't help myself. Whatever. What do you want? Well, Son Goku's comrades are currently knocking at our door! Ah, my other wrist! Jesus, use your shoulder! After a bit of an incident earlier today, I lost Android 19 and my arm- Wait a sec. You built another android? Wait, wait, wait. Was it that fat clown thing? I thought that was a joke. Well, clearly it was. It's dead. And so are we if you don't- Whoa, slow down. Are you an android? Holy shit, you're an android. How did you even do that? I took my brain out and put it into this body. How? I... Huh. How did I do that? Ah, now my shoulder! It's like it's made out of some kind of metal! So, we having a party? <gasps> Must be. Because you're late. Only because of this brat's constant back chat. Because you flew 200 miles past North City. And I'm about to put my hand 200 miles upside your head. That doesn't make any sense. Jesus, they're loud. Great, and now Vegeta's here. 17, 18, you two are charged with eliminating them. You know, I'll get right on that. But first we gotta talk about these trust issues because I get this strange feeling that after we kill them, you're just gonna turn us off again. And I don't even know how. Why, with this remote, of course. Oh. You mean this remote? No, uh, but you see, that's just the decoy remote. I wouldn't show you the real thing. <laughs> but, uh, I do need that remote back. It was my mother's. Oh, don't you worry. I'ma hold on to it real tight. Whoops. Did your hand just malfunction, bro? Think it did, sis. Enough of this. I'm sick of standing around. No, we can't do this without Goku. Why? It's a goddamn door. That's not what I... All right, so where are the real androids? That's them. Wow, you are just the grand central station of disappointment, aren't you? How are these people friends with you? Making a lot of assumptions right now. <laughs> wow, you got a whole hot mess of these guys over here. And you need to get rid of them! I don't know, we might need some help. Oh, what's this? Your secret project? No, he's in the base. I mean, yes! Very secret! Don't touch! Wait a second. Did you build a ginger android? Man, there's a soulless machine joke there, but that's beneath me. Wait, what? So I'm pretty sure that's three androids you've missed. Do I hear for? No, 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 no! Do not activate Android 16. He's not properly programmed. Oh, and how many of us are? Howdy, folks. I'm Android 13. Look at my trucker hat. I was going through a phase. Well, let's say we open him up and get to know our new friend. Don't you dare! I am your master, and you will do what I say! I... I'm sorry. Could you repeat that? I think the ear thing's back. I said, I am your master, and you will do what I... <laughs> sorry, Doc. <laughs> Just following orders. So, could one of you possibly spare one of those sentient <laughs> So, does this mean they're on our side? <laughs> Vegeta's kid! So, you're done throwing a hissy fit? At least I did something instead of just standing there staring at them! We do do that a lot! What? They're still alive? But that was my strongest blast! 
So you just assumed they were destroyed then? We do that a lot too! Besides, what exactly changed from you in the future and now? More than I thought, less than you'd think. Man, Mystery Kid up there sure is cranky. I think someone needs a nap. Whatever. Let's just pop this bad boy open. Initializing update one of 1,430... Yeah, screw that. Man, you are a tall bastard. So, Firecrotch, what's your name? I am designated as Android 16. What are the odds? The old man did always have a one-track mind. What's your deal? I am programmed with the sole purpose of murdering Son Goku. See, this is what I'm talking about. I'm glad I killed him. You killed Son Goku? No, Dr. Jiro. Oh. May we go and murder Son Goku? Well, ain't got nothing better to do. So if the name of the game is Kill Son Goku. Let's play. Hey, we should grab us a car. The hell do we need a car? Because I want one. Uh, are they flying away? Get back here! I am sick and tired of being ignored! I wish we could ignore you. No, Dad, stop! Are we really doing this again? I wish you'd understand. There's no way we can fight them without Goku. And I wish you'd understand who you're talking to. I am Vegeta. Why would I ever need that gibbering fool's help? Because you're not as strong as... <laughs> Push the Goku button. You shouldn't have did that. Uh, Chi Chi, you might want to come in here. Sorry, hun, cooking up a storm in here. This is looking kind of bad. He's screaming up a lot of blood. I'll make sure there's plenty of iron and protein in the meal. And I can't really remember the last time he inhaled. Now, while that's sort of impressive, I don't think it's healthy. Goku doesn't have a ton of brain cells to work with as it is. Look, to be honest, it's just nice to have him in the house for a change. Oh, good, he took a... All right, here's my idea. First car that comes our way, we appropriate it. Ugh, and all the way out here in the boonies, it's probably going to be a semi. Oh, I hope it's a truck. What do you think, 16? Will it assist us in murdering Son Goku? I don't know. I guess you could hit him pretty hard with it. Then I too hope it is a truck. Well, well, well. If it isn't Faggity Andy and on the Raggedy Ann. I'm going to break his arm. Kind of proving his point, ain't you, sis? Shut up, Ann. So, which of you children wants to tangle with the Saiyan Elite? Uh, I don't know. How about you, 16? No. He is not Goku. Man, we need to get you a hobby. Acquiring hobby. Hmm. Well then, 18, guess he's all yours. I'm on car watching duty. Ah, oh, thanks. Make me fight the troll doll. So, ladies first, then. Well, just to warn you, I'm not afraid to hit a woman. That's fine. Neither am I. <laughs> Hey, so was Vegeta always blonde, or...? The birds flew away. Oh, yeah? I like the birds. Good for you, man. Ah! ah! First blood! You may as well give up now and... God damn it! I was kidding! Huh? What is it, Clem? Well, you ain't gonna believe this. A couple of Europeans are fighting on top of the truck? Huh. That is weird. You know what else is weird? Aw, oh, damn it, Mitch! <laughs> Put that away! I can't believe he's taking them on alone! He has no idea the kind of destructive force they pack. The androids are humanity's greatest threat! <laughs> Kill as many people as I have to as long as you are one of them! Oh, hey, 18, you're back. No cars yet. You know, there is a freeway over there, right? Oh, I know. 
This is just funner. So, Android, are you done running? I don't know. Is your mouth? Well, aren't you f***ing clever? But wait! I have a retort! Ah, oh, yeah! A truck! Ah, oh, dick. Be honest. Is this just a short guy thing? You talk a lot of shit for a washing machine. And no, I'm not just saying that because you're an android. I'm saying it because you're a wo- <laughs> You know what? Just for that, I'm not gonna take it easy on you anymore! Hmm. Father, are you in there? Did anyone get the number of that bitch? 18. Thank you. You okay in there, Vegeta? Eat a dick! Okay, he's fine. Oh, hey. Vegeta's little pal showed up. How about it, 16? Wanna go knock some heads? No. Whatever, man. Father! Oh, thank God you're still alive! We have to get out of here now! Are you kidding me? I have her right where I want her! Do you live in your own little world? Yes, but unfortunately, I have to share it with all of you. Actually, <laughs> Vegeta, you don't have to share it all. You two seem like you're having fun, so I'd hate to have to interrupt. But if any of you decide to jump in and help MC Widow's Peak over there, I will personally introduce you to the ground. And trust me, your relationship will be intimate. Yeah, not exactly in a rush to help out Vegeta. I mean, maybe if it were Goku? Did he say Goku? Calm down, 16. He's not here. But I heard him mention Goku. Just focus on your birds, buddy. Acquiring birds. He likes birds now. Can we stop talking about Kakarot for just a minute? I mean, for God's sakes, he's never even around! Sad thing is, he's not exactly wrong. Now, if you'd like to continue this fight, I can finally get around to disassembling you. You smug c***t. <sighs> yep. Let's see how you handle this! Does that ruffle you, Android? Well, you've managed to destroy my favorite slash only jacket and ruin my leggings. So yeah, ruffled's a good word. Well, that was only a taste of my power. Now experience my super Saiyan How quickly bravado goes out the window when you're flat on your ass. That's pretty sad. Sad for you! Things are looking a bit dicey, but... Father! Okay! Okay, Trunks can handle this. I mean, that sword could freeze on top. Oh, no! Hey, Bright Eyes. <laughs> okay, we need a plan. We need to... Uh, run away! Oh, my God! What did I tell them? <laughs> So if you can explain to me in one sentence why you thought this was a good idea, I might just let you go. <laughs> yeah, see, I don't get it either. If you think breaking my arm was enough to defeat me, Android, I'll show you how wrong you can go! Damn it, woman, would you let me finish a goddamn sentence? See? This shit right here, this is why we don't group up. I'm just gonna do what we usually do and wait for Goku. <laughs> Hello, bird. What is your name? Toriyama. I would love to see your dinosaur. It does what? Uh, uh. Hey, uh, you okay down there? Uh, yeah, what did I miss? Well, both the Saiyans are down, one of the bald guys is getting choked out, and the other one is quacking. All right. I've got this. Whoa, no you don't. You wanna bet? Not really. <laughs> 
All right, so what do I win? Hello? Uh, oh, it's a surprise! Uh, why do I yell things? Hey, so who's got two broken arms and is a total bitch? You stupid bitch. You only broke one of my arms. This guy... Huh, that's cool. He can turn off the blonde. Yeah, and unlike you, he doesn't need a bottle. You're just mad because I wore it better. If by wore it better, you mean people kept mistaking you for me. I'm sorry, does that make me girlish or you mannish? <laughs> that's hilarious. You talk like he fights. Um, why do I do things? Okay, now listen. I believe that if we were to come to blows, I would, uh, come up short. No pun intended. <laughs> He's funny. Roll it back, pint size. We're not gonna fight you. You're about as threatening as a cocker spaniel. You bring up a fantastic point. So I shall continue to stand here and do nothing. Sounds good. We're gonna go kill Goku. I... You... <clears throat> oh, damn it, you can't kill Goku. Yeah, pretty sure we can. Okay, but you shouldn't. He makes a fair point, but I insist we still kill Son Goku on the grounds that I want to. Well, you heard the mandroid. Hands are tied. If that's your answer, then I will be forced to stop you. <laughs> that's uh, cute. You're uh, cute. Have fun living to not fight another day. The hell was that? You got a thing for dwarves now? What if I do? Societal definitions of beauty are BS anyway. Look, if this is about pissing off mom and dad, you could just date a black guy. Oh my god. Oh, right, they're dead. Oh my god! Wow! Oh man, I gotta tell everybody! But first, Dr. Sensubean! Huh? What the hell happened? I had like 15 of these! Oh, that should be enough. Man, they are not gonna believe this! I don't believe you. I can't believe you. I don't care. Dang it! What about you, Vegeta? <laughs> See? He believes me. And he's jealous. Damn it, not again, Trunks! Huh? Just give it up. Ugh. Mom said that he was stubborn, but this is just asinine. Yeah, but at least he's not trying to kill us all again. He tried to what? Jesus, future Bulma, what the shit? Not to belabor a point, but we just got crushed. They were way stronger than any of us could have prepared for. Yeah, and somehow, they're even stronger than in my time. What? Are you kidding? Jesus, future Trunks, what the shit? Fantastic, so even with two Super Saiyans... We're all just the north side of useless. Well, if Super Saiyans won't cut it, then maybe what we need is a Super Namekian? Huh? Too bad those don't exist, huh? Hey, Piccolo, right? Super Namekian! <laughs> oh, my other me! Shut <laughs> up! <laughs> you can all kiss the greenest part of my ass! There are greener parts of his ass? Wait, where is he going? Eh, looks like he's flying up to commies. Or whatever else is in that direction. Could be a lot of things. Wait, so I'm confused. Is it Kame House or Kami House? No, 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 listen. Kame House is the place with the turtle. So, uh, gonna tell me what that was all about? Look, just... You might be getting a new roommate. Do I have to move the pool table? When did you get a... I almost fell for that. Fell for what? <sighs> It isn't my beautiful daughter and my even more beautiful grandson. Oh, and Gohan. Long time no see. And, um, I'm not sure I'm familiar. I am Yajirobe, and I am here for your pantry. I see. Honey, we have a food stamper. Tell him I have a gun because I pay taxes. Challenge accepted. So, Gohan, would you like to come in for some cake and tea? And those little hard candies no one ever actually eats? No, I kind of have to go make sure my dad's not dead. Okay, well, you have fun. Hey, Mom, why do you never seem to age? <laughs> oh, your father won't let me. Hey, Piccolo, have you seen yet? You won't be as a cold or texted, or... Oh, damn it. Hey, Mr. Popo. Hello, young Kami. 
Ah, hello, Piccolo. Good to see you again. Cut the crap, Kami. You know what I'm here for. Well, that didn't last long. All these squares make a circle. All these squares make a circle. All these squares Okay, what's up with him? Don't All mind him. He just got through dropping a gallon of LSD. A, a gallon? A literal a gallon. All Out of a milk jug. A I don't even know where All he got it from. He never circle. leaves them. Call me! I need you to tell me that I can leave the lookout if I want to! Mr. Popo, you may leave the lookout if you wish. don't tell me what to do! All these squares make a circle. Quite. As you were saying, I'm here for your body. <laughs> Could at least take him out to dinner first. First, we don't eat. Second, shut up. And what makes you think that I'm just going to give it up that easy? Because if you were half the guardian of this dirtball that you should be, then you'd know that we don't have any time to waste. It is true. A great evil has risen. Unlike anything this planet has ever seen before. And you know what I'm talking about. You know exactly how dangerous these androids are. Am I the only one who just noticed a huge tone shift here? The androids are a threat, yes. But they are paltry to what I fear comes next. Seriously, can we speed this up? It's cold as tits up here. You know, maybe if you stopped whining and helped me look, we'd... Oh, oh, look, there's one. There's... Actually, second thought, we don't have to steal the first one we see. Oh, I'm sorry. I can't hear you over your welching. Ugh, <sighs> whatever. So, Jones, uh, how's the wife and kids? Still dead, Chuck. Been four months. Ah. Oh. I am terrible at small talk. Yes, you are. Huh? Huh. Lucky foods. Kind of ironic. Uh, young man, need you to stay out of our van. All right, guys, we're taking the van. No, buddy, we're gonna drive it. Oh. Sorry. It's cool. Now you have a place to sit. Affirmative. Shotgun. Not quite what that means, but hey, keep trying, man. Bitchin'. Next stop, Casa de Goku. How about no? New clothes first, Goku's Casa second. <laughs> Women. Am I right, 16? Confirmed. She is female. <laughs> she is. You know, I should have brought this up earlier, but we should probably move Goku before the androids get to his house. It's been pretty non-stop here, so I'm a little out of the loop. What happened to Goku? Oh, uh, he didn't take his medicine. Grape flavored. Go figure. Yeah. Go figure. Actually, I really need to go pick up Chiaotzu. Left him over at Kame House. So, how do you like my Chashu ramen? Well, that is frickin' tasty! What's in this? A little bit of sake, soy sauce, bean sprouts, pork... I'm delicious. How old are you? So, I'm gonna go grab him before things get... Weird. Later, Tian! I can never read that guy. Wait, before we go in, uh, uh I huh? wanted to ask. You ever think that Android 18 is, uh, kind of... cute? No. All right then, Dibs, by the way, quick warning. Be super nice to Goku's wife. She can be a total... Johan! Oh, it's you. Yeah, fine, I pretty much asked for that one. Huh? Hey, guys! How it is? Oh, uh, Yamcha, right? How's it, hey, I mean, how you doing? Oh, you know, hanging in there. Ah. <sighs> so, what happened? Did Vegeta clean up the androids? Quite. Turns out there were three more, Vegeta got his arms broken, they beat everyone up, Piccolo flipped out, and I got kissed by the cute one. The clown? No, 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 there's a girl now. I don't believe you. You know, we should probably continue this conversation after we've moved Goku. Move Goku? But he finally stopped screaming. Uh... Okay, well, well, he's petering out. We'll take him to Kame House! They'll never look for him there! That is literally the second place they'll look. Look, we're short on time and options. And who knows what those dastardly androids are doing? 
Wow, you actually pulled over. No, 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 this is gonna be great, shut up. You too! This vehicle has been reported as stolen! You are under arrest! Sir, I have checked the vehicle and I have identified another male. And he is f***ing big! You cannot sit in the back. I called shotgun. He has a weapon! Cuff him! <laughs> Do we have any bigger, stronger cuffs? Yeah, they're in the car! All right, I take it back. This is fun. So where's Vegeta during all this anyway? Oh, I'm sure he's off somewhere. Ah, oh, damn it! Yeah! Coping. Oh, good. Oh, I swear I am never letting you get away from me again. We're gonna get that GPS tracking chip installed in your neck by the end of the week! Uh... Little help? Androids are coming! Gotta move your dad! Get on the ship! Where are we going? Kame House! Isn't that literally the second place they'll look? Less lip, more ship! I'm here for Chiaotzu. We need to train. But Tian, the doctor said if your shoulder's get any bigger... That's why we don't see him anymore. Wait, so you didn't beat the androids? Well, they broke both of Vegeta's arms. So, you know, that was pretty fun. Otherwise, it was a total wash. I can never read that guy. Well, you heard the man. Pig, fetch my laptop. We're gonna buy us a submarine. All right, but you're not allowed to name it after your junk. Fetch up buying it, I'm naming it. <laughs> Oh, just fuse already. So, both arms, huh? Both? She was beautiful with a capital B. I, I mean, brutal. Uncomfortably brutal. I wasn't distracted by her eyes. So, wait. Trunks, I'm curious. If you came back in time again to help us, does that mean we already failed? Actually, turns out that's not how time travel works. So you're saying I can't just take your time machine, go back in time, and tell myself not to date Marin? I don't know who that is. But no, you couldn't. I mean, you could, but it wouldn't be the same you. You see, when I travel back to the past, I'm technically going to a different universe. Oh, you mean multiverse theory? Wait, what? Yeah. With every decision, it creates a branch in the timeline. Whenever you travel back in time, you're actually entering another parallel universe. How could you possibly- I've been studying theoretical physics. Although at this point, I guess it's just physics. Good. Then if that's all out of the way, we can start your review on cellular biology. Ah, uh, but cells are boring. I don't get it. If it doesn't affect your timeline, why even come back to ours and tell us anything in the first place? Well, besides wanting to make at least one timeline without the world being destroyed, my mother didn't tell me until after I'd already done it once. And then she tried to bang you! Uh -huh. Oh, speak of the devil, that's her ringtone! What is that? What is what? This music. You mean country music? Oh, this is country music? What, you don't have country in the future? No, shortly after I was born, it all just vanished. Nobody knows exactly what happened. So someone want to get that? Kind of fly in the plane. Ah, oh, fine. Krillin speak- Shut up, I've got some important news. Good or bad news? It depends. Is Trunks there? Is this a booty call? Krillin! Right behind me! Hi, Mom. Hey. <laughs> That was a warning shot, fat ass! Now put down the fridge! Viva la honey face out! Yeah, anyway, I just got the strangest call from some farmer in the countryside 50 miles out of Gingertown. Said he found one of our vehicles out there. Wow, this is so interesting. Does it have anything to do with the androids we're fighting? Shut up, and it might. I'm faxing over the picture he took. You have a fax machine? What's a fax machine? You see, that one makes sense. Just shut up and show it to Trunks. What? No, this can't be right. This is my time machine. 
Maybe you misplaced it. That's impossible. I put it away in its capsule. Are you sure? Of course I'm sure. Here, just let me show you. Wait, no! Oh, no. Oh, my God! It's on top of Goku! Dad! Put it back! Put it back! Put it back! Oh, good. That's back. So, I've been thinking about it. What do we do after we kill Goku? Whatever the hell we want. Who's gonna stop us? Not Goku. Exactly. Speaking of which, 16, what's our ETA? We are currently 2,544 oh miles Oh my god. Hey, come on, sis, it ain't so bad. Let's turn on our good old friend, the radio. Oh, that is 10 pounds of nope in a five pound bag. Right, right, sorry. Forgot we were out in the sticks. You know what? I think I know the first thing we're gonna do. This is the best you've got. That is our top of the line. How do you like it? Like is a strong word. So let's tolerate. Hate's actually looking a little weak right now. Oh, but darling, you look like the most beautiful rose in a rose garden. I'm sure if I came home with you, my daddy might even love me again. And that is my cue to leave. Later, cowboy. Ah, uh, sweetheart, you gotta pay for those. Uh, uh, ca cash or credit. The, the register's on the inside. You are getting into your car. You are driving away, and I have been robbed. You blind bimbo, you get back here this instant. Oh, no, 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 no. All right, we should be getting close to the site. Um, Mr. Trunks? What's up? If you don't mind me asking, you know me in the future, right? Yeah, actually, you were my mentor. Oh, wow. What does it don't me like? Well, I suppose you take a lot after your father. In what regard? You're the strongest, bravest warrior on the planet. Okay, good. By the way, why do you keep staring at my arm? Oh, uh, hey, what's that? Oh! Well, this definitely looks like my time machine, but it also looks like it's been here for ages. Ooh, a mystery! I never get to solve mysteries, like Sherlock Holmes or Batman. Usually we're just busy finding people, like Bruce Lee, or Batman. Hey! Oh look, your mom's here. Oh, God. Hey there, Gohan! And... son. Mother. So, is that your time machine? Well, it looks like mine, but it can't be mine. This one here is the one I used to travel back in time with. If you'll notice, it has the word hope written on the side. So unless this one has it written in the same place, we... Oh. Crap baskets. Oh, you say that too. Wait, why hope? Because you called me our last hope. Holy crap, that's so cheesy. What, do I have like a ton of cats too? Hey, anyone else notice the hole on the top? Huh, weird. Do you think whoever was piloting it was attacked? Actually, I don't think so. Considering the curvature of the melted glass, combined with the lack of any glass or damage in the cockpit, we're safe to assume whatever shot the canopy came from the inside. And what does that tell us? Um, that the glass came from the inside. Here. Huh. So, any idea what these are? Oh, I think I kicked an alien that looked like that once. Hey, let me get a look at it. I want to help, too. As the daughter of the world's leading class scientist with doctorates in both bioengineering and evolutionary biology, I can only deduce that this is a mutant coconut. Either that or an egg. An egg? <gasps> I know! Trunks! Whatever made that hole hatched from this egg. You keep examining the time machine. I'm gonna go search for clues. Well, at least one of us is having fun with this. Two of us. And then they flew off! God only knows where they are now. Thanks for letting us keep Goku here, by the way. Yeah, that's nice. So there's a hot one now. Oh yeah, like you wouldn't believe. Her eyes are this beautiful piercing blue. Her confidence is stunning. And she does this adorable little thing with her hair where she brushes it out of the way. Fantastic, how's the rack? Uh, Master Roshi, Goku's sweating purple. Is that normal? Did he eat grapes? I don't know. <laughs>
That boy can't handle his grapes. Speaking of fruit, what are we talking here? Apples, oranges, melons? Is that really important? Yes! Oh, hello. And what are you? Hey, Trunks, I think I found a clue. Either that or a record-setting cicada. I'm okay with both, actually. Ah! Oh my god, is that thing alive? No, pretty sure that this is just a molt. Something crawled out of that? Hey, if you guys don't want it, mind if I take it home with me? Whatever was in here might just be the creature that came out of that ship. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, really wish I hadn't. Considering oh, how fresh this head. molt is, it's likely that whatever oh, shed its sticky. skin did so very recently. Know, meaning that it might very and... well oh, still no. be here. Trunks, it was good to see you again. And go on, say hello to your mother. I'll call you later, okay? Bye! Long shot, but you wouldn't have to carry hand sanitizer on you, would you? Do you... do you not? Ew, 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 ew. Ew. What? So, you guys are by Gingertown, right? We were. Why? Because there is some major shit going on down there. Shit of what variety, exactly? The not good kind. This is Flash Stormwind reporting live for CQTV here on location in Gingertown. Well, thank you, Flash. What's the situation down there? Mass unadulterated panic, Hal. Just moments ago, screams erupted throughout the streets only to be followed by deafening silence. Now there seems to be nothing left but a ghost town, littered with the clothes of its former inhabitants. We have yet to find out the reason why. Well, do you have any speculations, Flash? Well, Hal, I cannot say for certain. However, recreational marijuana use was recently legalized in the region. So I believe we can all come to the same conclusion. Just a moment, someone is approaching. Excuse me, you terrified looking gentlemen. What are your opinions on the legalization of- Oh my god! Ah! Wow, someone should probably go check that out. Yeah, my stash is running a little low. <laughs> hey guys, we're back. What's that smell? Is there a skunk in here? Oh, hey, Gohan. You like mysteries? Do I? Hmm? Okay, so you felt that one right. I did. And you're still just going to put this off? I might. All right, I've had enough of this. I have literally been sitting here meditating. Dozing. Meditating for the last... Uh... Three hours! Thank you, Mr. Popo. Three hours! So either shit or get in my body. I... No! Listen, I still need to feel the situation out. What the hell is there left to feel out? Between your cryptic warnings and jerking me around, I'm pretty sure an entire city is either missing or dead! You're the Guardian. Start acting like it! Yes, I am the Guardian. The Guardian of this planet. And you wish to take that title from me. Are you kidding me? This can't be about the job. The first chance you had to drop this gig, you tried to hand it off to Goku. Goku! He doesn't even look after his own kid. I look after his kid more than he does. But it's still my job, my responsibility. And that's really good and all. But if you don't fuse with me, the entire world you're guarding might be destroyed. Maybe I'd rather it be destroyed than ever have to be a part of you again. Mom? Dad? Please stop fighting. So that's what this is all about, huh? No, no, that's not what I- No, no, it's fine. I was kind of a dick. I get that. Listen, Piccolo. I've been the Guardian for over 300 years. I've seen wars, sickness, death, and worse. All the while trapped on this lookout, unable to interact with the outside world for more than moments at a time. Now the only chance I have left is giving up my free will to someone else. It's just another prison. Wow, I... I didn't... It's fine. I'm done anyway. You're right. If I don't do this now, we are likely to lose everything. But know this, Piccolo. Once I fuse with you, the Dragon Balls will be no more. Ah, that's not a problem. We've got a whole planet of our people just waiting to make us more. What do you mean, our people? Stop being a smartass and let's just do this already. Well then, Mr. Popo, I suppose this is goodbye. It's been... 
a trip. Uh, yes! <laughs> well, I'm sure you're already familiar with the technique. Right. All right now. Lower. Yeah, not falling for that. <laughs> I didn't think so. That was crazy. So did you actually eat Kami, or was that the acid? So this is who we were, huh? Hello? Got real quiet. Holy crap, are they finally... <laughs> uh, of course not. <laughs> Isn't this the part where you chant to yourself? Shut up. Come now. We should do whatever feels right. Oh, please no. You can win. You feel great. You can do this. <sighs> hey, Piccolo, could you pick up Yajirobe? He doesn't have a... Ah, oh, crap. Well, I know someone who's not getting invited to Sunday brunch. Though, who am I kidding? We like him. Well, only one thing to do. Now, the lids are surely gonna shout racism over this one, but this is just what happens when you elect a dog as king. So you think this is whatever came from that egg chunks? Definitely. This isn't the work of the androids, that's for sure. Not unless they're starting the world's first mandatory nudist colony. I'm going to go down there and check it out myself. I'll admit, after everything that's happened, I'm a little bit worried I'm responsible for these events. Wait, are you sure you should go alone? The only other person strong enough to help us right now would be my father. And even if I knew where he was, which I don't, I'm not sure he would help us. No, you see, I didn't f up. I just underestimated her. I went in a little too overconfident. But of course I was a little overconfident. I mean, have you ever met me? I'm me! I'm a big deal! And you know who's really at fault here? The boy. Oh, the future is so bad! Well, maybe it wouldn't be if you weren't such a pansy ass! Now, once I get back in the game and destroy those metal brats, there'll be nothing left to get in my way. <laughs> well, this is classic. The moment God disappears, suddenly the rapture happens. Yes, the irony is not lost on me. Could you guys stop talking for a minute? Oh yeah, I don't want to distract you. Might get hit by one of these abandoned cars. I've always wanted to drive a car, but by the time they were invented, eyes weren't so good for it anymore. Piccolo, you've driven a car, right? How was it? Wait, seriously, shut up. What is that? Mr. Sandman, bring me a dream. Make him the cutest that I've ever seen. Give him two lips. Like roses and clover. Then tell him that his lonesome nights are over. Hello, friend. <laughs> God, I, I think I'm gonna puke. You can't puke. You're in my. Oh, good lord, it's everywhere. Ah. So, Piccolo, what brings you to my neighborhood? I sensed a disturbance. Well, I am pretty disturbing. Remember that time I drank that guy? That was fing weird. So, I take it you're the one who exterminated this entire city then? Oh, no, no, that was another guy. His name was Shit Sherlock. First name, no. Why? Just why? Well, three reasons. First, I was asleep for like four years and I am understandably hungry. Two, there's nothing more satisfying than the rush I get from watching a person disappear. And three, and I need you to pay attention on this one. Huh? Why does it feel like my dad is fighting Mr. Piccolo? And Vegeta is fighting Mr. Piccolo. 
And Mr. Piccolo is fighting Mr. Piccolo. That's weird. It even feels like I'm out there. It feels like everyone we know is fighting Mr. Piccolo. Except for Yamcha. Well, duh, that's because I'm right here. Yeah, that's gotta be it. Ah, and three. That is how I power the beautiful temple that is my body. You. You're a monster. Oh, I'm a monster. I haven't heard that one scream to me today. Of all people. <laughs> oh, that is just embarrassing. It's not even the right hole. As much as it disgusts me to admit, you and I at least have one thing in common. More than you know. But continue. We both get a significant power-up when we absorb someone. Ominous. <laughs> I can't believe you screwed up the van. Honestly, I don't know what you were expecting. I didn't even get my license before Dr. Giro went all Blade Runner on us. Excuses. Hey, 16! How's that tranny coming along? I don't believe the car identifies as either male or female. So, what do you think that explosion was? Eh, uh, who cares? Probably just Vegeta throwing a hissy fit or something. Wait, did you mean the transmission? Because it's fixed. <laughs> Oh, so he fused with Kami. So that's a thing. Did you just spin kick him? I know, right? I've always wanted to do that. Please don't do it again. My body, my rules. Damn it! Huh. Faster than me. That could be a slight pain in the ass. But... Oh, my ass, my... Ah! Wanna see something cool? Ah! What is he doing? That looks like your technique. Well, it's not. He's doing the finger thing. So Goku does that when he teleports. <laughs> oh crap. So that's how you pronounce it. <laughs> He's gonna kick me again, isn't he? All right, I'm gonna need you to do me a solid and not kick me anymore. Start by telling me how you know my technique, and maybe I'll consider it. Well, what can I say? Imitation is the greatest form of flattery. Speaking of which... Gah. No, that's impossible! The only one who knows that technique is Goku! And Gohan! And Master Roshi! And Krillin! And Yamcha! And me, that one time I tried it just to see if I could- Damn it! A duplicate time machine, a monster on the loose, and now an entire city gone missing! But we still don't know where the androids are! I know, right? A total fuster cluck! Ah, when did you- I didn't even feel you! I affectionately refer to it as stealth mode! So, what are we looking at? I have no idea. It could be a giant cicada monster for all we know. Hopefully Piccolo will be able to hold his own until- ah. So is that Piccolo or... Piccolo Piccolo? <sighs> this thing's just full of surprises. Surprise! Oh, oh. oh hey, he's behind you. Howdy neighbor. <laughs> oh, it must be your first time because you are tight. And unfortunately for you, it's also your last. Ah, uh, he's drinking your arm! I know! Will then do something! I am! Ah, my big mouth! Oh, God. You're even starting to look like Kami. Dick. You sure you don't want me to do the other arm? Even you out? Cause that's just distracting. Listen, I've obviously lost this fight. Without my arm, I'm finished. Wait, can't you regrow your- oh, Shut up, Nail, he's doing a thing. Ah, submission. A second favorite to futile resistance. But before you finish me off, <laughs> how about you tell me everything about you? Oh, well... Unless you don't have anything important to say. No, no, it's just... You're the first person to ask me who or what. Normally they just ask... Why? Well, to start us off then, I'm sure by now you're more than familiar with my father. Dr. Giro. Oh, god damn it. But wait, there's more. 
I am purely biomechanical, unlike my brother and sister, Cyborg 17 and 18. We call them androids. Well, good for you, you're wrong. As I was saying, our father created me with the sole purpose of becoming... perfect. Infused with the genetic makeup of the galaxy's strongest warriors, collected over several decades. So that's how you know our techniques. Oh, but I know much more than that. I know that in this timeline, there lies the secret to my true, perfect form. A secret I had all but conceded lost to me. This timeline? So you're from the future, but how? Oh. I found a way. All you need to know is that I am here now, and I will stop at nothing to achieve my perfection. Well then. I guess I know your story. You're welcome. But I don't know your name. The oh, truth is, I don't really have one. But all things considered, I think I'll go with... Cell. That's kind of boring. Coming from the guy named after a woodwind instrument. You know what? Doesn't matter anyway. I'ma drink you now. Wait, before uh, that... Do you want to see something cool? Now I know you're playing me. And I do. Oh, that is hardcore! Also not good for me. Also not good for me! What the hell is that?! And why is it giving me the most ominous sense of deja vu? Sorry kids, not telling the story again! But I will leave you all enlightened! Start a I fucking know! Okay, what the hell am I sensing? Is that the Namekian? Is that me? Is that me stronger than me? I'll fucking kill me! All right. So South City is to the north, North City is to the west, and East City is... also to the north. Where the f*** am I? <laughs> Sir, I need to ask you to move off the road. We have a very important game today against the West City Southerners and we're already running late. Aw, oh, East City has a panda sanctuary, that's cute. I am now going to start applying the horn. I am now going to use it again! I will now continue to use the horn until you politely move! Beep! 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 Now, I just need to find my brother and sister before- Hey, you giant green pylon! You ain't no casa! Get off the road! Else me and the boys are gonna have to make your face look like your ass! And your ass look like your face! <clears throat> hey you! I wanna make a joke about your team. What's its name? The East City Westmen! Hoorah! Oh, I am too hungry for this shit. <laughs> <laughs> beep, beep. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it! Wow, Piccolo's pulling a your dad. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it! Oh yeah, see? And uh, now we have this. You, Namekian, too strong! Explain now! He fused with Kami so we could become stronger. The f**k's a Kami? Basically God. But I'm still here! Do you really believe your own hype that much? I am the hype! Hey, finally found you guys. Just followed Vegeta's screaming. What'd I miss? Piccolo fused with Kami. Oh, that finally came full circle. More importantly, there's a new threat. Another android created by Dr. Jiro. Do I hear five? Everyone, you have to come quickly. Aw, but we're about to drink our lima bean and lentil smoothies. Yeah, they taste like vomit, but they keep me regular. 
like a soft serve ice cream machine in the morning. No time for those. Come upstairs. I'm coming. I'm coming. I came. Ah. Look, look at Goku. Hmm. What a miracle we have witnessed. Allow me to go call the local news. I've had to deal with him screaming bloody murder for the last three hours. I'll take what I can get. I wonder what he's dreaming about. Yay! I'm Pirate Goku! Are you ready for an adventure, Sword Guy Piccolo? Uh, actually, I think you need to wake up. The androids Wait, are- Wait! Look! It's Ninja Goku! Hey, Pirate Goku! Let's go on an adventure! Yeah! Yay. Yeah. So yeah, that's basically it in a nutshell. You mean a nut cell? Shut, Shut up. up! So if Cell manages to find whatever he's missing, he'll become even stronger? I guess. He was pretty vague about it. No matter what, though, if he and the androids join forces, none of us will stand a chance. Says you! And here we go. I don't care how many people you fuse with, you'll never be as strong as a Super Saiyan! Not really much of a milestone anymore. As for me, I will find a level beyond a Super Saiyan! So what? Like a Mega Saiyan? Ultra Saiyan? You're mocking me. Maximum Over Saiyan. F*** off, Triclops! Why do you antagonize him like that? You know he can kill you, right? At this point, it's a game. If he gives in, I win. And he knows that. Crazy thought. If that sells from another timeline, then there's gotta be one in this timeline, too. Pretty sure that emotional episode you had earlier leveled Jiro's lab. Well, he was a mad scientist. Shot in the dark, maybe he's got a basement? Ah, oh, crap, Baskets. Oh, you say that too. All right then. Trunks, you go back to Jiro's lab. I'm going after Cell. I'm going with Trunks to go after Cell. And I'm going with Piccolo to go after Cell. Break! So, now that I have the chance to say this, um, sorry my dad killed Chiaotzu. And you made it awkward. Hey there, Cherry. What's your name? My name is Nicky Town. Who are you? Name Cell. And you are looking fine. Well, thank you, Mr. Cell, but you're just saying that. Oh, I don't say that to every town I come across. Mr. Cell, please absolve me. Oh, don't worry. I'll get around to it. But I need you right now, Mr. Cell. Okay, 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 I'm in the middle of something right now. No, right now, Mr. Cell, right now. Bitch, I do what I want. <sighs> oh my god, was it always this cold? We were here at noon, it was not this cold! Well, if you need to warm up, start looking. You know, I sometimes complain about our lifestyle, but honestly, shipping lasers is fun. Achoo! 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 Are you making laser noises? All the time in my head. Why, is that weird? Achoo! 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 Hey, there it is! Well, we can't climb down that, it's broken. Just come on. Whee! Whee! I need to ask you a favor. What's that? If we find any more androids down here, please don't tell my father. I swear on my life, unless he threatens my life. In which case... Wow, danger Will Robinson. Who's Will Robinson? The future is no fun. It's really not. Huh? Hey, so, if I were a gambling man... Huh? Oh my god! It's adorable! Well, time to waste it! No, wait! Aww! These... these are the schematics for the androids! We could use these to find a way to turn them off! Don't ask how to turn them on! Don't ask how to turn her on! Don't ask how to turn Android 18 on! How do you turn Android 17 on? Shit! Also, it lists their real names. Lapis and Lazuli. And apparently, Android 16 was modeled after Jero's son. Are you making that up? It sounds like you're making that up. No, it's all here, really. Well, okay. Grab those and let's kill Cell! Hold on, I I've been thinking. Technically, it's never done anything wrong. So, doesn't it have the right to life? This isn't about a right to life. It's about making a choice. A choice we both need to make. A choice between a terrible mistake that can ruin lives and f***ing I'm dropping the pretenses, we're a boarding cell. Oh yeah! 
All right, let's get out of here before this place comes down on our heads. Sorry, just a little caught up in gloating. I killed Sal! Hasta la vista, baby! Probably should have backed up first. <laughs> It was fun. We should hang out more. Nothing but clothes with stab marks. Cell's calling card. Ah, damn it. He killed my star battle back. My entire fantasy team just went straight to hell. Are you serious? What? I have hobbies. <laughs> no, you don't. Hey there, Nikki Town. This is your local station, 98.5 The Nick, where TJ and the Wombat. 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 Me so horny. What's the weather looking like out there, Wombat? Wombat weather forecast! It's raining, man! We're in the middle of an impossible heat wave. A balmy 104 degrees. So make sure you stay hydrated. Real hydrated. <laughs> and in local sports news, many of our listeners are still waiting at the stadium for the East City Westmen, who are becoming increasingly late to the game. Probably had some traffic on the turnpike. Or maybe they're just scared. <laughs> oh, looks like we got our first call-in of the segment. Hello there, caller. What can TJ and the Wombat do for you? Hello there, I. <laughs> uh, okay, hold on, hold on. Ah, uh, uh, there. Okay. Could you play Video Kill the Radio Star? Wow. Uh, we usually only do the top 20. But today, we'll make an exception for you, killer. Oh, shucks. Thanks, fellas. I'll be right in. Right? What do you say? Oh, God. Oh, God. What is that thing? No! No, get away! Get away from Wombat! No! Put him down! Get him away! God, I love you, Wombat! I love you so much! Wait, so you're saying he had a sub lab? Of course he had a sub lab. We all have sub labs. Where do you think I keep your mother's clothes? Mom's what? Don't go in the basement. Oh look, there's bombs in the androids. I could probably make a detonator for that. I don't know, do you really have to blow them up? Why do you care? They're mostly just machinery at this point. Oops, except for the lady. Baby maker's still intact. Guess she's still useful for something. So you're saying she still has a- Vagina, yes. Just went from a 9 to a 10. Ugh, anyway, where's everyone else right now? Well, Piccolo and the others are searching for Cell. How are all these rides still running? Why are the clothes still on them? This is supposed to be a place of fun! So, hopefully that's going well. And Trunks went off to find Vegeta. Notice me! No! Best of luck there. And any update on Goku? Oh, he's just resting at Kame House. Probably still asleep. Ah! 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 The androids are here! Bring it on, you robotic sense of... Huh? Oh no, they've already got him! Ah! Did I miss something? Eh? Well, either Goku's awake or Moses has brought the Jews. Either way, my pantry's not full enough. <gasps> hmm? Aw, uh, hugs are nice. Oh, tell me you're finally okay. Yeah, huh? Never felt better. Wanna see? Hold on! Ah! Huh. Wonder when she'll come back down. I can't believe you took this thing off-roading. This thing barely handled on the freeway! Oh, come on, 18. Where's your sense of adventure? About 15 miles back with the shocks. I personally enjoy this alternate route. It is dense with foliage and wildlife and... <laughs> ...and spending time with you, but clearly you disagree. Won't lie, sis. Kind of a dick move. Oh, come on. We'll take him to a zoo after this. How's that? You want to hit up the zoo, 16? 
I want to see the parrots. Goku, you have missed a hell of a day! Oh, I know everything. I learned it in my pirate dream. I was having a ninja dream too, but it ended. All right, now listen. I know you just woke up, so... Yeah, I was out of permission for a while. I really ought to get back to training. <sighs> so I can fight Cell. <sighs> what? If, if you're worried about Gohan, I'll bring him along with me. <sighs> Fine. Huh? Go ahead! Go train! Take Gohan! Fight your evil android bug monster! But I want you to promise me one thing. Okay... What's that? I want another baby! Hmm. Hmm. Okay, bye! Uh, was that a yes? It wasn't a no! Hmm. Hmm. Okay, bye! Thanks for swinging by to pick me up! What were you doing at Bulma's house anyway? Oh, just dropping off the blue Gina. I mean, bad prints. I mean, thanks for swinging by to pick me up. This is bad. We can't keep running after Cell. Every time he slips away, we lose another city. Don't be so melodramatic. Worst case scenario, we wish people back with the Dragon Balls. Uh. uh... Oh God, what? So remember how Kami and I fused? No. And remember how we used to have Dragon Balls? Holy shit. Wait, I'm still confused. The Dragon Balls don't exist anymore, Krillin. Oh! Okay! Dude, don't worry. I still have the bunker. Why don't we have Goku? I'm taking Gohan. Bye. What? Good news. We have Goku. Bitchin, let's go hang at Kame House. Oh, good. We'll have to see if he's carrying. Carrying what? I'm asking if he's got any grass on that island. Well, yeah, but it's mostly covered by that house. He's asking if he has any pot. I don't know, probably. I mean, he knows the Mafuba. Oh my god. The what? Huh? What just happened? Goku had Gohan? I'll fill you in later, Gohan. Hey, Trunks! How's the training coming? I don't know, let's see. Hey, Dad, do you want to train with me? God. About that well. Ooh, only on two words, huh? I'll go talk to him. Hey, Jeets. <laughs> I heard you lost your fight pretty bad. <laughs> but you know what they say, Vegeta. When you fall off that horse, you get right back up, and you eat that horse. Come eat that horse with me, Vegeta. What the hell are you on about? Oh, I just found a place where we can do a whole year's worth of training in a day. I'm listening. It's up on Kami's lookout. Although now I guess it's just the lookout. Either way, they call it the hyperbolic time chamber. What the f is that? So 18, what's it look like in there? It looks like Goku's wife is a Chinese princess. Seriously, I'm glad she's my size, but who wears this junk? I mean, is Goku there? Oh no, place is empty. Devoid of both people and taste. Huh. Didn't figure Goku for a runner. Well, if I were a guessing girl, I'd say they're a Kame house. But that's like the second place we'd look. Confirmed. That is the second place we shall look. Hmm. But it's on an island, so we can't take a van. Oh, thank God. So we'll find a boat. No. Pardon? We have done it your way. Now we do it my way. The bird way. We fly. He's finally speaking my language. I mean, kind of. Here it is, maggots, the hyperbolic time chamber. Wait, I thought it was called the Room of Spirit and Time. I said that because you kept mispronouncing it. Oh, I can do it. Hyperbola mind chamber. No. Hyperglycemic crime chamber. You get one more. Hyperbonics rind chamber. Hmm. Inside, time moves at 365.24 times that of this dimension. In Goku terms, one day out here, one year in there. And only two of you maggots can enter at a time. Wait, how long have you known about this? Since I was a kid. Then why didn't Krillin and the others use it to train against the Saiyans? Th why didn't we use it to train against the androids? They had... other training. Besides, they most likely would not have survived. I threw Goku in there once when he was a kid. I almost died. Hmm. 
Then the boy and I will go first and save you two the trouble. Move it, boy! Help me! Have fun, Trunks! You too, best buddy! Huh. You know, you don't really seem like yourself today, Mr. Popo. Hmm. Make sure you let the right one in, or you'll be dead Not by today. Dawn. The death toll keeps rising as the unknown creature continues its terrifying siege across our nation. I get it, he's absorbing people! I'm trying to stop it! Maybe you should get some sleep like everyone else. I'll sleep when I'm dead! I can help with that. Ugh. Wake up! Ah! Oh man! I had the craziest dream! Cell was there! Well, the androids are here! Yo. We're here for Goku. Son of a bitch. Son Goku is not here. Son of a bitch. You heard him. Goku's not here. Oh, I heard him. We're just not very happy about it. Right, 16? Son Goku is not here. Exactly. And we came all the way out here to kill somebody. So you've got one of two choices. You can either tell us where Goku is, or, well... Or what? Or we kill you. Oh my god. Hey, 18? You... you come around here often? Nope. Hmm. Excuse me, androids? If you're gonna fight, could you please move it off the island? It's quite literally the only thing I own. That's fine. But when I win, I'm blowing it up for funsies. Hmm. All right then, follow me. There's a series of uninhabited islands over there. How do you know that? You three stay here. I'll handle this. Okay, I'll space book you later! So, if he fails, we're all gonna die, right? Basically. And we have no Dragon Balls. Hope training's going well. Uh, uh, holy... This place... It's... Nothing but a white void! I can't see where it ends. Or even where it begins. It's... Overwhelming. I need time. Time to adjust. Time to... Pretty big as now! <laughs> you weren't ready. Oh. All right, sis. Since you had all the fun last time, why don't you sit this one out? Already on it. I'll just hang out with 16 over here. I have spotted a pelican. So majestic. So majestic. Majestic. That is a big bird. Now, are you trying to buy time, or are you just looking to throw your life away? Because if I remember correctly, this did not go well for you last time. Oh, I'm not the same Namekian you faced before. Oh. Oh, shit, are you talking metaphorically? Because if not, I'm gonna start feeling like a racist because you look exactly the same. Huh. I'm feeling a whole lot of Piccolo right now. Either he's showing off, or he's fighting an android. We have to go help him. No, Gohan. We have to wait for Vegeta and Trunks to come out of the hypertonic lion tamer. That one was on purpose. Could have been. Well, how long do we have left? Four hours. We've been here for 20 hours? When? I mean, how? That's what makes it hypersonic, Gohan. Goku. Yeah? Uh -huh. Man, he has been at this for like 20 hours. It has been five minutes. It's called hyperbole, big guy. Also, I can't sense power levels. What's going on over there? Dodge. Dodge? Yeah. Yeah. You know, 16, yelling dodge is more distracting than helpful. He has fused with Kami. Kami? What? <laughs> Seriously, what the hell's a Kami? It means God. Now bow. Oh, there's my sweet little half-breed grandbaby. So, how's the detonator coming along? It's coming. But did you look at Dr. Giroux's notes? As it turns out, he only attributes model numbers to his successful projects. 
The crazy bastard was kidnapping dozens of orphan teenagers and experimenting on them. Oh, come now, you can't kidnap an orphan. They weren't wanted in the first place. As a side, that's kind of brilliant. Interesting that he set explosives in their chests like this, though. Must have been a failsafe, for in case they went rogue. Oh, he does that to strangers and it's fine, but I want to do it to my own children and your mother gets all uppity. Dad, any more talk like that and you don't get to hold trunks anymore. Hmm. Wouldn't be talking so mighty if you had a bomb in your chest. Too bad, Jolly Green Giant. Looks like you missed. Try again for his any. <laughs> <laughs> um, I stopped dodging. Seriously, are you even trying to hit me? No! The hell do you mean no? <clears throat> oh. Oh. Oh, shit. Hell's a grenade! Oh, man, it's even got a cool name. You know something I don't get? You try to kill Goku and that's fine. We try to kill Goku and suddenly you get all uppity. True, but when I did it, it was for revenge. You're just doing it for shits and giggles. Tell you what, you live a few years in stasis with your creator repeating the words kill Goku over and over again in your subconscious. Then you can ride that high horse all day long. Wow. What? Nothing, just nostalgia. Man, that is some serious power being thrown around. Damn it! We shouldn't just sit here like a bunch of cowards. We need to help. And do what? Get ragdolled again? No thank you. Of course you'd say that. Hey, he's actually got a point. I mean, between the Super Saiyans, the Super Namekian, the androids, and whatever the hell Cell is... No, oh, don't you start. Hey, I was on Namek, okay? Shit got crazy. I got stabbed. And blown up! I've been stabbed and blown up too! And dumped by the only girlfriend I ever had! Same! But you know the difference? When mine left, she took all my money. When yours left, she took all her money. Gonna need a sensu for that one. Not that this hasn't been fun at all, but I'm going to give you one last chance to tell us where Goku is. Or I'm going to have to start taking this seriously. Be a nice change of pace. <sighs> Hi. Uh, hi. Why are you back flipping? To gain some distance. You can fly! Dad, do you think Piccolo can win? No. But maybe... Then again... Although... Why do you keep stopping short? Oh, I'm sorry, Gohan. Were you saying something? I said the detonator's almost finished! Sorry, hard to hear you over the baby. He sure does cry a lot. Do you think he gets that from his monkey side? Dad! No racism in front of Trunks! Oh, come on, I'm using monkey unironically here. I mean, mostly. Half and half. Kinda like the baby. You know, it's kinda hard to enjoy my meal with your brat screaming. Where did you get that food? You've already cleared out our kitchens. Not the fridge in the basement. I don't have a fridge in my... Oh my god. Done. We effectively have a detonator for the androids. Bulma kills droids dead. Now if you'll excuse me? Wait, are you breastfeeding? Yeah, why? Awesome. <laughs> Oh my god. This is so dumb. This cannot get any dumber. Agreed. Sure is a lot of not killing Goku going on right now. You know what would fix that? Is it killing Goku? A good old rousing round of killing Goku. Yeah, well, well, at least I slept with Bulma. Yeah? Well, unlike Vegeta, you can't prove it. Can too. We'll just ask her. Bulma's on the phone. On uh, second thought, never mind. You know, in hindsight, I'm so glad I'm here right now. Grillmaster speaking. I will murder you. Whoa, hostile. Never mind that. Listen, I have the detonator for the androids. Wow, that was quick. 22 hours isn't quick. 
22 hours? When? I, I mean, how? How long did we sleep? Look, I'm on my way over. Try not to die in the meantime. All right, so where were we? <laughs> <laughs> This got so much dumber. Damn it, Green Man. You are hard to put down. Yeah. Not gonna lie. Actually beginning to enjoy myself here. Uh, man, we have a problem. Yeah, I know. I'm bluffing. I'm kind of at my limit. No, another problem. What, the other androids? No, another, another problem! What? I... Uh, oh. What the f*** is that? Hello, boys. Room for one more. So what is this, Spearmint? Your inbred mutant cousin or something? Wait, I thought he was on your side! What? Why would I know him? Hello. Brother. Come again? In a moment. And hello, my beautiful sister. <laughs> oh, f no. And, uh, um... I am designated as Android 16. Cool. Anywho. You have my sincerest gratitude, Piccolo. With our power levels, I would have been left searching for them blindly. But thanks to your little skirmish, I have been reunited with my family. And we have so much catching up to do. <laughs> okay, so am I alone, or did that not explain anything? He calls himself Cell. He's one of Dr. Giro's creations. He's from the future. Oh, sure. He's from the future. Yeah, and I'm a park ranger. That sounds nice. Can we focus? <laughs> Guys, is that who I think it is? Yeah, no, oh yeah, yeah, damn it. And we still don't have that detonator. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah, no. We're out of time. We need to do something now. Yeah. Here's a thought. How about one of you who can fly faster than the speed of sound go meet Bulma halfway? Chi Chi, you beautiful woman who lives in Goku's house. That is what I do. Well then, which one of you steps? Well, that works. Guess this is all we can do until Goku and Vegeta get Enough! back. Enough! I am not a spectator! I am a warrior! You can never read that guy. Aren't you going to help too? No. Is it because you're old? Yeah. Where's Yamcha? Hey, Master Roshi! You're out of toilet paper! Oh no. Oh jeez, oh god! Just a bit strong yeah. since last time. No big deal. We've got this. He's going to kill us. He's going to kill Piccolo, and by extension, us. I am trying to boost his morale in it. Is it hard to bear, Piccolo? My overwhelming power. Its weight. Its girth. How? How many people? Enough. Look, I don't know what you're on about with this family nonsense, but if you're here because of Jiro, I 86 him myself. So why don't we cancel these family matters, shelve the photo album, and... Come again? If you insist! Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, future bug man. Let's say I, uh, believe that now. Where do we go from here? Inside me. Stop it. He's also a walking, talking petri dish of the galaxy's strongest fighters. No need for flattery, Piccolo. You're already inside me. Stop it! Scared to ask, but anything else? Oh, tell him about the part where I took an entire battle ball team at the same time. Wait, is he kidding? No. Ugh, that's fun, but it really doesn't answer the big question. Why is he here? You know, it's rude to talk about someone when they're right in front of you. Okay, why are you here? Because, bitch, I drink people. 
Yeah, fuck that. Yeah! You should leave. What? Why? Neither of them can stand up to this cell. If he defeats them, you may not be safe. I can't just run. I'm way too curious to see how this plays out. I believe that is a poor decision. Maybe, but it's mine to make. I believe this is what the young people call getting wrecked. Yeah, man, if you have any techniques left up your sleeve, now's the time. Yeah, I think I got one. Really? Since when? About now-ish. Nope. Light grenade! He never stood a chance. See? And you were so afraid of the big bad bug. That is not who I meant. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> okay, last ditch effort didn't work. Any last, last ditch efforts? Just one. Now go! Any last words, my big green friend? Well said. Good game. <laughs> oh, that ain't good. Well, that's it then, isn't it? Gentlemen, it's been a privilege fighting with you. <laughs> you know, funny thing is, either way, we still wouldn't have Dragon Balls. <laughs> Gohan, no! I'll kill him! I'll kill him! You can't! Cell is too strong for you! Mr. Piccolo would let me go! No, he wouldn't! And he's smarter than me! I... Wow, uh, okay, that's... actually a good point. And besides, the moment you leave, that door is going to open. He's right, you know. Every time. Ah, Piccolo. He died as he lived. Drowning? Alone. That is sad. Yes, such isolation. I know his pain. So, my siblings, why don't you come with me, and you'll be in a world of truly pure perfection. Stop it! Seventeen, we need to go. No, I'm gonna play this one out. I believe that is a poor decision. Probably, but it's mine to make. You know, he wasn't wrong. This is the grossest thing! Ah, uh, come now, don't be so scared. Once you're a part of me, you'll be reunited with our sister in... I don't know, give me five minutes. Ten tops. And once I have achieved my perfection, I'll take my time killing every person on this planet. Even the mighty Goku. <laughs> Would you care to repeat that, you son of a bitch? <laughs> Got another one in ya. Stop. It. Damn, Sixteen. Where the hell did that come from? And what took you so long? I was waiting to see how things played out. Wait, was that sarcasm? I am not programmed for sarcasm. I'm proud of you. Now if you'll excuse me, I will eliminate Cell. I thought you were only programmed to kill Goku. This cell is comprised of 10.78% of Son Goku's DNA. These parameters are acceptable. Uh, okay, I guess we're doing this now! <laughs> oh, an admirable attempt by the red-headed stepchild! But don't feel too disappointed. For now, you shall be a part of me. Of me. Of me. God, God.
Why? What are you made of, pure metal? Affirmative. I am Android 16. Ow. Oh. Errors have been made. Minute now, I know what you're thinking. Should I rip off his tail? And the answer, by surprise. I was not ready for today. I don't think any of us were. Do you know how long it's gonna take to regrow my tail? Pardon me. Yep. Thanks to Uncle Piccolo's cells, an ultimately fruitless effort. But if it's any consolation, that hurt like hell. My mistake was starting at the wrong end. My next attempt will be on your head. <laughs> and your second mistake is assuming I'll give you another chance. Rocket punch! Wow, really? That is so cool! Oh my god, he actually did it. Why are you still here? Oh, come on, we can't just leave you here. We're the three amigos. You do not understand. I do not know if I am entirely capable of eliminating this cell. And should he absorb the two of you, he will wreak havoc upon this world. Well, yeah, but we were gonna do that too. Yes, but I like you. Aww. Over the last few days, I have come to feel a great adoration for this planet. From its trees, to its birds, to its people, to its birds. I do not wish to cause any more destruction. Actually, Sixteen, I think you've got the right idea. Yeah, you know what? Screw that noise, man. Forget destroying everything, forget killing people, and you know what? <laughs> forget killing Son Goku. Let's not get crazy. Too late! <laughs> <laughs> Oh god, this is totally disgusting! This isn't how this is supposed to work! I'm not supposed to die like this! I'm so cool! Someone pull off the tail! I'm so cool for this! I'm so cool! to live. Did you just... Hmm. So this is what lips feel like. ba 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 My cranial structure has received serious damage. How are you? I'd concern yourself less with him. It's not focusing on what's important. Me. You! Give me back my brother, you fish asshole! Now, now, being hurtful isn't gonna bring him back. You're a monster! And he was delicious. And you honestly think I'd let you do the same to me? To be honest, your compliance isn't a factor. Well then. I'll just have to do this. Give yourself a boob exam? No. Explode my bomb. In your boob? No. In my chest? Booby bomb! I'm serious! Okay, okay. But before we do something we're all going to regret, let's see what our brother thinks. 
What? Yo, Shiggy Diggy, what's up, my sizzle? Oh, my God. Yo, don't blow your tits, sis. That's whack. You gotta chill yourself before you kill yourself. This can't actually be real. Oh, it's real. And it's happening. So what you need to do is calm down and get all up in cell. It's downright tubular in here. We got candy and puppies and- You know absolutely nothing about us, do you? Okay, to be fair, I just met you. This isn't a game. Oh, but it is. All you have to do is kill yourself before I catch you. It's like tag for keeps. And now, with both Piccolo and 16 out of the way, we can play. <laughs> Not yet! Huh? Oh my god! It's Tien! What, was Krillin busy? <laughs> Come on, buddy, you can't be serious. With your power level, you're no android, you're no Namekian, and you're certainly no Super Saiyan. You're just human. Yeah? Well, you know what? Power levels! Super Saiyans! And... You! Shin! Piccolo! Oh, oh, that's a door of Shin! You! Huh? Blow yourself up or leave! I don't care which! Yeah, okay. Upstart, Troy Club, bitch! Come on, 16. We have to go. Where is 17? He's gone, buddy. That is sad. I am sad. We both are. Stop it! Stop it! I win! Keep up! Jeez, I think I can hear that. Oh boy. Is that Ten Shinhan? Yeah, and he is nettled. Super nettled. Uh, He's gonna die. Probably. Are you done? Because I'm coming out, and I swear to God, if you do that again, I will be so freaking nettle! Kikoho. Oh, damn it! He's really going all out. His body won't last long. The Kikoho just takes too much energy. Yeah, didn't he do that when you, uh, when you... Died, yes. Jesus, we've literally all done it. I haven't. Give it some time. You're hanging with the right crowd. What should we even do now? I feel so helpless. Listen, sometimes you gotta know when to hold them and know when to fold them. And right now, it's folding time. Pig, grab my dick. Please tell me you mean the submarine. <laughs> huh. Not dead yet. That's where, oh, there we go. <laughs> You know, if you want my personal opinion, Kiko Ho is a pretty sad choice of last words. But to be fair, it's far from the worst decision you've made today. Kiko, f yourself. Oh, see? That's the spirit. Be dead! No! We can't just let it die like this! You gotta save him! But I can't get him in time! There's no way I could move fast enough to grab him, get out, and... Did he just remember he can do that? Your father's an idiot. Huh? Goku? Hey, sorry, I'm just, I'm just here for my buddy. I'll be gone in a second. Let you get back to your business. Hold on, what? Oh, hey, Piccolo's alive too. <laughs> Ooh, little water lug there, buddy. I blew a hole in him. How durable is he? How durable am I? Questions for later. Okay, I'm about done here. See you tomorrow. Oh, and uh, by the way, Cell? You're gonna die. Huh. What? How? Why? I have so many questions! 
And you're sure you're okay? Bulma, you know what I've been hit by. I'm fine. Now, you got the detonator? Yeah, right here. Now listen, its signal is weak, so you'll have to be within 10 meters of the androids. So what you're saying is I have to get close. Eh, 30 feet isn't that close. Oh, I'm gonna get all up in that. Well, you could use some protection then. Pardon? I made you all battle suits, like Vegeta's. Oh, well thanks, but I probably won't need it. I'm pretty good about pulling out before I get into trouble. Besides, I tried one on Namek, but I got a huge hole in it. Okay then, I'll just hand them out to everyone else. See you later. Thanks, Bulma! Huh, this, uh, this remote's a lot heavier than I expected. Huh. Are you two okay? Yeah, we may not have Dragon Balls, but I guess Sensu Beans are a close second. It's a good thing I showed up when I did. Cell was about to 69 ya. 86, Dad. 86. I'm not good with numbers. I'll admit that was pretty ballsy. But all you did was stall him. Now he's alone to hunt down Android 18. And we don't have anyone with the strength to stop him. Your worthless huh? maggot friends are coming out! Or do we? No, Gohan. We haven't gone in yet. Wow, really, Goku? Trunks? Wow, neat hair. Oh my god. First piece of positive reinforcement in over a year. Respond appropriately. Thank you. I grew it myself. Damn it! Huh. That's funny. Roll with it. And hey, Vegeta. Wow, you guys sure got strong, huh? That's right, Kakarot. And you wouldn't believe just how much. You see, while I was training in the depths of the hyperbolic time chamber, I looked deep within myself and blah 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 pride, blah blah prince of all, blah 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 super saiyan, blah blah blah. And through all of that, I have ascended. That's right, I have reached a new level. Do you hear me, Kakarot? I am finally stronger than you! Neat! F you! So I'm a hair's breadth from perfection, and then Triclops shows up and decides, I'm just gonna turn triangles into f***ing squares. Then Goku shows up. Apparently he can teleport. Gotta look into that later. But at the very top of this long list of stupid questions is, Where are you, 18? We got lucky. With all these islands, it'll be tough for him to find us. Technically, it's an archipelago. Noun. A group of islands. Thank you, Sixteen. You are welcome. Well, we could sneak away if we could get underwater. Sixteen, are you waterproof? I was. Shit. Then all we can do is wait and hope he just moves on. Do you understand what we could be together? We could be perfect! Dude, oh. I know you're having issues with your girl. Trust me, I get it. But you're making a scene, man. Can I help you, uh... My name's Tom! Oh, well, hi, Tom! I'll try to make less of a scene while I liquefy your insides and proceed to drink you! Hey, no need to be hostile, man! Do you people <sighs> mind? My child is trying to nap! I'm <sighs> just trying to help this guy out with his lady problems. I don't need your help, Tom! But thank you! <sighs> well, now you've done it! Okay, ma'am, first of all... <sighs> Huh? Uh, uh. Oh, it's Bulma! Hey, Bulma! Did you bring back your drove? Ah, oh, of course you did it! Oh, I miss my bean daddy. Huh, so it does just kind of float there. Hey! Anyone uh, here? Huh? Bulma! Hey, Bulma! <laughs> Hey guys! <laughs> huh? Oh my gosh, huh? Trunks! Your hair! Uh, it looks good! Uh, Platonically, of course. It's okay, Mom. I literally just spent a year with Dad in the time chamber. I'm over it. Wait, you spent an entire year with Vegeta? Even I haven't managed that. Wouldn't recommend it. All he does is scream at you. Yeah, he does. Speaking of, how about you? Why didn't your hair grow? Because unlike a half-breed, a pure-blooded Saiyan's hair does not change from the day we are born. 
with the exceptions of beards and mustaches. Boy, now I can't stop thinking about Vegeta with a mustache. Mustache. <laughs> oh, before I forget. I brought you guys some armor for your fight against the androids. This is easily the greatest thing you've ever produced. Good girl. Yes, even you. Aren't you guys going to try them on too? No. No. Any reason? No. No. Hey, look, Vegeta! I'm you! Paragon till death! You ruined it. You ruined it and I'm leaving. You want I should teleport you, buddy? I hate you. I should follow him. Oh, before you go, you'll probably want these. Just in case. Thanks, but hopefully we won't need them. Yeah, but... Father. Vegeta... You should really hurry up. Said father has a head start on you. Yeah, and who knows what atrocity Cell is committing as we speak. My husband and I go to couples counseling every Tuesday, and it's really helped us. Yes, and I'm happy to hear that, Sally, but my situation isn't exactly... Well, if you love something, you have got to set it free. Okay, that's, that's not... You can't be so clingy. It's kind of creepy. But it's... Do you think it's inadequacies in the bedroom? And we're done. 18! You have until the count of five. Show yourself now, or I'm wiping out these islands one by one until I find you! Don't you think that's a little extreme? You're not involved in this anymore, Harry! I think I'm pretty involved! Five! This is bad. This is really bad. Oh. You're not fret. You are too valuable. Three! He would not risk destroying you. And you're Two. sure about that? Trust me. One! Can we please go back to talking about this?! You were saying exactly? This is a fluffy bird. Yeah, guess that one's on me. All right, you maggots ready yet? Yep, sorry for the wait. I can't believe you wasted half an hour on eating. There's food inside. Oh, come on, Gohan, what's half an hour? 7.6 days, <gasps> but that's half a fortnight. Okay, I'm done with this, you get in. Here we are. You know, it was awfully nice of you to come join me, Gohan. I never really had a choice. You basically kidnapped me. Oh, come on, Gohan. You can't kidnap your own kid. I don't know if that's true. I'll have to read up on that. Sorry, Gohan. No books here. Uh. Or internet. Only this room and the void. void. Uh, does it do that all the time? Oh, yeah. But only if you say the word void. Void. Okay, well, we're gonna avoid that word for now. Void. Why? Alright, Gohan. First thing we're gonna do is focus on getting you Super Saiyan. Now, it won't be easy because Krillin's not here to die for you. But I think with some crunches, pull-ups, and plenty of milk, you'll find your way. Oh. Well, if you really believe in me... Also, we're gonna fight. A lot. I need an adult. I am an adult. No. No, you are not. Well, I'm pretty sure that was the last island. You know, besides this one. Island. Noun. Island. Noun. We have island. got to get you fixed up, Noun. buddy. Have you tried turning me off and on again? That's the last island. She's either there, or I've killed her. Oh well, in for a penny. <laughs> ah, warming up by destroying some islands, huh? I can dig that. More of a planet guy myself. Ah, oh, people all day today. Hello, Vegeta. Hello. Ugly. Uh, now we're doing this. Okay. Wait, is that Vegeta? Well, bright side, we get to watch Vegeta bite at first. That bird has very sharp hair. So, can I help you? Because if you're looking for another broken arm, you can always help me find Android 18. Now, I just heard how ugly you were, and I had to see it for myself. Also, I'm here. And that explains the bravado. 
You brought Junior. Nope, he's only here because he'd cry otherwise. Because he's a child. Also, you're ugly. Riveting. Listen, Vegeta, I'm in the middle of something more important than whatever this is. So if you just want to run along and bring back some with substantial say, I don't know, Goku? That'd be great. <sighs> Did I touch a nerve? You pressed the Goku button. Excuse me, but why? You shouldn't have did that. Good try, Gohan. But you can't just power up and become a Super Saiyan. It comes from pure, raw emotion. You know where I was when I became a Super Saiyan? Yes, you- I was on Namek. I thought I finally defeated Freezer with the Spirit Bomb. But as it turns out, he was still alive. Dad, I was there- He killed Vegeta, and he killed Krillin. I saw everything. Piccolo, tripped or something. It was pretty bad for everyone. Then, he threatened to do the same to my son! Oh hey, you were there! Why didn't you go Super Saiyan? Ugh. Stop fisting me! Okay. Not all at once! Just, can I have a minute? Sure you can. Well, thank you. That's a priest. Wait, so I beat Vegeta. Data not found. But now Vegeta is wrecking Cell. Data not found. Okay, do you have anything substantial to add to this? Do you? Data not found. You know, maybe if you'd actually trained instead of gorging yourself on a worthless species, your punches might actually hit a little closer to home. <laughs> ah, this is an unfortunate turn of events. Did you just talk out your ass? Well, to be fair, Vegeta, you are part of my DNA. Ooh, that is the closest thing you've done to damage since I've gotten here. Allow me to fix that. Is that Cell or Vegeta? Doesn't matter. Steer clear of that. Except if I were a betting boy, that's probably where the androids are. Stealth mode, don't fail me now. There we are. No. Do you understand, Vegeta? What I understand is I'm about to pound you so hard the boy's mother is going to be jealous. Oh, can we not? But if it makes you feel any better, I'll give you one free shot. But I'm warning you, if you waste it... <laughs> <laughs> Strong! I trained all day yesterday. Oh, you think you're being cute? Bitch, I'm adorable. Fine! Then how about this? Girl and God! Oh, and that's just precious. So we're actually rooting for Vegeta. Let's be honest, we're rooting against Cell. What do we do if he wins? Which one? Which one is worse? You know, Vegeta might be... is a total ass, but he's not that bad. Says the woman he left a single mother. Please, I'm rich. It's hardly the same. Really, him leaving was probably for the best. Wow, really? What, would you really trust Vegeta with a baby? Well, not my baby. And there you go. Oh. <laughs> 
Look at me! I'm Vegeta! I'm the Prince of All Saiyans! And I both wear and am a Unitar! Who calls uh, that a Gallic gun? Dear God, get it together! I will end you! You'll die trying. <laughs> Yeesh, somehow I actually feel kind of bad for Cell. Oh well, should probably start looking for the androids. And found them. Man, I am really good at this. Okay, Krillin. Mission, start. I know I kicked him into the water somewhere. Damn it, he's pulling a bald one on me and hiding his energy. Uh, if I were a disgusting bug man, where would I- Surprise! <laughs> Looky what I caught! A walking, talking Napoleon complex! Oh, and looky what I caught! Oh no, not again! So, what do you do with this thing? I drink people! Were you trying to drink me? <laughs> no! Yes. You feel that? That's what honesty feels like. This... this is all wrong. You can't be this strong. Nothing about this makes sense. Well, if that's oh. racking your brain, try drinking this in. It may pain me to say it, but the boy over there is actually almost as strong as I am. Oh. Then again, unlike you, he's half me. What? Of course, the other half is his mother. I mean, look at that hair. I... You look like a fruit! You... And not like a homosexual, I mean like a literal walking fruit. Eggplant! Down it! I want to be perfect! I wanna! I wanna! I wanna! I wanna! I wanna! <laughs> Excellent. I've broken both your body and your spirit. Time to die. If only you had showed up just a minute later, I would have had 18. Then nobody could have stopped me! Oh, really? Now, Vegeta, I would have destroyed you without a second thought. Now, go on. No! Ah. Ah. You know, Dad, it's honestly been kind of nice training with you. Right? I like training too. Mm. But even though we're taking a nice soothing bath, we can't hold back. We have to stay training at all times. So... Squatty time! <laughs> all right then, here I go! Ha 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 no! No holding back! Ah! All I wanna do is see you turn into a Super Saiyan, a Super Saiyan All I wanna be is a dad who gets to see a Super Saiyan All I wanna do is help you turn into a Super Saiyan, a Super Saiyan All I wanna be is a dad who gets to see a Super Saiyan Oh, I know how to be great and I just can't wait To see your hair golden spiked and glowing Let out your rage, just break out of your cage Because you are at least half Saiyan Your power will rise like never before Just tap into the power deep in your core It's waiting for you, for you to turn into a Super Saiyan Super Saiyan All I wanna do is see you turn into a Super Saiyan I'll break your whole world! Hey, son! Were you watching me sleep? Like a Papa Hawk. I don't want to miss the moment you go Super Saiyan. Wow, it's been nearly three months in here, and you still think I can do it? Well, yeah. If you don't, the whole world will be doomed. Or not. Maybe I can handle it. So don't sweat it. And get some sleep, son. Uh, yeah, okay. Cause tomorrow, I'ma get you Super Saiyan.
Nah, see, I'm definitely going with Krillin. Call it a safe bet, but I think his history speaks for itself. You haven't known him as long as I have. Sure, he can be a little... Well, he's a total bitch. But when we really need him, he's always stepped up. Vegeta, on the other hand... Hey, uh, what are you two talking about? Oh, uh, we're just making a bet to see who screws this up. See, he's betting on Krillin, but I'm betting on Vegeta. Oh, I'll get in on that action. Okay, Vegeta or Krillin? Both. Wow. Damn. <laughs> Please, I've been in this longer than the both of you. Although, if I had to pick who's gonna screw up first... Okay, Krillin, pull yourself together. She's right over there, standing there like a mechanical angel. And all I have to do is push this button and... Watch her explode! Everywhere. A little bit of blonde hair here. Her blue eyes there. And then it's done! I, I mean, she probably won't even feel it! Or even know it happened! Just her life! Ended in an instant! By me! With no Dragon Balls to wish her back when Cell dies! Oh, come on, Krillin! Be strong for one second in your worthless life and push the stupid button! If you don't, everyone you know and love is going to die, including her! Oh. Quiet, boy! <laughs> now, continue. Thank you. You see, my dear prince... Don't push it. Uh, you see, Vegeta. This is only my second form. I am merely semi-perfect. Wait, how can you be semi-perfect? You're either perfect or you're not me. There's no gray area. My point is that this form was achieved by absorbing my brother, Android 17. And the only way I may obtain true perfection is to absorb the bitch. So in summation, you get the android and I get a proper challenge. Oh, I promise you, Vegeta. You're going to get everything that's coming to you. Oh, 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 ominous! He wouldn't. Sixteen, he wouldn't, would he? Wouldn't you? No! I'm sorry, what are we talking about again? Hey! Uh, whoa, it's the cute one. Was he hiding there? Wait, what's that on the gra- Oh my god. Uh, hi! Uh, hey. Look, I just- Can I ask something of you? Sh sure <laughs> Please don't kill anyone! Wait, are you- No deal! Sixteen? Son Goku is a person. Therefore, he is part of anyone. Therefore, no deal. Sixteen, calm down. I will get you a Goku. Do you promise? Yes. Proceed. Okay, now listen. We weren't planning on killing anyone. Except Goku. We haven't even killed anyone thus far. In fact, the only thing we want dead right now is Cell. Also Goku. Oh, thank God, that makes this so much easier. <laughs> ah, and you owe me some zenny. Oh, no. All right, what did Krillin do? He crushed the remote. He did what? That was 20 hours of my life, that wow. dick! And possibly the rest of it if Vegeta follows suit. I don't understand. All he had to do was push the button and blow up the... the girl. Oh, that makes sense. I don't get it. He really did it. He actually risked every life on the planet just for... for cyber sex! I didn't keep Koho myself half to death so he could get laid! Oh. Gross. Oh. Oh, wow. Well, I mean, that was really sweet and all, but maybe you should have kept that around. What? Why? Vegeta, this is the only chance you're going to get. If she slips away now, you'll never get the opportunity to fight me at my full potential. And let's be honest, do you really think Goku can give you the challenge you deserve? You know, the funny thing is, I know you're playing me, but you're right. She's all yours. Oh, thank you, Vegeta. Trust me, great things are about to happen. Oh, no. God damn him! Okay, now what did Vegeta do? He's letting Cell absorb 18! Well, looks like nobody wins. Well, I technically do. <laughs> you guys owe me Zenny. Cell is going to kill us all! <laughs> Jeez, bring down the whole mood, why don't you? Make it snappy! The boy's gotta be in bed by 7 or he gets cranky. 
Yeah, so I'm gonna be the only voice of reason here and say absolutely not. <sighs> Don't you get it? He's just been feeding you everything you want to hear. He's playing you! To be fair, I haven't lied since I got here. You're not involved in this anymore. I'm feeling pretty involved. Boy, don't make me come up there and be a parent. First time for everything. Oh, ho, ho. Wow, Vegeta, are you just gonna stand there and take the... Oh. Huh? Why is he doing that? Oh, oh no. Wait, but there's Krillin. Does he have the... No. But... Why? He... Why? What? The Android! Krillin! Crush! Remote! But... The turn! Perfect! Crush! Why? But... Twenty hours! Oh. What the hell is wrong with you? Oh, hey! It's Trunks! I said absolutely not! Oh. Huh. Vegeta was right. He is almost as strong as... Look, if this is about getting your own turn in, just wait until I'm done with him. Just ignore him. Krillin, get the androids out of here now! Don't need to tell me twice! Or at all, actually. Let's go! Right. Sixteen, let's move. But I just got comfortable. Sixteen! More importantly, Cell is only after you. I will slow you down. Now go! Fine, but I'm coming back for you. <laughs> You're doing a brave thing. As are you. <laughs> You are way out of your league, Tiny Duck. So, oh, hey, I know this isn't the best time, but, um, are, are you seeing anyone right now? She is. There you are! Vegeta! Trunks is picking on me! Linda Sam, rat! That's better. Now, 18. I'm not sure I like you hanging around with other men. Or in this case, half of one. Short joke, yeah, sure, fine. How about you leave the girl alone? Come on, 16, don't be so jealous. This is meant to be, and she knows it. <laughs> Just look at what she's wearing. She's practically asking to be absorbed. Okay, that line has been crossed. You wanna go, big guy? Let's go! Oh no, who would have seen that coming? Anyway, really? <laughs> Oh, you precious little cinnamon bun. Never change. A one year, a two year, you know what to do. That is it! I am stopping this now! Oh, what are you doing? What am I doing? What my plans? Sorting your plans? Are you? You know what? Yes! I'm pretty sure it'd be broken. Oh, oh no. You leave her alone or I swear no, I... No, little duckling. It is not your time. <laughs> Future kick! <laughs> Blow yourself up or leave! I don't care which! Yeah, okay. I hope you know. This means... Where's Vegeta? Come on, 16, move it! Why are you still here? It's like 17 said, remember? The three amigos? Well, I guess more like Dos Compadres now. Here, uh, <laughs> allow me! I might not be good for much, but I can lift. If we make it through this, I am going to rock his four-foot world. Huh. This is a new feeling. Pride in someone else. Unfortunately, it's overshadowed by all this unyielding rage! <laughs> Okay, this obviously isn't working. Wait. Ten Shinhan got me into this. And now, he's going to get me out. But, hey! I've been so close for so long, and I can't take it anymore! Eighteen! I'm coming. Slow up! 
front of me! <laughs> no. For the climax. I won't let him touch you. Just stay behind me! <laughs> Look after the little guy. but I can feel that. Does that mean anything? We're f***ed. P is for priceless, the look upon your faces. E is for extinction, all your puny races. R for revolution, which will be televised. F is for how f***ed you are. Now allow me to reprise. E is for eccentric, just listen to my song. C is for completion that I've waited for so long. T is for the terror. Upon you, I'll bestow. <laughs> My name is Perfect Cell, and I'd like to say hello. Alrighty, Gohan. I hope you got plenty of sleep, because today we're going to do some special training. This is going to be utterly terrifying or completely silly, isn't it? There is no in-between with you. Aw, we're just going to focus on a little bit of basic combat training that Piccolo told me you've been struggling with. No, you aren't. Today? I'm gonna teach you how to dodge. I really don't think you... <laughs> now, this is gonna be a Super Saiyan Blast. As a non-Super Saiyan, you have no option but to dodge it. Dad, you really need to listen. Because if you don't dodge this, you'll almost certainly, probably, definitely die. Dad, I'm serious. Ready? And... Damn you, Pavlov. <laughs> No. Nobody is here to save me this time. To save me like always. I can't run from this. I can't dodge this. But if I can't dodge... If I can't dodge... Well, look at you. And for a moment there, I thought you were actually gonna dodge. Good thing that was only half strength, or... Yeah, the first time is pretty intense. My first time was with Freezer. And boy, was that rough. So who wants a haircut? So, who's first? Ah, a volunteer. Krillin, are you okay? Do you need a sensu bean? You're right, that is a stupid question. Hey. Hello. 
So are we cool? You ate my family. Hey, don't lose your head. <laughs> they were my family too. So you broke the bald one's neck. Bravo! I hope you're not too proud of yourself. Oh, Prince, I am proud. Not of that, no, but of you. It takes a big man, not necessarily a tall one, to do what you did. Sticking to your guns and just throwing everyone's lives away. And for that, I tip my... Huh, what is that on my head? Would you call it a crown? Sixteen, would you call this a crown? I hate you. We'll call it a crown. <laughs> oh good, the sensu worked. You know, it's too bad you don't have say in biology. At this point, you'd probably be unstoppable. I know, right? Also, Vegeta's gonna die. What? How do you- Trunks, do you have any idea how many times I've been hit by someone stronger than me since I became an adult? How would I know that? Every time! Barring your mother and Chi-Chi, literally every time! And? And I know when someone's holding back! Trunks? Okay, I can explain. I don't think you can. All right. Perfect cell. Mm, love the ring to that. I'm going to enjoy wearing down the knuckles on these gloves. Okay, I know that wasn't supposed to sound sexual, but... Now, if you don't mind, it's time to turn your little coming out party into a funeral. And time's up. Prince, <sighs> while there's absolutely nothing I'd rather do than stand here and listen to you bluster at me till the heat death of the universe, mm -hmm. I literally have a million better things to do. So here's the deal. I want you to hit me as hard as you can. Oh, is that right? Now hold on. You might have misheard me. <laughs> not half as hard, not some arbitrary percentage. I want you to hit me as hard as you can. And if I don't play along? Well then, I guess your father was right about you. Ooh. Uh, Consider that nerve touched. Wow! Uh, how? Because, Prince, like a soon-to-be-broken man once said, you're either perfect, or you're not me. I'm okay. I'm a... I'm a... Fuck. You've been holding back this entire time! Okay, you're right. When I was training in the time chamber, I found a way to surpass my father. But he doesn't know! And if he found out, then he'd be mad at you? Listen, I like the guy, but his default emotion is angry! It's more than anger, it's pride! It would shatter him! And because of that, 18 had to die! What does it matter? That was your plan the entire... Oh. Shit. Wait, where is my father? <laughs> <laughs> See, uh, Prince, that's what you get for not listening. But since I know you have trouble following directions, I'm going to give you one last chance. You, me, hard as you can. Are we clear? Crystal. Maybe you should tell him before he does something completely reckless. There is literally nothing left that he could do to make this situation worse. Save blowing up the planet. <laughs> He is going to blow up the planet. But I live here! Oh, oh that's much better. I can actually feel that. In their moments, all you'll be feeling is oblivion! That or disappointment. Go ahead. Flip that coin. Father! Your pride isn't worth destroying the planet! Come on! Way past the bargaining stage here! Final Flash! Oh, how cute! He named the ocean! He missed the planet. Thank God he's not completely insane. Completely being the operative word. <sighs> Hard enough for you. Oh, 
Chris, it actually did something. See, everything worked out. I mean, he's not dead, but it's a start. <laughs> you, you think this is funny? You think this is funny? It's not as funny as your face. <laughs> Holy shit! You know, it might sound weird, but I kind of liked the old arm better. Oh well. I'll just have to break it in. Why won't you die? Prince, has this ever worked? <laughs> Don't need to answer that. Okay, Trunks, you're out of excuses now. He's gonna kill your dad. You don't know that. He could just knock him unconscious, and then I'll... We don't have Dragon Balls, Trunks! Some advice, Prince, for the future. Next time, why don't you remember your place like the rest of them? And wait for Goku. K.O. I win. Perfect. Hmm? Oh, here comes a new challenger. I like food cause it is yummy. I will put this in my tummy. Hey, 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 hey. Huh? Up. Now I might have gotten a little ahead of myself and already finished. But I made sure to save you this. So cook her up, son. Yeah, charred meat with no seasoning, just how Grandpa used to make. Gohan, what did I tell you about controlling your power level? Well, I'm sorry, Dad. Well, I'm just not used to my new strength yet. No excuses, Gohan. You have to eat. And just because the fridge magically restocks doesn't mean we can waste valuable food. Uh, Dad, I think your hair is on fire. Don't change the subject, Gohan. Who's cooking pork? <laughs> Boy, I'm glad you're a Super Saiyan now. I've needed a good training partner. <laughs> I don't know Trunks very well, and Vegeta's always so busy and angry. I'm not gonna lie, sometimes I think he doesn't like me. I mean, who wouldn't like me? Maybe you're just too good. Nah, I'm just Goku. And speaking of Goku, it's lunch time! Well, guess we don't know what time it is anymore, huh? Don't break Popo stuff. Don't break Popo stuff. What are you stuff. muttering? Six rule of Popo's training! Good lord, the lungs on that boy. You okay, Trunks? You, uh, doing good on air? There <laughs> and there's the twist. Not to be a broken record, but... Right, so, uh, no worries. You're, uh... Huh, I was gonna say husband, but... Well, I was gonna say boyfriend, but... Your baby daddy is still breathing. Yeah, barely. Well, that's a relief. On the other hand, Trunks is about to fight Cell. What? But he's just a baby! Oh, right. The future one. But he's just a baby! Okay, you done? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm so sorry about that. Hey man, it's fine. My power was rising, I couldn't control it. No, it's good, go kill him. Definitely didn't do that because you spared the android or anything. Well, obviously. Right? You know, if I had a watch, I'd be looking at my wrist really condescendingly right now. Trillin, take this. Give it to my father. You sure you won't need it? No. This battle was over before it began. Bad ass. Also accurate. Trunks, 
Zetsu beans heal physical damage. Only therapy will aid emotional trauma. Oh, please. There's not a shrink qualified enough to deal with that hot mess. And speaking of shrink, here it comes. Krillin, go kiss the prince's boo-boos. The big boys need to talk. Fine, whatever. Leave you to it. Say goodbye, Vegeta. <laughs> I'm going to make you pay in blood for what you did to him. Oh, don't lie, Boy Scout. That must have been catharsis by proxy. <laughs> He's going to be waking up for the next five years in a cold sweat remembering today. <laughs> I'm not a psychopath like- Kind of like you. Like me. Does Gohan know, by the way? Does he know what? That you let him die. I'm going to power up now. I'd be disappointed if you didn't. That's Trunks? Yeah, pretty astonishing, isn't it? It's infuriating! Why? Because the gap keeps widening? Because he could have A, killed Android 18, B, killed Cell, or C, killed Vegeta! Why Vegeta? Because I deserve something today! That's right, keep it coming, boy! I want a real fight this time. Don't you worry. I'll show you just how much stronger I am than my father. Your father? Oh, no, I'm sorry. I wasn't being specific. I'm referring to the last time we met. Of course you wouldn't remember because you weren't there. <laughs> I mean, you were, but... Get to the point! All right, kiddo, tell me. What do you know about time travel? Less than I should. Well, how do you suppose I got here? Well, my time machine, obviously. Yaha. Uh -huh. And how do you think I got said time machine? I don't want to answer that. Here's the thing. Multiverse theory's a bitch. Fact is, you, or at least another you, traveled to the past, saved the world, came back to your future, and finally defeated the androids. Congratulations, son. You won. But wait, then when did you- So you decided to celebrate! Head back to the past, get your hair ruffled, and finally get that thumbs up from daddy dearest. But you made one fatal mistake. You took away what was mine. Unfortunately, I couldn't fit in your time machine, so I had to revert to my larval state, made the trip to a year before you showed up, burrowed underground for four years, and, well, the rest is history. Then you're here. Because of you. But please don't beat yourself up. <laughs> you're just a child playing hero, complete with spandex. And you are just another mistake that I have to correct. <laughs> I'm impressed! Behind all that angst and ridiculous hair, there's a real fighter! And behind all that insufferable smarm is a dead man! Ah! Trunks, you couldn't fathom the amount of dead men behind me. Go unreasonably, buff bird! Now that might not have done a lot of damage, but damn did it feel good. Oh, oh, oh. am I sensing an iota of pride? Guess the apple doesn't fall far if you shake the tree hard enough. That snark isn't going to save you while I'm taking you apart. If you haven't noticed, I've literally got you against the wall. 
And don't think I don't appreciate the effort. By a wide margin, you're packing more of a wallop than Daddy ever did. However, you will never, ever defeat me with that form. But why? It's so strong! Oh yeah, in raw power, it can't be beat. But the amount of concentrated energy causes an extreme expansion in mass. The body can compensate. And while you'll see a 50% power increase, you'll see a 75% decrease in speed and mobility. You'd never hit your opponent. Did, did you... What just... What? Sorry, was thinking about fighting. I'm not sure what just happened. Silly Gohan, in a lame man's terms. You can't hit me. Then what do you call the last five minutes? Pity. <sighs> Drugs, do not worry. He is just playing you. <laughs> <laughs> Correction, he's been playing you. Why? How? Because you're green. Wait, you mean... No, not like me, you idiot. As in, you're a novice, an amateur. You're surrounded by fighters who have seen more action in a week than you've seen in your entire life. Hell, at your age, Goku had defeated an entire army, several demons, and sent a rabbit to the moon. Did... Did you make that last one up? And the worst part of it is, that form isn't even new. <laughs> Watch. Look at me! I'm Trunks! Please love me, Dad! See, anyone can do it. That's a terrible impression. But not inaccurate. Why are you still here? For God's sake, I bet even your father can do it. He's just not stupid enough to try. And as we've seen today, that threshold is vast. Now, how about you come on down, stop using that useless form, and quit wasting everyone's time. Jeez, I can't tell which is more shattered. Your father's body or your spirit. Just get it over with and kill me already. Whoa, and spirit it is. Seriously, Bucko, way to bring down the mood. Is this all just a game to you? A game? <laughs> Hardly. If this were a game, I'd be having fun. Or killing Goku. Now that sounds like a good time. That still doesn't make us friends. I'm crying, 16! Fine. Go ahead. Fight Goku. But when he wins, and when you die, nobody is going to remember you. Huh. All right. Change of plans. Turn that frown upside down, Boy Scout. You're not dying today. What in the... Why? Careful, Junior. Don't want that gift horse to bite you. You've just given me an idea, Zoe. What would I accomplish killing you here? No. The whole world needs to see what it's created. Oh, what the hell are you planning now? My revolution. Go take care of your daddy. And make sure to check the news. Time to see how well Sensor Beans do with a broken spine. Where am I? What happened? You uh, may have uh, blacked out a little bit. But I'm still alive. He must have realized his mistake and run away. <laughs> Dude, come on, it's just me. I... I don't get it. I trained so hard. I reached a new level. And yet... Trust me, man, I get you. I mean, my neck's still stiff from earlier. <laughs> I mean, if I had a dime for every time I had my ass kicked, I might not be in crippling debt! <laughs> <laughs> but, but if I had gotten a beatdown like that, man, I would have hung up my gloves, my blue spandex, my ridiculously pointy hair. <laughs> You're not laughing anymore. <laughs> Can I get a dime for that? Mom? What are you doing here? I, I'm sorry, Go-chan. She overpowered me. Go what? If you fall behind on your vector calculus, how are you going to do your taxes? We don't have the money to pay people for that. Mom, I'm trying to help save the world here. What world is there and you have no idea how to prove or disprove the Riemann hypothesis? The same one we live in now? 
I guess? If you wanted to squander your potential and disappoint everyone, you should just become a politician! Now, where is your father? Yeah, where is he? Yes. Where's hmm? Goku? Uh -huh. Oh, thank God. I mean, oh my God! My dear Gohan. Uh -huh. There's something you should know. I love you, son. Oh my god! Why are you tripping, Gohan? A nightmare. A terrible nightmare! Oh, was it the one where your mom and Piccolo come in, then Cell shows up and kills them, but suddenly he has my face and it's all like, what? Yes! Oh, it's all good. I've been having that one for a week. I think we've been in here too long. Uh, maybe just a little. So, a development. Cell's gone. Wait, so Trunks won? No, he split. As in grabbed his metaphorical shit and flew off. After killing Trunks? No. Vegeta? Nobody's dead. Yet. I think he just got bored and left. So, we won then? No. Oh my god. <laughs> Jeez, oh, he's taking it pretty rough. It's pathetic. Find some honor and defeat, for God's sake. You must be great from that glass house of yours. <laughs> we should go check on him. I... I'm sorry. I did my best, but he just toyed with me. I couldn't do anything. And in the end, I wasn't even important enough to kill. Sucks, huh? doesn't I mean, sucks to be you. Yeah, that was it. Again, guys, come on. It's just me. Krillin, everyone's friend. I would like more friends. Huh? I seem to have misplaced mine when Cell... Oh. You've got to be kidding me. I would never be friends with you. I was not speaking to you. I was speaking to the duck. Well, quack, quack, big guy. Any friend of 18 is a friend of mine. Let's get you all patched up. You are the pluckiest duck. Together we shall be the bird and the bee. The bee stands for... Probot. Yes. What am I watching? I don't know, but I hate it. Well, hopefully he doesn't try and screw this one. Ha! No, Robo. The perfect place for my cell g Son of an emerald whore starting again! Vegeta! Oh, it's been so long! How is space? Hello, Milf. Oh, Veggie, I'm a grandmother now. Call me Gilf. Your culture is so confusing. Lavender-haired gentleman you brought with you. Um... Grandkid from the future, leave the swinging for the park. Louie. Now, where Bulma at? We got an android in desperate need of repair. Uh, why come to the acorn when you have the mighty oak? I taught Bulma everything she knows. Except the dangers of miscegenation, apparently. Heck, if you're volunteering to help, we won't say no. Just try to keep the house guests to a minimum. We just got rid of Yajirobe, and we barely have enough food to accommodate anyone. What up, bitches? Where am I going Else. All righty. I'm going to hook your eternal OS up to my system. There may be some involuntary oil release that's natural. And... Good God! How long has this been running? How long has what been running? We're just going to close that for a moment. Kill Son Goku! Kill Son Goku! Kill Son Goku! Oh, that's the word! Kill Son Goku!
and then he just flew off. Now we don't know where he is or what he's planning. Well, plus side, you're alive. Oh, thanks for the consolation. Hey, don't knock it. Sometimes you ain't so lucky. Yeah. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Yep, yep, yep. Wait a second. Have all five of you died? Oh, yeah. Chowtu and I twice. First round was basically just Piccolo's dad being a dick. Yep. Second time, I blew myself up trying to kill Vegeta's dumbass friend. Now he's out there making movies or some shit. Oh, wait. So, how did Yamcha die? Uh. Um, oh, yes, go ahead. Tell us how you died. I'll fact check. On my feet, like a man. Well, you're half right. If you're finished picking on Yamcha, never! We've got bigger fish to fry. Cell's out there, and we have no idea what insidious plot he's brewing. How did all these squares make a circle? I just... No, no, it's fine. It's fine. It doesn't bother me. It doesn't bother me. It bothers me. It bothers me a lot. And that one's still green! Thanks to the schematics Bulma brought me, I should be able to repair you. However, after rooting around in your system for a bit, I've discovered that you're missing an extensive portion of data. Unfortunately, Jero's server was destroyed with his lab, so... That is fine. I am my own android. I will live my life accordingly, faults and all. I could always give you a sick Gatling gun. Appreciated, but unnecessary. What is that creature on your shoulder? This? Oh, this is my pussycat. May I touch your pussy? <coughs> as long as you don't crush it. Hello, pussycat. It is licking me now. Should I lick the pussy? Absolutely not! But Chi-Chi, if and when we have to fight Cell again, we're going to need Gohan. What you need is to get it through your heads. I told Goku he could train with Gohan. I never said anything about letting him fight. You cannot keep him out of this. He's a fighter. He's ten. And he's the third strongest fighter I know. Who's the fourth? Um... I'm a fighter too, you know? How do you think I landed the strongest man on the planet? Arguably. Do not make me come over there. I will rip your world up fucking sunder. <laughs> Look, I might be books in and books out, but that's because I want something better for my son instead of surviving off prize money and welfare. Now, I know that I can't stop him, but if he fights and gets hurt, or God forbid dies, and any of you could have stopped it, there's no dragon in this universe that will save you from me. Don't make me come over there. Finally, it is complete! Perfectly square, a fine marble white, and a full 24 by 20! Let it go, Cell. You have shit to do. Hey man, is that the last key tap? Yeah, and it's all mine. Ah! Ah! Oh god! Oh Jesus, why? Key tap? Come on, you've killed for less. That's not untrue. Hey, so not that I mind a good old veg sesh, but do we need everyone for this? You guys can go ahead and take off. I'll stick around and watch for Cell. It's been kind of neat to watch old TV shows. I checked out the Country Music Channel earlier. Did you know that Country is actually awful? Well then, if it's all the same to you, I'm gonna hit the gym. Make sure I'm ready for a Cell comes back. Oh, can I join you? We'll make a day out of it. Get some froyo after. It is my cheat day. Oh, that sounds like fun. Mind if I join? Maybe we can see a movie, too. Sure, that sounds awesome. I've been waiting for your being sarcastic, aren't you? Careful, it's learning. You know, if you're gonna skulk around, you could at least try to not be a total dick about it. Oh, you're right. Allow me to try again. Ahem. <clears throat> Hello, Earthling. How's that gaping chest wound? Just fine. How's your spine? I'm giving you a five-minute head start. Thank you. I'm going to need it. You're very fast. Where is he? I heard he's here. Where's my baby? You're holding him, darling. No, the big baby. Well, Vegeta's right over there, across from Trunks. Oh, thank God. You okay, Sweeney? I heard about everything. Do you need a snack? Maybe a juice box? Mom, I'm 18. Oh, right. Um, stiff drink? Mom, still 18. Work your body. You know there's actual porn on the internet, right? Pig, you gotta be able to appreciate the classics. It's what separates the perverts from the connoisseurs. You have great clothes! Roshi, change the channel! Oh, wait, I love this movie. Leave it here. Shoutsu! Fine, whatever. As you can 
see, every dog has its. The following contains violence, coarse language, and adult situations not suitable for minors. Viewer discretion is advised. Ladies, gentlemen, boys and girls, and that technicolor rainbow in between, I am Cell. You may remember me from the following cities. Of course, if you lived in those cities, you won't remember, because you are now part of my biomass as I absorbed you. But that's not what I'm here to talk about today. Today. I'm making an announcement! Please be leaving the planet forever! Please be leaving the planet forever! Please be leaving the planet forever! I am leaving the planet forever! Woohoo! After I blow it up! Oh no! Unless... <laughs> one of your planet's champions can best me in one-on-one -on -one combat! So Goku then. Shut up! I am officially hosting a once-in-your-lifetime event! A tournament so grand, it'll leave you breathless! I hereby dub it... The Cell Games! Be part of the conversation on Twitter at hashtag Cell Games. And he's already trending. For all of you familiar with your adorable little World Martial Arts Tournament, I'll be borrowing the rules. No brackets this time, however. Yours truly will be your only opponent. And much like Vegeta's mother, I will accept all comers. How dare. Why'd you take off your shirt? The location of this marvelous event is 28KS.5. If you don't know where that is, blame the cartographers. The games will start at noon one week from today. That should give you plenty of time to prepare. Or for those not participating, time to connect with loved ones. Get your affairs in order. Or maybe just kill your boss. Get a purge going. Live a little. Because in one week's time, <laughs> well, to give you an idea... So, keep that in mind, and I'll see you next Sunday. Also, feel free to pray to your god. But, spoilers, I won't be listening. One week, I'm using it! Over the last 13 hours, more than two dozen evacuation orders have been issued all over the globe. Thousands upon millions head for the countryside, including the endangered Saskatoon T-Rexes, while others seek shelter. The world has never seen terror as real as it has today. You're kidding me. Yeah, right? Dinosaurs are still a thing. It's odd how we never talk about it. At least not since we drove them out of the cities. I'm talking about terror! Never seen my ass. My dad released every murderer out onto the streets and overthrew the world government. Oh, right. And the king of the world is a blue cairn terrier. It's bullshit! I think it's pretty progressive. Aw, oh, look at the poor Namekian lost and forgotten to time. Even the attack of the Saiyans five years ago hailed in comparison to this overwhelming threat, as if comparing a cataclysm to a rampaging toddler. Bullshit! We turned an entire city into a glass floor! Aw, oh, look at the poor Saiyan lost and forgotten to time. Watch it, Namekian, unless you want to go right now. And I think we both know how our last fight went. And I think... I think we don't, because we've never fought. I... wait, you, really? But then how did you- Your dumbass friend. Right! Wow, we've never actually fought! That's so weird! Isn't that weird, black man? Yeah, almost as weird as what's gonna happen if you call me that again. What is he? <sighs> Alright now, Gohan. You get out there, try not to brag. About what? That's it, son. Don't let slip just how much stronger we are. Otherwise, Vegeta will be all, Oh, but my pride, girl, I wish I were a carrot! That's not inaccurate. Piccolo will probably just growl and grumble. Really, it's too bad we're out of Namekians for him to absorb. Then he'd be as strong as Vegeta. Speaking of, did you know they've never fought? Crazy, right? Oh, hey guys, what'd I miss? Mock my pride! Huh, <laughs> let me tell you, he's like a sea and saying. I'ma kill him! Ah! So, hmm? was there enough food in there? Hmm. Did you get stronger? Hmm. Hmm. Stronger than Cell? Hmm. For the love of Swallow, now! Uh, 
I'm not pooping tonight. Are you stronger than so? I'ma need my threads first. Yo, Mr. P, hit me up. Bitch, you're lucky you're endearing. <laughs> Another reason I want to kill Son Goku? He is so orange. It's like, come on, there are other colors. Am I right? So we'll have to machine the skull ourselves. Another reason to kill Son Goku, you ask? His stupid face. Have you seen it? Yep. That's a face even a mother could kill. Now, luckily, Dad has enough synthetic skin to patch that area. Another reason to kill Son Goku is- Hey, so how about we talk about something else? Very well. What is your favorite type of bird? Oh, um, penguins? Wrong! Ah, good old orange. Really brings out my stupid face. I have them washed for you. Aw, oh, man. Now they don't have that Goku smell. Hey, Gohan, we'll have your mom make you a new gi when we get home. You're probably too big for your old one now. I've got it covered. Uh, Mr. Piccolo, could you, uh... What, you want me to make you a gi like your dad's? Actually, I was hoping I could get one like yours. Oh, did our heart just skip a beat? Shut up! The f up. Yeah, sure, I guess. Clothes me! Wow, you know, that works on you. I mean, if you don't like orange. Quick rundown, doors are gonna be a little <laughs> difficult at first. I suggest a 45 degree angle. Huh. Also crowds, but I don't really deal with them. Look, I don't mean to be that guy. Oh, that's accidental. But there's a green cyborg elephant in the room. Goku. Are you or are you not stronger than Cell? Good question. I'll go check. I'm sorry, go check what? Look, I understand that you sponsor all forms of sporting events. But just so we're clear, you do realize that everyone dies if I win, right? Yes? Yeah, I guess it is a win-win for you, isn't it? All right then, it's officially the Cell Games presented by Hita. I kill for a Hita. Oh, Jesus! No, actually, it's Goku. Need to put a bell on you. Huh? Nothing? Sorry, I just wasn't expecting you for another week. <laughs> Must look a mess. I just got done finishing the ring, patching a hole. Speaking of which, what do you think of our glorious battleground? <laughs> eh, it's all right. Kind of small, isn't it? I prefer intimate. Well, I'm not intimidated either. Oh, but you should be. Because in it, we shall decide the fate of not only this boring blue ball of dirt and water, but the entire galaxy. So you best bring your A-game, Son Goku. Because the stakes have never been higher. <laughs> <gasps> and before you say it, the price isn't actually stake. I wasn't thinking that. Yes, you were. Then what is the price, you monster? Living. Also a lifetime supply of heat app. You know, they say lifetime, but they never consider the Dragon Balls. Anyway, I just came to measure you up, and I gotta say, nice. Maybe you know it. I've seen all I need. Now, I'm off to go and have a high fiber dinner. See you in a week. It's a date. Yeah, I know. That's how days work. I'm gonna miss him when he's dead. So the androids took my arm? Yeah, you lost it saving my life. Well, did it at least look cool? Oh man, it was the coolest! You were always the first to jump in a battle, and you never backed down, and you saved my life so many times! I died, didn't I? Brutally. Wow, okay, yeah, he's pretty strong. Also really handsome. Like, why did none of you warn me he would be so handsome? But is he stronger than you? If he's as strong as he is handsome, then oh boy. I mean, I'd never cheat on Chi-Chi, but, Dad, so handsome. Well then, if it's all the same to you, I'm gonna take my turn inside the chamber. Hey, maybe after you're done, you and Jeets can finally have a go. Go easy on him, best buddy. You know, I was stronger than you yesterday. Yeah, but that was a year ago. We've all grown, like Gohan. Just look at him, all super and Saiyan. About that, you've been super Saiyan since you came out. What's up with that? Well, after extended exposure and focus, our bodies acclimated to the elevated state. We can sustain it without literally any loss in stamina. What? Yeah, huh? Also, we kind of forgot how to turn it off. <laughs> Truthfully, it's very concerning. Yeah, for a cell. And, uh, 
also yours. What did you do? See what the Cell Games presented by Rita! That hollow skull bastard, now I'm angry and thirsty! Boy! Huh? We're going back in the chamber and fixing this immediately. Yeah, Piccolo just went in. What? Then what the hell am I supposed to do for 24 hours? Hang out with you two idiots? Fine. Your literal humanity disgusts me anyway. Guess it's just you and me now, black man. See? I told you it would happen. Twas never a matter of if. Only when. Crazy, so you're both like a year older now, huh? Yeah, huh? Which means he's Team Gohan now. Actually, I'm 11, so that means I'm a- That means you need a birthday party! Ooh, can it be Super Saiyan themed? <gasps> With little spiky pieces of yellow frosting? That sounds amazing. Chi-Chi, Super Saiyan cake me! Goku? Yeah? Did you take our son into a magical reality outside of space-time for an entire year, bleach his hair without my consent, and suddenly come back home demanding birthday cake? If it makes you feel any better, it's not bleach. It doesn't. Are you upset? No, because I know how you're going to pay me back. Mom, what do you mean? Krillin, would you take Gohan out for a few hours? Go on, we're going to Kame House. Wait, what does she mean? Guys? He said one week. And I'm using it. What are you? Hey! Hey! You wouldn't have to spend anything on supplies manufacturing. I am focusing on training. Fine, but what would we even call this hypothetical clothing line of ours? Big green threads. We might need to workshop that. I think it has a perfect ring to it. Yeah, well, you're big and green. You have a bias. Wait, are we hallucinating? Three days. I'm out. I call dibs! Man, it feels like years since you and I just went fishing and chilled out. And of all times, right before a tournament to decide the fate of the world. Weird how stuff works out, am I right? Nobody knows, Krillin. Huh? Nobody knows the weight on my shoulders. I feel it every day. Before I go to bed, when I wake up in the morning, sometimes I wonder, can I do this? Wow, I, uh, I had no idea this cell stuff was getting to you so badly. Cell stuff? I'm talking about Chi-Chi. Chi-Chi? She's been non-stop. Ever since I got out of the chamber, in and out, day in and day out, she'll send Gohan for groceries five counties over in the middle of the day just to get him out of the house. You know you can say no, right? Well, duh. But it's a challenge, Krillin. And I never back down from a challenge. Also, it feels really good. Have you ever tried it? Like, with a real person? Hey, Dad. Mom sent me to tell you to come home. She also told me to pick up a lot of peanut butter. Villain? Look, if you're asking me to tag in, I'm willing, but... Ma no! Catch more fish while I'm gone. Oh, duh, of course. Like, that'd never work. Yeah, no, it... But if you had a wig... And now, introducing your world martial arts champion, the strongest man on the planet, Mr. Satan! Wait. Martial arts champion? Uh, did we miss a tournament? Yeah, there was one last month. Damn it, we were busy training for the androids! What do either of you care? Prize money? Mr. Satan, what do you have to say to your opponent? Now you listen here, Cell. I know why you gave everyone a week to prepare for your little tournament. It's so you could spend the last seven days on Earth playing that Mr. Satan wouldn't show up. So after I eat my Jimmy Jones and drink my heat and my hot Asian wife, I'm gonna squash you like the bug you are. Mr. Satan, everybody! So, do they know what's going on with his name, or...? Hail Satan! Hail Satan! Hail Satan! Okay, yeah, they know. 
Guys, I need help with my hot Asian wife! Who told you you can leave the bedroom?! Guys, don't tell her I'm here! This is bullshit, man. This is suicide. Dude, pull your balls out of your purse and do your job. Okay, that's sexist as hell. Yeah, it's sexist. And do you know what's standing out there? A bullet, sir. Now go get it! Uh, um, um... Hello? Hello there. How may I help you? Well, wow. Mr. Cell. Oh, please, now. Don't be so formal. Call me Perfect Cell. Uh, okay. Perfect Cell. Mr. Perfect Cell. M Mr. Perfect Cell, can you tell the audience where you are and who you came from? I, I, I mean... No, actually, an apt choice of words. As for the where, this is the Immaculate Cell Games Arena. As for who, well, <laughs> let me weave you the tale of my origin. Though I must preface that it does drag on in places, so I'll try to minimize the filler. Now, our story begins as many stories often do, with a young girl shooting a little boy in the face. You, uh, okay, buddy? You look exhausted. Uh-huh. I didn't get a wink last night. Chi-Chi keeps trying to break my record of nine times. Go for ten, she yells. Go for ten! I feel like a man dying of thirst watching another man drown. Well, you know what they say. A saying gets stronger every time he comes. Oh, oh. Back from the brink of death. Well, where is she now? She's looking for something in the other room. Come on, I know we had another bottle of it somewhere around here. I will use canola oil if I have- <laughs> Damn ghosts! Then why don't you just- I don't know, strategically withdraw. No can do. She said she needs all of it. I meant just disappear for a little bit to recharge your... batteries. Well, it is strategy. But we can't use the back door. Chi-Chi says I'm not allowed to anymore. What? Why would I? Because you could both use more friends. I am terrible at small talk. And you're never going to get better unless you try. Now, go on. So, uh... Huh? Do you hate your dad? Uh, wow. You were not wrong. See? Uh, you know, I wouldn't say I hate him. I guess I'm mostly just disappointed. He's the single most frustrating man I've ever met. <laughs> but you know dads, right? Goku killed mine. Oh, jeez, uh... Sorry, I... Oh, perfect. He's just as bad as you are. Please tell me nobody here wants a piece of me. Ah, uh, well, when Dad's out of the chamber, he'll probably want to swing at you. I knew it! Why did you bring us both along? Because if your mother questioned you, you talk. Yeah, I would. So, Piccolo! How's the time chamber? I don't want to talk about it. Yeah, I'm probably not going to bother going in myself. At this point, either you guys can beat Cell or you can't. No use risking my life without the reset button on hand. Wow, I hadn't even thought about that. We live in a world without Dragon Balls now. Oh yeah, that sounds terrible. I'm so sorry. It's alright, we'll manage. I can't be mad at you. I don't get it. Why can't you just make us some new Dragon Balls, Piccolo? Because, Goku, I'm from the Warrior Clan. Kami was from the Dragon Clan. One punches people, the other makes Dragon Balls. Wait, but you two come from the same person- So, oh, if you want oh. Dragon Balls, you need another Namekian. What about new Namek? I bet there's a whole gaggle of Namekians who can make us a new set. We'd have to find new Namek first, and who knows where that is. Also, gaggle? Well, what would you call them? A pod of Namekians? A pride? A cornucopia. What do you call a group of humans? An infestation. Point is, without a Namekian from the Dragon Clan, we aren't getting any Dragon Ball. <gasps> is this a Dragon What's It? Where am I? Who are you? Where's my family? Hey. And so it turns out, he was an alien the whole time! Whoa! I did not see that coming! Right? So, two more Saiyans show up a year later. Wait, what about Goku's brother? Oh, he died. Anyway, enter Vegeta. Now, <laughs> strap yourself in for this cartoon character. Hey, Dad? Can you come take a look at this? What is it, Pumpkin? Find your own spawn stash? No! I mean, uh, maybe? 
I found this hidden folder. It was completely inaccessible to him, and it's full of incomplete and corrupted files. But there's one undamaged video here. Well then, open her up! Also, 5,000 Zenny says it's interracial. Ugh. Oh, now you find it gross. May 12th, 7.50, 4.30 p.m. Red Ribbon HQ. Wait, why does that date sound familiar? Hey, Dad. I, uh, I'm here at headquarters, getting everything put away. No bunkmate, so room to myself, which is good for a guy my size. <laughs> well, uh... I just wanted to, you know, record something for you since you and Uncle Frapp are busy building robot guys and stuff. I know you're calling them artificial humans now, but that name is way too long. I mean, what about Cyborg? Like, from that movie we saw? Hmm. Well, uh, just wanted you to know that I uh, miss you, Dad. What the- Hey! Get your ass moving! Thing is tearing its way through the compound. We gotta go. Uh, okay. Sorry about this, Dad. Gotta run. Love you. Good luck with your cyborg. Jesus. Yeah, that's a hell of a bomb to drop. Oh, that reminds me. I also found this. Huh. At least you're always consistent. By the way, you owe me five thousand zenny. Ah, daughter of a bastard. And that's why we need you, Dende. Okay, let me just clarify what has happened. That asshole... Thanks, Goku. ...literally kidnapped me from across the entire galaxy with neither my knowledge or consent. Just so you could make me mystic you up a new set of Dragon Balls. Because you are all a cavalcade of f***-ups. Did I miss anything? Well, we missed you. Good. No, great. That's great. And what do I get out of this? Gonna make me your king? Well, can't do that. King's a dog. But well, we can make you god, though. The f**k's a god? I mean, the f**k's a dog? I mean, what the f**k? As the creator of the Dragon Balls, you shall assume the throne of Kami, guardian of this planet. Nobody is thankful, there are no days off, and no one ever visits. Ugh, sounds like being a parent. Fine. I graciously accept the position of your almighty god. So then you'll help us? No, Volkot. I'm going to help Gohan. Speaking of whom... Loving the new do, Gohan. Rocking that blonde. Oh, uh, thanks. Super Saiyan style, you know? Delightful. And, uh, have you been hitting the gym? Cause, uh... Ow. That hurt me more than it hurt you. Okay, I'm all for awkward reunions, but we are on a timetable here. How long will it take to make a new dragon? Uh, depends. Do you have the original sculpture around? Here it is. We were using it as a paperweight. Which reminds me, we'll need to go over the contract later. Wow, that's your dragon? Our dragon would literally wear him like a scarf. Okay, before I get started, any alterations? Do we get three wishes? Not if you want multi-res. I can give you two, though. Seems like an awkward number. It's a magical wish-granting dragon nail. I don't make the rules. Now, let us begin. Man, all this lore we're learning today, and we even get to see a new dragon being made. This is gonna be awesome. Hey, dragon, wake the f*** up! It's already past noon! Get your life together! By the way, two wishes means I had to nix immortality. Better that way, nobody pulling any more of that Frieza shit. Huh, I wonder if that'll upset Vegeta. Wait, did you say he's still in the chamber? Yeah, why? It's been three days! Oh, I muted the time dilation in the chamber. One day out here is now one day in there. You can do that? Why did you do that? Because f him. You really like screwing with people, don't you? Hmm. Of course, his first mistake was going in alone. Why is that bad? They called me crazy. They all called me crazy for letting him achieve his perfect form. Well, guess what? I'm gonna get out of here! I'm going to be so much stronger! No one will be able to stop me! Especially Cell! Right, Nappa? How... How dare you?! Show to him. So after everything, he just starts crying. Wow. Like a bitch. And that's what Frieza said before he killed him. But, sadly, Vegeta does come back. Dragon Balls, right. 
By the way, does the fat green one come back? Cause he's funny. <laughs> I wish. Hey, Chi-Chi. Please don't be upset, but... What is it, sweetheart? I'm throwing in the towel. I am tapped. Like, boned dry. You know in those cartoons where the guy in the desert finds a faucet, but it just comes out like... <sighs> that is me. That is my balls. And speaking of balls, I need to go find the dragons. Oh, Goku, darling, that's fine. I took a test this morning. I'm already pregnant. How? And so I told him, pull your pants up, man. I'm not that kind of doctor. Bulma, sex makes babies. I'm well aware. Also, I need the dragon radar. Tool cabin in the back, third drawer. Awesome. BT dubs, we have dragon balls again. Bye. Wait, we didn't have dragon balls. Oh, and Chi Chi's pregnant. Oh my god, congratulations! Okay, so Article 5 says that atrocities can and will be committed in your name, but you can't do anything about it. Awesome, but question, do I have to answer all of these prayers? Well, technically, you don't have to answer any of them. Oh, thank god. Or I guess I should start saying, me? Well, that does raise the question, which do you prefer, Kami, God, or Dende? Oh, Gohan, you can call me whatever you like. Well, I'm going to call you Little Green. Your funeral. I like you. Don't feel bad, Mr. Popo. I'm his best friend, so that means only I can call him Little Green. Right, Little Green? No! You will call me Dende! Dende! Say it! <laughs> Say my name! Dende! Dende! No. Super Kami Dende. So after I finished humiliating the entire Saiyan royal bloodline, I made my newsroom debut, delivered my immaculate address, and now, here we are. Any more questions? Yeah, um, were the parts about fake Namek and that Marin girl really necessary to the story? It's called world building. Right. Um, last question. How did you know about the parts you weren't there for? Ah, that's a story for another time, I'm afraid. But for now, I must bid you adieu. Oh, well, thank you for your time, Perfect Cell. Mr. Perfect Cell. A challenge from a monster. I'm making an announcement. A promise from a hero. I'm gonna squash you back the book. You are one ring to decide it all. Are you filming up there? Join us as it all comes together. At the Hashtag Cell Games, only on ZTV. With your boy Jimmy Firecracker reporting live on site as the mighty Mr. Satan takes on the Sinister Cell in a no-holds-barred fight for the fate of the world. Will it be humanity's last stand? Or will the devil get his due? Find out this Sunday at the Cell Games. Presented by Heat Tap. Got my wristbands on, my little boots are tight. Gonna crack my fans and fight a bug guy. Do do do, today is fighting day. Goku! Hey, Chi Chi! You coming with? What? No, I. Ugh. Look, you've already died once. I can take that. I can make peace with that. You're a fighter, and to be honest, it's why I fell in love with you. But Gohan? Not Gohan. Not our baby boy. Chi-Chi, come on, don't be like that. Goku... If Gohan dies, that means the world's doomed anyway, so what will it matter? Okay, for the record, we know that I'm not great at this, but you know what I'm good at? Leaving? Fighting! <sighs> Maybe I'll get lucky and Cell and him will just kill each other. Daddy! Sweetie, I can only afford to support two Saiyan mouths, and you've got a bun in the oven. Hey, huh? guys! <laughs> Y'all ready for the... For, for the tournament? Wow, did someone die? Oh, gosh, where's Yamcha? Nobody's dead! Yet. And why are you all so glum, chums? Come on! Today is fighting day! Goku, last time I fought Cell, he basically tambourined me. And he's gone through two transformations since we fought, so... Still trying to come to terms on that one, really. Long story short, we're basically just going for moral support. Oh, I know. 
but I'm just so excited, guys! I finally get to punch him! Right in his handsome face! Why do you keep calling him handsome? Because that jawline don't lie, and neither do I! Now let's go! I don't want nobody getting a swing at Cell before me! Oh, sure! Like anyone else would be dumb enough to show up! Jimmy Firecracker here, live from the Cell Game, presented by Heatat. Because apparently nobody else would take this job. But don't worry about me. Because Jimmy Firecrack corn and he don't give a f He'll take any job. He'll take every job. He'll take your job. And speaking of jobs, nobody else is here yet. Will Jimmy Firecracker have to get in that ring? Does Jimmy Firecracker gotta come down there and slap that perfect jawline? It looks like Cell is saved the wrath of Jimmy Firecracker as his first opponent has arrived. I'm receiving words that this is him, folks. The man, the legend, the winner of the 24th World Martial Arts Tournament, Mr. Satan! Maybe shouldn't have made this an open invite. The champ has stepped up into the ring. Better update that TV PG to TVMA, cause you're about to see a full-blown massacre. Wait, what's this? The champ is calling us down. Come on, Larry, what do I always say? Where there's smoke, there's firecracker, sir! You're god dang right! Mr. Satan, sir, what do you have to say to your adoring public? First, to all the kids at home, do not recreate the violence you are about to see. Unless you buy the new Mr. Satan action figure on sale now in stores everywhere! And why, Mr. Satan, have you come here today? Well, aside from being sponsored by HeatTap, Mr. Satan never backs down from a challenge! Not when it comes to evil, vile, wretched, contemptible, wicked, monstrous. Definitely shouldn't have made this an open invite. Nefarious. Oh, hey, it's Ten Shinhan and Yamcha. Hi, guys. How you doing? Just heading towards the arena. Vegeta passed us earlier, flipped us off. So that was a good way to start the morning. Yeah, but we totally flipped him off back. I flipped him off back. You just waved and laughed nervously. Look, I don't have your mutually sustained hate boner for the guy, okay? I don't have a hate boner for him. Dude, it's a pretty hateful boner. Baneful, iniquitous, execrable, villain like you. Now, what do you have to say to that? Oh, what's the matter? Satan got your tongue? Are you sure about this? Speak up, bug boy! You look like an extra from a budget porno flick. The kind where everyone gets tested afterwards. Even the cameraman. Oh, um, you're- Did they find you in the subway? Were you homeless? Did you get your start in bum fights? This is getting oddly personal. Do you have any actual friends? Any relationships at all that aren't about your money or your position? I have a daughter. Oh, that poor orphan. Can we, can we cut to commercial? Another man has just touched down at the arena! Uh, uh, sir, are you looking to take on the terrifying perfect cell? Get that mic out of my face before I give you a colonoscopy uh, uh, with your camera. Message received, violent stranger. <laughs> Answer the question, Prince. Do you plan to take me on? Because I'm ready to throw down when you are, buddy. Come on, let's toss you through a mountain of fire for old time's sake. The old silent treatment, is it? Don't tell me you came all the way out here just to stand around and look mean. <laughs> oh, I see you took my advice. You're waiting for... Goku! Mm -hmm. My dear Android 16, how wonderful for you to join us today. Are you here for... Goku! Of course, your little murder crush. And another mysterious stranger has appeared from thin air. Where do these people keep coming from? And who does their hair? Obviously, they're just hiding behind rocks, waiting to make their dramatic entrances, and using cranes and wires to make it look like they're flying. Similar to the practical effects we used in Sky Jana 2, Mr. Satan vs. Dr. Boy Man, in Theater's Friday. Will you be participating in the games as well, 16? Or are you just going to sit on the sidelines like the prince mm. over here? Goku! Okay, are you seriously just gonna say his name over and over? He is here! Hmm? And our roster is complete. 
I hope this day finds you well, Son Goku. Slept a little weird on my arm, but yeah. I see you've brought the whole gang along to witness our battle. Piccolo, Trunks... Tension on. Kiko, how you doing? Perfect. And Yamcha, what a surprise! How's it going, man? Oh, uh, good. I brought towels and water bottles. And like that, you've already contributed more than Vegeta. Hello, little duckling. Hey, 16! Looks like they fixed up your dome real nice, huh, buddy? Indeed. I am now operating at 100% efficiency. And for some reason, register 10 kilograms lighter. Good on you, buddy. You look great. Oh, hi. I'm Son Goku. Who are you? Huh? I have waited oh so long. Please don't tell me, baby, I was wrong. Dreaming of you every night. Holding back until the time was right. I've counted the days. This guy's intense. Yeah, uh, I get paid for every second I'm on camera, so if we could just... Excuse me, sir. Are you or any of your freakish-looking friends participating in the tournament today? Oh, yeah. I'm gonna go punch that cell a lot. In fact, if you don't mind, I'm gonna go do that right now. Okay, enough! Ah! Fuck! I am not playing second fiddle to a bunch of gym rats with too much time on their hands. I am the world martial arts champion, and I... We'll be the one to defeat Cell! <sighs> there is a tournament? You won a tournament? I won a tournament! That means he's even stronger than Krillin! Wait, hold up! Why me specifically? Dang it, and I really wanted a turn. Oh well, I guess we'll just have to let the champ handle it. Are you for real right now? Yeah, he's the champ. He's got this. I can't tell if he's serious, and that's very concerning. Good! Now that we have rank all sorted out, I think it's about time I teach Cell where he falls, specifically at my feet, when I, Mr. Satan, end this little freak show once and for. Hope y'all ready to get down and dirty with the three hottest stars from the Y Network. What's this? New challengers from the bitter rivals of ZTV? Like we don't got enough knuckleheads hogging my spotlight. How many of you lie from the Cell game? Belushki and Karoni, and we are... Did... Did those people just die? Don't be an idiot, Jimmy. Obviously, that was just an unmanned remote-controlled cargo robot with a voice recording. And filled with fake cadavers for added effect. I'll give them points for effort, though. Mr. Satan ain't no one's fool! Go champ! If we're lucky, it'll be that quick with this Satan guy, huh? Krillin, people are dying and we're just watching. Yep. Now, Cell, if that is your real name... It's actually perfect, Cell. It's actually garbage! And Mr. Satan's gonna take out the trash. Wait, you were serious? You're actually gonna fight? I thought you were just somebody's hype man. I am the hype! Kill him! I'm trying to get this on camera, Gary. L Larry. Cause I'm gonna end this in a single blow. And it's gonna be faster than light. Satan! Pull! My name is 16, may I please kill you? Hold on, what'd you say? Nothing. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen at home, Mr. Satan, our champion, is dead! <laughs> <laughs> Did I kill him? Did my punch destroy the ring? Is this my blood? Oh good, he's alive. One thing. I wanted one thing today. 
What about killing Cell? Would you believe me if I said this was more important? I'd be shocked otherwise. <laughs> Mr. Satan! Did you die? If so, you have officially beaten Jesus' respawn time. Can you tell us what happened out there? Magnets. How does that work? I put magnets under the ring, the tiles, and uh... When I went for my punch, I must I must have turned it on, and I went flying because of all the iron in my blood because he eat my spinach. That makes sense! Alright, now that the back of my hand is all warmed up, who's first? Guys, don't freak out. Mr. Satan may have lost, but you've got another world champion right here. Technically, we have two. Yeah, but I beat you, so does it still count? Of course it does. Does it, though, Triclops? And how many tournaments have you won? I don't know. How many planets have you blown up? None. How many Gokus have you beaten? Can I fight now? Yes! yes. Getting right down to it, are we? A bit out of character. Shan't you send in your entourage one after the other so as I may leave you for our grand finale? Well, I mean, I already waited a week, so I guess I could wait a couple more minutes. No, 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 this is good. Call my bluff. No, I'm more than happy to skip the hors d'oeuvres and dive straight into the main course. Now you're speaking my language. Ladies and gentlemen, this orange hillbilly has entered the ring, set to take on Cell! I would advise all parents to remove their children from the room immediately and tune back in when I... Mr. Satan, get back in that ring and show that trickster what for! Right after I shake off this concussion. Also stretch. Stretching is important, kids. <laughs> Holy crap, Briggs, do you feel that? F*** <laughs> off! And he didn't even have to buff up like some roiding, angsty child. <sighs> well, Goku, now that you've shown me yours, let me show you mine. Yeah, whip out your power cell. Let me feel it. Woohoo! Now you're speaking my language. Mr. Satan, they are engulfed in flames. Fire retardant clothes, obviously. And their bodies are covered in a thin protective gel. Just like our stuntman Morgan from Sky China 2. God rest his soul. What happened to him? AIDS. Always wear a rubber, kids. And don't share needles. So, you gonna take a swing? Or are you just gonna stand there staring into my eyes? Who? What was that? I was busy staring into your eyes. Oh, you beautiful Saiyan bastard, just punch me already! By the way, Trunks, wasn't your hair like shorter yesterday? Yeah, but I decided I liked it longer. Meat! <laughs> Wait, so the after image can't move it? How do you even- <laughs> Guys, he rings so hard! Oh. You just forgot we can fly, didn't you? No, but I just have hope, okay? Is that so wrong? The fact that you have any hope left in your life is your most admirable quality. Huh. Thanks, man. Yamcha, for the love of God, don't thank him. And as for you, clever little move there. But would you truly have been satisfied with a ring out? Well, yeah, it's how I beat Piccolo, and Ten Shinhan, and my wife. My god, this orange hillbilly beats his wife! It really wasn't much of a fight. One hit and she just went down. Then we got married, I put a baby in her, and now she just stays at home, cooks my dinner, and raises our kid. You know, when he puts it that way... <laughs> Suddenly really happy I don't go to public school. Fair enough, Goku. This is a test of skill as well as power. But if you're looking for a ring out, you'll have to try a little bit harder than that. Oh, don't worry, Cell. I'll show you just how hard I can get. Well, if we're going to get freaky, then perhaps we could make this a menage a moi. Gohan, what, what was that? It's French, Dad. Specifically, my household, but it's really awkwardly... Nerd! But speaking of academics, it's time to take you, Goku, to perfect university. We'd say take you to school, but I think we're beyond the basics. Doesn't that make it P.U.? And we love that you got that. Ugh. 
This has got to be for shits and or giggles. The multi-form technique basically halves your power level with each copy. Yeah, but at least we can follow the action a little better now. Wait, were you having trouble? Yeah. Well, then you're going to have a lot more when they start getting serious. Wow, sayings, am I right? Uh, yeah. Oh shit, was that racist? Mr. Satan, can you explain this malicious mutant's multiplication? Well, Jimmy, you ever heard of mirrors? I believe I have. Well, there you go. That also makes sense. Pop quiz, Goku. Which attack is this? Ooh, that's the, the, the beam thing. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, this is killing me. I, I mean, it killed me. Piccolo, what's this thing called? Oh, come on, Goku, it's the Makakas... Makanaka... Madoka... Mankanko Sapo! That one! What? Makanko Sapo! Alright, time to do some math! Looks like four divided by one is just one. No, Dad, that's still four. Go on. I know, banging my head on a brick wall. You know, I was hoping you'd play along, maybe make four Gokus, but if you're just going to sink the showboat, I'm not going to bother. Sorry, Cell, I'm here to win, and you're never gonna beat me with your stolen techniques. And what, are you gonna beat me with your stolen techniques? What? I don't steal techniques. Actually, Goku, yeah, you do. What? What about the Kamehameha? Oh, that was Master Roshi. The solar flare? That's mine, thanks. The spirit ball? Goku, I'm watching the tournament. Don't think you can pull that shit. Oh, hey, King Kai. Quick question. Did I learn the Kaioken on my own? My fucking name is in it. Kame! Duh, that's Yamcha's move. King Kai, I gotta go. Kame! Hey, so, uh... Pretty sure if you shoot that this close to the ground, it'll blow up the. Yeah! I should see that all. Mr. Satan! What do you. Laser, Jimmy! Laser is an industrial fan! Such insight! Wow. It's over. After everything. I killed him with his own technique. <laughs> Ain't that a kick in the head? Hey, what do you think happens to those beams when they fire off into space like that? Well, if it can sustain its form, it's all about whether or not it comes into contact with anything. Good day to you, my faithful subjects! It has taken over a thousand years, but we are finally repopulating our new Alia! To celebrate this momentous occasion, I shall now make love to my hot bug wife, who is also my sister! It is sexual! <laughs> Shit. I told you before, you have to. Clear my mind of all other thoughts. Yeah, primo advice. Might as well ask me to herd Starknoffs. I'm gonna assume those are similar to cats? Oh no, they eat cats. Exclusively. Me, damn it, I wanna watch this stupid fight! Tell me, what thoughts are clouding your mind? Hey, Dende, could you put this lotion on my back and or butt? Mmm, god stuff? Well, worry not. All we really need is a little green. I specifically told you not to call me that. I'm not. Yo.
strike down. What feats of incomparable skill and might! What power! What speed! What a battle is what I'd be saying if they were in the ring! Where are they? Maybe they're moving at speeds too fast for the human eye? I could try using the high shutter camera. Jerry, you're a terrific camera guy, but a lousy martial artist. Nobody's that fast. They're just using camouflage, like the Predator or Harry Potter. <laughs> Harry Potter, sir? My daughter's a big fan. Good, Goku. Very good. This is exactly what I've been looking for. <laughs> uh, you know, when I became perfect, I was a little scared. Scared that I'd never be able to test these abilities. Like a master surgeon without a patient. Or a grill without a burger. Yes, you get it, Goku. And that's why we're here today. You are the only one who can complete me. Compete with me. All the others, oh, they mean nothing. This tournament, this ring, they're all for you. So we could have our perfect battle. Well, honestly, you didn't need to go this far. I'm just here for a fight. God, that's what I adore about you. You're so simple. That's what nobody else understands. Now then, how about we slip into something more comfortable? Wait, I'm confused. Are you asking me to get naked? Because I'm not going to say no, but I shouldn't say yes. Oh, bad guy? Ah! Looks like there's a hole in the ring! <laughs> really? Let me go! <laughs> Um, th th thank you for saving us, Mr. Um... 16. Android 16. Anything you'd like to say to the audience? I want to murder Son Goku. Well, you heard it here first, folks. Yeah, fuck Goku! I'd feel worse about all the time I spent making our perfect ring, but now that it's gone, we can fight unabated. Uh, chi, chi told me that makes you grow hair on your eyes. Killing you will be the hardest thing I ever enjoy. <laughs> Sir, what's our life insurance policy? Same as our ethics policy! Then I'm real glad I don't have a family! What's he doing up there? Ooh, you think he's going for a solar flare? Uh... That's not how the solar flare works. He he can't be serious. Man! Getting dad flashbacks here. Ah! <laughs> I see. Yes, Goku. You're absolutely right. This is the only way it can end. This tournament, these fools, this planet. They mean nothing to men like you and I. We will go out together in a ball of molten rocket death. Me! Go go now! Yes! Oh, Rapaski! Are you alive? Somehow, sir. And get back out there, Larry! <sighs> well, those guys with the camera better stop rolling, because it looks like Cell's going topless. <laughs> you know, just because everyone somehow survived this, I'm gonna let you have that. I won't, you suck! Oh. God has my witness. It looks like that orange hillbilly has exploded the top of cell. Mr. Satan, do you have any explanations? Well, if I were a betting man, and I am, it's a serious problem. They combine the lasers and the mirrors with C4 charges. And switch the body out in the ensuing chaos. Now you're thinking like a Satanist, Jimmy. Awesome. Hey, Krillin, can I get a 10 count? You got it, Goku! One! 
right time, time out, time right the hell out. How did you- You weren't here for this, but TLDR, Piccolo sells. Okay, I am 90% sure I can't do that. We'll figure that out later. In the meantime, what I really want to know is how you keep popping in and out of reality. Well, that's just my instant transmission. And don't tell me, is that another technique you stole? No. Kinda. I got it from eating sick aliens. That's disgusting. You eat people all the time! Yes, and I'm a monster. Yeah, with all our stolen DNA. I didn't ask to be born, dads! <laughs> <laughs> Satan. Can you make heads or tails of this? Because right now I'm more confused than a homeless man under house arrest. First of all, I find that offensive. Why? Secondly, uh, I don't want to give away all the trade secrets. Otherwise, what would be left for the kids, Jimmy? What would be left for the kids? Pragmatism at its finest, Mr. Satan. Hey, I'm here. Sorry I'm so late. I had to pick up trunks from daycare. Oh, you brought the baby. Is that a problem? Uh, nah, it's fine. He is legally obligated to inform you that he is- Paddle, I've watched her poop. She knows what I'm about. <sighs> I'll admit, Goku, I'm impressed. A blast that strong should have wiped you, but here you are still swinging away at me. So, if I gained anything in the days leading up to this tournament, it was endurance. What did you do to him? What didn't I do to him? You're just like your mother. This is bad. The last time I saw Goku this winded, he was having a heart attack. He can't keep this up. Wait, what about the sensu beans? You know, the magical beans that heal all wounds and restore your stamina? Okay, guys, if you're bothered by cheating, either loosen your moral code or stop hinging the fate of the world on death matches! I can't what? believe you're my son. Hey, you said it, not me. Kakarot isn't like you! He's a full-blooded Saiyan warrior! He'd throw that sensu bean back in your face because it's not the world that's at stake! I'm pretty sure it is. It's his Saiyan pride! He'll see this fight to the end without any of our help, even if it kills him. I give up. I'll kill him! I'm sorry, I'm rather high up here. What did you just say, Goku? I give up. You win. Great fight. Wait, what is he doing? Well, this is your father, so he's either saving all of our lives or dooming us all. But we're not finished. I'm not finished. This isn't a victory. This is... I don't even know what this is. Nah, it's totally a victory. Because I'm giving up. That means you win. Every word you just spoke has made me violently angry. Oh, great! Now I'm agreeing with Cell! Look what you made me do! Cell, you knew what this was. Just a fight. Nothing more. You bitch. If you seriously concede, I'll... I'll just blow up the Earth like I said. So unless you want me to turn this whole planet into an asteroid field, Kakarot, get back up here and punch me in my perfect jawline! Hold your horses, Cell. You said this was a tournament. There's still a fighter left to take you on, so you'll have to fight him first. Oh? Oh, oh, I see. This is a prank. My god, I honestly never figured you for a prankster, Goku, but you son of a bitch. You got me. Okay, who is it? Is it the prince? <laughs> no, it couldn't be. I don't even take my own sloppy seconds. The boy? Hardly. He looks like he's about ready to crush coal into diamonds with a sphincter. Oh, could it be Ten Shinhan? Please tell me it's Ten Shinhan. Man, that's like a hate boner triangle. No, Burino. The fighter I've selected, the fighter who will finally put your terror to an end, is... Mr. Satan, get out here, you! Maria! Well, shoot. Original plan, then. Gohan, get out here! I'm sorry, we're a little high up here. What did he just say, Mr. Piccolo? I think he just said, Go on! Out of the entire list, you pick him! He wasn't even on the list! Yamcha was on the list! Wait, why was I? Half-time entertainment! Frankly, I'm just happy to be included. All right, Gohan, he's all yours. Have fun! Pet, I'm gonna have to politely ask you to back the hiffle up. What in Denmei's name are you doing? I'm sending in the strongest fighter we got. This is what you trained for. Th that's what you 
trained for. I was never supposed to fight. I was just there to make you stronger. Oh, Gohan, you're just being insincere. Insecure, and no, he's not. He's 11 years old. Goku, we're not going to tell you how to be a parent right now. I am. But how do you think Chi-Chi is going to react to this? I am going to castrate him. Guys, trust me on this one. I spent a whole year training him last week. So get out there, Gohan. You got this. Do I even have a choice? Of course you do. You either go out there and kill him, or the planet gets exploded. That's not a choice, that's an ultimatum! Gohan, we both know I don't know what that word means. Obviously not. <sighs> okay, fine, I'll go by Cell. I've never been wished back by the dragon, so hey, this will be a learning experience. Gohan, wait. Before you go... What? You're so much stronger than you think you are. Yeah, well, let's see what Cell thinks. <laughs> Goodness! The Orange Hillbilly, previously reported to beat his wife, has resigned himself and sent his own child to fight Cell! With a butter knife, you son of a bitch! I'll tie you to a chair first and gag you with a goddamn Daigo Radish! So, the biggest, most important fight of my life walks away and sends in the world's strongest bookworm. Fine, Goku, I'll play along with this little joke. But I want you to know, while I'm busy pounding your son, I'll be thinking of you the entire time. Thinking about it, I might actually have the advantage here. He took as much of a beating as Dad did, if not more. And after spending a year with Dad in that time chamber, I'm at least as strong as he is now. And then, if I play it carefully, I could actually win this. Oh, hey Krillin, can you be me real quick? Oh, sure, here. Thanks, friend. Hey, Cell! Hmm? Sensu Bean! No! What? Why? What? I'm just playing fair. He's tired. He's got post-Goku exhaustion. Dad! He is going to kill me! Hey, you said it, not me. Oh, that's that good shit! Suck it, Kale, you Bush League superfood. Well, War of Attrition is out, so depend it is. Which one was it, Goku? Which concussion did you suffer that made you think any of this was a good idea? Piccolo, just watch. You're going to see amazing things out there. What's amazing about watching your 11-year-old son get murdered? Gohan might be 11 years old, but he's also like, I don't know, a hundred times stronger than I was at that age. Goku? He's been keeping pace with us since he was a baby. I mean, you should know, you kidnapped him. Goku! And after spending that year alone with him, I know more than anyone that he's going to... Goku! What? Think of you, Goku! Folks at home, we here at CTV do not condone child violence. We will, however, continue to bring it to you live in high definition, all thanks to our sponsors at HeatTap. When you're feeling sapped, Bring the tap! Goku. Don't worry, Piccolo. At some point, Cell's hand is going to cramp up. And then Gohan will... <laughs> oh, God, me! Gohan, look out for low kicks! Turtle, son! <laughs> You're quite a treat to knock around, kid. Durable like your father, but soft like your mother. But if you think the only way to win is to not play, I have news for you, brat. You're playing the wrong game! <laughs> Gohan, done! You must be so proud. Your precious runt is becoming a man. Yeah, but... I mean, it could be dodging better. Good gravy! This 11-year-old child is currently fighting for his life! Huh. Methinks the Make-A-Wish Foundation has gone too far this time. Game over, kid. <laughs> Sweet, merciful God, I think he's dead! Can we show that on network television? I, I mean, we're live, so... <laughs> Sweetheart, remember, you have another one coming! So, which one of you wants to try and describe the word filicide to Goku? I'd ask Gohan, but... Well, he's been filicided. I'm actually not sure what it means either. I think it's when you murder a pony? 
It means Gohan is dead! And it's your fault, Goku! He's dead! Yo, Gohan! Stop hiding your power level and come on out, you goof! <sighs> Oh, goody. Can I say something? I've been humoring you this entire time anyway, so why not? But if you're looking to exchange bobs, I'd recommend cutting your teeth on something simpler first. Like that embarrassment over there. Leave me out of this! I know why I'm here. I know why my dad threw me to the biggest wolf in the woods. Oh, trust me. I'll huff and huff and blow you down. He's 11! I'm 6! Wow! It's because whenever I get backed into a corner, I snap. And when I do, I hurt people. We're like, uh, what do you do to them? When I get angry, when I lose my mind, my power skyrockets. And Everything goes red. The world around me just fades away. And all I can see is the person I want to kill. Of course, I've never actually managed to beat anyone in the past, but I think my dad knows that if I step here... Let me guess. You'll kill me? You said it, not me. <laughs> well, threaten me with a good time. Huh? At first you had my curiosity, but now you have my erection. You mean your attention? You all know what I'm about. That's Freeze's move! The one he killed Vegeta with! Remember that, Vegeta? I was there. You should really watch out for that. Didn't Freeza blow you up? Oh, ho, ho, yeah! Then you should really watch out for that! That's you. Team Three Star? No. What's that? Is that a club? Can I join? No! Ah! So to be clear, when you break, I die. Is that the gist of it? That would be the process of events, yes. Well then, let's see which breaks first. <laughs> Just according to cake. In this endless pile of hay, Goku, this is the last straw. If you don't go out there, your son, your flesh and blood will die. No ifs, ands, or buts. But no buts! Speaking of bots, which way do you think his organs are gonna come out? Because I'm betting mouth, but I'm hoping... I get what you're saying, but this is exactly what I've been planning out this whole time. You? What could you possibly... Why do you think Gohan and I went into the time chamber after Vegeta and Trunks? Ego? Because if Gohan and I came out first, we'd have killed Cell right away. But leaving that job to Vegeta? <laughs> well, I mean, you saw what happened. I'm... Confused because it sounds like you knew Vegeta would screw up. It was gonna be him or Krillin. Oh my god. But how did you know he wouldn't just kill everyone after becoming perfect? I took care of that myself. Oh, and uh, Cell? You're gonna die. Cell would never pass that up because I wouldn't. Okay, but, but why Gohan? Piccolo, I ain't gonna be around forever. Sooner or later, that's just gonna stick, you know? So what then? Someone's gotta be here when I'm not. And when I was in the chamber with him, I realized that that person is Gohan. Listen to those bones crackling and popping. So where's the snap, kiddo? Ha! Like father, like son. Wait, no. Like father, like son, Gohan. <laughs> Perfect. Well. Seems like you thought of almost everything. I just treated it like one big fight. Kind of like everything in my life. Unfortunately, you skipped one small detail. What's that? Gohan doesn't like fighting, you moron! What? No. I mean, right? Have you ever, in your life, actually asked your son what he likes? Um, but he went in that chamber with me for that whole year. Because he wanted to spend time with you, his father! The man who spends half his time training, and the other half dead! Sometimes both! I mean, is anyone else? No, a little bit. Pretty hard no. to dispute. Eh, yeah, that was perfect! I've made a terrible mistake. No, oh, I've made a terrible mistake! That's you! Krillin, I need another sensu beam. 
Oh, oh no way, Jose! Krillin, I'm serious! You're gonna use it on me this time! Krillin, I'm serious! I'm gonna use it on me this time! That's you! Uh, just quick update, everyone. These are now tournament illegal. All right, thank you. Okay, that's my B. It's all right, Krillin. This is everybody's B. I have done literally nothing wrong. Yeah, join the club. So there is a club. I see now that not all roads lead to Rome. Torture won't do the trick, so let's change up the game plan, shall we? I'm going to drag each one of them down here and murder them until you finally give me what I want. No, please! Shh, it's okay. I'll save your dad for last. Hear that, Piccolo? I mean, if you're just gonna say it. I don't get it. Stay away from the <laughs> Sit down. This might take a while. Enough! Sixteen! Listen, buddy, I'm thrilled that you're finally coming around to me, but your timing is less than ideal! And the jolly green ginger has got Sal in a bear hug! Everybody's getting love today, folks! Robot! Be careful! Stop calling him that! Don't judge our rope romance! What is he doing? Within me is a high-yield nuclear explosive. I am going to self-destruct and take Cell with me. Also, probably most of you. That is my B. I do not consent to this! Your compliance isn't a factor. You had a chunk of your head missing! How do you remember that? Wait! You don't have to do this, Robot! You still have so much to live for! If I do not do this, Cell will continue to kill and destroy. Also, I call dibs. If I cannot kill Goku, nobody will kill Goku. We can split him, 16, in half, together. You cannot talk your way out of this one, Cell. My countdown has started. Ten, what are the odds about running a nuclear nine, explosion? You remind me of Bob Shelter. No, a bridge. You're being seven, really selfish right now. I hope you know that. Larry, one more five, time, for old time's sake. Where four, there's smoke, there's firecracker, sir. You're goddamn right. One, no, zero. <laughs> Negative one. Negative two. Negative. A critical error has occurred. Where's the kaboom? There was supposed to be a cell shattering kaboom. Oh, right. Uh, my mom said she took out your bomb during repairs. Who gave her the right? Well, 16, not that this long embrace hasn't been heartwarming at all. My endorphins are just going crazy right now, but I have a time to break. Now, if I'm correct, you are looking for a kaboom? If I said no, would you still... No! Son of a... If I knew he was gonna go nuclear on Cell, I'd have left the stupid thing in him! Why'd you even take it out in the first place? Are you joking? Imagine if he decided to blow his payload the first time he saw Goku! Try explaining that to Chi-Chi. Whoops, sorry I let your husband and child get nuked, but the Hippocratic Oath and all that. Boma, I think you need to relax more. How's about a brewski? I'm still breastfeeding. Well, then two of us are thirsty. <coughs> you go, baby. <coughs> oh, 16, I wanted you to be the wind beneath my wings. But all you've done is take the wind out of my sails. Now I don't even feel like killing these fools. Does that mean? Yes, kiddo, I'm not going to kill your daddies. They are. The implication being... Oh my god. Ladies and gentlemen at home, the terrible cell is now doing one of two things I'm pretty sure we can't show either on network television. I don't understand. Where's the egg? You did this to me! My father finds a way <laughs> to make me vomit! Huh, this seems easy. I don't get what Chi Chi was complaining about. Oh god. Alright. Oh, fantastic. That's gonna be doing that the rest of the day. Goku, I've decided that your insistence on fighting your progeny will be best returned in kind. So behold, my children! Norio, Damien, Travis, Curtis, Dale, and Jonathan. Oh, and of course, 
Vegeta Jr. Jr. Vegeta! It's like every nightmare I've ever had fused into one, cloned itself, f***ed the clone, and then made those! That is terrifyingly accurate. Gather round, children. Daddy set up a play date for you. Now make sure you share your toys, don't leave Daddy's sight, and bring me the bodies. <laughs> but most importantly, have fun! L Jr.'s incoming! We are not calling them that! Vegeta! <laughs> I'm fighting you. You're too slow! Look, worry, bastard! Are they not precious, my own little family? Oh, now after I'm through with this worthless little planet, I'll have someone to accompany me as I trounce about the stars. Perhaps I'll try conquering Namek. Wear that hat for a little while. No. Yeah, you're right, that's the freezer talking. So tell me, Jojo, where does this fit into your master plan? Well, you know what they say. Everyone has a plan until they get punched in the- <laughs> oh, not the map! Please! I take back what I said about my hidden power. I don't want to fight you. This is my dad's fight, not mine. So I'm begging you, just rein them in. Give my dad a sense of being and- And there it is. <laughs> that right there. That is why I despise you. You know what they all have in common? The Saiyans might be fools, the humans might be weak, and the Namekian might not belong. But they're still out there fighting. Not just for their lives, but for this dunghill of a world. You see, even Krillin's doing his best. Thanks for noticing! <laughs> I really try! Krillin! But none of them, boy, not a one, shares that trait with you so vile it drives me to wretch. You, Gohan, are a coward. No! I'm just a pacifist! So, a coward patting himself on the back. Congratulations, pint-sized. You can stand proud next to the bodies. Yeah! Please don't break my arm. No. Play baseball for real! Dear viewers, it looks like Cell's gone full septimom with seven sinister spawns! Mr. Satan, do you have a plan to deal with these terrifying toddlers? These chilling children? These prepubescent predators? Uh, you see, Jimmy, those are actually children. They're dwarves, paid to fight on his behalf. And honestly, I bet you they ain't even paying them industry rate. I'll tell you, Jimmy, the way little people are treated in show business oh, is downright criminal. Uh, I'm gonna go right now and look up their agents and give them a piece of mind. Excuse me. <laughs> I seem to be without a body. Would you mind lending me yours? <laughs> Why are you screaming? Because you're a talking head! So are you. That is cutting, sir. I need one of you to give me a hand. I must get close to Cell and the boy, so one of you will need to get me there. I believe that I know a way to finally put an end to this madness. Are you crazy? What makes you think we're going anywhere near that war zone? I'll do it. Mr. Satan? I have a daughter at home, Jimmy. Little girl about the age of that boy out there. Right now, I'm being told I might be able to save the world. And all I gotta do is throw this robot's head in spitting distance of that crazy killer bug monster? Sure. That may sound crazy. No, it's definitely crazy. Larry? I have been finding God throughout this entire experience. Well then, who better to leave it to than the world martial arts champ, Mr. Satan? And besides, what did I tell you, Jimmy? It's all a bunch of tricks. They are not. You could die. Do you have a mute button or something? Not anymore. Damien sure is kicking the shit out of Yamcha. It's like a metaphor. Uh, he honestly doesn't deserve this. But it's still funny. Hey! Hmm? I'm gonna... I'm gonna... whip off your head and... Um, yeah, yeah, come on, come on, you can do it. I believe in you. And, and defecate mm -hmm. on your lunch? Oh, now you're just embarrassing us both. Seriously, how hard is it to piss off an 11-year-old? 
You should be a stomping mess for me taking a toy away. Meanwhile, your friends and family are getting beaten into mulch, and all you can do is cry? And now he's crying? Are you serious? Maxine, kids, put your toys away. We're going home. Wait! And to be clear, I mean kill them all, so I can blow up this shithole and find something better to do. Waste of my f***ing Sunday. Hold on! I'm just one step closer to the edge, and I'm about to- Everything you say to me is pissing me off. You had your chance, kid, and in the end, it didn't even matter. Wait! Ow, ow, hmm? ow. Huh? Thank you for your assistance. Don't name me! Mr. Satan. Kids, when you're done with them, draw and quarter that buffoon. As for you, I'm surprised you're still... Well, I was going to say kicking, but... Go on. Huh? Alright, fine, fine, then you talk to him, Jesus. What? What are you... Grow up. Huh? You act like you are the only one suffering. But I believe that Trunks has some stories for you. And I can assume they all end with, and then he died too. And before you start whining about your father, again, and I get it, take a moment to consider that my father made me a soulless killing machine to kill your father. And that doesn't even come close to the complete tragedy of fatherhood that is Vegeta. You wanna come up here and say that? I am ahead. Then maybe you should quit while you are. Cell was right. You think you're better than everyone else, but there you stand. The good man doing nothing. And while evil triumphs and your rigid pacifism crumbles into blood-stained dust, the only victory afforded to you is that you stuck true to your guns. You were a coward to your last whimper. Of fear and love, I fear not that I will die, but that all I have come to love, the birds, and the things that are not birds will perish with me. So please, go hard. Stop holding back. And hey, if we do make it out of this, please pick up my head and beat your father to death with- I'd say he's gone to a better place, but... We both know he never had a soul. Hello, finally! And here I thought killing 16 was harder for me than it was for you. I'm confused though, were you friends? Did you talk about birds together? Couple of bird nerds? The murder of one's own child or children. Uh... What? You wanted me to define suicide. Oh! 
All right, would anyone care to explain? The f I'm kind of afraid to because I'm pretty sure that would involve giving Goku credit for this. The takeaway here is, you're welcome. The ends don't justify the means, Goku. You're mean. <laughs> Really? You're using Krillin as a hostage? His death is a day trip for us and a free ice cream sundae for him, go ahead. Actually, I'm lactose intolerant! Nobody's lactose intolerant in heaven, Krillin. That's why it's heaven. <laughs> too little, too late. <laughs> Bitch move. Suddenly, life has a new meaning to me. There's beauty up above and things we never take notice of. You wake up and suddenly you're in love. Jimmy Firecracker here, reporting from this tree. The young man has apparently undergone a harrowing transformation and is currently dismantling these demented delinquents one after the... Sir, a big explosion from earlier wrecked the camera. We're totally dark. Oh. <laughs> so, another riot? Sure, why not? Yeah, f*** this city! <laughs> I ain't no helicopter papa, sink a swim, bitch. You forgot your water wings. Don't. Gimme, 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 gimme! Trunks! Uh, oh, uh, sure. On it. Try to forget your hat, Vegeta, and don't f it up. Fucking. Hey, Krillin! Krillin! Sensi Bean! Uh, okay, okay, now let's just. Yamcha! I sense you need some help. Uh, Trunks, just stop. Oh, am I glad I'm not allergic to those. All right, let's get you up. Great. Now I can watch us become irrelevant vertically instead of horizontally. What are we even doing here anymore? I brought towels. Anyone want a towel? I'll take one. Today is a scorcher. Since beans are gonna heal ya. So what are we gonna call this? Because it's way stronger than Super Saiyan. Well, if the level beyond Super Saiyan, then... Then he must be a Super Duper Saiyan. Hmm. If he's a Super Duper Saiyan, then I shall find a way to become a Super D Duper Saiyan. Bean Dad? Yes. Look at you! I'm gonna call you Whooping Goth because you just devastated my children. And for a second there, I thought that yarn you were spinning was going to turn up short. But here you are, my final challenge. Careful, Cell. Your Vegeta's showing. You, you know, you're not wrong. Oh boy, nothing like a concussion to really get the blood flowing. Cell, you don't get it. I hate this. The vibrations through my fists on contact. The taste of blood in my mouth, the sound of my heart in my ears, I hate it. I always have. But right now, in this moment, the only thing I hate more than it is you. Put that on a Valentine. 
Because you were right about me. I was a coward. Scared of what would happen if I snapped. Afraid that, if I lost it this time, I'd never come back. That I'd finally kill someone. But I'm not scared anymore, so... Well, I'm glad I could... Because there's no point in being afraid of the inevitable. Oh, f this. Instead, I thought I'd have some thought throw a turn in my butt. F you suck my perfect dick. sand in there yes yeah. everywhere uh guys holy shit hey kid you missed a spot <laughs> all right gohan think it's time you brought her home hold on i'm not done ripping the wings of this butterfly red flag uh kiddo I understand you're angry, but... But what? You gonna give me advice now? Let me guess. I should let him go so he can be an even better fight later. Or maybe I should let him power up to 100% so I can teach him humility. Wait, I know. I should throw him a goddamn sensu bean and let you fight him. Ah, I see what you're getting at, Gohan. And shut up and put on your poncho. You're in the splash zone. Is that also a red flag? Crimson. All right, Sale, we saw what losing your cool got you. So tone down the freezer and chill. Are you done getting your shit together up there? Because I'm starting to get bored. What did you just say to me, you heartless little shit? I said I'm bored. You're boring me. Damn, anyone else feel that? Pretty sure my pity well is bottomed out. Oh, oh. oh no. Guys, uh, starting to think he wasn't kidding about this place. So... Wow! <laughs> it's a girl. Mazel tov. Android 18! Later! But my bay team! I will get a hose! <laughs> No, no, no! Wait, so if he doesn't have 18 anymore, does that mean... Is that what he turned into after he beat me? I'm kind of offended by his lips. Am I allowed to be offended by his lips? Are you offended by Mr. Popo's lips? Wait, can we talk about that? Uh, so, uh... You gonna eat that? No. Then, uh, can I? No. Mr. Satan, <laughs> I'm gonna be straight with you. What the hell is happening? 
That camera's broken, right? Fubar, sir. I have no fucking idea. Gohan, do it now! End this! Fine, Christ, if you wanted to die so bad, kill him yourself. Pretty sure anyone with blonde hair over there could. Kumri? No, 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 no. I can't die to this. He's a middle school of throwing a tantrum. And I am the perfect being. I was. Then he took it away. He took it away from me. So I'll take everything away from you. Wait, I've seen this before. Krillin, if he turns blue, you've got to go sing a song. For the last time, I am not an Oompa Loompa. Hey, Larry, look, it's your mother. She's diabetic, dude. Yeah, because she's fat. She lost a foot. And now she's 50 pounds lighter. So what was the plan here? Become so grotesque I wouldn't want to touch you? Because I'll be honest, it's working. Oh, my dear boy. I think I finally realized what I inherited from you. Not my BMI, obviously. <laughs> no, Gohan. It was your explosive temper. Oh, no. Oh, no! Oh, yeah! You see, in less than a minute from now, I'm going to burst and take you and this whole wretched world with me! So what you're saying is I have less than a minute to kill you. Uh, uh, uh! Any attack could set me off. A punch, a kick, a wave of thin meat. So how about you save for the time you have left? Before I go pop! Hope you enjoyed the sound games! Bye, everybody! Go fuck your pal! I did exactly what my dad and Vegeta do. What is this shit, genetic? <laughs> Well, I guess I should go clean up my mess, huh? Goku? All of you, take it easy. Wait, are you? Goku! Huh? <gasps> hey, son. Dad? What, what are you? I I'm sorry. Fighting is... Well, it makes me happy. And I just thought it would make you happy, too. And I want you to know that that year we spent in the time chamber was the best year of my life. Take care of your mom. Hold on, are you? I'm proud of you, Gohan. Bye, son. <laughs> Goku, for the sake of your friends, your family, your planet, you gave yourself. I'll see you soon, my friend. Hey, King Kai, what should I do with Cell? Is it a bad time to point out Goku just stole that win? Stupid, selfish, impulsive hypocrite! You had one job! Get angry and kill a cell! Hey, now, Gohan! But no! You didn't just take a page from Vegeta! You were a sequel to his freaking book! Gohan, listen to me! Chapter 1! Kill your own goddamn dad! Gohan! What? Dragon Balls! Oh... Yeah. Huh. I mean, I still screwed up, though. And now you're one of us. Um, it seems that Cell has disappeared? Along with the orange hillbilly, I, frankly, am lost for words. Either of you want some weed? Yes! Well, I guess this gives a new meaning to picking up chicks. What are you doing with that? I'm taking her to a doctor? Mechanic? 
A Bulma. I'm taking her to a Bulma. You put that real doll down this instant. Yeah, how about no? I can rip you in half. I know you can. When did you get the balls? If I said it didn't have anything to do with holding a beautiful woman in my arms, I'd be a liar. He is for priceless. The look upon your faces. He is for extinction. All your puny races are for revolution, which has been televised. F is for how f***ed you are. Now allow me to withdraw. Ah, oh, shit, that was meant for TN. That's my B. It's just so hard to pass your power levels anymore. You're all so weak. Guys, Cell's back! Thanks, Yamcha. But I see those shocked expressions of yours. Brains racking over how I'm back. And better than ever. And it all lies within my body. A nucleus ever so small, but frighteningly powerful. And lucky me, it survived my little kamikaze. Although Goku did not. But the most important part is, my inherited Saiyan biology, thanks dads, gave me a boost in my power, returning me not only to my perfect form, but a form even greater than before. I am now Perfect cell. Okay, Yamcha, accurate, but tone it down. Hey, go on. If you knock him in the gut again, do you think he'll pop out a second 18? Asking for a friend. Uh, I'm not even mad you're still alive. I've got some shit to work through. Oh, is the cat in the cradle? Here, let me put you in a grave. Ow. Oh, I'll... Buddy, I've been where you are. We're gonna get you a sensu bean, and he's dead. Uh, he's dead. Been there too, I guess. Although, honestly, the afterlife part isn't too bad. But the whole dying part of it is haunting. Everything just kind of slows down, and you feel yourself flip the mortal coil. To this day, I still wonder if I've ever been brought back or if I'm still in the process of dying, you know? Oh my god, someone finally put it into work! Is it any easier the second time? Believe it or not, it's worse! My baby boy! Vegeta, no! Vegeta, yeah! Vegeta, no! <laughs> Goodbye, Vegeta. And when you get to hell, tell them to make some room. No! For Vegeta? Really? Yeah, really? Really! <coughs> I can free up five minutes, or however long it takes to charge this. Drill it! Setsu, now! Ah, uh, you know how we only had eight beans, right? And? And how many people are here? So we're out of- We're out of Setsu beans! I want you to know this blast isn't just meant for you, Gohan. It goes out to the entire world. My swan song to this planet. Vegeta, you brain-dead idiot! Trunks could have been brought back, no problem! But no, you picked now to be a parent? Oh, well look at me! I'm no better! Could have just let you bite it! Now I'm on a plegic and Cell's gonna kill us all! Uh... Sorry. Oh wow, we are fucked. Well, if this is it, then... I love you! Hey, Tien? Since this is the end... If you're about to say I love you, I swear to God. Actually, I was gonna say you're the biggest asshole I know. Oh. 
You're also my best friend. So are you, man. Honestly, Gohan, the maraschino cherry on top of all of this, besides rending you from existence, is that because I am not burdened by the evolutionary failure of aging, I will live forever, free to roam the stars. Gonna have to pick up a hobby, though. I'm thinking craft brewing. So this is how I die. Down an arm and killed by an android. Why does this feel oddly familiar? Gohan! <clears throat> snap out of it! Your father wouldn't sit there and take it, and neither should you! Mr. Piccolo. You want to do right by Goku? Then don't let that bastard scare you! He's right, Brat. It's just like you told me. There's no point in being afraid of the inevitable. Yeah. I guess you're right. One last stand against me! A climactic showdown! Give me what your daddy couldn't before I send you home to him! with sign language, is that a speech impediment or an accent? Damn it! My legs feel like they're about to give up. I can't feel my arm, and nobody's shutting the hell up! Oh, sorry. I'll come back later. Dad? Hey, son. Sorry it took me so long to call. King Yama's line was the worst. I literally thought I skipped it and went straight to hell. You should go to hell! Also, the phone won't stop yelling at me. Dad, I... I don't think I can do this! He's so much stronger and... And it's all my fault! It was my cowardice, then my hubris, and now my weakness! We're all gonna- Gohan, I wanna tell you that if you don't do this, Piccolo is gonna die. Your mom's gonna die. Everyone is gonna die. But before all that, if you don't do this, you're gonna die. And you're better than that. You're better than him! You're better than me! <laughs> See? I'm not even close to that strong yet. You are more than just my son. You are Son Gohan. Now plant your feet, grit your teeth, and eat that horse! So what's this, brat? Your second wind or your dying gasp? Either way, it doesn't matter. Behold the power of two hands! Gohan! No. Take solace, Gohan. Though you have fought alone, you will not die alone. That is my last gift to you. A perfect death! Oh, shit. Do it now! And now, the end is near, and so I face the final curtain. My friend, I'll say it clear, I'll state my case, 
of which I'm certain I've lived a life that's full I've traveled each and every highway but more much more than this I did it my way Regrets I've had a few But then again Too few to mention I did What I had to do And saw it through Without exception, I planned each charted course, each careful step along the byway, and more, much more than this. Dead. Cell is dead! Nobody's gonna hold it against me if I start crying, are they? Better now than five minutes ago. So, buddy! You beat your first bad guy! How's it feel? Go on! If anybody's there, my autonomic nervous system shut down all non critical bodily functions. I cannot move, hear, or see. On a related note, I really, really need to use the bathroom. You know, let's get you to the lookout, little buddy. Is that Tent Shin Han? You have very soft hands. So, is there any food on the lookout? Because I'm starving. Fourth rule of Popo's training! Yeah, yeah, don't eat his stuff. Hey, Piccolo! We're gonna stop for snacks on the way! You know, Vegeta, I'm surprised you're not taking credit for the win. I'm surprised you're not thanking me for saving your worthless lives. <laughs> well, don't worry. We'll go revive your baby boy. Fucking better. We're... We're alive! After all that... I need to rethink my life. Mr. Satan! <laughs> Mr. Satan, we found some working equipment in the van. We've only got audio, but the people can hear you. Would you like to tell the world what just happened? I, I don't, I'm, I'm not really. Mr. Satan, would you like to tell the world, including your millions of scared, confused, and apparently rioting fans, what happened? Well, Jimmy, all you at home. I won't lie to you. Cell is dead. And I am the one who took him down! Is there a body, Mr. Satan? No! 
I mean, of course not! They exploded without a trace on impact, Jimmy. That's why it's called Mr. Satan's Megaton Clutch. But if he weren't such a chump, I'd have given him a punch for all my wonderful Satanists out there. Satan! Hail Satan! What do we do now? Orgy? Orgy! Yeah! Fuck this city! Well, King Furry, it seems that we were victorious today. <laughs> Yes, sir. I do believe it was the son of that Goku fellow. Unfortunately, the world may never know the truth. <laughs> we'll go for walkies later, sir. The orgy has begun. Gohan! What did you idiots do? Nothing! We just let him fight Cell! Alone? Well, yeah, that's just kind of how we do things. Just give him to me, you mook! I don't think the healing is working. I need to give him mouth to mouth. Dende? Gohan! Can you breathe? Better than usual, actually. No, okay. Hey, sorry about your dad, kid. Yeah, that's rough. You guys, it's fine. He's dead. There's a lot to unpack there. You did a good job out there, kid. Without you, we'd all be dead. Yep. I, I just wanted you to know that. I know. Uh, okay. As long as we're clear. Okay, so why did you bring two dead chicks to my lookout? Huh? Good morning, Sunshine! <laughs> Where am I? What happened? Where's Cell? On the lookout, Gohan killed Cell and... Gohan killed Cell. What's the lookout? It's where God lives. What up? Okay, wow, you're throwing a lot at me here. Also, I'm in love with you! And that's my limit. Thank you, bye. That was- Oh! Man, I'm bad at this. We both are. Suddenly, I'm elated that Trunks is dead. Dude! What? So he didn't have to see that. Still, dude. Okay, Shenron. Wakey, wakey, eggs and dead people. I am the Eternal Dragon. State your wishes, and I shall grant them. He seems less moody than usual. Sup, Shenron? Sup, Big Green? Eternal Dragon, our first wish is to bring back everyone on Earth killed by Cell. A simple matter. I get it, it's a beautiful desk. Can I just go to heaven? Where am I? You're on the lookout. Oh, good. I've got my clothes back. All right, since you resurrected more than one person, you only have one wish left. Make a count. Something doesn't seem right. Yeah, shouldn't Goku be back now? You want to tell them, or should I? Oh, please, I insist. I was going to save this for after Krillin died, but since you apparently did the impossible, we still can't bring back someone who's already died before. What? Woo! Bullet dodged! Don't freak out. Harunga can still bring back people who have died. Good thinking, Piccolo. We'll just use the remaining wish to go to Namek. You want to tell them, or should I? Don't talk to me! Dad? Goku? Hey, guys! I'm in heaven with King Kai! Yeah, thanks for specifying on Earth, by the way! Yamcha! You asshole! Okay, Goku, we're gonna go to Namek and wish you back, so just sit tight, buddy! Yeah, about that. Oh, here it comes. I gave it some thought, and... Well... Raditz and Vegeta came to Earth because of me, right? And then Freezer came to Earth because of me, and the androids were made because of me. It just feels like every time the Earth's in danger, I'm the come and dominate. And frankly, I'm tired of dominating. It's your turn to dominate, Gohan. Everything you just said was technically correct. I'm just thinking maybe it would be better if I stay dead. But you've been a part of our lives for so long. You can't just end like this, right? I know it's hard, guys, but I think it's for the best. And this doesn't have to be goodbye forever. Maybe one day, when the time is right, I'll come back to see you again. But it is goodbye. For now, at least. Gohan, I know I... Dad, don't. It's okay. Because you were right about one thing. I can take care of us. Just... I promise you'll call every once in a while? Of course! I am not your cell phone! Whoops, I gotta go here, getting some interference. 
take care, Gohan. And say hi to your little brother for me. Wait, Mom's pregnant? Hi, sons! Now, where's the old button? Get your hands off me! Ah, oh, my eye! See you later, Dad. So, if uh, you guys don't have any wishes, I've never really gotten the chance to... Did you turn 17 and 18 back into normal humans? What? Oh, no, it's cool. Next time, though? Oh, I get it. Turn them back into humans and make them weaker. What? No! Dr. Jarreau stole their lives away from them. I just think they deserve a better life. That wish is beyond my power. Bullshit! Look, I don't make the rules. Then who does? Hi. Because they are incredibly fair and balanced. Honestly, man, I don't see the downside to being an android. You know, except walking around with a nuke in your chest. Wait, Shenron, can you take the bombs out of them? I can. That, please! Your wishes have been granted. For the record, I agree with the results of your wish, but not the motive. I just want to do the right thing, okay? I think it's sweet. You're a good guy, Krillin. Thanks. Too bad Android 18 will never know. I wish I had one more chance to talk to her. Okay, what the hell was that? Thank you, Shenron. You could have wished for a billion zenny, or a nose, but instead you used a magical wish-granting dragon for us. Asking the real questions here. It just made sense. Okay, look, I've got to go find my brother. I can only imagine what's going through his head right now. <sighs> I never did get that boat. I actually bet it's a name. But... Let's talk later. Wait, wait, but what's your number? 18! <laughs> Guess I flew into that one. I'm not sure what just happened. Krillin's got a girlfriend. Gross. Well, I better get home. I told Chiaotzu if I wasn't dead by the end of the day, that we'd eat out. Ha! <laughs> Gay. I'll miss you too, Yamcha. Thank you for all of your help, Mr. Ten Shin Han. You're the one who picked up our slack, kid. Now keep that bright head in the clouds and strong feet on the ground. And Trunks? Huh? Go wreck their shit. That's the idea. Until we meet again. Which will probably be when the world's in danger, so just... Keep a close eye on Vegeta. Can any of you get a read on that guy? Not even close. We should probably follow his lead. Mammoth has shorter days than this has been. Are you going to stay here on the lookout, Mr. Piccolo? I mean, that's up to Dende. Are you going to visit us, Gohan? All the time. And then yes, we have a room for you, Nail. I've never had a room before. That's depressing. And hilarious. I call it deprarious. If you guys wouldn't mind, I'd like if you could come by Capsule Corp tomorrow, before I leave. Before I'd met you guys, all I had was stories. And now that i fought alongside you all, I'm... I'm gonna miss you. Oh shucks, buddy. We're gonna- Specifically you, Gohan. Was that necessary? We'll be there with bells on. And I'll see you later, Dende. Visit soon, Gohan. We'll have a slumber party. We can play spin the bottle. <laughs> 1v1 me, bro. Alright then, guys. Ready? Let's go home! No, sorry. There's only room in the time machine for one person. Can't you, like, put me in a capsule? Why would you want to go back to my post-apocalyptic future? Is it because my mom is single? Oh, hey, my apartment's this way. Later, trucks! might be, well, is one of the dumbest, most selfish, most irresponsible people we know, <laughs> but 
Before he died, he mentioned us. All of us. Even me? Granddad, seriously? Could you not? Right now? My... my Goku. You sure about this, Goku? About as sure as I can be. Most men would die all over again just to get back what you had. A loving wife, two sons, unearthly powers. Yeah, but those aren't going anywhere. And if they do, they'll probably just be back to me. It's a win-win. You're a strange creature, Goku. I'm just not afraid of change, I guess. I've never been. When it comes down to it, I know they're going to be all right. Because if I've learned anything since landing on Earth... Big if there! It's that everyone is stronger than they think they are. I left behind the best people in the world, and I'm happy about that. Things changed, and they're gonna keep changing. There ain't no stopping that. The most important part? Now, they can live their own lives, and make their own futures. And I can't wait to see the kind of future they make. What? Surprised you knew I'd be here. Seemed like the obvious pick. True. So, um, what can I do you for? I made a promise to myself, and I'm here to keep it. Want to see a movie, or...? Dude, drop your pants. Oh, oh okay, but, um, just a heads up, I am a grower. Oh, my God. What? Get on the bed. Yes, ma'am! Scatter bullets! Wow. Make sure to tell future me she raised you right. Oh, I've got a lot to tell you. I'm gonna miss you, Trunks. Have a safe trip back to the future, McFly! On that verse, Einstein. Collapse that wave function all over your pasty German e- Huh? Trunks! Oh, you're back. Thank goodness you're... Everything go well? Hey, Mom! You ever meet Dad? <sighs> okay, look. Love is complicated. Seriously, how was I supposed to prepare you for a year alone with him? I never even got a week. Mom, you didn't prepare me for a car ride to the grocery store with the man. What did you see in him? A short, stubborn, powerful person desperate for recognition. As a female scientist in her early 30s, I guess I identified with that. I just wish I could have. Well, apparently you're his baby boy, so he wasn't all bad, right? A revelation that came at the cost of my literal life. Then again, considering the dysfunction of that whole group, maybe I'm not the worst off. Yeah, it's because I raised you right. Oh. Uh, about that. Before you found out I was your son, in the past, you might have made a pass at me. Well, duh. Mom! Hey, it's not my fault your dad's genetics and mine got along like chocolate and peanut butter. Is that why you used to call me your little peanut butter cup? This is Alpha Leader Wombat coming at you live from Parsley City. We've got our special guests, the Cyborgs, and they are tearing it up! I'm already lost five men, I'm running out of ammo, and I'm holed up in the bank. Looks like this will be ALW's last report. Watch out, DJ! I'm coming home, brother! But tonight, we died in hell! Perfect. Just saved me the effort of hunting them down. Be careful. I know you're stronger, but I don't want history repeating itself. Don't worry, Mom. I'll be back before that tea gets cold. Actually, it's it's probably going to take me a little while to get there, so... Right, so want me to put in a thermos you can just, or uh, make more when you, you get know, back? I'll just, I'll just finish it now.
You know, sis, they say catharsis is actually bad for your health. And so is calling me a quote, hobot, end quote. I'd have gone with Rose thought. I'm not even an android! Well, duh. Since you're a girl, you'd obviously be a gynoid. Which is funny, considering guy is in the... Mother? <laughs> not a bad shot, Pops. <laughs> Must be popular down at the shooting range. I, on the other hand, have terrible aim. I gotta get up real close, see? So do me a favor. Sit still. If you're reading this... Oh, right. Gynoid. Like gynecology. Huh. It's obvious when I think about it. <laughs> got everything out of your wretched lives you wanted because they end today nobody else is going to oh probably could have microwaved that tea well 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 hey there lilac it's been a few weeks surprised you're on your feet already also breathing see 17 this is what you get when you don't double tap also, does he look different to you? Yeah, ditched the sword, lost the jacket, plus you got jacked. You must be crushing that 5x5. Five five. Also, did you get a little taller or...? Jesus Christ, swipe right already! Pretty sure he's more your type. No thanks. I'm into shorter men. Sis, watch out! <gasps> God damn, she's cutting asshole! Now it's too bad you left that sword at home. Now I'm going to have to do what comes next with my bare hands! Is this a bad time to point out his specific choice in shirt? You know, it's funny, and a little bit sad. You two androids didn't have to turn out like this. The ones I met in the- Hold up, did you just call us androids? That's offensive. Again with this shit? Oh, right. Uh, they called you androids in the past. The past? What, did you time travel? Uh, yeah. Wait, when was that? Shouldn't we remember you? How about this? If I don't kill you in the next minute, I'll give you an explanation. Trust me, wife beater. By the time we're done with you, we won't need one. Wait a second, that's what you meant by his choice in shirt? Jesus, dude! What, are you kidding? I put a bullet in some dude's gray matter not two minutes ago, and that's what's got you offended? Right. Any chance I could talk you out of this? What was my master's name? Huh? The man who taught me. The man whose arm you took. The man you killed. What was his name? Go. Wrong answer! You really think he's going to take the bait? I'm pretty sure I have a corpse in another timeline that says, yes, he will. Now stick to the script, Mom. Jeez, morbid. <clears throat> All right, son. Time to take this time machine back to the past, where there are two living cyborgs for you to help Goku defeat. Thanks, Mom. I can't wait to save all those juicy fat people in the past from those cyborgs with this time machine. Make sure to write. <laughs> <laughs> What? Oh shit, is that him? You know, you never told me he was green, but I imagined he was green. Mom. He's looking right at us. Does he... does he know I can see him? Is his vision based on movement? Mom, script! All right, son, I'm going to make dinner. It'll be done by the time you get back. All right, tall, dark, and bugly, I know you're there. No, you don't. This is an ambush. Uh... I also know you're here to kill me and take my time machine. So let's skip the monologue. Also, you killing me. 
Ah, oh, but that's the fun part. And unfortunately, I seem to be missing two vital pieces. So I'm gonna need that time machine so I can... Go back in the past and absorb the cyborgs. To achieve my... Perfect form. Okay, you suck. You are sucking all the fun out of this. I'm the only one who sucks here, boy. That came out wrong. No, sounds right to me. Seriously, whose DNA made him look like he stepped into a teleporter with Jeff Goldblum? How... How do you know all this? Because, as someone once told me, multiverse theory's a bitch. Okay, I feel like you're referencing something, and I don't get it, and that's not fair. So I'm really gonna need that time machine now, so I can just go back and redo this whole conversation. Sorry, Cell. You already got your way once. Hey, Cell. Is that my name? Oh man, that's way better than the name I came up with. I was thinking... Jiren. Yeah, see, I thought it was boring too. Ah! I hope you're prepared to meet your maker. In hell. Because I'm pretty sure that's where Dr. Jero is. <laughs> you think you're cute? Bitch. I'm adorable. Boy, howdy, kids. Looks like your old friend sells in quite a sticky wicket. Whatever should he do? Use the Kamehameha. Good idea. Ha me. Let me finish. Get out of my fucking timeline. It's over. After everything, this feels... This feels... Anticlimactic.